In this video, I survived 1,000 days all in hardcore Minecraft. I adventured through all sorts of challenges such as surviving on a literal dirt block, stranded in the middle of the ocean, and even surviving a zombie apocalypse. So grab your favorite snack and prepare yourself for all the mysteries that unfold in this 1,000 days. This is me, and this is the tiny raft I will be spending the next 100 days of hardcore Minecraft on. Will I be able to survive and expand my raft using only the items I find in the ocean or let's find out so we're on a raft it's a beautiful morning the sun is out we've started off with a fishing rod so i think the obvious thing to do right now is just to do some fishing so we're going to see what we can get here come on we're going to try and reel that in there we go okay we've got a barrel what's in it oh okay not not too bad that coal actually could come in handy there all right so we managed to get some dirt blocks some saplings uh, a raw card nine coal two strings and some cobblestone we're going to place this dirt block right here and place a sapling on top of it so we can get some wood and other than that i think we're just going to do some fishing come here come here so i'm going to try and get this wood over here that's definitely going to come in handy if i can reach Ah, uh, you know what? I'm just going to run in and get it. Come here. Thank you. Thank you. So there's not a lot to do on the first day apart from just grabbing resources. All right. And as of right now, I don't see any other items floating about that we could use. I think that'll do for now. I wish this thing would hurry up and grow because I need some wood bad. All right. And there appears to be some other items floating about. So what we're going to do is we're going to reel these in. It's only cobblestone, but hey, they could help. Where are you going? Come back here. Oh, look, there's another barrel. This is very hidden. So we're going to get that. And then we're also going to get this leaves block here. And by the way, look how beautiful this ocean is. Look how many, like, sea creatures there are. Yo, is that Nemo? It's actually so beautiful under here. There's a lot of, like, lighting as well on the corals. All right, we're going to go back up. Oh, actually, we're going to get you. Oh, no, that isn't good. All right, now we're going to use this barrel, see what's in it. And, oh, okay. Uh, two dirt blocks, some more saplings, which is good. So we're going to plant these as well. All right, so not a bad start. There's more objects now floating about, but nothing I can see that's going to be too useful. Um, but we're going to grab them and we're going to get these leaves. Thank you. I don't see nothing else laying about now. We're probably just going to go do some exploring, to be honest. We could do with some more wood. Um, oh, what is that? There's pretty much nothing else floating about apart from just some fish. So we know we haven't got to go far if we need some fish. There's going to be another plank there. And oh my gosh, he's trying to kill us. We've got to get back up to the raft. Is he trying to shoot us? What was he doing? Whoa, that was kind of close. All right, okay, okay. Enough of that, enough of that. We've already got angry mobs trying to... Oh my. We've already got angry mobs trying to eliminate us from the world. That was extremely close. Okay, we're going to stop looking at him because I feel like he's actually going to kill us right now, which we don't want. So I think I'm going to stick to my um <laughs> my fishing rod to reel that in instead of jumping in the water there because that is pretty dangerous. Look at him. Look at him thinking I can't see him. Oh no! All I need now is just another plank of wood so we can go ahead and craft a crafting table so we can make a furnace and eat some food. It looks like the sun's kind of going down now, and it's getting really dark out here. So we're going to have to try and find some light ASAP. Regardless, we've got to still do some fishing because we've got a lot of materials to gather so we can survive out here. Because it is getting pretty, pretty lonely and very dark and scary. I think that's another barrel. Okay. Yes. All right. Come on. Please have something good in there. Oh, iron ingots. Okay. Carrots. Coal. All right. This stuff could come in very handy, actually. But now we have enough to make a crafting table. We're going to go ahead and craft one of those. Pop that down. Uh, we're going to make a furnace. Thank you. Put the coal in and we can cook some fish. There we go. Raw salmon. All right, so we've made a furnace. We've got a crafting table. We've went ahead and cooked some food. We've got a cooked salmon. We've got some carrots also, which will come in pretty handy. All right, we're going to manage these uh, barrels, actually. So we're going to put food in one and then maybe some cobblestone and dirt in the other. Take that puff fish out. Go in there for now. Then we're just going to put the rest in here for now. So with the iron nuggets, they will come in very handy. So we're going to leave them in there. Look at that green fish. That is so cool. Anyways, we got to stop getting distracted. Gonna get some string. Oh, where did that go? That's there. Oh, and some cobblestone also. Anything else around? Uh, what is that? All oh, cobblestone. We're gonna go and grab that too, actually. And is that a fish? Yeah. Thank you. So we managed to get some more raw cod. That is very useful to always have extra food there because them hunger bars will not last forever. So we're just gonna wait till that cooks. And by the way, look how like dull it is out here now. If you look right in the distance, it's just so scary. Like, I have no clue what is out there. It is getting very, very scary out here. Is that another barrel? Yes. Okay. Oh, where did that go? Come to me. Come on. Okay, some more food. Oh, obsidian. Look at that. More oak leaves, dirt, two potatoes, beetroot, and a cobblestone. All right, now we're getting somewhere. We're going to put that in that barrel. We're going to go ahead and put this food in here for now, actually. I can actually cook them potatoes, can't I? Okay, I'm going to put them in there. Make some baked potatoes. All right, we're going to go ahead and put the cooked cod in there. Yeah, okay, we're actually, we're pretty decent for food right now. We could do with making a bed, to be honest. So, we could do with getting some more wood. Did I get that? No. Come on. 
Come on. There we go. Where did it go? Why is it so difficult to fish? It shouldn't be, but because it's me, it is. Get some more string there. There we go. Got some more oak leaves as well. Got another oak sapling. We need that. It's in this one. All right. Place dirt block there. Oak sapling. All right. So this should get us plenty of wood, to be honest. Some more wood out here as well. So we're going to go ahead and get that. Come on. Oh, nearly. And again. Come on. There we go. Oh, is that another? Okay, another barrel. This is good. We love those. We want to see more of those. Come here. Gonna place another one. We're actually running out of a little bit of room now. More cobblestone, carrots, dirt blocks, potatoes. Oh, this is good. This is pretty good. Tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna put cobblestone in one. We're gonna organize these a bit more better. String in there. Where did that one go? I'm getting confused now. There's too many barrels around. We're gonna have to start putting signs up. All right, I'm just gonna put it in that one. And then dirt in that one. Actually, we're going to need one dirt block just to place that sapling there. Because we're going to need that, aren't we? Boop. Place that on top of there. And we should have a little tree farm growing there. Okay, this is a very good start. Some more oak leaves. We're going to bring them in. There we go. We've got some more string. We're going to reel that in. Come on. Stop running away from me. There we go. What's that over there? It's more wood as well. This is going to take forever, isn't it? All right, come on. We're going to have to swim out to you again. Come to me. Thank you. We need some more barrels. We love seeing barrels right now because they are so handy. Oh, where are you going? Thank you. Basically, this first day is just going to consist of me gathering materials just to get that good start. Get some more string here. I'm going to put it back in there. Oak leaves also. Where to put... Alright, we're going to store the wood in here, actually. I think that's the best thing to do. There we go. Obsidian. Mm, we're going to put it in there, actually. It looks like the sun's about to rise back up, so that was a pretty tough night, but we managed to get through it, alright. Just 99 more of those to go. We might start exploring just in a little bit. Um... The sea, see if we can see any like caves or anything so we can go mining uh, to gather some materials. We do need a pickaxe though, so I might just make a wooden one real quick. We got a wooden pickaxe. That will be our friend for a moment. Actually, we take the sticks with us just in case. Uh, where is that food? Um, I'm going to take the baked potatoes and the cooked cod. Don't know why I've still got the iron. I'm going to put that in there actually. All right, look at that. It's another beautiful morning. The sun is up. It's a new day. It's a new life. Let's get it. All right, we're going to go ahead and take a jump. Oh, there we go. Oh, hello fishies. How are you? We're going to go and start making our way over here, see if we can find any caves or anything like that. That'd be really, really helpful right now. All right, there's, it looks like there's not much going on over here, apart from just a lot of squid and fish. Oh, we need to go back up the top there to get some breath. We're going to go back down. There's a bunch of coral and stuff. There's another squid. We might just have to mine straight down, to be honest, to get to a cave or something like that. By the way, look how beautiful this water is right now. Look how nice it is. Let me go ahead and show you that. That is beautiful. Oh, we might just have to start digging down. Okay, come on. It takes so long for that to happen. Oh, uh, we're actually going to have to start coming back up now. No, 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 no. We're going to have to get some breath back after doing that. And look, more items are appearing and bobbing up and down above the water surface. So that's good as well. Hopefully by the time we come back, there is about like five barrels over there. That would really help. I can hear a skeleton, I think. We're probably going to have to sacrifice some hearts just to get down here. Oh, okay, okay. There's a cave. There's definitely a cave down there. Oh, and look at that. That's another barrel. We're going to eat this baked potato, and we're going to head back over to our raft to go and see what other items we did get. Oh, look at that. That's a barrel. That's a... Was that another barrel? What was that? Okay, that is another barrel. We're going to go ahead and stand up here. Reel that in real quick. More wood. And look at that. We've already got back to the raft, and there's two trees that have grown. Thank you very much. We're just waiting on another two trees to grow. And then we'll be surrounded by trees, which is very good. We're going to go ahead and get some more items. So what is that over there? Please tell me that's a barrel. Yes. Okay, that's another barrel. We're going to go and get that. You're not disappearing from me, buddy. We've managed to get three barrels. Oh my, we're stacked. So now we're gonna, just going to play some cobblestone, actually. Barrel, barrel. Oh! Look at the stuff in here. Coal, more coal, carrots, more food, a lot of string. What's in this other one? Again, the same. A lot of other saplings, dirt, some more string. All right, that's cool. That's cool. Oh, sorry, we have one more. All right. Carrots. Oh my, look at the coal we've got. More string, iron. <laughs> Guys, we, it looks like we're getting pretty stacked. All right, I need to manage these so bad. But actually, before we manage these barrels, we're going to go and chop these trees down to make some space. And oh, would you look at that behind us? 
Oh my, alright, okay, now we definitely need to chop these trees down. <laughs> alright, actually, do you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna make an axe to speed up the process a little bit. I feel like that would be a better idea. There we go. Chop the trees down. Just like any other Minecraft video, we are chopping trees down. Break these leaves here, clear up a bit of space, because I literally cannot move on my raft. Oh, we got an apple there. Break some more of these leaves, hopefully we get something else. Hopefully more saplings, more apples, something that's gonna help us. Come on, oh, oh wait, no, sorry, that fell up here, didn't it? I'm gonna go ahead and turn these into planks. Other than that, though, we're just gonna keep chopping these down, uh, getting some more wood turn them into planks hopefully we're gonna get more saplings and apples and whatnot off of these leaves because they do come in very useful i see another barrel there also so we'll get back to that clearing up the space what is that it's like a little we're gonna go explore that later actually that looks kind of interesting is that more wood up there yeah okay we're gonna, we're gonna have to actually oh we're gonna have to use some of that break some more of these leaves hoping to get some more saplings and apples hopefully it drops something here though because that'd be pretty uh sad if it didn't i think i did just get something there. I'm not sure what though, but I think I'm pretty sure it was a sapling. Almost there. Just clearing up a bit of space. Okay, and I think we can chop this down now. I don't think we need that, do we? There we go. Chop this down. Get some birch wood right there. Well, some birch logs anyway. Come on, give me a sapling. Come on, don't be shy. Oh, there we go. We've also got another load of uh, oak leaves that we can break also. Oh, what was that? A stick? Okay, that's cool. Another stick. I'm going to pick that. We're actually going to pick these up. Some more wood. What was this? Oak leaves. And I remember there was a barrel here somewhere. I actually can't remember where, but I know it's somewhere around here. Hopefully it didn't despawn. That would suck, to be honest. Is there a barrel? Am I just imagining that? Did I actually see a barrel? Did it despawn? That would suck. Please tell me it didn't despawn. Is that... Oh, no. I, I thought that was the barrel there. It got my hopes up a little bit. We're going to get back onto our raft and reel these items in because I cannot be bothered to go out and keep swimming back and forth, back and forth. Yep. Nope. Yep. Okay, there we go. Was that an oak sapling? What was that? Come on. We're not even going to bother that oak leaves, to be honest, if we can't get it. Okay. We're not going to bother that for a minute. Is that another string? Eh. We'll leave that for a minute. We're going to go ahead and use this dirt to uh, expand a little bit. All right, that looks about good. We're going to go and use our saplings. One there, one there, one there. Oh, I didn't realise we had more dirt in that barrel. So we're going to go ahead and extend even more. We've got a birch sapling. Oh, there's an oak sapling. I didn't even see that there. I'm so blind. There we go. And then we can start doing that the other side as well. Actually, do you know what? We're just going to do it the same here as well. I'm going to go ahead and extend it by one more dirt block. Break that one. There we go. We're going to also extend this one out as well, just so it looks all even. And... All right, that's pretty cool. We've got a little tree farm on the go now. Okay, that's what we, that's what we need. All right, it looks like there's more items appearing as well. So there's more string there. I think that was a string we saw earlier. but So I'm going to break these barrels a little bit to make it look a little bit better because I've literally just got barrels scattered all over my raft. So I'm going to organize it a little bit better by using some oak planks to extend. Actually... What is it still doing here? Let me break that down real quick. As I was saying, we're going to use these oak planks to extend the raft so we can, you know, have a little bit better organisation of our barrels there. We can make like a little barrel room or something like that. That'd be pretty cool. But just for now, we're going to go ahead and place these barrels here like that. See, look, guys, we're making progress. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that also because that's just laying about doing absolutely nothing useful. Break these other two logs like so. Uh, what have we got in here? Nothing. All right, take the wood out of that one. Break this barrel. I'm going to go ahead and take everything out of this one and do the same. And then we're going to go and take our food out of this one and break it also. All right, just like that. We can extend it a little bit more. Just so them three can fit on the end there. There we go. All right, so I think the first one, we're going to go ahead and stick all the wood into it, just so we don't get confused on what's what. Cobblestone, uh, maybe some iron ore, obsidian. In this third one, maybe some dirt, some trees. Actually, not the wood. No, actually, sorry, we should put this one into that one. That would make more sense, wouldn't it? Uh, birch wood, get our fishing rod back there. Pickaxe, axe, baked, or not baked potatoes unbaked potatoes raw potatoes we're actually going to go and stick them in there let them cook up a little bit in this thing i think we're just going to put our fish into here or, or maybe even our food we're going to go ahead and stick all our food in this barrel um so we don't get confused maybe just sand put an apple in there why not put some string in this one we've also got iron nuggets what i did forget we had we're going to put that in there also we're going to take this out sorry potatoes two seconds i just gotta smelt my iron ore while that smelts in there we're gonna go ahead and go back into our barrel put our baked potatoes in there and raw potatoes and take our iron nugget iron nugget iron ingot and would you look at that the sun is down the moon is rising it is gleaming on this raft and we're gonna pop that in there and so far we've got the trees going we've got the potatoes burning while cooking and then the barrels are organized so it's not looking bad it's not looking bad we're gonna go ahead and mine these couple stones here because what are they even doing the sun's rising the moon's going down. It looks like it's another day on this lovely 
beautiful raft I've created. All right, so while that's cooking, oh, actually it is cooked, sorry, my bad. We're gonna go back into the food barrel. Matter of fact, we're gonna eat these because we need to. Another beautiful morning has arrived. We're gonna go ahead and put them back in there. Uh, any more items that we need? No, not really. Just some cobblestone, some string. We will actually go and get that. All right, and I think after this, we're gonna go ahead and do some mining. Um, I feel like we need to do some exploring, see if there's any caves about. We did actually dig down, didn't we? But I can't remember what side that actually was. Uh, we need to find that, don't we? Was it this side or was it the other side? I can't really remember, but we will soon find out, won't we? Okay, I don't think it's this side. I think it's over here, maybe. I think it might be over this side, actually. There it is there. Is that it? Yeah, okay, I think that is it. That is it. Oh, actually, we don't want to risk that. We need some food. So we're going to return back to the raft, get some food, and we are going to go down there and do some exploring. Look at that, another barrel. All right. Another one to add to the um, <laughs> the collection. All right, just some dirt, coal, some more carrots and strings. All right, that's not too bad. We've got some more food to put in to the barrel. Actually, we do need to take some though, don't we? We'll take some cooked salmon. We're going to go ahead and quickly cook these up. While that cooks in there, we're going to go ahead and retrieve some more goods. Some more cobblestone there, oak leaves. As intriguing as that looks, don't worry. We will go over there and see what's over there. Oh, you... look at that. That was magic. Got to go ahead and chop this down then. I'm not complaining. Oh, no. All right, fine. I'll craft another axe if I have to. Uh, sticks. Yep. This is good, though. We're getting along nicely. We've got some wood there now we're collecting. It's looking pretty good, especially when we go and explore. Imagine if we find diamonds literally this early on. All right, so that's another sapling down. That has grew. Drop me something, then. Come on, drop me some. Oh, okay. There we go. Is that a stick or two? I think that's two sticks. Oh, look at that. Two sticks. Let's go. Oh, and a sapling. I didn't even see that. Oh my gosh, another one has grew. Do you know what? We're going to do some mining first. I feel like that's more important right now. So we're going to go ahead and go back to our barrel. Stick some more stuff in here like that. Put some dirt in there. We're going to take that with us. Um, which one? There's too many barrels. I forgot which one's what. Nugget in there. We're now going to go back to that hole that we dug and go and explore some caves. I'm going to forget again what side it was, aren't I? Oh my, I'm so bad at this. Oh my, I've made the same mistake again. I'm pretty sure it's over this way. All right, so after struggling to find where it actually was, we're going to go in here before we take damage. There we go, look at that. Oh my gosh, guys, we even made it. We're going to go ahead and mine some cobblestone. I think we're actually going to go back and craft a uh, cobblestone pickaxe because I do believe we will be needing that. Not to forget which side it is, I'm just going to remember that the furnace is facing this way, so <laughs> I don't get mixed up. Some sticks, there we go. Nice cobblestone axe to get us through the cave. And just to be on the safe side of things, we're going to go ahead and craft ourselves a nice stone sword so we don't get too scared down in them caves. There we go. Look at that. I'm going to take these just in case we need them. All right, back to the cave. While we're down this cave, I am hoping we can find some nice iron. I think there was iron down there, wasn't there? So we've got some iron there, um, which is very good. I'm going to go ahead and quickly mine this. Oh, look at that. Nice iron. Come to me. Any mobs down here, I have got to be very careful. Because the last thing I want is to be blew up by some creeper. That would really ruin my day. I'm going to mine some cobblestone just so we've got some. So we can, you know, use that. All right. I'm going to go ahead and block that. We could do with actually making a trap door real quick and putting it on there so we can stop the water from, you know, coming through. Doesn't matter too much for now, though. What we're going to do is just going to place that just there so we don't get stuck. More iron anywhere up here, potentially. No? Okay. That's it for the iron. We're going to go ahead and explore this part first. I feel like there's more going on down here. Oh! Oh no, 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 no. Oh my, oh my, oh my. Alright, this is. Okay, it's coming at us fast. Go back. Go back. Go away. Leave us alone. You're not gonna kill us now, are you? Hey, that was quite scary. Oh my, that arrow really hurt me, to be honest. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat some salmon real quick. <laughs> Did I not bring more food? I'm sure I brought more food. I can't remember what I've done with it. Nice coal there. It's always nice to have some coal on the raft. Look at that bat. What are you trying to do? Oh, okay, look at that. More iron down there. Anything down here? Not much going on down there, is it? Oh, okay. Oh my, look at the iron down here. Look at that. Check if there's a creeper behind. Okay, there's not. Beautiful stuff. All right, we're going to gather all this iron, and then we're going to craft ourselves some iron tools, and maybe some armor, depending on how much we actually have, but being careful not to fall in this lava here. We're going to go ahead and place that. We're going to need some more cobblestone, actually, just to get across. All right. Like that. Maybe we need some more, don't we? All right, so we might... Oh, look at that lapis. So after mining this iron, I do think we are going to go back to the raft just to uh, craft some iron tools that we do need because, you know, it's a lot stronger than this stone pickaxe right here. But before we do proceed to do that... Oh, look at that. We found diamonds. Oh, oh my. Just as I was about to leave. I can't believe we just found diamonds. Two diamond ores. All right, before we do mine that, though, we are going to just quickly... Get that. Okay, I actually just can't believe we've gone ahead and found some diamonds this early on. 
That is crazy. That is a crazy start for us. But we do need to craft an iron pickaxe. So what we're going to do is we are going to go back to the raft. Don't worry, we're not going to go ahead and leave these diamonds now. I can assure you that. Bye for now, diamonds. We will come back to mine you. Don't worry about that. Hopefully we don't forget where this actually is. That would be really bad. We need to mine some more cobblestone though, to get back up to where we came from because we haven't got enough resources to get back up. I'm going to keep that there so I know that's down there. And it was back up here. So dark. When we go back to the raft, I will remember to craft some torches as well. So I can actually see where I'm going. Alright, follow the water source. And it brings us back to our raft where we come from. Look at that. And look at that. There's more trees that have grew, which is very good. I think we'll chop those down tomorrow. We're going to focus more on the um, on the mining right now. Anyway, we're going to take our salmon. That's what i done. I left it in there. That's so silly of me. Then we're going to go ahead and put our raw iron into the furnace to smelt down into some iron ingots. So when we've got enough iron ingots, we're going to go and craft ourselves some iron tools. So we are more powerful, more strong and more prepared for that cave because this is easy as that little skeleton down there trying to you know stop us from mining our um i believe it was coal at the time or iron you know it is it, very close them arrows are very very painful so we don't want more of that do we but while i don't forget that there is literally uh diamonds down there i'm gonna go ahead and craft myself an iron pickaxe so i can go ahead and mine that i think we're gonna leave that running down here actually before sorry where is that uh like that all right Go ahead and put that back in there. Craft ourselves a nice sword. I don't know why I keep putting two sticks in there. I literally could have just crafted that. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and stick our iron back into there. Wait for that to smell. I'm going to leave crafting some armor for now because I feel like we don't really need that at the moment. Although it would be very useful, but I think I'm just being lazy to be honest. Okay, now I recognize where I'm at. Back through here. Careful not to fall in the lava now. And... Look at that. We've got some diamonds. Just in case it does fall over here, we're going to go ahead and quickly cover the lava so it doesn't burn our lovely diamonds. Okay, come on. Please be more. One. Come on. Be another. Oh, no. All right. Do you know what? I, I can't complain. I can't be too ungrateful. We did manage to find ourselves two diamonds, so I can't complain with that. Mine this redstone right here. Get some XP. Lovely, lovely stuff. Two diamonds. We've managed to find ourselves two lovely lovely diamonds all right so we're gonna head back up to the top now we have secured our diamonds back to the raft we're gonna go ahead and store them in a nice safe barrel before i um you know somehow manage to lose these and i can't forget to craft some torches because it is getting really dark down here and it would be very handy because i'm so forgetful that like i literally don't know where i'm going <laughs> so but we're gonna go back to the top uh ooh, if, if we can there we go back up to the top oh look at that it's very dark out here it's cold Get me back onto my raft. All right, we're going to go ahead and place these diamonds in our safe barrel next to our iron nuggets and obsidian. So this is more of like a, you know, I don't know. I don't know why there's wood in there. Let me take that out. All right, and before we forget, we're going to go ahead and craft ourselves a nice torch. I think 12 will be enough for now. Actually, no, you know what? I, I can't keep being lazy like this. I've got to literally craft as many as I can, to be honest. There we go. I think I think 28 would do, actually. I can't be too, uh, too wasteful with my resources right now. Any other barrels floating about? Is there another barrel anywhere? No, just more wood, string. Uh, maybe over here there might be something. Not that I can see anyways. We're going to get ourselves some more food. I think carrots is pretty good for now because we haven't got to waste too much time cooking them. And we're going to go back to the mine. Just so I don't forget though, I am going to place these two torches here. Maybe a bit of ambient light might travel up there and, you know, let us know where the actual cubby hole is. But we're yet to explore this side of the mine. So I think after we're done... Real exploring down here. Okay, I think I saw. Okay, it's just a bat. Never mind. Oh, no, 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 it's not. No, it's not. Come on. Get out. He's got completely destroyed there. We're going to place more torches down here so we don't get more of those because those are pretty scary. But there is more iron up here, so we're going to go ahead and mine that real quick. Okay, it's only one iron. I hear a zombie over there. I'm not going to head over there for now. That is very scary. All right, so I'm getting confused. Did I come from... Okay, I come from down there. So what's down this side then? I don't think I've been down this side yet. Ah, oh, that was it. No, it was literally nothing down there. I'm going to head back up to the mine. The best thing to do is go ahead and come back down here because we did manage to find some success with the diamonds so i believe this might be the, the lucky the lucky part of the mine we're gonna leave that redstone for now we don't really need it come back through here and then i think there should be some more goods down here and would you look at that it's another side of the lava go back through here i smell i smell diamonds i can literally smell the diamonds yeah we're gonna swim back up to the top because i feel like there's literally nothing going on down there i'm gonna get rid of this coal here because i feel like it's literally just like sitting and staring at us so we're gonna get rid of this real quick as we go further and further down the mine we are gathering up more and more resources as you can see here 25 coal only one raw iron which we will get more don't worry about that and like i said we did manage to get ourselves two diamonds that is so cool honestly just finding diamonds is it's got to be one of the best feelings out there you guys understand go ahead and comment down below if you love the feeling of uh, finding diamonds because 
It is the best feeling. Gonna go ahead and mine that there. Place a torch here. So lots and lots and lots of coal going on here. There's also more iron, so that's good. Go ahead and get rid of that. More coal again. There's actually coal everywhere down here. I think I heard uh, lava going on as well, so I've got to be careful of uh, mining these blocks here, just in case any lava pours on top of my head and, <laughs> you know, it won't be good from there, will it? I feel like I'm getting further and further away from it. I, I think it's above us. There it is. All right, I know you was hiding from me. Come on, where's the diamonds at? Show me the diamonds. No, nope, nothing going on down here. All right, we're going to dig around here. We are literally surrounded by lava. We've got to be so careful because this is hardcore Minecraft. So, you know, there's no respawning. There's no coming back from this. Yeah, so that pretty much covers that sort of area down there. So we're going to go back to the top. Oh, hang on a minute. I think we're going the wrong way, aren't we? Yeah, <laughs> there we go. We've covered that area. We've covered this area. We're going to mine further further and further down. What can we do here? We're going to go back and check on our iron, see if we've, uh, you know, that's all cooked. I think we're going to go ahead and mine our trees as well because look at that. It's getting a little bit overgrown there, isn't it? And as we collect more wood, we're going to extend our raft so we can put more and more goods onto it. I'm thinking of putting some chests on down here. And when this island is done, it's going to look pretty, pretty cool. What do we need? What do we need? All right, check our iron. All right, 39 ingots. What can we make? We're going to make a nice chest piece like that. And then, hang on, let me actually just put that on real quick. Look how cool that is. Then we're just going to make a helmet, I think. There we go. Look at that. We're getting there. Look at me. Look at us. Then I think we're going to put more raw iron in there. And then when we get three, we're just going to make ourselves a quick uh, iron axe. So it's a lot quicker to chop these trees down. By the way, if you are new to the channel, do not forget to subscribe because I'll be posting a lot more videos like these. So let me know if you do enjoy them. If so, also please be sure to drop a like. I really appreciate it. All right, take our iron ingots out. Where's our sticks? I don't think we've got any. We're going to graft some uh, in there. Make ourselves a little iron axe. Now it's going to be a lot quicker to chop these trees down. Give us that wood. Once we've chopped all these down as well, we're going to um, replace them with saplings as well so we can get some more to grow. Chop this one down. There we go. Well, I think we need to build up, don't we? Well, that one was high, wasn't it? Gotta go ahead and get rid of these oak leaves as well. Yeah, get rid of these oak leaves because they are really distracting, aren't they? <laughs> they take up so much space. Chopping these trees down, I'm just thinking to myself what I'm going to do on my raft next. I've got a couple of things I do want to do uh, when I expand my raft, but I'm not sure what the first thing is what I am going to do. So I'm probably going to decide that later. Oh, getting rid of these oak leaves is a job in itself. We're not getting much luck from these drops as I say that. Two saplings have fell, so... <laughs> Sorry about that, Minecraft gods. Hunger's looking pretty low. Good job our cooked salmon's going to come in handy. Get rid of that wood. We don't need you. Well, actually, we do need you. Please don't stop growing. Look how lit up the ocean is. Look at that. How cool is that? That is really cool. Whoa. Look at them beautiful shining stars. Got a few more down here that needs to be uh, taken care of. How high are these trees? Oh, look at the wooden. Actually, before that despawns, I'm going to go ahead and get that. <laughs> I've already learned that mistake. What's that? Oh, look at that. Another barrel. Look at that. Hopefully there's some goods in there. Get that string. Um, get some more cobblestone, even though we don't really need it because we have literally nearly got a stack. Oh, actually, never mind. We've got two stacks. Probably more in the barrel as well. All right, that, that'll do for now. Um, we're going to resume chopping these trees down, get rid of these oak leaves, clearing up a little bit of space on our raft so we can um, build some more good stuff. It'd be cool as well when um, my tree farm expands as well because I'll be getting like I'll be getting double the trees. And the only thing is though, is just maintaining it all, just literally getting rid of all of these. <laughs> I need to make shears bad. Now that's done. Um, we can chop this cobblestone down now because it's looking pretty messy. Go ahead and get rid of that. We're going to start replacing these with um, saplings. Oops. Um, boom, boom. There we go. Don't know why that's still there. Okay. Now, we're going to go and place our barrel and see what we did get. We're going to expand that. Get rid of that. Place the barrel and... More obsidian, dirt, more oak trees, saplings, cobblestone. Oh, we can't hold anymore, so we have to actually quickly get rid of some wood. More cobblestone, fierce, beetroot. I'm going to go ahead and put this back into our food chest. Oh, that's what we're going to do. We're going to place some of these torches so it lightens up our, uh, our island a little bit. Let me chop this tree down quickly and then I can place some torches. 
brighten up the raft a little bit, you know, give it a little bit of character. We're gonna take a birch one, just because it's easy to chop down. And maybe because I am lazy. Um, where is that dirt barrel? There it is. Alright, dep deposit that back in there. Cobblestone, put that in there. Look how much cobblestone we have now. We're gonna go ahead and save our diamonds, save up until we get three so we can, you know, craft ourselves a nice diamond pickaxe. Put that wood back in there. So, now, we're gonna take the wood back out of the uh, barrel. And we're going to start expanding. So after sorting all that out, I realised what we're going to do with this space of land. We're going to go and expand our raft this side, so then we can build a nice house on here and you know, settle down on our raft. It's not coming along too bad. We have a lot and a lot of improving to do. So, anything to smell? We got any uh, raw iron anywhere? Put our wood back into here. Oh, and look at that. Another tree's grew. We're going to leave that for now. Um, we'll come back to that. But now we do need more oak planks so we can expand. So, we're just going to go ahead and use these up real quick. Just like that. Look at that, only four more left, but whatever. And as we go along wider and wider, we're going to expand our tree farm wider and wider as well. So therefore, you know, we're getting a lot more wood. I think we're going to do a nice, cool, but simple, um, nice, you know, water house. It's going to look pretty cool when it's done, so make sure you stay tuned for that. Maybe craft some more torches. Uh, I think we need more than that, to be honest. Three more, maybe. There we go, 35 torches. That'll do the trick. Uh, we've got our torches at the ready. So we can put that in our left hand now. And saying that, look at that behind us. There's now two trees. Look at that. What was that over there? I'm sure I just saw something. I might just be imagining things. It's just this heat. This heat's really getting to me. More sand in there. I'm going to put our dirt in there, actually. I think it makes it a bit more uh, easier to know where it is. Look at that floating underneath. I didn't even see all this. Oh, more string. More wood. What's that? Another oak leaf. Look at that. And <laughs> look at that. Another tree has grown. There's too many barrels to know which is which. It's so confusing. Using the items I had, I gathered as much resources as I could to help me. I used iron nuggets to craft two iron ingots and broke the oak leaves I had in my barrel with my bare hands, hoping that it would drop me some more saplings to extend my tree farm. Using the iron ingots I made from the nuggets, I crafted myself an iron axe to chop my tree farm down a lot quicker. So I won't be needing this rotten axe anymore. I used my new axe to my advantage and collected more logs so I can craft more wooden planks. And just as I was minding my own business, I was chased and attacked by two angry phantoms. So I grabbed my sword in fear and slayed the mob where I stood. And to celebrate, I ate a nice piece of cooked cod. After that scary experience, I quickly remembered to craft a bed to help me get through these terrifying nights. Uh, this will do for now. Oh, I feel as fresh as a daisy. I know it's not the best shelter, don't get me wrong, but it sure did get me through the night. But let's be honest, it looks terrible. So I'm going to create a much better build that doesn't look like an eyesore. I'm going to start by farming a bunch of resources to complete this build. The materials consist of oak logs, oak planks, dark oak planks, some stone, etc. So... I'm going to get to work. I've already got most of the resources, which is very helpful. So as you can see in this wooden chest here, I've got a lot of oak saplings, which I do need. Uh, dark oak saplings, birch saplings, and some planks and logs. So this is going to help me with what I need to build. I'm going to chop down some trees so we can gather some more oak logs. And then hopefully we can have enough by the end of it. But just to be on the safe side of things, I'm going to go to sleep so no angry mobs attack me like last time. I'm going to continue chopping down these logs so I can clear some more space up so I can plant more saplings. And hopefully the sun's came out now hopefully some of these saplings grow oops i broke the sapling i've got to replace that back otherwise it won't grow it's looking a bit crowded around here as well so i don't think it's allowing other trees to grow so the only thing to do from here is just to extend my tree farm to make it more spacious giving the trees more room to grow so i'm pretty sure in one of my barrels here yeah so right here we've got some dirt we're gonna start extending All right, I think that's about good. We're now gonna head over to our um, tree barrel, if you will. Take some of these saplings out. So we need to plant some oak and some dark oak as we will be needing those. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and plant them just about there. I think if I leave it one, two, three, just to be safe, I'm gonna leave it four blocks apart. Oh, 
one, two, three, four. Yeah, that's fine. Then we're going to plant some oak ones. Just like that. And hopefully by tomorrow morning, some of these trees will grow. So we can harvest those down and add them to the wood barrel. We need to gather as much wood and stone as possible to complete this build. So right now, we're going to go and look at one of our barrels to see if we do have any cobblestone in there. But if not, we're going to go down to our mine and we're going to collect some cobblestone. So in here, I think, yeah. So in here, we have two stacks of cobblestone. We have 28 also. So that's going to help. We just put that on our hot bar here. And then, um, oh, we need some food actually, don't we? So if we're going to go in here... I'll grab a baked potato, that'll do the trick for now. Nom 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 nom. There we go. Uh, we're going to go ahead and put these saplings back into our barrel. Um, the dirt back where it belongs. Where is it? Just in here, so... Got to put that back in there. We got some sand here for the windows, so that's good. But we do need to get more of those also. So I've decided this barrel on the end here is going to be the one dedicated to our resources and materials we need. So therefore we don't get confused and keep going in different barrels and getting different resources. So... It just speeds up the process a little bit more and also makes it a lot easier for us. Soaking up some sunshine on my raft, I grabbed my trusty iron axe and got to work. I chopped the logs down that grew on my tree farm to make space for the other saplings that wanted to grow. I then headed down to my dimlit cave to mine some cobblestone. This cobblestone will be used to smelt down into stone. It's to be used for things like slabs and walls. With the cobblestone I gathered, I then decided to head back to my raft to go and put them all in my barrel. Alright, so we're heading back to the raft. Some trees have grown. Good sign. And look at that whale. Okay, just doing 360s. Anyways, so if you have a look in this barrel now, we have five stacks of cobblestone and also ten. So we're going to use this to smelt down into some stone to build slabs. And I think we're going to have to keep the cobblestone just to build some walls. So we got enough of that for now, but we do need to grind some wood. So let's get chopping. These leaves can be very annoying because they just take up so much space and they take like forever to break. But we're going to just get rid of them so, you know, it doesn't look too messy on our lovely, lovely tree farm. But even from them like two trees there, we managed to get ourselves two stacks of logs. So that is really good. We're going to need a lot of these dark oak logs just to build the pillars of our house. Almost done. All right. So enough of the leaves. Let's get down to the logs. We're going to have to dive down into the water, aren't we? Because otherwise we're going to take some fall damage if we fall on there. So high up right now. Let's see if we can fit through this gap. Oh, whoa, look at these fish. Let's collect all of this. Look at this. Nice saplings. We're going to need those. Some more saplings, some sticks, apples. Did any of it fall down here? Um, I can't see any. So we made it like a little staircase from the logs um, just to get back up so we can, you know, break these oak leaves. The build of this house, I've got something really cool in mind. It's going to look like so awesome when it's all done. Chop the logs. Oh, that was so close. Collect more of those saplings. I think we're going to replant them, actually. Just like that. Boop. And over here, same again. Okay. Oh, and there. Okay. It's just this last tree left. We're just going to break all these oak leaves just to get rid of them all. Um, I don't know why it takes so long, to be honest. I think leaves should be like a lot quicker of a block to break. But apparently it's not, so we're going to be sat here until it's broken. Oh, and just two more left. And bye. There we go. That looks a lot better and cleaner. Oh, hang on. I think we've got to go ahead and plant some dark oak here as well. It's weird because you've got to plant them in a, like a like a two by two. It's definitely worth it though because they grow like so big and they give you like a lot of logs. From them couple of trees, I've literally gathered nearly three stacks. So we're going to go and chuck them in there. So... We're getting there, aren't we? If you have a look in this one as well, we've got a lot of oak logs in here. So we're going to put that in there. Oh, hang on. Let's take them out and put these ones in here. That's cool. I don't know why I've got a single birch fence gate, but just put that in there for now. Take the oak planks out as well, I think. Put that all in there. So it's all organised. Now I've collected all my resources to build my base. Oh, and it's thunder, so that's not good. Let's get straight into the build. Alright, firstly I started building the foundation of my new base, which took a lot of dark oak logs, so thankfully I grabbed quite a few. Oh, 
I then began to extend further out and also started placing my pillars from day to night. After the sun came back out, I started raising the pillars about 9 to 11 blocks upwards. I put the pillars up, put the floor in, then built the shelters, so I put glass panes in for windows. After the windows, I began to put the roofs up made out of oak stairs and oak slabs. And just for contrast, I filled the middle of the roof in with birch stairs. Furthermore, I put oak fences up for railings to avoid falling off of the sides. Following that, I put a clean looking farm in the middle of my base, decorated with some cobblestone walls and lanterns. I decided to add another farm because why not? I kept on having to go down and collect more water, maybe I should have just made more buckets. And like my other farm, I decorated it with cobblestone walls and lanterns. Thereafter, I pretty much just grabbed my stone hoe and got to work. Alright people, the moment we've all been waiting for, the base is built, everything's put in place, time for the big reveal. Honestly, I'm so excited that we've got it all built now. We finally don't live on a little trash raft. We've now got a pretty, pretty big base. But before we walk out and show you around, look at that beautiful view we got right in front of us. Look at that. How lovely is that? You can watch the sunset go down. You can even look at the moon. It's so beautiful. You could even, you know, put maybe put a little porch outside here, like a little balcony and do some fishing. How nice is this though, guys? But anyway, let's not get too distracted. Let's just come out here and look how beautiful it is out here. It's all lovely lit up. We've got lanterns. We've got some torches. Look at this. It's well decorated. We put, um, for the, for the pillars here, instead of just, um, leaving them normal, like plain, we put some cappings on them. So we put some wooden slabs. I think they just add, like, a really nice touch. And then if we go ahead and walk over here, these two rooms here, I'm not quite sure what we are going to put in them yet. But I feel like, you know, it could be just extra storage. Maybe we can put some extra chests in here. Same with this one. If you have a look in here, it's pretty much the same just on the other side. Um, we can put some chests in here, maybe. Um, that'd be pretty cool. And if we go and walk in the middle here, if you can see, we've got a nice wheat and carrot farm. That actually does need to be harvested because it is, like, fully grown. Same for here. We decorated them with cobblestone walls, some lanterns. Give it that nice glow and light so you can actually see if you want to harvest your um your wheat and your carrots in the dark you can see we took blocks away to put water in here obviously for it to all to work so that also looks cool it's like a it's like a waterfall down here <laughs> look at this if you want a quick escape you can just use the waterfall but it's also well lit down here just in case any mobs do spawn down there um it keeps them away for now the farm does look pretty cool it's so satisfying how it's all like grew i like, look at that it's all like oh I've just destroyed that. Have I got a hoe? No, I think I used it. Oh, well, we'll sort that out later, but as I was saying, like, look how satisfying this looks. I think the fact it's like a big circle as well it makes it look so much better. But we've got plenty of room. We've got plenty of things to do on here. Um, same with this side as well. It's same as the other side. Same sort of rooms. This is going to be like my main house, so I've put my bed in there for now. I've got to move some barrels over from there to there. You know, maybe put a few more chests in there. My furnace, crafting table. Maybe even put a few ladders up top. Make it a little enchantment room. We'll sort that out later on, but I think it looks pretty cool. I'm very pleased with it. It took like many hours, especially grinding. Just getting all these materials alone took literal ages. As you can imagine. I'm very pleased we've got it up and running. We put another farm up here. Uh, I just didn't know what to do with this area. So I think putting another farm. Listen, you can never have too many wheat and carrots. So we've done the same up here. We put some carrots and wheat here. We could get rid of the wheat, to be fair. And maybe put some potatoes here. So grow like a carrot and potato here. And just wheat and... Um, carrots over there because i feel like otherwise we just got way too much wheat going on and you know so oh i keep accidentally doing that but then if we come down here oh please leave me alone what is going on man come on then come on angry phantoms because you know you want to ruin my video come back down man up what do another one to come behind me oh 
no. Stop flying away, come on. They're going away, or are they coming back? No, they're coming back, they want more. Come on then. Come on then, Mr. Phantom. Whoa! Okay, I actually got away with that. Get out of here. Give me that XP. Oh, and I also figured we could put like a little XP farm somewhere here as well. You know what? I think we need to put some stairs here because I keep jumping up. And it's just going to keep removing them. Or is it? Is it going to do that? No, actually, I think we're alright. So it's not going to... Oh my gosh. What am I doing? Matter of fact, I need to replant these anyway. So let's just take these up for now. Look at them carrots. Give me those carrots. We're never running out of carrots, are we? See, this is why you can't be having a nice, sustainable food farm where you're just never going to run out of carrots. Oh my gosh, I'm literally rich in carrots right now. I'm going to have like five stacks. Nice four stacks. Let's replant them all real quick. Plant them down here. Just across. Yep, that looks about good. I need to hoe that. Oh, what am I doing? I need to hoe this down. Um, so I don't want to forget about that. Let's go ahead and place these all back. Alright, that's cool. And then I think we're going to craft some chests here um, to put some carrot seeds and... Well, I say carrot seeds. Carrots and wheat seeds and some wheat in here. So we've got all that in here. So it's almost like a little, like, gardener shed, isn't it? <laughs> and as you all know, same for up here as well. I actually need to eat some carrots. Look at my, look at my hunger bars are getting pretty low there. But yeah, same thing pretty much up here. Um, I think I am going to replace the wheat with potatoes over there so we don't run out and we have a nice potato farm. But if we do come over here, like I was saying before I got interrupted by the Mangry Phantoms, if we extend out here, I'm thinking of putting like a nice XP farm here and then maybe make like a little shed like that again. And you know, make it... Oh my gosh. Oh no, 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 no. Come here. Oh, i got to get in. i got to sleep. Honestly, I'm I'm not getting attacked by three phantoms today. Oh! Nah, I'm going to bed. Screw this, I'm going to bed. All right, hopefully they've gone away now. Have they? That's right, go home. I don't want to see you again. That's it, burn. You burn. Anyways, look at that beautiful sunrise. Oh, I just love the glow it gives off these wheats. I just love the glow this sun gives on this farm. It looks so nice. But yeah, if we extend this out, maybe a few blocks, um, put a little XP farm in here, and then make a little shed like that. Uh, we could store some, maybe like stone swords in it so we don't, you know, use our proper one. Uh, also, if you notice, down there in the mine, I made some lanterns so it give it a little bit of a glow. So, you know, we can clearly see it. We know where it is anyway, but I just think it looks better like that, to be honest. But yeah, I'm on my beautiful new base, as you can see behind me. I've got the beautiful sunrise behind me. It's all going well. Honestly, I'm so pleased with it so far, but we are not done yet. So I think the first thing to do, if we drop down here, because I can't be bothered to use a ladder, but we made... Oh, I thought I just saw a creeper. Did I see one? No. I thought it'd be cool to make it like a little dock here. Two lanterns on there. I just... I don't know. What do you guys think? I think it looks cool. Um, down here we got the original raft. Um, we went ahead and got rid of our old <laughs> little terrible whatever that was, like the bed with the... You know, in the wood, it was absolutely terrible. We got, we still got our trees though, so maybe we could extend this and make it even bigger to have a nice, sustainable tree farm. We're still yet to go and explore this. Honestly, I think it's just like nothing, but we're gonna go check it out because I kept on saying that I want to go and see what it is and check it out. So we'll go over there eventually. Um, for now, we are, we're gonna take some wood. Um, we're gonna turn them all into planks and then we're gonna make some chests I think we're gonna make quite a few actually yeah that's about good let's make one more just to make it even there we go all right let's go up here and let's put our chests in um, we're gonna start with our little garden shed I'm gonna call this if we go in here take these out oh it doesn't work what am I doing we're gonna put these next to here so we're gonna put just put like seeds in here and I don't know, maybe just some other stuff, but for now we're going to put all of our carrots in here. And then let's farm our wheat real quick so we can put the wheat in the other one. Get rid of that. How satisfying is this? What is that? Oh, little fishy. Hello, fishy. Don't mind me, I'm just collecting my wheat. Pretty sure some went down here, didn't it? No, okay, it's fine. Let's go ahead and replant all of these. I'm trying so hard not to jump. <laughs> I feel like I'm just going to keep breaking my um my soil, making it like all hard and horrible, like that, for example. Yep, one there. Oh, 
and I think that is it. So yeah, like I say, we're going to go in here. Plant. Oh, wrong one. This is going to be our carrot chest, and we can make this one our like wheat and seed chest. That's cool. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're just going to put all these down here. So we can put all our seeds in here, and then up here we're going to put all the wheat, half and half, kind of. Anyway, yeah, so I think what we're going to do is now, yeah, let's go and make ourselves a hoe. Have we got one? I don't know if, yeah, I'm, uh, yeah I think I did run out then. All right, bit of cobblestone in there. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? I can't play this game. There we go. All right, now what we can do is we can go back. You know what, we're going to take the cool way up because we're cool. We're a cool guy. Go up here and then, oh my gosh, i got to start planting that seed back. If I go back to my seed chest... I'm going to put some more down, because I keep ruining it. Literally, what am I doing? I've got to break this with my fists. No, I'm not. I'm not I'm not that stupid. Whee! Just make a little pickaxe really quick. And then go back up the cool way. No, actually, I can't be I can't be bothered. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not feeling too cool today. Right. Get that down. Plant the seed. Is there any more? Oh, yeah, I'm, I believe there was some over here. So, up here. Uh, there it is. Plant that down. I think that does it. I think that does it. Right then. So we've done that. Let's go and put our seeds back in our chest. And then let's go harvest these over here. So, you know, we've collected everything and allow it to grow. Let's do wheat first because why not? This is so satisfying. Honestly, I, I love doing this. I can just sit here all day and just harvest my wheat and live a peaceful, happy life. Pick that up here. Oh, I haven't even got enough space. Let me just chuck that out for now. Oh, actually, oh, do you know what I can do? Wait there. Bye. Oh my, I can make like a little bin. Look at that, how cool is that? Just goes in the ocean. I don't need that anymore. Get planting these seeds back. While I'm planting these seeds, I'm trying to think like what to do next. I think I'm going to, where that where that mine is over there, I think I'm going to make like a cool glass tunnel uh, leading back to the dock. So that would be pretty cool. Like we've got a, like a cool entrance to the mine. And so we haven't got to keep going underwater all the time as well. I just think it would look cool as well. It looks so much better. Have I missed any? No, that'll do the trick. So we go back to our wheat chest. Go in here, plant our seeds. Get the wheat in there. That's what I like to see. And then let's harvest our carrots. Give me those carrots. I love how you get so many carrots from one. Nearly done. Get rid of them. Oh yeah, I'm so rich in carrots. Honestly, I'm, I've got more carrots than Bugs Bunny. Eat a few as well, because why not? I'm feeling a bit peckish. Planting, keep planting. Oh, good job we got our stone hoe. Alright, that's cool. Right then, we're all up to date. So, oh my god, I knew I was going to do that. Right, go back to our garden shed. Let's make that even, I was really going to. Okay, there we go. Uh, right then, go in our carrot chest, put some carrots in here. And I think that is it. What's in here? Oh, we've got more seeds in here. Oh, wait, okay. That's, that makes sense. So in this one, instead of having the seeds and the wheat, I remembered I just made that other chest, just put the uh, seeds in. So that'll do it for now. And if I get too full in this one, I can just put it in here. So it works both ways. I just think it looks even in here. It makes it look better as well. You never just stop getting a nice view out here, do you? How cool is that? I love this shaders pack. Honestly, it, it makes everything just look so much cooler. I know what we're going to do with these spare two chests. We're going to go back to our home and then next to our bed. Just for now. Let's put them there for now. And then let's bring our furnace. Actually, you know what? I can't. I'm so lazy. I cannot be bothered. We're just going to make our own. It's handy to keep them down there by the dock anyway, just in case, you know, we want to use it. But we're going to go and put that down. Make a furnace real quick. And then put that there. Actually, I don't like it like that. I'm going to put it facing this way. I think it looks better. There we go. My OCD's playing up. And then in here, um, I'm going to put some wood. We're just going to put like useful things like torches, wood, maybe buckets, apples. And then, oh, I have an idea that look pretty cool. I think if we make, if we mine these two oak planks here, we can make like an underground... I don't know, maybe storage room. Yeah, that'd be cool. So I think that's what we're going to do, actually. So let's put two trap... Oh, wait, no, because they're slabs. Will trapdoors go there? Hang on, let me work this out. Go up the waterfall. Make some sticks. Oh, I need to make trapdoor as well, also, don't I? Oh, it does work. Oh, this is cool. All right, and then what we can do is we can... Out of oak planks, maybe? Oh, let's remove this lantern real quick. Sorry, lantern. And then if we come down like that... 
Yeah. Get rid of that. Like that. And then maybe we can make... Yeah, okay. I know what we're going to do. i got an idea. We're going to make this little square here into our room. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and fill this in. What's that up here? Like that. And then maybe if I put a lantern... Mm, I don't know, I'll, just, I'll put it there for now. Like that. Might have to do a bit of parkour here just to get back up. Oop. Oh no. Let's try that again, you ready? Oop. Oh my gosh, I'm so bad. Alright, come on, please. Oop. Oh, there we go. Get more wood. Make more sticks. Let's make more. I think that'll do it. Surely. So now, if we go ahead and put these down. Can we get back up now? Yeah, okay. There we go. Place more ladders. We need one more. Of course we do. We're always one short, aren't we? Come down, place that, and then get the wood back out. Fill these gaps in real quick. Actually, let's take the lantern up and just replace it with a torch. Because I think the lantern will look better inside. It's just going to be a waste otherwise. Put that there. Put one on either side like that. Just to light it up a bit. All right, let's go back up. And now we're going to fill the floor in. I've got to stop misplacing blocks. Put a lantern in here. All right, let's put it there for now. And if we go back up here, go and grab some more wood. And then let's make a ton of chests. Let's get planting. Why does it do that? I hate it when it does that. Light it up a little bit. We haven't got to do nothing crazy down here, but let's just keep it simple. So that's like a storage room down here. Then we got our, our bed. We've got a barrel here. Oh, and it's got stuff in it. <laughs> Didn't even know that. Thank you. Collect some cobblestone here, some iron nuggets, cobblestone. We, got, we have another barrel. Okay, there's nothing in that one, but that doesn't matter. All right, that's fine. Uh, we've got two slabs. All right, we've got a little bed here. Uh, we've got two little um, barrels. So this, we're going to keep it simple for the bedroom. We could make it a bit crazier, but at the end of the day, we are on a raft. So let's keep it a little bit simple for now. Um, over here, we've got stuff we need. Just a furnace. We might make an extra furnace, actually, in case we need to smelt more stuff um, at the same time. So go ahead and put that down there. Um, let's go back to our dock and let's go grab some more coal and other resources we need to put in that chest. Whoa! Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to hit you. Sorry, fish. Go ahead and grab all of this. Grab some wood. We're going to leave the saplings in here because, you know, we do need them in case we harvest these. Um, in here, take as many cobblestone as we can. Coal. Can we take coal? Food. We'll take that later. Let's go back and move some of these items in the chests. Put our carrots in here. Turn around. Wheat. Seeds. And if we go back through here, slap a bit of torch in there. Cobblestone. Birch wood. And then coal. Split it, put 20 in there, 19 in there, and then let's go and bring our food back. Let's actually use the ladder for once, and then our food is in here. Let's go and take all of this. We're gonna leave these barrels here just for storage, though. All right, it looks good. Hang on, have we got any? Okay, well, mm, no, I'm gonna leave that in there actually because we might need to smelt something up here for now. Chop some trees down later. Let's go back and just move all these first, and then we can worry about anything like that. Our wheat's grown extremely fast, which is good. Back in here. Slap some wood in there, some ladders. Yeah, we are going to put food in this chest. It's our main chest. Right, tropical fish, carrots, puffer fish. We don't need that, do we? That's just rubbish. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do. In this chest, I'm just going to do strictly dirt. And the, the middle one, I'm going to do sand. And then above it, cobblestone. That one, wood. So it's all organized. I'm going to sign it up also. I'm going to get it labeled so I know what I'm dealing with. Why is it doing this? Oh my gosh, guys. What is going on? We'll do it quick. There we go. All right, so in this one... Just dirt, in this one cobblestone, then this one we're just going to do wood, so let's go back up. Everything wood related, apart from the barrel that can stay. Plant all our wood, sticks, logs, birch logs, saplings, ladders. In this one I might do, I don't know, I might just do like food actually down here, just to organise it all. Bottom one, all food. No, actually, bottom one, all fish. Then in this one I could do all vegetables. Is an apple a fruit or a vegetable? It's a fruit, right? I just went completely dumb there, didn't I? But it can stay. Don't worry, I'm not too fussed. I'm fussy, but I'm not that fussy. Back out here. Let's go back. Just to double check if I have gathered everything. Take the dirt. Uh, leave the saplings in that one. Right, obviously we're going to take this, aren't we? All right, that's fine. I'm nothing in these last two, is it? Nah. All right, do a little bit of parkour. Oh, 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 oh. Up the waterfall. Come back down here. Put my dirt in there. Sand can go in there as well. Dirt and sand. I can't be bothered to literally put a chest for every individual 
item. So that's done. We ha we got a little storage room. We're not worried too much about storing things now because we have a storage room. But all right. So next move. So I think the next move. Oh, got to be careful because I think that's a drown there. Don't. Don't intimidate me. I've got a sword now. I'm not afraid to use it. You walk away. But as I was saying, we're going to make like a glass tunnel connected from our mine straight to the dock. So it's just easy access. I haven't got to keep, you know, diving in the water, risking my life, going in the mine, etc. Especially because someone like this could just go and potentially kill me and just ruin my whole 100 days experience. First thing we're going to do, we're going to come down here, avoiding the drowned. So we need to get more sand. So if we go back to our house, craft some shovels get some sand and then from there we can you know craft some glass and then make a cool looking tunnel this is why i said it's handy instead of coming all the way back here smelting it and collecting it i can just go back to my dock i've already got a furnace there waiting for me just to use walking back to my dock back in the water right let that smelt in there for a minute and let's go ahead and craft ourselves did we leave anything in here oh no we didn't oh gosh this is bad we forgot to craft shovels. No worries. Let's go back and craft some shovels. Where's our stone in here? So, grab that. And then our sticks. Oh, let's put a crafting bench down here. And then we can put a furnace down here as well. Just in case. You know what I mean? You might as well fill the gaps. Alright, let's go ahead and craft some shovels now. Let's craft about seven. Why not? Right. Now, all oh, we need to eat, don't we? These hunger bars do not last long. I'm always hungry constantly. It's, a, it's, it's becoming a little bit of a problem for me. Let's take some raw cod, go up to our furnace, put that in there, let that all cook up, and let's go to sleep to avoid any angry mobs. Oh, I hit my head there. That's that's not good, is it? If you're tall in Minecraft, look at that. You just kind of bump your head. Look at that. My head's just too big. Ooh, and it's cooked. Ready for us to eat. Nom, 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 nom. Beautiful. All right, let's shut these up. Let's go up here and dive down our waterfall, come down it, and just might be a little bit slower, but let's just get some sand. It's all floating to the top as well, so that's quite annoying. Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh, what is that? Is that... Whoa, look at the barrels here! It's like barrel heaven. I wonder what they're doing floating around me. Oh, and string. Maybe it all appears here now. I've literally gone and collected myself four barrels. There's got to be something good in there, surely. Let's go back up and check out what these actually were. Come on, little carrot. Go back in your home. Let's plant these barrels. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, 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 more iron, more coal, more wood. Are you ready? More coal. Let's go. Cobblestone, leaves, potatoes, more food. Carrot, string, cobblestone. Same with this one, more coal. I'm not complaining about the coal, by the way, guys. This, this stuff comes in very handy. And then let's cook some raw salmon. Smelt some iron. Um, let's go back down here. And then maybe for the top we can plant some barrels. Maybe just up here, you know. I knew that was going to happen. That's pretty cool, right? More cobblestone in there. Put some wood in here. Collect our cooked salmon. Three bars of iron ingots. Place our sticks in here. Equip our shovels back and get back to work. Sand is so annoying to mine when you're underwater. It just takes forever. Do you know what? We're going to go back up quickly and just put the sand in the furnace to smelt for a moment. So we're going to smelt these closer to where we're building it. Saves us going back and forth. And then let's go ahead and smell it. Oh, it's already smelting. I completely forgot I even left some sand in here, you know. We'll see how we get on with this. This is more than a stack, so see how we get on for now. But we're going to be needing a lot more, to be honest. But I think we're going to get rid of these two barrels here. Even three, maybe. And once we've gotten rid of all of these three barrels. Okay, I've got an idea. So I'm going to extend this further out to about maybe here. And then I'm going to go downwards. So make some, uh, so make some stairs leading downwards and then tunnel it off and block it off and then connect it to that over there make the hole bigger round there we've got a pretty cool you know pretty cool mine so we haven't got to keep swimming so i'm going to go back and make myself a nice axe all right let's get rid of these three we need to move you actually you can stay for a moment we just move this crafting table for now let's go and grab some oak planks and then extend out and we'll get building the tunnel so i've already got my glass down there all I need is just really oak wood. All right, so if we go back down to our storage room, all we need to grab is just some oak plank stairs, 19 iron. Do you know what? Let's go and let's make ourselves a shield because I feel like we need that. There we go. We're all equipped it up. And let's go ahead and make ourselves some leggings and boots. Make ourselves some nice boots and voila. Look at our nice shield. We've got some protection. Look at that. Nothing's coming around me now. They're going to be too scared. I've got a shield. I'm going to protect myself. I've got my sword. Oh, yeah. I'm ready to rock and roll down these mines. No mobs can stop me. Let's go back to our tree farm. Take down the 
dark oak logs and then fill the old saplings in with some oak ones because that is what we need let's eat some carrots as well let's get rid of these actually let's just plant them for now take these down I feel like we need a bit of lighting going on down here let's take the shield out just for a second The thing about these trees, they just come in literal 4x4s, so it takes like double the length just to take one down. But then again, it gives you a, a lot of wood, so I'm not complaining. For some reason, I thought that was a shark, but it's not, so we're all good. Finally, it's all chopped down. Let's go and collect our logs. Squish just popped in just to say hello. Go and equip our shield back because I feel a lot safer with the one. But let's check how our sand's getting on. Let's make them out of dark wood. Yeah, I think... Mm, yeah, let's do that. Alright, so maybe it might give it a nice bit of contrast. What do you guys think? I don't know. I just like it. And then what we're going to do from here, if we just put them down like that, maybe like bring it out to there because then now we can do that, which I think looks better in my opinion. What do you guys think? I think that looks cool. So now we can start coming down like that. To get rid of this water, we need to like block it off completely and just fill it up with blocks so it stops all the water from getting in. Takes forever to break underwater. All right. And then same again. Bring it down like that. It's cool. Stick our torch just on the edge there for a moment. What we're going to do is we're going to put two lanterns here as well just to, you know, make it look nicer. Now we're going to grab our glass and here's how we're going to do it. Like that, right? And then same the other side. Create like a archway and make it go smaller and smaller each time. So like now, for example, it would come to like there. You know what I'm saying? I think that looks cool in my opinion. I think that looks pretty cool. I don't know, I just, I like it. Yeah, I think it looks pretty cool. It's like, it's like an underground, underwater, you can see through the glass. I like it. Alright. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Alright. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't expect to lose that many, that many hearts. That was scary. So let's go collect more oak planks if we do have any so we can build the stairs. I'm sure we had some in here, right? Did we? Or didn't I? I think I'm just imagining that to be honest. So like, when you look from a distance, I don't know, I think that looks pretty cool. Especially when it's all under there. When you're actually under there as well, when you look through the glass, you're going to be able to see, like, the base as well. So, I don't know. I just like the idea how it's all see-through. Like I was saying, let's go check if we have any oak planks. I'm pretty sure... I think we actually used them all. Oh, we needed to grab more food, though, didn't we? Did we cook any? No, okay, we took it out. So, what food have we got? Raw corn, raw salmon, so we can cook them. Let's take some carrots for now. Oh. My gosh. Did you guys just hear that? That was... That was really loud. That even scared me. Anyways, let's put the raw cotton here. Raw salmon. Uh, what is that? Is that thunder or is that like God's lightning? Because it, it's so it's so loud. Oh no, it's rainstorms. Oh no. Oh, looking back, we've had some oak trees. And look, the green fish is back. Maybe he's warning us. Yep, he's warning us. Alright, let's take these down real quick. We're not going to worry about the leaves for a minute because we literally just need oak planks. I think I just heard a skeleton. I don't know what I heard. That is a skeleton. Where is that? I think he's underneath us. It's fine. I thought he was, I don't know, maybe like behind us. I was going to say that is scary. I can hear you, Mr. Skeleton. You're not fooling me. What? He was up there. Where did he come from? I thought he was below us. Sneaky, sneaky skeleton. Completely came out of nowhere. Look at that. I've got an arrow to my head. Oh my, man. What, what was that skeleton's problem? What did I do to deserve that? What did he think was going to happen there? There's only one result. Right, so we got 28 logs. Turn those... Oh. Turn those into planks. Let's go down here. Place in our stairs. Oh, no. What are you doing to me? Whoa, that is scary. What is going on? I'm gonna eat my carrot and mind my own business. Whoa, look at them little fishes. They just disappeared. What was that? I do not like this thunder at all. 
I think it is just so scary. But look at our island. Look how nice it looks. It's all lit up. It's nice. I like it. Whoa, I don't like that though. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nearly kill me. That's fine. That's absolutely fine. Because if I get hit by a skeleton now or anything. But you know, that's fine. I'm just going to get scared by some lightning and lose a lot of hearts and... That's fine. All right, now the stairs are done. All we have to do now is just block this up, get rid of all the water, and then create a tunnel uh, leading to a mine. And then, yeah, we've that's that part done. So, now, what do we need? What do we need? We need glass, don't we? We need lots and lots of glass. Come on, lightning. I'm just doing some gardening in peace. I want to be left alone. I don't want to be attacked. I just want to live my life. Yeah, so I think after we eat these carrots, we're going to go back to our bed, have a sleep, and then in the morning, get a lot of sand, smell it into glass, and then make our tunnel. So now that's cleared. This is better. This is what I like to see. Mine in the sand is just making me question why I haven't got an automatic sand farm. It's kind of annoying how we got to go underwater to just to grab some sand because otherwise you can't get it above the surface. After mining some sand, we managed to get ourselves two stacks and 46. I'm going to see if that will do the trick. I think that should be enough. If not, like I said, we can always come back. Oh, look at that. It grew right in front of our eyes. All right, let's go ahead and stick that in there. We need some more coal, anything to burn it. Worst case, I'm literally just going to put wood in here, but whatever. I think we should chop down some more trees. Like I say, I'm not too worried about um, taking the oak leaves down at the moment because it does take a long time. I'm not too fussed anyways. How much do we get out of that? Oh, 23 logs. If we go ahead and turn these into planks. Look at that. It's a stack and not a half, but stack and 28. Whatever. Still helps. Take some glass and then bring that down. I think it looks cool like that. From a side view. I don't know. I, just, I like that a lot. I think that looks cool when it's all done and lit up as well. Especially over night time, it looks so cool. Because from the base, you'll be able to look down and have a look at it. And then, obviously, when it's all lit up, it's going to look way better. Oh, another sapling. Don't mind if I do. I'm going to eat this apple. Right. Put that in there for now. How much? Oh, seven glass. Let's go ahead and quickly get rid of that shovel. Go down. Let's do some more glass placing, if you will. When we do connect all this up, I think we're going to go down into the mine and do some mining and hopefully try and find some more diamonds and get ourselves out a little bit. Let's build that along. I need to come down. Place that up there. And the other side needs to be brung down a little bit. I haven't missed any up here, have I, on the sides or anything? I don't think I have. Yeah, so we're going to do this for now. Oh, please stop damaging me in the water. I don't like it. I love being sea level with the ocean. Looks so nice. What do you think? Swerve round? Would that work? I don't know. What do you guys think? I think I'm going to do up till there. Let's go and check how our glass is getting on. 10, well, 11 now. So, cut a long story short, I ended up finishing our little tunnel, and as you can see behind me, little reveal there, but let's give you guys a quick tour. So, the sun's back out again, as you can see, it's all decorated nicely. I went ahead and put some darker shade oak planks here, just, you know, give it a little bit of contrast. I ended up putting four lanterns here, so when it's dark, you can see it, it's all brightly lit up. I can hear a skeleton over there again. There it is, okay. Let's just fight it quick. Come on, Skelly. You don't know where I'm gonna go? You don't know where I'm gonna go? Or where is he? Where did he go? Am I being blind? Where did he go? Oh, he's down there. All right, well, you can stay down there for a moment, buddy. Oh! Wait, imagine if he actually shoots himself. Oh. What is... I've never seen this before. What is this? What am I even watching right now? No way. Well, I'm going to leave him down there for a moment. But anyways, let's get into the big reveal. So, as you walk down here, I need to replace these with uh, wooden stairs, but that's no problem. We can do that any time. But as you come down here, look how cool that looks. How, like, the water stops there. Like, how cool is that? So, anyway, you come down here. We've got another lantern up here, lighting it all up. I'm pretty sure the skelly is somewhere over there. But, yeah, look how cool this looks. Look like the, the roof looks all glossy from the water. We put some lanterns down here, followed up with some cobblestone for the flooring. And then if we come down here, I put some lanterns here so it's like guiding you to the mine. And here it is. Here is the mine. So if we go down here, we put a little back wall here for some ladders. And then look at that. We're back in our mine. And look how much better it looks now. We've got 
two, four, six. We've got six lanterns up here. Do you know what? We've actually crafted so much lanterns just for this mine. But I think it looks pretty cool. Let me know what you guys think. I think it looks pretty cool. Now we haven't got to keep swimming underwater. We can just go straight to our mine. Just like that. Fly down the ladder. And then we're in our mine. But how about we put our mine into some good use. And go find some diamonds. So I'm not seeing much at the moment. We've come down mine a little. Oh, we've got some iron. Saying that. We'll take that. Take some nice iron. Oh, got to be very careful here. I don't know if we should go. Should we mine down here? Let's keep going. Why not? Let's actually go around real quick. I oh, know we can't. We're going to just have to keep replacing the, the floor with cobblestone, aren't we? Come on. Please be diamond down here somewhere. Oh! <laughs> no way! What are the chances in that? Is there any more? No way. Please. Oh, no. Oh, wait! There is one. Come to me. Come to me. Oh my gosh, there's another one. That's three diamonds. No way. We've managed to find ourselves three diamonds. That's what you like to see. Any more around here? I'm going to check around this side. Got to be very careful though, because I really do not want to die now. I didn't come from that way, have I? I haven't been that way yet. I only come from this way, so. Let's have a little look. It's just more lava. Oh, there's more iron though, so I'll take that. I've got to be very careful though, because I can hear lava all around me. Why don't we go ahead and mine a bit further down? Hopefully, there might be something down here. Like more diamonds, for example. <laughs> oh. Oh! What's down here then? Hello, railways. Let's take some of that. What was that noise? I just heard like a really strange noise. I don't know what that was. Alright, we've done some mining down here and we found a little... Look at this. Oh, there's actually nothing in here. I don't know, there could be actually. Oh! Hold up. No, we need to go back. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh my. There's some more mining down here. <gasps> no way! More diamonds! Come to me! Oh! Look at this, two more! Oh my gosh! How many diamonds is there down? <gasps> no way. That is so lucky. We found nine diamonds like that. No way, our luck is insane today. I really want to go check it out, but I don't want to risk dying. I can hear all these strange noises. Oh, let's go and check it out. Whoops. Oh! Hello, zombie. Good night, zombie. While we're at it, let's mine this iron because we need to stock up on some iron, actually. I'm being very careful not to get snuck up on. You know, no creepers, no zombies like that. Oh! Oh my gosh, how many skeletons are down here? Oh! They're fighting each other! Yes! Let them battle out for a minute. And then while they do that, I'm going to go up here and check it out. I think we're going to have to battle out these skeletons. Get out. Alright, so we found something. We found more rails and more like builds here. Up here, skeletons as well. Yep. And I think I just saw diamonds. I think that is diamonds. Oh my gosh. Is that diamonds? No way there's more diamonds. Is that another. Why is there so many skeletons down? Oh, there's a chest. Some globery, some rails. Nothing we really need, but we'll take those anyway. So if Mr. Skeletons let me pass. No, then. Oh. Is that a creeper as well? Come on then, Mr. Skelly. There we go. Get out. And that creeper, I've got to be careful as well. I don't want him creeping up behind me. No way! No no way there's more diamonds over there. There's more diamonds. I can't believe there's more down there. Is that just one? Right, let me mine here as well. Yep, I knew there was more. Come to me. Yeah, maybe... Well, that didn't sound good. What was that? But look at that. Oh my gosh, more diamonds. Okay, just checking if there's any mobs here, because you can never be too safe. One, two, four. Oh yeah, oh yeah. All right, what if we come around here then? Is there anything down here? Anything? Oh, no, 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 no. There's two creepers down here. Oh no. Oh, I don't think it'll attack me. No. Oh. Whoa, what was going on? I don't think they can attack me if they're eliminated now anyway, so who cares? Creepers ain't scaring us today, even though there's more. Come on, Creeper. Come on. Do a little mare. Hit and run. Hit and run. And then you're dead. Right, let's go back down here then. Let's go down here. Oh, more diamonds, baby. Let's go. Give me them diamonds. Oh, my gosh. We're filthy rich. We are actually rich. Oh, my gosh. No way. Look at that. 21 diamonds. 
Yes, please. Some gold. Do we even need gold? I hear, zomb I hear loads of zombies over here, actually. What is that? Well, I think there's a spawner here. Yeah, there's definitely a spawner here. Hang on. Yep, there's a spawner. I know where I'm getting my XP from. Look at this, I can just sit here. This is OP. Whoa! Hi, right, little bro. Oh, you know what? I think we're going to sit here for a little bit. I'm going to make speed. Give me XP, zombies. There we go. I want to go see what's in that chest. So let's make a diamond pick. Oh, yeah. Oh, we found another little cave here. That a creeper. Yeah, I see you hiding. I see you hiding, creeper. Nothing much to name tag. Some bones, gold. Nothing we really need. Alright, you're annoying me now, zombies. You're getting too loud, and I don't like it. I want to go see what's in that chest. So it's about here, right? Whoa! Diamond horse armor. No way. Oh, and a music disc. Alright, we'll we take that. Let's have a look down here. What is that? Is that another spawner? Oi, okay, and there's diamonds. Okay, there's too many mobs. I don't like it. Oh, no! He's poisoned us! He came out of nowhere. That little spider, he kind of poisoned us. This is dangerous around here. But there's diamonds. Okay, I need to regen a little bit of health. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh no! Oh no, 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 no. I gotta be so careful. I'm so scared. Oh. oh, what is going on? I gotta get out of here. It's too scary. I'm getting out of here. No way, we're not chancing that. I think we're getting, we're getting out of here for a minute. We've got our diamonds. We're getting out of here. All right, thank God we made it out of there. Oh, look, it's just behind our base as well. Right, so we've got to remember where we came from. It was down there. So let's just remember that. It's actually directly at the back of our house. That was a very close call, guys. That was a very close call. We almost died. Just from that baby zombie as well. And them spiders, they're deadly. But I'm so thankful we came back in one piece. Because that almost got very dirty out there. But you know what? That was pretty successful. We managed to get ourselves 21 diamonds. But we used it to, you know, craft ourselves a nice diamond pick. Quite a few goods there. So let's go up here and put them in our chest so they're nice and safe. Now we've got 20 in total. I think we're going to make ourselves a nice diamond sword as well. You guys almost saw what happened there. I nearly nearly lost the lost everything. Oh, we've got to take some food out of our furnaces. But let's let that cook for a minute. Let's eat our carrots. But we've got ourselves a diamond sword, a diamond pickaxe. It's not looking too bad. Well, without that being said, let's just go ahead and take some of these carrots up. Because, you know, they're all overgrown. We need some more to grow. And let's go and take our wheat as well. Alrighty, almost there. Gonna use up these last few seeds. Alright, that's all done. Let's go to our other one and quickly do the same. But we've harvested and replanted all the vegetables and the seeds and the wheat. Alrighty, so we're back where we started. And thinking of it, I think we're going to make a little XP farm, a mob farm. So we're going to do the same like we did here with the... Um with the dark oak planks so we're going to build out five blocks just like so and then we've got to build up really high so the mobs can spawn and make it all dark we're just going to build that there and then uh we're going to make it we've got to build up so we've got to make loads of ladders so let's just craft loads of sticks so we're going to go quite high for this one um i think we should build out of yeah let's build it out of oak planks just to make it look a bit better so we're going to make it two by two like that and then the only way is up Look how high we are. And look at our beautiful base behind us. It's coming along just perfect. Look at our underwater mine as well. Told you it would look nice. Let's place the ladders from the bottom. I'm just going to extend up, you know, making it nice and safe for us. Because if we done it by one block, it just, it'd be so dangerous. So we got to craft some hoppers. Um, so obviously when all the stuff falls in the hoppers, we can collect it from the chests. So we need some iron and we need to make some chests and now make our hoppers just like so 
Oh yeah, of course. We forgot to collect it out of our furnace, but right, let's get back to crafting then. Right, so craft that in here. And then we got ourselves a nice two hoppers. So now if we run to our mob spawn, well, in progress mob spawn, we can now place these two hoppers above the chests. By the way, I think I've actually got to make another two hoppers, but it's okay. It's alright for now. We do need to make another two, so let's go and do that quick. Alright, now we got this down, we're going to build it 22 blocks high. Alright, time to place the trap doors to stop any spiders from, you know, sneaking in. So, let's quickly do that. Down here. The one there. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Why is it every time I do something, I've got angry phantoms trying to just destroy my life? There we go. Alright, enough of them. Let's just place any torches so no mobs actually do spawn behind us. Because that would be so, like, so terrible. Um, oh my gosh. Get out of here. Stop trying to mess with me. This mob farm sure do take a lot of slabs. But regardless, we're going to fill these gaps in with slabs. And that's that one done. Then we're going to move on to the next one. Being very careful not to fall between this gap. Even though there is water below us, but just in case. You can never be too safe. Alright, and now these are filled in. Now it's time to put some slabs here. And then we're going to put some buckets of water just on top of it so the water flows down this hole here. So let's just do that. How are we going to get down? We're going to have to jump down. We should have come prepared. Oh, actually, hang on. Oh no, because we still need water. It's fine. We'll have to just build back up. It's fine. Ooh. Alright, so that's flowing nicely. And then time to do these last two. And then the last one. Alrighty. There we go, look at that. I don't want to fall down there. Oh no, this is dangerous. Which way did I come from again? Let's come up here. Because I built up, but I can't remember what side I built up. Oh, it's here. I'm so blind. Right, so let's go back down. This is how high we uh, we built up, so we need to get rid of this. Alright, come along. Just like so. And then do that just like that right now we gotta make the roof out of slabs and then we gotta fill in these gaps here so let's do that real quick So it appears our mob spawn has turned out pretty successful as you can see lots and lots of mobs have spawned but what I've noticed is if I shift then the creepers have a chance of seeing me and literally blowing everything up and destroying everything in the chest but we've got an arrow there but let's just do some farming and then when we get enough XP we can start looking into getting some enchanted gear and going from there so let's just destroy these mobs oh yeah look at that did it drop anything in the chest? just rotten flesh, arrows, anything else in this one? Just more bones, gunpowder, arrows, nothing too special, but it's pretty cool how we got this here now, and it appears to be working, so that's the main thing. It took quite a while to build, honestly, a lot of slabs, a lot of trapdoors, and that was pretty much it, but once we got there in the end, it was um, pretty successful, so we're going to leave this here for a moment, um, maybe sit AFK, try to get a few more XP, and then we can start looking into getting enchantments. I'm thinking of building an enchantment room somewhere over here. I think we're going to do it in this room here, or this one. They're both the same, but regardless, we're going to make an enchantment room, uh, make some bookshelves, get that enchantment table, and then start enchanting our stuff. And then we can even look into going to the nether, so stay tuned for that. Using our diamonds in our chest, let's go ahead and craft ourselves a quick little chest plate like that. This is going to look so cool. Oh, yeah. And a little helmet maybe as well. Yep. That's fine. Now we're starting to look like the business. Alright, I think we're going to leave the rest of the diamonds in there for now because we don't want to waste them all. Um, we've got enough carrots. We've got a load of stuff here. Let's go down here. Got some dirt there. Um, wood. Yeah, we can go ahead and place that in there for now. Uh, let's put glass in here as well. Why not? Alright. 
Is there anything in our furnaces? No, no, there isn't. So let's go and have a look at our mob farm from the outside. Look at that. You come outside our home and then you look at the sky and look at that. It just looks like a big blob in the sky, but it does the job, that's for sure. We've been waiting for quite a while again and let's get attacking. Whoa, that is so satisfying. Look at that XP just rolling. Oh my. That was pretty successful. Hello, skeleton. See, when you when you crouch you have a chance of setting the creepers off and then might blow up and literally wipe out the full farm. I wonder if we stand like that and the skeleton shoots a creeper, maybe we we'll, we'll get some music discs. But I don't think it's worth risking, to be honest. So we're just going to farm normally. I'm going to be level 30 before I know it. It must be a really good spawn rate up there because a lot of mobs are dropping down. Hmm... There's a bow here. A load of arrows, that's for sure. Next step, enchantment table. So in order to make an enchantment table, we need a lot of sugar cane to make the books, and obviously we need to have some obsidian and a diamond. We've got the diamond, that's not a problem. We've got the obsidian, we just need to get a book and some sugar cane. But looking over there, some sugar cane I can see. So let's go over here, collect the sugar cane, come back and craft some books. So we've went ahead and crafted ourselves a nice boat. So it's a lot quicker for us to go back and forward. Ah, look how relaxing it is on this nice sea. Hello, little island. I see some sugar cane and that is all we need. So let's go ahead and get off our boat real quick. Mine some of that. We've got a little sugar cane farm now. That should be enough. So we're going to plant that back to grow, actually. This is really helpful. We can actually go and make one over here now. Right, we'll sort that out later. But let's just do the most important thing and just make a book first. Alright, pull up to the dock. Let's anchor it up. We're going to anchor it right there. There we go. Alright, and now let's go ahead and make some pages. There we go, free paper. Now let's make a book. Alright, let's take that lever out. Um, we've got three pieces, which is enough. And let's craft this book. Three along, and then just one down here. Voila! We've got ourselves a book. So in order to craft the chanting table, we need to have ourselves four blocks of obsidian and we've only got three. So we need to go back down into our mine, um, quickly get one obsidian, and then that's it. Put the book on top, two diamonds each side, and we've got ourselves a lovely enchantment table. Let's get a bucket of water, and then let's go and get ourselves some lava. So there appears to be plenty of obsidian down here, so matter of fact, let's get mining down here. It takes forever to break obsidian, but nevertheless, oh no, that isn't good. I think we've got to mine it like this. I've got to be pretty careful just in case any creepers come up behind me, because that would be terrible. I'm going to shift as well, so if there is lava beneath us, I won't fall in it and die and lose all of our stuff. Even though we needed one block of obsidian, I'm just going to mine a few so we've got it. You never know. Okay, four pieces we do. Let's head back up. Now then, let's go back. Let's go on our crafting table, just like that. And then, hold up, where's our book? We haven't got all the stuff we need, have we? Uh, book, then two diamonds. Now we have everything. So, just like that. One either side, and then, there we go. Enchantment table. We got one. Now we just need a bookshelf. Well, bookshelves with an S on the end we need quite a few so one bookshelf is just three books and then wood on top and bottom so we just need to grind a few more sugar canes and then we can make some paper turn them into books and then so on so you could say i've been grinding quite a few books as you can see so we've managed to grab ourselves 19 books so this is going to help to get level 30 enchantment i'm pretty sure it's 15 bookshelves you need in total so uh, obviously we're going to need a bit more but we've got most of it done anyway so let's just go ahead and um, craft some bookshelves let's grab that wood in that chest and then come over to our crafting table all right and then just wood on top and bottom there we go put six on the bottom six on the top there we go we got ourselves six bookshelves yeah we're going to need we need nine more bookshelves well this is going to take longer than I thought. I think we're going to have to make a separate enchantment room because because when I go to think of it, I don't think it will actually fit in here. I've decided because we haven't got enough room in any of these rooms to put an enchantment table as you've got to leave one block in between the enchantment table and the bookshelves. So what I've decided to do is build out a little bit here 
so I'm gonna make the enchantment table sort of out here so I broke this fence here so I can place these oak logs like along here just like that and then also along here and then come down right just like that and then I think we're gonna place our bookshelves now right and I'm gonna place my enchantment table here and then come around with the other bookshelves so let me grab my enchantment table grab that and then come back to the enchantment room Right, I'm planting that just there, so we get a total of level 18 at the moment. We've got eight more books, so I'm pretty sure we can make a few more um, bookshelves. But it's okay, we only need a couple more now. And then we can build them there, and then we'll have a level 30. We've got 22 at the moment, so we're getting there slowly. So let's go ahead and grab ourselves some more sugar cane to then um, make more bookshelves and get level 30. And then we can start enchanting. But we do need to grind some XP also, so... I think the first thing we're going to enchant is our diamond pickaxe. Sitting at this mob farm is really making me think what to really enchant first. Because I feel like the best thing to enchant first would be a pickaxe, but... I don't know. We'll see. I think it will be a pickaxe. I don't know. Maybe I'm getting a little bit too excited. But anyway, let's uh, destroy these mobs. Oh yeah. Oh, I didn't drop any XP, that one. Sitting at this farm for a while. We managed to get up to level 30. Oh, see that? When I shifted, he saw me, the creeper, and nearly just blew up everything. But I'm level 33 now. Well, 34 as you speak. We're getting there quickly than I imagined. So yeah, we're we're pretty good for uh, XP at the minute. We're pretty good for levels, uh, level 34. So obviously the max enchant is level 30 anyway. So we got a max enchant on anything we have. And then the rest we can just come back here really and sit here a little bit AFK, let some mobs spawn in and then just kill them, take their XP and enchant some stuff. So let's get rid of these last few mobs and then we'll uh, start making more books again. Alright, so let's jump down. Let's go and check on our sugar cane, see how that's doing. I'm on my bold again, I'm on my bold again. Alright, so it doesn't look like it's changed actually. This isn't good. We've been sat at this XP farm for quite a while now, building up the XP, level 37, soon to be level 38, but I feel like that's enough for now. Let's go and check back on our sugar cane to see if it's grew. Oh, let's just get rid of that creeper first. Woo! Right, let's quickly hop on our boat here, and let's sail over to our sugar cane island, and by the looks of things, it's actually grew. With a little bit of hope, it seems to have grown, so that gives us a chance to craft more books, which means more bookshelves. So let's just anchor up here real quick. Okay, not looking too bad. Let's actually go and take everything we have for a minute. Or, or should we? Should we not? Mm, yeah, I'm greedy. 12 sugar cane is going to do me for a moment. Honestly, I think it would look better if I just had water falling down there and climb up the water instead of the um, oak planks and the ladders. I suppose we can always change that. It might look cleaner, but I don't know. It might just be too much hassle with the water. Let's park our boat there for a moment. Alright, so let's go ahead and craft our pages here. So, three up here and then one lever down here. Alright, six books. And then we can craft ourselves six book. Well, no, it's actually only two bookshelves. What am I talking about? It's so much effort to craft these bookshelves. Right, let's head back up to the enchantment table and then place these two bookshelves and then um, keep grinding for more. Hello again. Alright, let's go ahead and place two. Uh, join it in now, can't I? What am I up to now? 26. We're getting so close. Honestly, just... Ugh, look at that. So annoying. Alright, let's get two more bookshelves. Guys, I kind of messed up. I forgot to click start recording when I went over there and got more sugar cane, crafted two bookshelves, went over to the enchantment table and enchanted my sword and my pickaxe, and even my chest plate. Me being stupid, I forgot to click record. Oh, man. That's so annoying. I'll, I'll go and show you the enchantment table. Why did that happen? So silly, honestly. I, I placed two bookshelves over here. Hang on, let me check if I am recording. Okay, I am. But... Like I was saying, I placed two bookshelves here, then I put- Oh, and we went down and mined some lapis as well, because we didn't even have any in our chest. So we managed to get a stack in, like, seven uh, lapis, and then we put the stack in here, and then put our pickaxe in here first, and then chant like that. It only took three- it only took three levels off for level 30. So, but anyway, that happened. <laughs> I, um, I got my sword enchanted, pickaxe chest plate and that's it for now but like i was saying i want to sit at my mob farm for a little bit grind some more xp and then i can enchant more stuff it's fine though i mean we didn't do a 
I mean, we didn't do a lot. We just went back over to our sugarcane farm, like I said. Harvest some more sugarcane, turn them into paper, and then made some books, but whatever. But anyway, let's sit at our mob farm for a little bit. Right, and that should... Okay. Go away, creeper. That should... Oh. Why is there so many mobs dropping now? It's just when you're leaving as well. Alright, go away. Give me that XP, and I'm gone. Wee. We got level 35. Um, let's go back over to our enchantment table and enchant more stuff. I can't believe I didn't even record that. Why would I even do that? Um, will it be a waste to enchant iron? Do you know what? Well, let's attempt to mine some more diamonds first, and then once we've got enough, we can make a full set of diamond gear, and then we can enchant that. That would be the smarter idea. We're on the way to find some more diamonds again, if we can get down the ladder. Alright, so we found more lava then, um, which is a good indication that there could be more diamonds here. I think it was where I found them the first time, wasn't it? Yeah, it is. Alright, let's go down here then, because I know there's more caves. More iron. You never get too much of it, I suppose. We'll pick that up on the way. Oh, more iron. We'll take more of that. Any more down? Yep. Yeah. Alright. It literally as I was about to say, oh my gosh, bro. What is going on? Well, I guess I'm not complaining, but <laughs> that was easy. That's that done. Collect more lapis as well on the way, because why not? My diamond luck is just insane, honestly. Well, there's loads of iron in this cave, but is there a lot of diamonds? Hmm, we hope so. We hope so. Ooh, hello. Hello, Enderman. I'm not gonna mess with you for a moment. Some more iron anyway, so... Should we fight that Enderman? We'll see. If he's if he's still there, we're, we'll take him on. Ooh! Oh my gosh. That creeper just came out of nowhere. He was hiding, waiting for me. That was way too close. I wanna stay away from the lava, so I just know something's gonna come up behind me again. Oh no. Is that a... No, 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 I'm not going back down there. That's a, that's another spider spawner. Where is that scaly up there? Oop. Oh, no. Get out. Nothing down there. So, let's go up here, then. Oh! Well, there's something down there. <laughs> this is a weird-looking room. We don't care. There's a diamond here. Oh, is it just one, though? Ah. Oh. You'd think they'd at least put two ores here, wouldn't you? Oh, well. More iron. I'm not really interested in iron, though, because there's too much of it. We can get that any time. That's a creeper. Hello, creeper. Bye, creeper. Hello, bat. We're not interested in iron. We've came here for purely diamonds. What is that? Oh, okay. I thought that was diamonds. Really got my hopes up. These are horrible-looking things. They're actually quite cool. I can't lie. They keep making me believe that they're diamonds, but they're not. I think we're going to get some obsidian for the nether portal as well. Because if we don't get it now, then we'll have to get it later. Oh. Like I was saying, if we don't get it now, then we'll have to get it later anyways. So, I think we should get some now. I think we've already got a few in our chest, so. That actually helped me, like, quite a lot. So, we got eight obsidian. That's plenty. Have we already... Oh, I think this is where the spawner is. Yeah. I knew it. So I know where I'm at now. Why are these zombies so strong? You know what? Let's go down here. Yes. <gasps> this is the diamonds I left before, wasn't it? Because the, the spiders came and literally, like, nearly killed me. Technically, we found those diamonds, like, earlier. But whatever. We got them now. That's the most important thing. So what's down here, then? Another chest. I'm just going to check these corners because you never know. Are you a poison spider? Please don't. Please don't. Please don't. It is. Whoa! We found a diamond in the chest. Oh my, look at that. We've got 26 diamonds. Oh, and a golden apple. That was insane luck. One diamond out of a chest. Let's go. There's more lapis. I thought that was diamonds for a second. I think I'm going to head up top, actually, because we've got enough diamonds now for a full set of diamond gear. So, what are we even fussed on diamonds for? We've already got a diamond sword, diamond pickaxe, and then soon to have full diamond gear. Let's head back up. Let's go back to the top. Don't mind me, zombies. Do not mind me at all. I'm just passing through. I need to get home. Just let me through. Right, let's get out of here. Where are we? Oh, okay, there it is. 
Ah, there we go. Just next to our spawner at the back of our base. Let's go back. Let's go and craft ourselves a full thing of diamond gear. And then we'll think about building the nether. Respect the enchanted sword. Respect the enchanted sword. So we've got 29 diamonds in total. That's quite a lot. You know what? Let's go ahead and craft ourselves some diamond leggings. And don't need those old things anymore. And then let's craft ourselves some diamond boots. Voila! Look at that. We've got full diamond gear but it's missing one thing and that's enchantments so let's head over to the enchantment table and go enchant them quick we've actually got 18 remaining so we've got 11 obsidian as well um what else did we get we've got a lot of cobblestone let's put that in there for now glow ink sack uh golden apple that could come in really useful if we're fighting the ender dragon uh saddle lots of lapis some beetroot seeds pumpkin seeds we could grow those all in a lot of iron let that smelt and then um let's head over to our enchantment table and enchant our diamond gear oh wait no sorry we need lapis all right let's take our lapis let's get ourselves over to the enchantment table let's do our uh, diamond helmet oh look at that aqua on our leggings what we're gonna get here yeah just your standard and then on the boots right come on come on oh fire protection i'm breaking depth strider all right all right I love it, I love it. Now we look the business. So with the depth strider, it's going to allow us to move in the water a lot quicker. Look how much quicker we can move through the water now. This is so cool. And with our aqua affinity, it gives us some more speed. So like, when we're mining underwater, we just mine like, a lot quicker. So this is like, good for sand for example. Just look how much better that is. And how fast it is, and this is with an arrow. Imagine like a shovel. Anyways, let's not get too distracted. Let's head back up here for now. Now we've enchanted our full diamond gear. Let's look into building a nether. So, where should we put this nether portal? I think we should put it... Hmm, where shall we put it? Oh, do you know what? I got an idea. Because we put an enchantment table that side, how about we put a nether portal this side? Right, let's go and make ourselves an iron axe because we have a lot of iron to spare and we don't want to waste our diamonds just for an axe. Come on now, guys. Yeah, okay, 30 sticks. Let's go ahead and take those out and then come back over to our crafting table. Craft a little axe real quick. Let's grab ourselves some oak planks and oak logs we'll go and get some oak logs over in our tree farm we'll just have to get it from our sustainable tree farm give me those oak logs Seventeen oak logs we've got to turn some of these into planks so we'll work it all out on how much we got there's lots of sticks though I'll bother with that. Let's do it as we go along. So let's build the oak logs first and then whatever we've got left we can turn them into planks. We can start coming along here. Right. Let's build outwards and then following the oak logs either side. How how far did I come out? I want to make it really even because like, I'm so OCD. Honestly, I can't have one side bigger than the other. Right, so it's one, two, three, four, five, six seven really we don't need this do we so it's seven hours so one two three four five six seven there we go and then follow up with oak logs mm, yeah that's it all right that's that's fine and then we can just put it here can't we on the end so let's go and make our never portal but before we do so we need to make a flint and steel real quick so let's see if we got the stuff to do that oh actually we've got literal flint in our thing here so some iron oh yeah let's get our flint and steel and let's take our obsidian and let's get to the exciting part where we place it down and light it up so i believe normally you need about 14 blocks but we've got 11 and you only need about 10 to make it when you just you know not include the corners let's go and make that quick uh it's not gonna look even though it's fine whatever we don't care and then hold up I hear phantoms, yeah. You're always there, the same two. You're always there when I want to do something. Well, he's just screwed himself. Plant that there, and then three up. And put that one there. Two up, and then do that. Oh, let me just place that there for now. And we've made ourselves a nether portal. It's not even though. I don't like this. It looks stupid. We'll fix that later on, but anyway. Alright, now we've planted our torches and we've actually built the frame of our nether portal. Let's light it up. Alright, you ready? Three, two, one. Look at that. Before we enter the nether though, let's go and sort our inventory out. You know, we we got we gotta come prepared. So we've got fully enchanted diamond gear. What is that? Is that a well? 
Go away, well. But anyways, we've come prepared. We've got fully diamond enchanted gear. We've got an enchanted sword, enchanted pickaxe. We've got some... Let's take some cobblestone because you need some of that. Parrots. We've got logs. Oh, let's enchant our bow. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do that and get infinity on it. How cool would that be? Alright, so we've actually got loads of bows up here, but to be fair, we could probably just craft a new one. We need to get to level 30 again as well if we want max enchant, so let's get to level 30 in this mob farm, and then we can get a bow and enchant it. <laughs> no. oh. Stop scaring me. i really got to stop doing that, man. I'm going to learn my lesson. Oh yeah, level 30? Come on. Ah, oh, so close. We're halfway there. Look how good our base looks now. We got enchantment table one side, nether portal the other. I don't know what to use these two huts for. Oh, I know what I could do. If I do enchant other gear and stuff, I could put chests in these and then leave the enchanted stuff in it and like lapis. And then over here, I could put like chests full of like nether rack, like nether stuff, you know? Like things I need for the nether and that's what I'm going to do, I think. I've got my two farms here. I've got my tree farm, my underground mine. I've put a lot and a lot of effort into this. Oh, and sorry, most importantly, this uh, mob farm as well. I've just put so much effort and time into this world. I'm very pleased with it. I am pleased. Come on, zombie. Give me level 30. What are you doing? The sun's rising again. We're sat at our mob farm, trying to get some XP. I didn't mean to take a screenshot, but we're hoping for more mobs to spawn in and, you know, get rid of them. We need XP. Oh my. Did that break anything? Oh wait, it broke a slab. Uh, I mean, it's not a big deal. Hang on, we're literally like one mob off of... Bro, what? Oh no, 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 we need to fix this, we need to fix this. We need to fix this. Quick, 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 for any... Okay. What just happened? Why did... Why did that happen? What the... Oh no, this is an awkward situation to be in. Of course this would happen. That hasn't happened yet though, so why did it happen now? We got close there because that could have been a lot worse. People could have come down and literally blew us up. Please, creeper. All right, let's just um fix this real quick. Now that's fixed, the creepers actually blew the cobblestone slabs up on um, above the hoppers, so I had to quickly replace those. And that was it, really. Just kill these, take our XP, and go. We've got our bow. We can just craft a new one, but let's pray we get infinity on this bow. If not, we're just going to have to keep going. Right, let's pick our lapis up. Where are you? There you are. And now, let's head back over. All right, come on. Please, Minecraft gods, give us infinity and fire. Come on. I'm not even going to look. No! Do you know what? We're going to keep crafting bows until we do. <laughs> I'm not having this. I'm not having this. All right, let's just quickly craft this. Oh, no. We're only level 29 again. We're going to have to sit on this XP farm for quite a while then. Let's go back over to our XP farm and grind that for a little bit. Level 34. Oh, we've got to keep going. I just really want infinity so bad. It's not the end of the world if not, but because I can literally just go up there and collect as many arrows as I want from the skeletons. It's always nice just to have infinity, and I also want fire as well. What do I get? Punch one as well. It's not even... I don't know. Please give us something better. Oh, okay, we got flame. We just didn't get infinity, though. Right, come on. <gasps> infinity! Yes! I think... We use the infinity, honestly. Just, yeah, I mean, then we're never going to run out of arrows. So we got a bow, we got axe, we got a pickaxe, we got a diamond sword, we got our flint and steel, we got some carrots. Let's take more, though. And, alright, that looks good. So let's take what we got and let's go and explore the nether. I'm feeling quite nervous for the nether because, you know, it's a very scary place. But, here goes nothing. And we made it, people. We made it and. Ooh. Look at this. Get some nether quartz, why not? Good for XP as well, these are. How good would it be if we found some bastions? Oh, I'm not going down there, that's for sure. This is such a scary place. Get some gold nuggets. More XP as well. Hmm, let's get some nether rack as well. Look how fast we can mine this. Oh my gosh. Oh, I hear pigmen. They're quite scary though, aren't they? I should have came with a spare pickaxe. Just in case anything went wrong. Oh, they look angry. Sorry. Whoa, that was one shot. <laughs> this thing is OP. Come on, we can have a little standoff. You got a bow? Okay, never mind. Let's go and take that XP. Whoops. 
that was not good. Let's not forget where we came from. We should have crafted more torches, shouldn't we? Oh. Don't try and start on me, buddy. Oh, more XP here. There's more pigmen down there. Oh, look at that little thing. I hate the noise of this stuff when you mine it. <laughs> How about we go up here and then like kind of cut around? Whoa, 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 whoa. That's what we gotta be careful for. There's lots of lava down here. Oh, look at that headshot. Headshot, dead shot. Nothing going on down there. I feel like we should start heading this way. Go away, pig man. If I build over here. I see you. You're not peeking me. Hello. I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm just gonna destroy all of your people. Oh, headshot. Why did I just like a load of them just spawn there? Literally full family of them. Alright, screw that. Get out. Get out of town, Buster Brown. Come in, pigman. You gotta be smarter than this. I've got a bow and arrow and you've got a sword. And I've got high ground. Oh no, he's got a bow and arrow as well. These pigmen haven't got anything on me, but whoa, look at that. I can't aim today. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. There's loads. There's quite a few over here. I just gotta make sure no one comes up behind me. You've come at the wrong time, buddy. What are you doing in the lava? Go in the lava, even though it doesn't do anything to you, but whatever. I wanna I wanna start heading over here, so hmm. <gasps> Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, buddy. We're all good for now, aren't we, pigmen? Just mind my own business, pigmen. Don't worry about me. I'm not going to harm you, so don't harm me. All we'll be friends here and get along. What's he doing? I say I don't want to harm anyone. Oh, my. This is so risky. Oh! Some bone block. Come on, skeleton, I'm used to you in the real world. This isn't nothing new to me. Oh, okay, you want to have a jewel off? No problem. Oh my. Apart from you've literally got aimbot. Oh, there's an enderman down there. I hear another ghast. Oh, I think we found a bastion. Oh my gosh, we found a bastion. Oh no. There we go. Oh, you want it as well, skelly? Huh? Huh? Okay, we actually found a bastion. I'm so happy we've managed finally to stumble across one. Yeah, guarding those chests. I don't want to rush into them because they are quite strong and I don't want them to, like, do anything dangerous to me. But I'm just going to keep picking them off, I think. All right, I think let's start to build over. Being very quiet, though. Hopefully we get some good luck in these chests. Let's go. Oh, what is in the chest? Oh, enchantment book. Soul speed. All right, what are we going to chuck out? Let's chuck... Rock flesh out. I think we're okay from it. What's in this? Oh, oh, diamond pick. Curse of vanishing. Oh, you're there, aren't you? Get out. Please leave me alone. Let's keep exploring this bastion then. Go outside of it so we can see what we're doing. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> we can't let it end like this. Alright, enough of that. I really don't want to keep taking full damage, so I'm going to build a cross. And I'm going to run and jump. Like that. You're not going to start me, are you, Mr. Pigman? We're going to be friends, we're going to be peaceful. We're going to be kind to each other, and we're not going to cause no one any stress, or just don't be alarmed, I'm just passing through. 
minding my own business, even though I'm not literally looting their home. Oh. Oh, there's another chest. We're going to check that out. Alright, I need to go get that down there. I say we get this chest first, right? And then he's really angry. Okay. We're going to have to pick him up from a distance then. I want to block this off so no one can come up. Okay, let's see what's in this chest. Another banner pattern. Alright, let's go get that other chest. Oh, this is going to be a hard chest to get because it's right in the centre of literally everything. We're going to be so careful. Try my best not to get in any any fights. I just want to take my loot and go home, okay? I'm scared of this place. I just want to go. Oh. Right, we're not getting involved in that down there. Other diamond pickaxe. More arrows. Okay, I'm not even going to risk the other stuff. Honestly, I'm, I'm too scared. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. You see that? How he tried sneaking up on us? It's too dangerous down here. And we've already got our loot. So I think we're going to go home just for a moment. I think we just head back up, honestly. I think we head home and you stay safe. <laughs> there might be some more chests lingering about, though. So I will come back. I will come back here. All right. And on the way back, we may have just found a nether fortress. Oh! Give us those blaze rods. Okay, we've just found a bastion. Now a nether fortress. There's a chest down here. Let's see what's in this one. More diamond horse armor. All right, it's definitely a blaze spawner down there. But let's take these blaze rods. Oh yeah. All right, we gotta be careful for wither skeletons as well. More iron. All right, let's go and look at this chest. More iron. We take it. We take it. I was about to say nothing up here, but there's another chest. Gonna be very careful. Okay, there's a wither skeleton. Come on, buddy. Get away from us. This is why I needed a bow. So I absolutely just love it. Let's go down here and then over this way. Let's retrace our steps a little bit. Let's go let's go back down here. Maybe mine up. Or should I? Should I? Should I not? Screw it. I'm just gonna go up this way. Now I heard a blaze spawner, but I don't know. I can't remember which way that was. I think that was where we started. And we've already come up here. Wow. Alright, so let's head back down this way. Oh, look at that. Oh, there it is. There it is. We found a blaze spawner. Alright, let's get some blaze rods. If we just sit here and keep peeking it. And just shoot from a distance with the arrows. Then they can't hit us, right? Go and take the blaze rods and then come back. And I think we're just going to keep doing the same thing. There's even more spawning. Oh, one shot. Did he drop any rods? No. I need to eat some carrots, I've just realised. Right, we know a blaze rod spawn is there now, so how about... How about we just hold tight for a moment and go explore? The thing is with these nether fortresses, they're just so big. Oh, hello blaze rod. How are you doing, sir? Okay. Oh, there's another, there's another one here. Let's kill this thing. Oh, he just jumped over it. Oh, whoa, why is there so many? <laughs> there we go. Wait, there's another one? Oh my. If there's another one, I actually give up. Alright, let's get more blaze rods. Alright, come on, blaze. Oh, there's loads up there now. Oh my, wait, stop spawning for a minute. Oh, no, 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 no. Stop spawning. I haven't even got a light or anything. No torches. Oh my gosh. There's so many. Let's collect all of the blaze rods. How many have we got now? Oh, 11. All right. I think we're going to head back now. Um, we're going to head back now, actually. Yeah. So my never put me somewhere completely random. Oh no, 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 no. What is that? This is um. This is interesting. Go away, zombie. Right. So we're going to have to try and find our way back home then. Oh no. Right. Let's go and check that out over there. Oh, this is scary. Hello, drowned. Goodbye, drowned. Right, let's go over here then. Look at all these caves. What? I didn't even know this was here. Where even am I? There's more sugar cane. Let's get that while we're here. We can't even hold it. Um, let's drop some of that. We don't really need that. I'm going to take more of that. I'm going to take it all. Right, I really want to check this out. There might be some, like, some chests over here as well. Whoa. We're going to check that out in a second, but look at this. What is that? 
Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Look at it ended so terrible. Look at that drowned. Come up here. Check this out. What even is this? Oh, there's a chest. Very treasure map. Huh. Right. Let's just drop that. Okay, is there anything else down here? What is this? I didn't even know this was here. There might be another hidden chest somewhere. Let's check this um buried treasure map. Right. Oh! It's a zombie villager! Hang on a minute. I know what we can do with you, but I don't know if we should do it. Okay, alright buddy. Okay. Why is there so many mobs? Go away. I've just battled loads of pigmen and wither skeletons, blazes and is it oh whoa, 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 whoa. it's a zombie villager but there's too many mobs. Hang on, let me just get rid of these. Go stop zombie villager, go away. So I've got to take these out one by one now because I don't want to kill the zombie villager. Zombie! What are you doing? Are you serious? Alright, zombie villager. Please, phantoms, will you leave me alone? <gasps> no! I accidentally killed the villager! Oh no! I didn't even mean to do that. Oh, it's these phantoms. I hate phantoms. I actually hate phantoms with a passion. Do you know what? Let's kill you because we need enderpearls. He actually nearly had us. Well, I mean, it's finally getting lighter outside. That's one thing. We need to find our way back to our raft. Right, so what's around this side then? Wait, is that another chest? Whoa! Look at the emeralds in here. Uh, all right, let's let's take those. Um, man, I don't know what to drop. Well, I doubt I need bone blocks to be honest. But look at that. We got we got emeralds. Loads of iron. We don't really need that though. Oh. Right, so we got emeralds now, and we found our way home. So, you don't understand how happy I am to see this beautiful raft again. Missed you, raft. And my little boat, too. I've missed you. I made it back alive, people. We're alive, and we've collected quite a few goods. So, let's go to our home, let's go in our chest, and go discover what we've got. Alright, so, we're going to have to go down here for this one. So, we're going to put all our nether stuff all up here and go through each individual item what we got so this is everything we found in the nether so we got one diamond pickaxe with mending on it we've got one diamond pickaxe with cursor vanishing on it we've got 46 gold nuggets two pork chops and some nether rack some cracked polished blackstone bricks nether quartz diamond horse armor we've already got one of those we've got two banner patterns 11 blaze rods 57 nether bricks, 2 shroom lights, 27 crimson stems, and 64 nether rack as well. So we found quite a few items. Sorry, and we also got this one as well, Soul Speed 3. The curse of vanishing isn't going to matter too much because, like, this is hardcore Minecraft and once you're dead, you are dead. But anywho, we managed to get all of these items anyway, so that's pretty cool. Alrighty then, so we've made it this far, and the last thing to do right now is to find a stronghold, enter the ender portal, and slay the ender dragon. But before we do so, we have to make some eye of enders to then, you know, right click on them and it will show us where the stronghold is. And then from there, all we have to do is find it and put the eye of enders on the blocks and then we're in the ender portal. But it's going to be a lot harder than that. On the way, we need to find ender pearls to then turn into eye of enders, which we, we got about, I don't know, maybe like 12, 13 blaze rods in the chest. So, so we can turn the ender pearls into eye of enders and then get started. So we're going to head back here to our home and then try and see how, just to double check how how much we actually have okay yeah so we have 11 blaze rods and we have one ender pearl so we're going to make one eye of ender and we're going to use it to then look at the direction that we've got to start heading in and then on the way we can we can slay some ender men and then take all their ender pearls so what we're going to do is we're going to put one in here take the blaze powder and it's just one across and one like that and then we've got an eye of ender with the blaze powder all we got to do is just you know put the uh, ender pearls in with the with the blaze powder and then we got ourselves a eye of ender let's eat a carrot before we do anything because we're quite hungry out here it's another hot day again today it helps the farm grow all right so let's see we're going to go on to our dock and see what direction our eye of ender takes us in all right here we go we're about to do it three two one oh in this direction then is it come on please drop don't break yes all right so it's in this direction, so I guess we're going to start heading over here. It's going to be like a few hundred blocks, well, definitely over a few hundred blocks away, that's for sure. So, we're going to start heading in this direction. So let's get on our boat and get going. Hey, just to double check, it was in this direction, wasn't it? Yeah. Alright, so we're just going to start heading in this direction, and I guess wait and see until we see a little bit of land. Oh, hello, squid. Oh, look at that. There's a little bit of land over here. 
followed up with some sugar cane. I'm pretty sure this is where the uh, nether portal was that we uh, randomly spawned in. Oh, and I see an enderman. We're waiting for us just to slay him. All right, so we're going to anchor up just here. Just here will be fine. And let's get going. Oh, hello. You like this? Come on, enderman. Come on, do you think I'm scared of you? Them scary sounds? Then you're wrong. There we go. Give me that. By the way, I think that's the scariest mob in the whole entire game. Ooh, what is that over there? It's like a little dome. Let's go and check that out. Good job he dropped us an enderpearl. Speeds up the process a little bit. We just need to get a couple more on the way. Well, let's check this thing out. What even is this? Let's have a little look at it from the side. Huh. All right, let's go check it out. Let's walk up the steps, if we can. I guess we can't. Okay, I guess we're just going to have to chop our way through here, because I'm very impatient and I'm lazy. Oh, there's a chest here. So let's build up. Hello, chest. What's... Hello? Oh, bottle of enchanting. Okay. Iron nuggets. Loads of iron. Holy, we don't really need the gold, to be fair. I wonder if there's any more chests in here. Let's actually go and pop these two down. Oh, yeah. A little bit of XP there. Get our way up here. Oh, there's another chest. I knew it. All right, let's check out what's in this chest. Oh, there's a clock. Bit of paper. Buried treasure map. Okay, so there's another buried treasure map. And there's a clock. What does this clock do then? We're going to keep that there for now. All right, buried treasure maps. So, oh, is that is that the buried treasure? Is this it? No, but there's loads of wheat in here. Lots of paper as well. Some gunpowder. We take that. So I have a feeling there's more like, there's more chests, but I'm not sure where. But hey, you give us plenty of wood. All right, let's go see what's back in this direction then. Let's go, uh, let's just keep heading towards where we was going. And what is that? What is that? Oh, hello. There's like a little village over here. Let's go and check that out. Before we do that, let's just quickly make a little eye vendor again on the way we're just going to keep crafting them so you know we're doing it as we go but let's see what direction yes yeah, okay it's over this direction anyway so let's go and check that out oh there's a villager see him jumping around well he was jumping around there's a villager there as well on the end and they're walking around let's go and see what they want we got a ton of iron from that chest as well so that was good hello villagers i come in peace let's go and climb up this ladder and oh hello mr villager how are you what have you got to offer us mm, nothing special i mean some leather if we need it but oh there's some Oh, hello, baked potatoes. Come to me. Oh, TNT, gunpowder. Loads more TNT. What is this? Fire charges, gunpowder. We're going to take you as well, just for our home, for decoration. Oh, look at this one. Some bamboo. Um, potatoes we're also going to take. I think we're going to leave the bamboo. We don't really need it for, to build anything. Oh, more TNT and gunpowder, though. More oak logs. Yep, I'll take that. Don't mind if I do. What was that? We'll take that banner, though. Thank you, little village. What's that? There's another one up there. Another Enderman for us. All right, let's go check that out up there. It's like a shipwreck. Before we start the Enderman, let's um, start on the other mobs. Come on, then. Let's get involved. Come on, then. Come on. Where do you go? Where do you go? Where do you go? Whoa. Phantoms! Oh, yes, he dropped us an Enderpearl. Right. Come on, then, Phantoms. He's got my head in. We need to pick that Enderpearl up. Uh, what can I drop? Just drop that. Boom! Get out of sight. Keep getting too many distractions from the phantoms. Honestly, I hate them. They're the most annoying mob in this game. What? Ooh, look at that in there. What's this colourful bit of sand? Nothing going on there. No chest, no anything. We're gonna kill this creeper. I'm scared of creepers as well, because, oh, too many times throughout this video they've tried blowing me up. Oh, no, there's two, there's two. Ooh. No, 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 no. Get back. Get back. Go away. Get away from me. Take that XP. Don't mind if I do. And look, it's like a shipwreck. It's on the sand. Is that another creeper in there? Okay, no, it isn't. I'm just seeing things. Okay, so, oh, yeah, there's definitely something in here. I want to be careful if there's any traps, though. Or maybe not. Just more paper. What's that? Bur another buried treasure map. All right, let's go and check this out, then. Oh, I'm guessing it's this red thing. Oh, no, is it? I don't know. I can't really read treasure maps, but I'm, I, I'm not too sure. Oh, come on, zombie. All right, let's check this eye of Ender. Okay, so it's down this direction anyway, so let's start ahead. Come on, please drop. Yes. Are you serious right now? That noise is in my nightmares. Hello, creepers. Blow each other up. There we go. He took the bait. Is that another Enderman? Yeah, it is. All right, let's go and take him on then. There's two Endermen. Come on then. You're no threat to us. He's just a stupid Enderman. Oh, he's coming first. Did he drop anything? No, he didn't drop us anything. Come on then, Enderman. Oh, you're getting comboed. You're getting wombo comboed, buddy. And he didn't drop us anything either. I need some Ender, but... Oh, wait, I've got one. Right, so we got three. So, I mean... Uh, you know, it, it'll do for now. But on the way, we do need to find more, obviously. I hate spiders as well. I think they're annoying. Oh, not as annoying as these. Get out. Zombies, don't you start as well. Right, so let's keep heading back in this direction, I guess. That's the only thing to do. Hello, creeper. Don't mind me. Passing through. Ooh, look at that. There's another build over there. What about over this way? Sorry, Skelly. I'm just going to kill you. I feel like you're going to kill me. And I'm also going to take your XP while I'm at it. So let's go check that out. Whatever that is. It's like a... 
whale made out of sand. Like a wishing whale. There's a drowned guarding it. Oh, he's burning. I'm gonna finish him off. Why not? Oh, and there's another, like, little villager thing over here as well. Like a village of raft. So what's in here, then? Nothing. Okay. Uh, oh, look, there's another little shipwreck as well. So I'm guessing... Let's go check this out, because it's literally just right here. And then we'll, we'll move over to that as well. All right, hello. Chest, there's a book. Um, do we need that, though? I mean... Not really, to be honest. Another buried treasure map. Why is there so many? I can never read it where the treasure is, though. Oh, okay. I think it is actually over here. So it's got to be somewhere here, right? Is it? Huh. I think it might be, like, somewhere under here. Maybe? No? Is it under here? Ah, there it is. Whoa! Hello, emeralds. More iron? Oh, okay. And more lapis. Right. Well, now we've discovered that and i just want to say before we continue if you've made it this far into the video and you want to show me your support please be sure to subscribe and give this video a like as it helps me and the channel out i'd really appreciate it without that being said let's go check this out found a lot of iron there look at that we've got 25 bars just to spare i mean we don't really need it as we have literally diamond tools but whatever Ooh, okay is there any villagers yep there's two villagers on it and i think i see some barrels for me to take well to loot hello little puffer fish oh wow is it like that now? You know what, just for that. Ah! Stupid little thing. I wasn't even going to cause it any harm, but whatever. I guess we have now. Right. Um, some more leather. Not really. Loads of bamboo, though, if anyone's interested. <laughs> more TNT. We'll take some of that. And gunpowder. More carrots. Yep. A lot of potato and carrots. Wow. Okay. Oh, look at the fireworks. Whoa. Yeah, we're, we're definitely going to take those. So there's plenty of fireworks, but I can't... I can't hold them all. Oh, wait, I can hold them. Oh. Well, I didn't mean to do that, but whatever. Let's go check another eye of Ender. Okay, so we're going in the right direction, just to make sure. Please drop. No, it broke. And look, there's another building, which we're also going to go check out again. Swimming with the fishies and all the squids. All right, what's this? This is a peculiar build. Let's go check this out. Where is our axe? Why have we got a shield in here? Oh, I see a chest. It's a good sign. It's always a good sign. But, I mean, another buried treasure map. Right, so we have to check this one back out, aren't we? Show me the treasure. Oh, we need to go out here so we can see it. This one's a little bit hard. I can't really read this one. Not going to lie. Maybe up here? Yep, there it is. Oh, look at that again. Why have we got... We've got so much iron. Look at that. We've got a stack of iron nuggets alone. Oh, and another emerald. And let's head on with our journey. But eat a carrot on the way. Oh, another shipwreck. I see you. You're not hiding from me. Oh, look at that. Go check that out in a second. Actually, we're closer to this little villager thing over here, so let's go check this out. Oh, look at this. It's like in a, in like a little divot. Some more fireworks. Loads of bamboo. Okay, thank you, villagers, once again, for your contribution. Oh, you stuck there? You're not going to get back up? Come here, buddy. Oh, where are you going? I'm literally helping you. Don't be alarmed. Whatever. Suit yourself. I'm going to go check the shipwreck out. I see. Oh, look at that. Leather cap. Lots of paper. We're going to take that. See, if I would have came in and explored all this earlier, then we would have been a lot more stacked, wouldn't we? Was there no buried treasure maps in here, though? No, there wasn't. That's a shame. Get our eye of Enders out again. And check we're going. Oh, okay, CC. We had to use it there because we was heading in the wrong direction. We've already explored that, haven't we? So we're not interested in you anymore, buddy. Look at this beautiful desert sunset, though. How nice does that look? It's all, like, golden. It's golden hour. We might see more shipwrecks and funny buildings on the way. So we've got to keep our eyes peeled. And like I say, there's another one over there. I'm guessing we're going to go check that out. And now it's night time. Hopefully we get more uh, endermen spawn as well. We're going to chuck a fire ender down every few hundred blocks. So therefore we're not wasting them. Because sometimes you have a chance of them breaking. Which we don't want to risk right now. As we've only got literally two. More potatoes like usual. A lot more fireworks. That's lots more TNT. Fire charges. More potatoes, more oak logs. Screw you, Phantom. Come then, Enderman. Drop a Enderpel. Drop me an Enderpel right now. Right this minute. No, nothing again. Go away, zombie. Well, looks like we have to just sit and wait and destroy some Endermen till we get some Enderpels. What are they doing lurking about? Let's get involved. Go away, Spider. Trying to make everything more worse. Did that drop any Enderpels? Yay, it did. Really? Really, Spidey? You want to start us again? Oh, you don't try and scare us. Oh, go away. Come on, then. Okay, I've got to go over here a minute, because... 
I'm literally getting started on. Yes, okay, thank you. The skeletons are dueling off. This is good for us. There we go. Did you drop another enderpearl? So he didn't drop us another enderpearl, so we've just got to keep going until we get more enderpearls, I guess. There we go. Yay, an enderpearl. At last. That brings us to five eye of enders. And let's just sit here till it gets night time again and try and slay some more. But actually, where? let's have a look where... It, oh, it's over here now. Please don't break. Yay. Okay, so it's over here then. Boom. Let's go. Oh, he's comboing us. He's, he was comboing us up there. Hopefully these two drop one as well. How good would that be? Whoa! You just started out of nowhere, didn't you? These endermen are so strong as well. No, he didn't drop... He didn't want to drop us anything. Oh, wait. Yeah, we did. We got another enderpearl. Let's go. Hello, Skelly. Not sk I mean, Spidey. Whoa! Thought we just fell in lava. Wow, that was close. Is this lava here? Oh, my gosh. That... That could have been very bad. I didn't even mean to chuck that. Where did that go? Where did that go? Where did, that, where did our eye of ender go? Oh, it said us to go down there. Oh, it's there. Look at that. It must be down here, then. We must be just above the stronghold. No way. We was literally still above it the whole time. What? We just need a couple more um, eye of enders, though. And then we get digging. So it's just down here, then. I just got to remember this big, like, divot. Why is there so many endermen all of a sudden? Yay, an ender pearl. We've got eight now. We're getting there. Come on then, Enderman. Let's go. Block. Attack. Oh, why didn't that work? I feel like I'm PvPing a real life player here. We're getting good rates at this point. Good drop rates. And we got nine. Oh, hello, zombie villager. How are you doing? Block. There we go. Oh, another Ender pearl. I hate these baby zombies. Oh my gosh, there's so many of them. Oh! Get away from us. Get away. Stop trying to strafe us. Oh, not you, creeper. Why does everyone want to start on me all of a sudden? I'm too cracked at this game. I'm just... I, I'm OP. No one can stop me. Right, so we've got 12 Eye of Enders, and we're ready for the stronghold. So I believe it's down here, somewhere in this divot. So let's get digging. Before we do, though, let's quickly put a quick crafting bench down so we can craft a few spades. Might be a bit easier. We're not shy to use some iron, that's for sure. Right then, let's get digging. Oh, look at this. A little cave. Have we got any torches? We haven't got any torches. Right... Hopefully we see some coal down here then. Let's go down here though. Oh, hello Skelly. Come on, where you at? There you are. The stronghold would be beneath us, probably. Alright, so let's craft 20 torches. Let's get those down. Right, let's go down here then. Alright, I hear a zombie. Hello creeper. Right. Oh, here we go. We found it! No way! Look at this! We found it! I knew it was down here somewhere. Right, so there's a few doors. Quite a few doors, actually. Alright, let's light this... Oops. Alright, let's light this place up a little bit then. Alright, nothing in this room either. This side is not good. Oh, we're getting... I think we're getting closer. It's like a maze, though. Obviously nothing in there. Oh, there's a chest. Iron chest plate and iron helmet. We don't actually need that, though. We're going to leave that. Nothing in there. Oh, I knew it. So what about this chest over here, then? Oh, another enderpearl. Wait, did we come from this? No, we we didn't come from this way, did we? Right, let's just go from here, then. Let's go to where we originally was. Right. Whoa, hello, creeper. Eat some carrots. What's down here, then? Right, I think we're getting closer, guys. No, dead end. Right then, so let's retrace our steps a little bit. Oh, so there's nothing down that side, so there's got to be something around here. Yeah, it's got to be down this side then. If it's not down that side, yeah, it's got to be... Oh my gosh, why is there so many creepers? They came out of nowhere. Wow, this is going to take us a while to find then. All oh, right, we see a water fountain. What does that mean then? At this point, I don't even know where I'm going. Right, there's a water fountain here, right? I've got to be careful with creepers. What is this? Oh, we found it. Oh, go away. Let's, let's break this spawner. We finally found it. We actually found it. We actually found it, people. I can't believe we've made it this far and we've survived. Oh, hello, spider. What do you think you're doing? Right, let's go see what's through here then. Nope. Literally nothing there. But let's head back over to the uh, ender portal. Right, guys. Let's get placing these eye of enders. Ooh. Three, two, one. Whoa! There we go. Oh, my gosh, bro. Look at this. We've done it. I don't like that lava. I'm going to block this up. <laughs> Oh my gosh, we've done it. We've created the ender portal. Right, let's eat some carrots first. Just to prepare ourselves. 
We've got more potatoes as well. This is nerve wracking. So I went and grabbed a bucket of water. Uh, I used two iron to craft a little bucket and just, you know, got the water. We're going to be needing it in the end portal just in case, you know, we have to place a bucket of water or anything like that and make a little waterfall. But, right, this is it, I guess. Here goes nothing. Here we go. Right, we made it. Where are we? Let's dig up, I guess. And look, it already says Ender Dragon at the top. Oh, here we go. This is scary. There he is. There is the Ender Dragon. Look at this place. Oh my gosh. Right, so the first thing we have to do is destroy these crystals to stop the um, Ender Dragon regenerating some health. Oh, okay. Come on then. Being careful not to have a look at the Endermen. There we go. Right, we got that one. What about this one? Come on. Oh, and that one. Ooh, getting close, getting close. Come on. There we go. Oh, we've got that one. We need to build up to get this one. Oh, she's tied that on the minute. Let's get these two over here. Come on. Hit it. There we go. Right, we hit that one. We just got that one up there, haven't we? Right, let's build up to this one then. Oh! You just started on us. Go ahead, the man. I know you're, you know, defending your dragon and all, but there's no need to do that. Let's pick that Enderpo up, actually. Yeah, why don't we pick that up for now? Alright, let's build up to this one here. Alright, let's build up. Come on. Oh! Alright, so we've got rid of that one. All we need to do now is just get rid of these few up here. And then we can, um move on to actually destroying the ender dragon. Where is the ender dragon? We didn't bring... We're going to have to use wood, worst case. Where is the dragon? Where did he go? Oh, he's up there. Look at him. Right, quick, let's make a move. We're going to use any block we possibly can because we didn't come prepared with the cobblestone, did we? Screw it, we're just going to have to make these into planks. I don't know, is this going to hit us though if we do this? Right, just in case it does. Oh, okay. We're fine, we're fine. So let's move up here. And let's see if we can hit these. Yeah, and just this one. Ooh, close. Hit it. Hit it. Come on. Just like that. And just that one over there, isn't it? Can we even reach from there or we get Oh! Well I think I destroyed it. Right, come on in the dragon. Alright, so let's go back down. Eat some potatoes. Make sure we can regen health ourselves. Come on. Oh. He dealt me a decent bit of damage there. Alright, come on then. Let's keep hitting him. We're going to keep picking him off. Come on. Oh, we're hitting him. Come on, dragon. What are you doing? Our hunger bars are not lasting though in here. We have to eat potatoes every, like, literal two minutes. Two seconds, even. Come back down, Ender Dragon. Come back down. Oh, I knew you would start. I knew it. You just knew you couldn't help yourself for two seconds. Oh, no. Not another one. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Oh, my gosh. I think you just... Go away. Stand back. We aren't going to risk these two on our case. I'm trying to hit you, but you're not. You're too far away. Come on. That hit. Hit again. And that. What is this dragon doing? We're building up. We're going to put this down, just in case anything goes wrong. Look at look at this place, though. It's all purple and it's all glowy. It's so cool, though. But it's just so dangerous. Come on, dragon. Come down. Fight me! Let's build right up. Oh, that one hit. There we go. We're getting a few more cleaner shots. If we have to jump, we will. Come on. Come on, dragon. We're picking you off with a bow and arrow. There we go. That should hit. No. Oh, that one did. Yep, that one did. Come on. He's nearly half health. There we go. 
quite hard actually. Oh, that that one did. Oh, and that one. Oh. Come on. He's getting scared. He's panicking. He doesn't know what to do. If he comes anywhere close to me, I'm dropping down there. I say we build up even further. Come on, Ender Dragon. You're too low. Come down. Oh, no, 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 no. There we go. Oh! That is why you have a bucket of water. <laughs> right, let's go back up. That was our fault there. I don't know why I stood there. I should have just built out a little bit more, but whatever. Right, let's stand here for now. I think we can pick him off just from here. Where are you going? We're hitting him a couple times. Come on, dragon. Oh, he's heading right here. Come on. We can pick some shots off here. Oh, he just missed us. Just missed us. He's getting scared. He's getting very scared. Come on. There we go. And again. Oh, no. We need some of these shots to connect. He's so low. Whoa. Come on. And again. No. Can I hit a few more? Please. There we go. Come on. A few more. A few more. Oh, he's nearly dead. He's nearly dead. Yes, that hit. That hit. And again. Let's build up. Let's build up. Let's be quick. We don't care about this wood anymore. We just want to slay this ender dragon. I can see the whole entire end universe. Okay, our blocks have turned transparent for some reason. I haven't come to lose. I've come to win. Wait, did that hit? I think it did. Oh, he's just like two shots. Come on. He's nearly dead. Oh, he's one shot. He's one shot. Yeah, let's go. That's it. We got him. No way. Look at this. We did it. We finally did it. We slayed the ender dragon. Wait. There he goes. It's trying to die now, hey. <laughs> actually, you know what? We're going to take this bucket of water just in case. We actually did it. And do you know what? He didn't do much damage to us, like, at all. I was expecting more of a, like, a lot harder fight, to be honest. So, we did it. We finally slayed the Ender Dragon. And you can probably tell, as you can see, the credits on the screen. But we finally did it. He didn't put up as much as a fight as I thought he would, but he might have been a bit glitched. But nevertheless, we managed to destroy him anyway. And, yeah. As you can see, we teleported back to a nice cosy bed where we belong. It's been a rough day, but we finally got there in the end. And we've done what we had to do. So, it seems to be we've done most things. We've built a pretty nice raft. We made a mob spawner. An enchantment table room, a nether portal, we went to the end, we slayed the ender dragon, and we just done whatever we had to do, I guess. I'm gonna miss this raft. I think I I think it looks amazing. Oh, and I forgot to mention we also built the underground mine. Um this is gonna be missed as well because I was really excited to build this. But it turns out this is it. Anyway though, it is now day 100, which means we have successfully survived 100 days on a raft. So this means goodbye to our beautiful raft we have built. If you are new around here, which I'm new myself, I'm a new channel. If you do want to support me for the work and effort I've put into making this video for you guys, for your guys' entertainment, then please be sure to subscribe and like the video and comment what you think. I've been Scoops and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out. In this video, I'm going to attempt to survive 100 days on one block in Hardcore Minecraft. This one single block regenerates every time it is broken and can even summon hostile monsters or friendly mobs. Will I be able to expand my one block without dying? Well, time to find out. Well, this is an interesting place to find ourselves. We're stuck in a one block in the middle of the sky and there's not a lot to do. It's not like we can go anywhere. We're kind of we're kind of stranded. If you can read below me, the first thing it tells me to do is break the block below me. So I think we're going to listen to that. So let's go ahead and break this. Some dirt blocks. This is an infinite block. It spawns more than dirt. Okay. Okay. Good. I mean, that's a good thing. Blocks even improve over time. Oh, chests can also appear. All right, well, let's open it. Ooh, two oak saplings. I guess we're just going to have to break it then. Being really careful not to fall off because anything can happen here. Enlarge your platform. And that's exactly what we're going to do. So we've crafted some oak planks and we're going to, you know, just to be extra safe here because we are on one block in literal the middle of the sky. We're going to go ahead and, uh, you know, extend there. A dirt block again. Lots of dirt. Ooh, what's that? An earthworm. We're not going to be needing that. Get out. But I will take this. Ooh, there are 10 phases. Ooh, each phase has a theme. Yeah, I thought that. What else? The first phase is planes. Whoa, hello, Mr. Pig. Hello, how are you? <laughs> 
That, that actually scared the life out of me. Stay there, Mr. Piggy. We're just going to extend out a little bit more. I really don't want you falling off that edge. So let me just craft more oak planks real quick. So I can quickly build around Mr. Piggy here. And you know what? I'm just going to... I'm going to shove you over here for now. Oh, please do not fall off. Thank you, Mr. Piggy. There we go. Look at him. What are you doing up here? You scared me. Right, stay there for now. Uh, let's go ahead and make a crafting bench real quick. And while we do that, we're going to place that down just in case we need it. Actually, do you know what? I'm going to make some sticks and the oak planks. I'm going to make myself a quick wooden axe. So therefore, any wood, I can just really chop it down even quicker, you know. But let's keep going. Um, oh, another chest. What does this say? Save your items in chests. Oh, okay. Oh, it give us a chest. So every chest we break, do we get to keep it then? Oh, that's so cool. All right, well, let's just uh, store that in there for now. All the stuff we don't need. And keep this... Oh, wait, what does it say? I think I'm blocking it. Hang on, let me just get rid of this real quick. So if I turn this into more oak planks and, you know, quickly just extend out a little bit. There we go. Then place the two chests there. That's perfect. If you fall, your items are gone. Oh, no. We don't want to fall because we will die. It's hardcore Minecraft. More dirt, more oak planks. I mean, not oak planks, logs. What am I talking about? More dirt. Mm, not good, not good. Actually, I suppose we could use it. Blocks like gravel fall down. Oh, so we have to be careful then. So let's not stand on the block. Oh, that makes sense. Place a block under the infinite block. Uh, okay. That's what we'll do for now then. So let's just take this. And how am I, um, how am I exactly doing this? Right. I don't know how I'm going to do this. Hey, Mr. Piggy. Are you all right over there? Do you want an earthworm? Take an earthworm. Oh, here you go. Why isn't it? What is going on? There you go. I'll leave you to play with that earthworm for a little bit. It's fine. We just won't stand on the, uh, you know, the block. This item may help you with that. Oh, that makes sense. There we go. There we go. All right. That makes a lot of sense, actually. So let's get that down and then come under here and then just like that. There we go. All right. Well, thank you, uh, random text for helping us out there. Uh, let's get rid of this and then we can add it over here. So we got more chests, right? Yeah, more gravel, of course. So I think we're just gonna, you know, keep mining this for now and just hope we get good drops, I guess. Ready for an adventure? Ooh, are we are we ready for an adventure, Mr. Piggy? Are we ready? I think we're ready. Actually, no, we're not. Let's put all our junk in here for now. Oh, where are you going? Go back in your corner. Where do you think you're going, Mr. Piggy? You're not coming with me. You're staying Ooh. You're staying just here for now. I don't want to... Okay, just stay there. Please don't move. You know, it'd be really, really bad if you just fell into the void and, you know, I never saw you again. So, just stay there. But let's head into the adventure, I guess. Oh, love heart chest. All right, well, let's open this up. Oh, a gift. Okay, thank you for your gift. And because I'm scared of the dark, I'm going to place this torch here. And with the remaining oak logs we have, we're going to turn them all into planks. So we got, you know, just a, just enough. Thank you for the gift, whoever you are. Right, let's get rid of this. Oh, seven, six. Well, what is this? A random countdown. I'm scared. Am I going to have, like, a random mob attack me or... You have reached phase one, the plains. Enough flowers and trees grow here to last a lifetime. Okay, well, thank you for that, I guess. We're going through the plains phase, so I guess we just gather all of this dirt. This will help with our sapling, so do you know what? We're going to extend out here for now, and then what we're going to do is we're going to place a dirt block here, a dirt block there, and then, hang on, let's just build more out real quick. All right, so we're going to place another one here and here, and we're going to place our oak saplings on top, so we got a little tree farm going on there. That's cool, right? So let's just quickly get rid of this. Right. Yeah, that's cool. And then I feel like maybe we should, you know, extend one more block out here. Where are you going? Stop following me. Get, get in your pen. In your make-believe pen anyway, because this isn't even this isn't even like a proper pen, but whatever. Right, let me place this down here. All right. This looks pretty good, right? We're getting there. You can see this, the progress is already being made. Well, let's just continue breaking these blocks, I guess. Ooh, more wood. That's what we like to see. More grass. I bet this is going to be really scary of a night time. I'm just thinking of the phantoms, though. Are they going to come and literally, like, sabotage me? Because in my last video, they just... They wouldn't leave me alone. They kept torturing me and... Oh, there was such a nightmare. But let's hope we don't get many of those. Ooh, we got some clay. What? What are you doing? Where, where do you think you're going roaming around on my lovely one block? Huh? Where are you going? Ooh, look at this. We've got some melon. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what we're going to do. Let's put our... Well, I say food is still an earthworm. But oh, look at that. One of our trees have grown. Let's go. All right, well, let's just put all our stuff in here for now. And you know what? Just in case I do accidentally fall off, I'm just going to place this water bucket just in case. And this doesn't mean you can go down it, Mr. Piggy, and, you know, explore down there. Because believe me, I will never see you again. Oh, we got some birch wood, is this? 
Yeah, okay, we got some birch wood as well. All right, you know what? Because we're getting a lot of dirt blocks, I think we're going to go ahead and craft ourselves a quick uh, wooden shovel. Let's just do that really quick. Okay, there we go. Then let's put our planks over here and... Oh, you know what? Let's place a chest here as well. There we go. Will that uh, still grow if it's like this? You know what? Just in case, I'm going to quickly place an extra two planks here. Actually, three planks. And then I'm going to move my chest over, you know? So, just like that. Hold up. Let me just fix this real quick. There we go. That's much better. All right, well, let's put our stuff that we already had in there. We don't really need gravel, do we? I mean, what do we need that for? We don't need it, do we? But let's go and use our shovel to, the, you know, mine the dirt a lot quicker. Oh, we got another friend for you, Mr. Piggy. Hello. Um, do you know what? I feel like we need to make a little pen just in case. You two are going to get along very well, and you're going to make me even more piggies to then, you know, potentially slay you and eat your pork chops. But whatever. Don't uh, ignore that for now. Just, you know, go over here out of my way. So I don't want you falling. Thank you. You know what? Just entertain each other for now. You know, or more melon, more dirt. Okay. Oh, uh, more clay. More dirt blocks. We need more saplings, actually. Have we got any more? No. See, we haven't. Stop following me. You guys are creepy with them eyes. Oh, pumpkin. Okay, so we've got more pumpkin now. Yeah, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to put all our random stuff in this chest. And then in this one, we're going to put strictly food so we don't get mixed up. You know, so it's all organized. So let's just put that in there for now. Let's turn this into more planks. And let's make some birch planks as well. Because why not? Whoa! Hello, Mr. Cow. Well, where did you come from? You got some, you got some friends here for you. So, um, <laughs> let me push you over here. Uh, so there's a lot more friendly mob spawning in now. You know, we got some friends giving us some company on this lonely one block. I say one block, it's now technically quite a few more now, but you get the point. No, you can't be fed at the moment. Just go over there and when I get enough food for you guys, you can have it, I promise. So it's just going to give me more dirt for now. Oh, another chest. Come on, please have something good in here. Yes, another sapling and some pumpkin seeds. So I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to build even further out here, right? And then we're going to place more dirt blocks. And then we're going to go ahead and stick this birch sapling on top. And then let's actually get rid of this real quick. Like that. There we go. Oh, look at that. Look how cool that is. Well, that was satisfying. So we got six oak logs from that. So let's go ahead and turn them all into oak planks. And then let's place the sapling back. Oh, look, we've got quite a few from that. I think we've got to space them out a bit more, though. You know what? Just to be on the safe side of things, I'm going to make it two blocks apart. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. So let me get rid of all of these. And then let me place like that, right? And then these ones on the end, like so. And then they should grow better now right well let's put that on there for now um so we got a little sustainable tree farm and let's get rid of this chest and see what else we get just more dirt of course what else would we have got oh we got a sheep i spoke too soon oh no this is gonna turn into a, like a little zoo up here i'm gonna have to you know i'm gonna need a um a little pen actually so i think that's what i'm gonna do let me make some fences so two either side and then put some sticks in the middle there we go so let's keep doing that all right where are we gonna build this Hmm. You know what? Let's build it next to our tree farm. So let's build this a little bit further out, right? And then let's place our fences. So let's make it... Yeah, I think this big would be fine. Right, we need a lot more, actually. But let's all push them to one side. There. Oh, come on. Come over here. You like this oak sapling? Yeah? Yeah, you, you want it? You want it, Mr. Piggy? Just, just come on. Come in this little... Go into your pen. Come on, guys. I need you all in one side now. I can't have you scattered all over my one block. Let's go in here. Come on. In you go. No. This is going to be a long day for these guys. Well, do you know what? Let's just carry on with our journey. Can we make a little bit more? We're going to, we're going to use the birch wood to make some more sticks then. And then we're going to make more fences. All right. So we've got six more fences. So let's just quickly. Right. That's cool. Oh, no. We need um, some fence gates, don't we? Right. Okay. All right. Well, we need more wood. I guess we're just going to have to keep, you know, breaking these for now. Hoping we get more wood. More melon? Oh, they look like a dirt block there. Yay! All right, more birch wood. What are you doing, Mr. Piggy? Go away. So I guess we just keep breaking this for now. Look at him watching me. Look at you. What are you doing? You're way too nosy. Oh, we've got a chicken. Oh my gosh, we need a bigger pen. Let's put this in for now. Let's make some sticks. And then, yeah, we're going to... doesn't look good, though. Do you know what? We're going to make do for now. Even though, yeah, I know, it isn't, you know, it isn't matching, but whatever. All right, whatever. Oh, he's already in his pen. All right, do you know what? Oh, this is going to be hard. No, you had to walk out. Well, come on, chicken. Let's just go on our pen. Come on, it's fun in here. There's lots of things to do. Look, you can look at this beautiful sunset. No, where are you going? Oh, gosh. This is going to take ages, isn't it? Come on, Mr. Chicken. Come on, yeah. Oh, look, it's so cool in here. Look here, Mr. Chicken. Get in there. Get in. There we go. All right, let's lock him in there. And then let's put the cow over here. And let's put you in there. 
Where are you going? Yeah, that's it. Go in here. It's nice in here. It's nice in there, Mr. Cow. Yeah, look at that. You can stay in there. Right, come on, Mr. Sheep. What are you doing? Get out of here. And you, pig, you're stopping my tree from growing. Get off. Get off my tree. There we go. Just go in here. Yes, no, 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 no. You're not going anywhere. There we go. Right, we're getting there. It's just these two piggies. Of course. It's always the pigs. Right, so you can go in there for now. And then let's take this pig and let's put it in the pen as well. No, what are you doing? I knew that would happen. Get in, get in the pen. Come on. Right, you ready? Go in the pen. Go in, go in, go in. Yes, shut that. There we go. I just wedged his face in the um, birch gate. <laughs> oh, there we go. All right, well, at least they're all on one side now. So, you know, they're not running all over the place. And I can risk losing them. So, they're safe now. That's all that matters. But let's keep mining, I guess. Well, breaking our block. More dirt. We've got a stack and a bit of that now. Oh, and another chest. So, let's get more. Oh, let's just break this for now. That's really annoying me. And let's place this on the corner. And then, when we've got enough wood, we can just um, extend out and put more chests there. You get the point, right? And it looks like my tools are about to break. Yep, I guessed it. Come on, we need more wood. Another piggy. All right, come on, pig. Go in here. See, I don't want to open this because he is so eager to get out. Let's line you up with that. Little nudge. There we go. And then get in your pen. Yep, just like that. Reverse in. No, 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 no. Chicken, chicken, chicken. Stop. Oh, no. I think there's too many in there. Is he in? I don't know. I'm just going to keep pushing you. We need these trees to hurry up and grow. Keep breaking the blocks. Oh, another chest. Some eggs. We don't need many eggs now that we have chickens. I guess we can keep that in mind. So, we got more. We got more saplings. Okay, we just need wood. We got a lot of pumpkin and melon though, haven't we? And clay. We've got 45 melon slices. And of course, we have another sheep. Whoa, what, what's going on? Oh, okay, I was about to say that was that was really strange. So let's chop this down then. Normally the tree should fall. I don't know why it isn't. We could have done with the oak tree growing, but whatever. There we go. Maybe it just doesn't work like that for birch trees. All right, well, let's place another oak sapling there for now then. Hello, Mr. Sheep. Just don't mind me. I'm just going to push you over here. Give us more oak logs. Come on. I thought you were supposed to give us a lot. We don't need all this grass, right? Ah, uh, some more birch wood. Seriously? We need oak. Give us oak. There we go. That's what we'd like to see. And another cow. I nearly just fell off the edge there. That was close, but luckily I've got my trusty water source here. Where are you going? Look at him looking at the view. What do you think you're doing up here, huh? Who told you you was allowed on my oak sapling? Well, I guess let's turn these birch logs into birch planks and get placing them in the chest. But we need to extend our farm, whatever this is going on here. But we need to organize them later on as well. You know, put sheep in one, pigs in the other, cows in the other, chickens, etc. So, right, let's go ahead and turn these into oak planks then. Then using the oak planks, let's just extend this, I guess. More oak logs. Yes. Give us more oak logs. Not more clay. Do we need this much clay? I don't think we do. Yay, there we go. That's what we like to see. Right, so let's turn this let's turn these two into more planks then. Um and extend this. Yeah, you know what? Let's just build that out there. Right. Two more chests. That's if they line up perfectly and form a whole chest and not just two separate ones. I think we need to uh, split it up a little bit. There we go. And let's put the crafting bench in this little space between the chests. Oh, I thought it disappeared there for a second. All right, there we go. You like that, Mr. Sheep or Mrs. Sheep? More oak logs. Let's go. Let's keep getting these. Not another sheep. Come on now. The sounds are getting really annoying. Well, I didn't mean to do that, did I? All right, let's break this uh, oak plank. Let's look at the chest. Oh, two pieces of leather. Okay, some wheat seeds. Oh, so then let's take our bucket. Oh, okay. All right, I got an idea. I got an idea. But first of all, we do need more. We need more oak planks. Oh, wait, I don't know why I'm... No, no, actually we don't. I'm literally just talking rubbish. Ignore me. Right, let's take this down. I hope it doesn't drop all the way down. No. Oh, well. Let's hope we can be quick and catch this one. Whoop! There we go. Right, so let's place some dirt around here then. And let's remove this oak plank and make it dirt also. And then let's make a quick wooden hoe like that. And then let's quickly do all of that. And then put some wheat seeds down. And then we get some wheat. There we go. All right. So let's get rid of the chest for now. Some more wood. What are you doing shoulder barging me? Oh, no. I need some wool anyway to... Uh, make a bed so and this sheep is really irritating me oh maybe never mind. where are you going these two sheeps are really annoying me okay well can you not fall please there we go thank you so let's make it like this right oh i got a cool idea i'm gonna build up here then i'm gonna make some stairs and then lead up to like another island that's gonna be cool let's break some more dirt then i don't know why it's giving us so much dirt though like you know it is nice to mix in some other stuff but whatever and not birch you know what? i'm sick of having birch logs 
And another sheep appears. Let's quickly do something. I didn't want to do this, but I'm sorry, Mr. Sheep. I need some more. There we go. White wool. This sheep is... Mm, do you know what? You can live. You can live for now. Just get down. Get down here. There we go. Yep. And then let's make another wooden axe. I feel like we actually need one of those. Like that. There we go. All right. More dirt. All right. Let's go ahead and put all this in here for now. Let's put... Let's keep some dirt, actually. We're going to keep a stack. And then we're going to put some more clay in here. Uh, put our wood in here. Oh, we've got raw mutton. We haven't had any cobblestone yet. I think that'll be like a next phase, right? But anyway, let's just keep breaking this. Can we give us more oak? There we go. Keep giving us more oak. Another chicken. All right. Well, hang on. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to make more. Okay, right. So we're going to we're going to use the birch trees to make us more sticks because we, we don't really need it, to be honest. And then let's just make a couple of more fences. So now what we can do is build it out here for now. So let's get rid of this and this one. Let me just walk in here. Don't mind me, sheep. Just picking up my oak fence. Whoops. There we go. Right. Now it's made a little bit bigger. We can start extending it. Is that a gap? Okay, no. That, that literally looked like a gap there. And then what we can do is we can start extending. Then we can start extending our pen and then making it a bit more, you know, bigger for them. And Because there's going to be a lot more of sheep and cows where that came from. So there we go. That's what we'd like to see. More wood. We don't really want to see more clay though, do we? Mm. Right. So now let's quickly move this back a little bit. Right. Just for now. Okay, we still haven't got enough wood, but... You guys get what I'm trying to do, right? Back to breaking. Collecting these wooden logs is really getting me thinking what I'm going to build next. Ooh, nice potato. Go ahead and stick this in the food chest, if you will. Earthworms, is that... Is that food? I mean... It's the disgusting kind, I guess, but whatever. Right. Come on, Mr. Sheep. You can, uh... You can go over here. Get out, get out of my sight. Come on. Give me something good. I don't want clay. Like, I really don't want clay. I mean, it could come in handy, I suppose, but... I need a lot. And what was that noise? Did someone drop anything what was that an egg yeah all right well thanks for the egg put that in there for now there we go we're starting to get a lot more oak logs now there we go yes oh thank you thank you so much keep it coming oh we got another love chest let's open it up oh we got more apples and saplings and we got a grass block okay let's go ahead and stick that in there for now and then put our apples in here Oh, we need to put our leather in here as well. Oh, I forgot we had more oak fences. All right. Let's go ahead and turn these all into planks for now. And then, if Mr. Sheep moves out my way, I can quickly come through. Yeah, come on, Mr. Sheep. Over there. Right. So then if we extend this a bit more. Wait, let's actually just mine this for now. And then let's quickly make some more... Um, oh, didn't mean to do that. Let's make some more birch planks, sticks. And then let's go ahead and... How many do we need? We don't need many, do we? Let's just make six fences and then let's go back here and where are you going mr chicken it's like you guys just want to fall off this edge don't you you just want to make my life a lot harder let's take this off right oh wait wait wait! no i know what we can do so i was thinking of section it off doing like one cows one pigs one chickens and so on but if i do that i'm gonna have to i'm gonna have a long time just organize it so, you know what? i'm just gonna put them all in the pen for now and then i will sort it on later on you know i can i can filter the pens and what goes in what later on so that's fine for now. Right, so just move up then. Move up in your pen. Come on. Clear some space for the other sheep, guys. Come on, stop being selfish. That was worth the raw chicken. All right, so let's push you over here. And you, Mr. Sheep. Come on, you've got to go as well. You can't stick around forever. And then, if I squeeze these two in here, like that. Right, there we go. How cool's that? We've got a little pen going on here now. And it's quite a big one, too. So, that's good. Let's get rid of the love heart chest. Oh, another upgrade. Another upgrade in 20 seconds. Are you guys excited? Are we all excited over here? Yay. What am I doing? All right. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Boom. I've reached phase 2, the underground. Many a monster room through dark hollows. Right. That isn't scary at all. So this is... Okay, I need to make a pickaxe now. Hello, wooden pickaxe. All right. So let's get mining then. So we're going to get some more cobblestone now. There we go. How cool is that? We can finally make a furnace. Let's craft ourselves a furnace. There we go. And then, let's extend even further out here. And also, put a little furnace. Yeah, I'm going to keep it even, so I'll show you what I'm going to do. I'll show you the plan. Just stick around. I'll show you. So we're going to put another two chests here. And then next to this one here, is going to be where, it's going to be where my furnace lays. Like that. It's like two chests, crafting bench, two chests, furnace. Should we... No. All right. Let's just keep mining. We'll probably get coal next, to be honest. Yep, as I guessed. <laughs> we need some coal to cook our food. And also to make more torches. Because this is going to get pretty dark. And would you look at that? Before I can see, 
two oak trees have grown. That's what we like to see. Let's go. And the sun is rising. It's another happy day on my lovely big plank of wood filled with lots of friendly mobs and a few trees as well. So, oh, and don't forget the wheat. That's going to grow also. Let's go ahead and make this a bit bigger though. Let's um extend this out by one more and then hoe it down like so. And then later on, if we get a bit more water, we can, um, you know, make it even bigger. Let's get back mining. Oh, look at that. So we need to make ourselves a stone axe real quick. There we go. We're upgrading. We're getting there. So we got some iron. Okay. Oh, some more gravel. Do we need gravel, though? What do we need all this for? This is just like rubbish. This has got to be like the most useless block in the game, right? Oh, more trees now. Is a trees even supposed to appear in this phase? I'm not sure. Well, we're not complaining. We're just going to keep getting more stone right now, aren't we? Oh, my gosh. Hello, Mushroom. Um, didn't think you'd appear. Wow. All right. Well, I guess I'm going to put you in the pen as well. You can join your friends. All right. Open these two up. Ah, uh, I know what you're doing, Mr. Sheep. No, 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 no. Go in your pen. You're not escaping out of here. There ah, no, 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 no. Go in your pen. What are you... What are you doing? Get in your pen. There we go. Naughty sheep. Stay in your pen. And don't give me them puppy dog eyes. Right. So we're getting more dirt. Even though I literally thought this was supposed to be the other phase. Maybe it just filters through all the phases at the same time, you know? But, I don't know. But let's keep collecting more dirt. Some more cobblestone. Even more cobblestone. Oh, some oak logs. And we get another moose room. That noise really scares me. And she just catches me off guard every single time. All right, we need to start pushing these mobs over here now, don't we? So let's put this here. Come on. You need to fill it up. Stop, like, you know, coming in one corner. Let's go out of here. We're going to wait till our wheat grows as well so we can feed our friendly friends. Look at this chicken trying to fly out. Stay here. And, oh, would you look at that? My hunger bars are running low. Well, not running low. It's, you know, it's going. But let's cook some chicken. Let's put our coal in here. I'm sure we had a raw piece of mutton, right? That's our food chest, isn't it? Yeah, there we go. Yeah, right. Let's just take that out. Take this and then put our piece of raw mutton in here and let that cook. Mushroom, I thought you was going in your pen. Come on. Let's go in the pen. Keep it moving. There we go. Walk over in this direction. Not in the tree farm. What are you doing? Oh, these damn mobs. Honestly. These mobs. What are they doing? Come on. Oh, we got another egg. Thank you, Mr. Chicken. The chicken's been the most beneficial one so far. Okay, right. Get in here. Oh, no. Come on. Will you just go in here, please? Yes. There we go. Come on. Keep going. Keep going. You're getting pushed out. There we go. We're going to save our chicken. We're just going to wait till the hunger bars go down a little bit more and then we can start eating. You know, it's just it'd be a shame just to waste a whole cooked chicken on just one hunger bar. So I might as well just wait. Oh, another chest. Some feathers. Oh, and some spruce saplings. All right. There's more oak ones as well. Do you know what? Let's quickly extend our tree farm out a little bit more. Right. And then plant this over here. Right, then place oh, place these two on here. Have I got any more oak saplings? I don't think I have, have I? No. Right, and then I'm going to plant all my wooden stuff in one chest. Okay, so this can be all my dirt and rubbish, because, you know. And then in this one, I can put all my wooden stuff in here, so I know where everything is. This one, I suppose, to be like my cobblestone chest. Oh, no, we need that, and put it in this one. Whoa, look at that! Triple. There we go. That's what we like to see. Let's mine this. Ah, it's connected. That's why. I was wondering why it didn't fall. Oh, look. Another one has grown. So maybe if we just chop this down like here. No, will it not work like that? Do I have to chop all the all the oak logs off? I think if I chop this one... Oh, no. Let's go ahead and make ourselves a, another one real quick. Just like that. There we go. And then let's quickly chop this one down. And then all the saplings and the, uh, and the leaves should fall, right? There we go. Yeah. Oh, no. A lot of them fell off the edge. Oh, that's fine. It's not a big deal. Let's go ahead and collect that, though. Let's replace them real quick. Oh, look at them growing now. That's what we like to see. We're getting more oak logs, more oak planks. Let's go. How about we start extending and putting it out, you know, maybe a few blocks more outwards, you know, just so we got more room. Yeah, let's do that, actually. Just like that. Yep. All right, that looks pretty good to me. And then let's... Have we got any more coal? Yeah, we have. Mm, let's make some torches. There we go, four torches. And then let's just place these, like, over here. The last thing we want is any hostile monsters spawning in and, you know, literally ruining us. Let's place these torches over here. And let's place them on my farm like that. That looks pretty cool. All right. Um, right. Let's get back breaking, I guess. Actually, you know what? Like that. 
And let's do it again, just one more outwards. And I think this is going to be the size of our tree farm. There we go, just enough. Alright. Let's place this one here. Oh. There and there. And let's place our saplings on top. And that's our oak one done. So we've got a lot of trees growing there for us. Let's actually get rid of them. I know, guys, stop crying. Don't worry. It's going to get better. I'm going to make you a much better pen. Right, and then let's mine this last tree here. And then we should get a pretty good drop from this. There we go. Come on. Yay. Come to me, saplings. Oh, and a stick. There we go. So then, let's craft... Let's turn all these into planks. So we've got 48 planks. We need to eat now, don't we? Let's eat a chicken. There we go. That is much better. Oh, and look at that. The moon's just about to come out. And then the sun's going down. That's how the world works. Let's extend this out a bit more. Because why not? I mean, I'm probably wasting wood at this point, but anything to make the uh, anything to make the one block look a bit better. Well, let's keep breaking the block. More stone. All right, birch wood. Mm. I mean, not our not our favourite, but we'd take it. But we definitely will take some coal. Whoa! Where did you guys come from? Well, that just completely took me from surprise. Go away! Oh my gosh! Wait, what if a creeper spawns? Oh no! Yeah, I've just. I've just thought about that. What if a literal creeper spawns and just takes us all out? I did not think that one through. Well, let's just be very careful then and stay back a little bit. That would teach me for going too close. Right, we need to be very careful. I'm going to collect our stuff in certain bits. Yep, I knew that would happen. More zombies. Stay away. Stay back. There we go. Let's take our food out of this one and put it into this one. Put the egg in there as well. Feathers. Let's turn these birch logs into planks and then put them in our wood chest. Like that. Right, there we go. Oh, same with these two. Let me just quickly turn these into planks. And then... Have we got any more seeds? I mean, we've got pumpkin seeds, but we don't really... Mm. Do you know what? We're going to take this potato and we're going to plant it here. And we're going to make a little wheat and potato farm and then maybe even add some like... I don't know, we can add something else on the farm as well. Alright, let's remember to stay back because, you know, we've already learned that mobs can literally spawn out of literal nowhere. Oh, some iron! Let's go! How many though? Oh, only one. Oh, I just realised we've got three. Didn't even notice that. Let's put that in here for now. Let's make more of those. Oh, I know what we're going to do with the birch with the birch wood. We're going to turn them into planks and chuck them in there so we can cook some stuff with them. And another chest, some brown mushrooms, feathers... And spruce saplings. Let's go ahead and put all of our saplings in here for now. And then in this one, let's put some more cobblestone in here and all our cave stuff. Let's keep this bucket. Right. Okay, let's keep going then. What is that? What is that? Oh, hello. Um, I'm going to kill you because I need your food. Oh, we need to eat. Um, let's go and, uh, yeah, let's eat some cooked mutton. Nom, 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 nom. That was very yummy. All right, well, let's keep mining then. Some more dirt. Don't really need that. Even more wood. There we go. That's what we like to see. Oh, and some more iron. That's good. See how our iron's getting on. Yeah. All right. So we've got three iron at the moment. Let's put another one in there. We've got four. Well, it's looking pretty good, actually. That scares me so much. I just have a... Well, I guess I knew where the other one went. Wait, where did... Where's the other one? Why do they keep falling? Did the other one fall as well? What is it doing? Well, goodbye, rabbits. Right, so let's put our dirt blocks in here. Right, turn these into more oak planks. And then, let's go ahead and put our dirt and stuff. Oh, no, actually. This chest. Put our dirt and gravel and... Uh, it's this chest we need to put this in. Go away, earthworms. We don't need you. Whoa. What is that? I don't want to open it. Oh. Oh. Okay, that looked really scary, but it's a variety chest, so... Some apple, coal, seeds, saplings. Thank you, um... Variety chest. Let's take that one, put it in here, and then let's take the other one while it cooks, and I'm going to put it in that chest also, just like so. And then let's put it in this chest. So I carried on the rest of the night, just breaking my one block, hoping to get more wood so I could craft more wooden planks. I'm thinking of building another level upwards so that I can build my main house on its own land. To build this, I was going to need quite a bit of wood, so with a bit of hard work and the company of my small companions, I managed to grab quite a bit. So if you probably couldn't tell, me and Mr. Piggy here have actually been at the grind and we've managed to get ourselves four stacks of wooden planks also 22 oak planks as well and i realize we have nine oak logs so let's quickly turn those into planks so almost five stacks so i've just been sat here really you know farming my trees and just you know breaking some blocks and it's gone pretty well so far so how about then we craft ourselves a little stone axe 
and then let's use this to our advantage real quick and chop the remaining trees down. And I've just realised all of those have literally just fell into the void. Well, don't I feel silly. Alright, well, let's just try and at least pick them up while we can. Oh, some saplings drop as well. Cool, cool. So let's go ahead and quickly place those saplings back down. As I've been doing, because every time I just chop a tree down, it drops saplings anyway. So I tend to just literally pick them back up and quickly replant them so they grow a lot faster. And I haven't got to really worry about them. All right, so all we got to do now is quickly chop this one down. All right, there we go. Drop some saplings. Nice, nice. Oh, and a stick. Thank you. All right, so let's quickly chop this one down as well. Fall down for me. Oh, look at that. Some nice apples there. Oh, and some sticks. How many? Look, okay, yeah, we've actually got three sticks from that, so that's pretty cool. Let's keep going now, then. There we go. Come on. Drop some saplings, maybe. No. Oh, well. We've got enough fella at the moment, anyway. Oh, there's two here. So, let's go ahead and plant these back down, then. So they can grow nice big trees for us. All right. Oh, and there's one here. So, I'm trying to get Mr. Piggy here back in his, um, well, it's not really his. It's kind of like a communal barn, but why aren't you going in there, Mr. Piggy? Every time I try and, you know, push him in, he's just, look, he just... He resists. He doesn't want to go in there. Go, your friends. Look, they're waiting for you. I'm sorry, Mr. Piggy, but I feel like it's time to get rid of you. So, I'm sorry about this. Then again, we got two raw pork chops. So, realistically, that might have been a bit of a good idea. So, how about we pop these in the furnace then? Uh, let those cook. Well, I'll tell you what we do. We turn these oak logs into planks. Oh, look at that. We've got quite a lot. So, how about then? Uh, we don't need a spade for now. So, how about we put that there? And then, let's quickly take our cooked pork chop chock let's take our cooked pork chop out and then quickly put it in our in our chest so the food's building up we got two cooked rabbit 11 melon slices 11 apples six eggs and also a stack over here as well but and we got some seeds so we could plant these but i think we're gonna do it when we um you know extend up here so how about then we start off really just crafting some stairs right maybe make it what is this there's a block behind this so one two three four five six seven eight nine so how about then we craft steps like this craft some steps upwards maybe i don't know like four blocks high right so we need to make quite a few just to have them so how about 16 now nah, let's craft more than that uh let's craft about i don't know maybe 32 yeah that'll do so half a stack right so so like from here right being careful not to fall off now and then do you know what i think three is more than enough so how about we just do three yeah i think we just do three come on no damn it i hate when that happens i really needed that get rid of this i know i'm not gonna get it but whatever oh no i did i lied right so i think that looks too much I think two is actually more than enough. What do you guys think? Yeah, I think two is more than enough. I think it looks too silly. It looks too high, you know? So let's just save these three, right? And then let's start expanding out like so. Yeah, mm, yeah, all right, whatever. We'll just keep it like this for now. So now let's just start extending out. And while we extend out, I'm trying to think what to actually build on here first. Because obviously I need to build like a little starter house and a bed just to, you know, get through these dangerous nights. But I also need to build a really nice base so we can really survive out here and in comfort also. But let's keep extending. Let's extend out here for now. So I'm just trying to vision where I'm going to put what. Hmm. While I leave that there for now, how about we go chop this tree down real quick. Collect that wood. There we go. Come on. Fall down. Look at that. Come to me, saplings. That's what we like to see. Right, let's get that one down. Boop. So, it looks like we need to actually eat something. You know what? We're going to eat an apple because it's very nutritious and it will get us through this night. So, let's go ahead and put this back then. And then go into our wooden chest and quickly deposit our saplings in here so they're all together. And then, uh, what else can we do? Oh, we actually have three coal, so we can go ahead and put this in here. And while we do that, why don't we break a few more blocks and see what we get? Okay, good. Some, some more oak logs. Nice. Oh, a chest. Oh, look at that. More wheat seeds. So how about then? Oh, and a sapling. So how about then we quickly plant these down? Just like that. The wheat's growing as well. So that's a good sign. But let's get rid of this chest and hope to get something else. Because I really want to see another phase. I don't know why. Because that could be a bad thing. I could get like, I could start getting like all creepers and stuff, you know. Could be dangerous out here. But anyway, let's keep mining then. Oh, another pig. He's come back. Mr. Piggy's come back. Right, come on then. How about you get in there? Because the last one just refused to get in his pen. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, seriously. You was coming oh. out as well. Go in your pen. Come on now. It's getting dark. Go to sleep. Back up. Back up, buster. That's right. You go in there. Look, look at this. Now he's just disrespecting me, standing on my nice sapling. All right, so how about, Mr. Piggy, you get off of my sapling. Oh, I'll take the egg, though. How about you take this egg? Oh, nearly had you. Nearly had you. Do you know what? You're, get, you're really getting on my nerves, so I'm going to kill you. There we go. And I'll take them two raw pork chops. How about that? 
Oh, another chest. Right, come on. Please have something good in here. Oak saplings? I'm curious. Do you get diamond drops then? Hmm. Well, I guess we'll have to find out. Our pork chops should be done. Yep. Cool, cool. We've got four iron as well. I'm thinking, not now, but I think we can craft a pickaxe later because the blocks we need to break, we're not really required a um, iron pickaxe right now. So let's just keep the one we've got. Our stone one's really getting us through it, so we're not complaining right now. I'll tell you what I'm going to do as well, just to clear up some space. I'm going to put some, well, I say some, all of my um, oak logs in here and oak planks. I'm going to keep some oak logs, so I might need them. We've got seven chests. Sorry, I mean six. My maths is not mathing today. Right, another chest. Come on, please. Another bucket of water. That's quite handy then. How about then we put it in... Hmm, maybe this chest over here. Let's put... Where's our wood? There we go. Let's put that in there for now. I wonder how long the phases last. Ooh. What's this one? Oh, thank you, Mr. Villager Voice. Um, <laughs> thank you for the torch as well. Actually, what I can do with this, I can put it up here for now. Give that a bit of light, right? And let's keep going. Oh! Oh, yes, there's another phase. All right, let's go. I wonder what it is this time. I'm going to stand way back, though, just in case anything, you know, spawns out. But let's have a look. What is it? Oh, just a dirt block. Well, that was disappointing, but let's not get too comfortable because something might pop up, and I'm very scared. Well, lots of dirt, that's for sure. Something's going to catch me by surprise. I know it. Something's waiting just to pop out. I can feel it. And my shovel's broken. Oh, another Mr. Piggy. What is wrong with you? You keep coming back, but you just don't want to get in your pen. Go, no! Oh! Right, let's uh, quickly craft some shears then. Right, just like that. Right, let's take your wall. Oh, let's take yours. And let's also take yours. Right, so you guys are all hairless now, so I hope you are happy. But I know I'm happy because I'm about to craft myself a nice little bed. Oh, there we go. Nice white bed. Look at that. How about, how about that, Mr. Piggy? So how about we take some more oak planks then? And then let's build a little hut. This is what our hut's going to look like for now. Boing, boing, boing. How about we put a new lid over our hut? Look at that. Look at this masterpiece. And then all we have to do, build that. What's Mr. Piggy trying to do? Get in our, get in our bed. Get in there. There we go. Right, we've got a pet. No. Right, so Mr. Piggy has just completely stolen my new home. Yeah, don't, don't give me that look. There we go. We can, uh, we might keep you actually. We're going to name you Mr. Piggy. You can stay. You can be our little pet. Oh, no. All right. Thank you. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on now, Mr. Piggy. I don't think he'll actually fall out of there, though. So I think Mr. Piggy shall be okay. We've built a little hut for now. That would get us through this night. How about we use up the rest of these oak planks, then? Come out a bit more. Come out to here. And just build out as far as we can. We're making progress. Uh, we've built the extra land up here um, to put our new home on. Obviously, this isn't going to be our final result. Don't worry about that. But it will do for now. It'll get us through the night. We've got a bed in there now, so that's cool. I think we should just carry on breaking these blocks. What do you think, Mr. Mushroom? There you go. I just shaved you. Hopefully, that teaches you a lesson. All right, now get, get back in there. There we go. There you go. See, I'm smarter than you, Mr. Cow. Quickly mine these. Right, there we go. Oh, some apples dropped. I'll take that. And then final one. Let's get rid of it. There we go. Look at that. Look at all of these saplings fall. Come to me. How about we extend a little bit so just in case any saplings do fall or sticks or whatever it is, apples, they don't fall off the edge. I think that would be a much better idea. And how did he get out? What are you doing? Like, you're always sneaking around, aren't you? You're always sneaking around. Well, I'll let you off. You're probably just soaking up some sun. I'll let you off for now. Let's get through this other phase then. See what it brings us. It could bring us some joy. It could bring us some fear. I guess we're about to find out. But let's keep going though anyways. Um, seems to be we're getting a lot of dirt here. Some pumpkins. Not bad. Really? Another cow? Another chest? Come on. Come on. More apples and eggs? Mm, I mean, not the not the best, but not the worst, that's for sure. Mr. Sheep! Do you know what? I'm going to take your wall. How about we take some wheat, and now we can guide these two in their pen. Maybe that would be the better idea, wouldn't it? In you come, in you come. No, 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 no. What are you guys doing? Come on. Come on. Come in. Don't be shy. Let's go. <laughs> Whoop, there we go. It's always the pigs. Always the pigs. Come, come on now, Mr. Piggy. You can't just go in front of me while I'm breaking blocks. Well, hello, Mr. Chicken. Come on, come in. Come in. Ugh, don't you try escape. I know what you was up to. Go away. But how about we take a break for all this mining? How about we go back to our hut, sleep through this night, and wake up in the morning and do it in the sunshine? Ugh. That's much better. We're out. The sun is shining. The pig's still out here soaking up sun from all different ways. And it's another new day. So I think today I'd like to make a better start on my house. So I 
think we should get rid of this absolute disaster and start building our new one. So to achieve this, we're going to have to mine some more oak logs and turn them into oak planks so we've got quite a lot of wood and we can get started. So from last night as well, I managed to obtain quite a few oak planks. I've also got uh, 23 oak logs here, but if I put these in, I've nearly got a stack of oak logs. So, And I've realised we've also got four oak planks. That's a good start. But there's also maybe like two or three trees here. Yep, there's three trees here as well that haven't been taken care of. So by the time we mine all these and craft all of our planks, I think we'll have quite a few. Let's get started. So I began collecting resources. I was going to need quite a lot of wood, so I grabbed my trusty stone axe and got chopping. Then it was time to get rid of my bed and break the remaining pieces of planks so I could make a stable bridge. And while I was at it, I thought it'd be a good idea to extend a little on my tiny farm. It was time to start building the outline of the base. With just a little time and patience, I had it done. Furthermore, I filled the gaps in on my base. I started my build laying the piers down and then began raising them. And I thought it might be nice just to add some cobblestone walls for detail. Alright, and place these stairs here. Doesn't look too bad. And oh, these stairs doesn't really these don't line up properly. So how about we get rid of these real quick? And then let's just quickly place these upside down so they look pretty good. And look at that. Look how much better that looks already. Alrighty, then let's go around this side and do the exact same. So let's quickly build up and right, let me place that there. Then place that oak stairs just there. And then one next to it. And then I gotta repeat the same thing but down. And how about we break this block here and then replace it with oak stairs? And then if we come down, we can place these two for now and then place the oak stairs just in front of it and then break it from behind and then do the exact same. So just place them upside and we're stuck. Well, that was silly of me. So let me quickly just mine that. And then from this angle, we should be able to. There we go. All right. So that looks pretty good. And then let's just do the same at the bottom. Um, let's place that stair there. Break that real quick. All right. That looks good. Let's move on to the other side. All right. So let's build up like usual. All right. Let's place that then one next to it again. Chop this down real quick because it is just an absolute obstruction. And then how about we place these two down here and then do the same thing underneath. There we go. All right, that looks good. Let's start filling this roof real quick. And beforehand, I just thought it would look cool decorating the pillars with a few trapdoors. I just like the idea of it. And also, i am just placing some torches underneath just to give it some lighting. So just keep placing it around here. And just like that, Mr. Piggy, we filled the roof in. So I pretty much just carried the rest of the work out by building another floor above the roof. Then I began raising the pillars. I added oak stairs above the entries purely because it looks cool, but I just thought it looked right. I added one more layer on top and raised more pillars. The resources were getting low, so just to make sure I didn't run out, I chopped my oak trees down. So I've built the frame for my roof, and now I just need to add some oak stairs to the edges to give it a nice clean finish. That looks good, so now I'll just add that one there and one next to it, and then on the end, and let me just build round real quick. Alright, place one there, then one next to it, and the same again, let me just extend out a little bit. And now just two there, one next to it, and so on. I added some oak fences connecting to both cobblestone walls just for a final touch. Now the main things are done and out of the way, I've just got to craft myself some ladders quick to place inside of my home so we can go up and down each level. Walking over my beautiful bridge back to my home, I'm just going to place these ladders both sides now. So if I place it left here and then just here, I can start placing it up now. And look, I can actually finally get up here. So this is where my bed's going to go, by the way. So this is like my bedroom kind of thing. And we can also go down now. We've got two more, though. So this is going to be a bit of an issue, isn't it? But how about we just quickly craft ourselves a nice crafting table, quickly put that down, and then craft some ladders. That should be enough. So let's just quickly pop those down like that. And let's go back up. And yeah. That'll, uh, that, that will do it, actually. Looks pretty good. Ooh, look how nice it's starting to look now. But, hang on a second. Piggy, what are you doing hiding behind there? Huh? And, oh, just... Don't just jump on my crafting table like that. Come on now. But how about we restore those hunger bars? And it's also getting kind of hot out here as well, I noticed. I've got an idea to put some leaves around the build. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my shears and quickly just take all these leaves off so I can place them all around my build. Oh, now that's out the way. How about we place them down now? Okay, so let's start just by filling in the edges with some cobblestone. So this bit isn't really that tricky. There we go. Just follow it around. And pretty much I just got to do this all the way around. I think it's safe to say as well that I got enough leaves for this as well because I've got quite a bit there, haven't I? Right, so then just connect this up around the back. Oh, 
didn't mean to do that. Almost finished now with the edging, and I've run out of cobblestone. Well, this is great, isn't it? But in the meantime, how about we just do the oak leaves anyway? And then later on, we can think about filling in the rest of it. I'm sure it's only a couple blocks anyway, so it's not the end of the world. But I'm going to place these oak leaves two blocks high to give a nice little look. And I'm just pretty much going to do this all the way around. And how about that? It looks pretty good to me. I like it. It gives it a bit of character. All right, so it's pretty much done for the house so let me just show you around real quick so here's our nice bridge we got looks pretty cool i got a bit of cobblestone on the edge followed up with that as well and then just mainly just oak logs oak stairs and i did not mean to break that oh it's there there we go so yeah like i was saying it's just a little bridge that leads from this island to that one and if we just go up here real quick i'll show you around so we've just filled up with some oak logs and some fences put that around and like i was doing with the cobblestone around the edging and the leaves um i actually ran out so it's not a big deal though because when we mine more of them blocks over there it should drop us more cobblestone so we'll just replace it later on but anyway so a little side entrance here so it's four ways it's left right front and back so if you walk in here i put some fences here i don't know i just like the detail i think it looks really nice so i'm down here as well more here got some like little poles here i think they look pretty cool but if we go in here and go up this is where our bed's going to be placed we're going to put some barrels up here or chests put a little crafting table and a little furnace up here and then if we just go down here on this bottom floor, we've already put a crafting table and a furnace in here. But down here, I think it's going to be, you know, maybe the utility section. Mr. Piggy. I mean, I didn't say make yourself at home, but sure. I mean, just, just go for it. So I guess he's living with us now, which is all right for some. But yeah, like I say, put some torches in here. Light it up a little bit. I might stick some more here because uh, it's a bit dark over here. But put some more torches over this area. And yeah, so that's pretty much it. It's just clean. It's basic, but it's nice. It's just what I need. So you're probably wondering, Scoops, why have you left each side open? Well, let me tell you. So on this side, I'm going to build a mob farm, which is going to help me enchant my tools to get them to the maximum potential. And then over this side, I think I'm going to put just like a wheat farm, a potato farm. And then on the right side, I'm going to move all my lovely animals over there to here and then keep them all over here so they're all in one place. Or I could just make like a little enchantment room on this side. I don't know, but we'll figure it out. But that's the plan anyways. But let's take our bed from the chest. Uh, have we got anything else? Oh, we've got more wood in here. I'm going to take these chests. And also, I left these blank because i haven't got any glass yet so i'm planning to put some glass in here which i haven't got yet so but i will do it all right so let's put our bed here how about we put two little chests this side maybe a couple up here and let's go to sleep there we go it's another beautiful morning and look at that we got a little view outside our bedroom window how nice is that and on this side we can also check how our animals are getting on and was that was that pig already out I think he was, wasn't he? Oh, well, and I can see a lot of oak trees that have grown here as well. So I'm going to take those down. Oh, look, he can actually get out here. Let's try and push him back because we want to avoid that, don't we, Mr. Piggy? All right, so let's head back up top. Well, I say top, middle section, whatever you want to call it. And then let's get mining our block. Before we do mine that block, though, let's just quickly mine these oak trees because there is quite a lot here. No saplings dropped from that? No? Okay. Oh, no. All right, we need to craft another axe. Oh, no, actually, we haven't got any cobblestone, have we? No, we've only got cobblestone walls. Right, well, I guess it's time to break the block then. <laughs> oh, of course we get wood now, right? To speed up the process, I will quickly craft myself a uh, wooden axe. I know it's not a lot. It will have to do for now, all right? Oh, put too many in there. There we go. Little wooden axe. It's, it will have to do just for now, okay? Oh, another chest. Come on. Oh, three apples. I mean, we take it, but... Not the best. We're storing our food chest here. But yeah, that's another chest to add to the collection. We've got quite a lot of those, haven't we? Hey, pig. How are you doing? And looking over our wheat, look how much that's grown as well. Let's take our wheat up real quick. So we can allow more to grow. All right. There we go. And let's plant them back down. I wonder when the next phase is going to be as well, by the way. More apples, saplings. Um, that can go straight in the chest. Why don't we just put the wheat and seeds in here as well? Why not? Come on, I want another phase now, don't you guys? I'm just... It's boring mining dirt and wood, basically, when I've already got a sustainable tree farm over here. Another bucket of water. Not bad. We'll just go ahead and stick that in our chest. Ooh, okay. What's in this one, then? Some more wood and torches. I mean, not too bad. I guess we can't complain, can we? Ah, finally. Let's go. Let's go, Mr. Piggy. Come on. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Come on, we'll begin. Okay, hang on. Let's have a look. Oh, hello, cow. Go in your pen. Quickly shut the door. There we go. Let's eat our cooked pork chops real quick. We need some cobblestone, like really bad. 
I said cobblestone, not a sheep. One second, let me just grab my oak saplings and then plant them where I chop the others down. I'm waiting for that one creeper just to spawn in and ruin me. I'm I'm just waiting for it. Come on then. Um, let's go in this one. Come on. There we go. I mean, I'm not surprised. Wow, okay. We have quite a few out here, don't we? <laughs> some more seeds, some leather. Okay. Oh my gosh, how many pigs are on this little plank of wood? Move out of the way, pig. Why are you walking towards my block? Go away. This is my magical block. No one steps foot on here apart from me. Why are you staring at me, chicken? Huh? Well, I'm certainly not in the need for any oak logs anytime soon. Ooh, a grass block. Not bad. Whoa, finally. Oh, no, no, no. Zombie, now is not the time. Ten, nine, eight. Mr. Piggy, take yourself. It might be something cool. I don't know. All right, here we go. Boom. Yay, there we go. Some more cobblestone. This is what we need. Let's go. Do you know what? I actually think this right here is just enough to finish off this section. So let me grab my oak leaves real quick. And then if we head back up top, this should be enough to finish it. Oh, we just did it. We just did it. All right, so let's quickly add these on top then. There we go. Now look at that. How much better does that look? Finally, though, it was about time we got some more cobblestone around here. We're going to need quite a lot of this. Oh, and some coal. Nice, nice. Maybe some diamonds. Oh, some iron. And literally, as I say that. Right, let's craft ourselves a nice cobblestone pickaxe. Let's put our coal in here and put the raw iron in there as well. Let that cook up for a second. Yes, more iron. I like to see it. I love to see it. Yes, let's go. Now we can actually craft ourselves an iron pick. I like this phase. It's like we're going mining, but we're just mining one block and getting all these resources. We'll start leading them over here and quickly guide them back this way. Oh my gosh. That could have been very, very very bad i'm so thankful for this thank you so much waterfall wow that could have gone so bad my heart dude well after having the absolute panic of my whole entire minecraft experience um i'm going to continue mining yeah how about we start giving some of these wheat there we go oh look at that we got a baby cow look oh i still can't believe that waterfall literally saved us and by the way i was so close to like the end of it as well with the cobblestone we've gathered i think it might be a good idea to go ahead and craft ourselves a little uh stone axe because the wooden one isn't going to cut it out oh wrong one there we go <laughs> nearly crafted ourselves another stone axe there, uh pickaxe there but whatever we've got a lot of oak trees here so what if we just quickly break these just so we know kind of where we're at with it and then what we're going to do is we're going to chop them all down and then replace all the saplings on top so then obviously they grow back because it is just a waste of wood just leaving these here so well i didn't mean to do that why was the sheep so weak though that was a sheep wasn't it yeah i think it was yeah why was the sheep so weak drop me some saplings there we go there's a few over here that i didn't even notice what about over here a little log not bad oh and here so yeah i think when we get more cobblestone we're gonna start building our mob spawn which will look pretty cool over there actually i can't wait to start building that all right so it's just these three last trees here oh there we go that's what we like to see. Drop us some more saplings. And a few apples, maybe a few sticks. Yep. Uh, what about over here? Some over here as well. Oh, there's a stick over here. How did it get all the way over here? Sorry, Mr. Cow, but I'm going to have to politely ask you to quickly step off that dirt block. Or I might just push you off. There we go. If we need some planks, we just craft it into planks. Because, you know, we might actually need the oak logs. Hopefully, in the meantime, they grow. Let's head back to our little house up here. And how about we store some items? Actually, we need to place a torch up here, don't we? Maybe when we craft some lanterns, we can start, you know, hanging them from down there. that look pretty cool. Let's put that up there for now. Because, you know, it gives a little bit of uh, ambient lighting. Regardless, let's keep breaking these blocks. Another chest. Two other saplings. We'll take it for a minute. Another pig. All right. Surprise, surprise. We need more iron. Talking about iron, have we... Uh... Yeah, I thought we left it in here. Let's go and make ourselves an iron pickaxe because we do need that. In the meantime, let's put our dirt and stuff we don't really need in here for a moment. Also, if you are new around here and you want to make Mr. Piggy really happy, I'd really appreciate if you guys could smash that subscribe button. It means the absolute world to me and it really helps me and the channel out. And if you're enjoying the video, why not give it a like while you're at it? Oh, hello, chest. Come on. Bucket of water again. Not too bad. We've got quite a few buckets of water now. So that's kind of cool to stack up on, to be honest. You can never get too much of it. Because, I mean, where else are you going around here for some water? I'm just waiting for that new phase. Oh, hello, Mr. Villager Chest. Got a little torch, though. Do you know what? With this little torch, we're going to go and place it up the top here. What do you think? Mm, yeah, let's place it up here. Let's just place one opposite. So, like, there we go. Here we go. New phase, new phase, Mushroom. Let's go. Come on. Five, four, three, two, one. 
Ooh, we're stone this time for a change. Maybe some diamonds on this one. Who knows? I guess we'll have to wait and see. Imagine if we actually get diamonds on this one. That'd be crazy. We'll collect our first diamond on the one block series. Man, what is with these mobs? You'll deserve a little smack. It's like a wild zoo around here. Oh, some carrots. Finally, now we can attract some pigs. Oh, and there's two iron in here as well. I didn't even notice that. And another bed. Let's quickly place our other bed next to our other one. So we got a little double bed setup going on now. There we go. Look at that. And we might as well have just gone to sleep because, you know, how can you resist this nice, comfy, king-size bed? I need some sand, though, to start filling these uh, those windows, start filling the gaps. Well, I'm pleased we have a carrot now because we was getting way too many pigs. And we have a sheep. In you come. In you come. What? Well, he was crowd surfing for a minute there. So with a little bit of grinding, we managed to grab ourselves over two stacks of cobblestone. And I'm pretty sure in this chest over here, we have quite a few as well. Okay, yes, yeah, so we have 21 in here. So that's good. So we've, you know, built up on the cobblestone now, which is good. Obviously, we need quite a few more materials. But I think we should start heading towards building our, our mob spawn. So, okay, yeah. So let's get rid of these ones then. Right, so one, two, three, four, eight nine and then same the other side so one two three four five six nine yep okay and now let's go and grab some oak logs i mean oak planks and then place them in between 54 should be enough for now there we go all right now let's get some fences up 15 that should do the trick actually that's probably not going to be enough no we're literally one two three short we've got quite a lot of wood so it shouldn't be a problem just like that six fences even though we need three but hey we've always got extra we're going to need it anyways but there you go all right so we extended them out left and right side so let's go have a look at what we've done um i only just extended it i think it 11 blocks outwards or 12 i think 12 including the end there but it, we've uh we've extended it in total 12 blocks outwards i think it looks cool personally we've got to do the same with the back side which we haven't done i just thought we'd I, you know i'd get the left and right side done i think we should start extending out this side let's go and grab some oak planks and then let's go extend it all right 38 should be okay oh we need some cobblestone so we just grabbed a stack there um it's more than enough but i'd rather have more than enough than not enough you know you know what i'm saying all right so two three four bring this out and then right side with the cobblestone yep being careful not to fall off now because I already made that mistake, but luckily, my trusty water source helped me. So thank you, water source. Let's go and grab some oak fences now. All right, 21 fences should be enough, hopefully. <laughs> All right, here we go then. Oh, and I haven't even got an axe. And just like last time, we've gone ahead and crafted ourselves six oak fences. There we go. Now it's time to build the circles. So I've just built the outline for the circle, and to be fair, it looks pretty cool and symmetrical. So all I'm going to do here now is just basically fill it in. So this side is going to be my mob farm, um, and then the other side is going to be just like a um, an animal farm, I think, or even like a, maybe a potato wheat farm. I'm not sure yet, but I'll work it all out. And just like that, it's all been filled in. Look how much space we have on here now. Look at that. How cool is this? Right then, so now all we're going to do is we're going to go around the edges and just put some cobblestone in for the leaves to go on top. We've only got two pieces of iron, but we do need to set a shears for more oak leaves. So what we're going to do is we're going to quickly just craft one. And then take all of our leaves here. Why not snip some sheep while we're at it? Now let's continue breaking some more oak leaves. And without that being said, let's uh, play some oak leaves. And that looks pretty good to me. Um, I like it, honestly. Let's stand back here, see if we can get a bit of a better view. Oh, yeah, look at that. Right, let's build up, actually. Let's uh, take a little quick sneak peek. Oh, yeah, that looks cool. I like that. I think around it, we should maybe put some torches as well. We're definitely going to put some torches on the fences uh, just to give it some lighting. But I like it. Honestly, I like it a lot. Uh, if we do the same the other side and behind, it's going to look pretty cool, guys. But while we're at it, why don't we just chop these remaining oak trees down? It would be pretty cool, like, when the trees are all chopped down, and instead of like saplings and sticks dropping but let like oak leaves drop as well that'd be pretty cool wouldn't it oh, look there's actually some over here that i haven't picked up yet go away pig you're always like bothering me always on my case i'll take it all right let's plant these saplings down then we've got a lot more on our chest so let's go and grab some real quick look at that 42 quite a lot to be honest how about we eat our melon slices and also while we're at it we might as well just quickly harvest these real quick there we go how about we plant our wheat seeds back down i mean three potatoes we can 
place them three back down and then i think the rest we should just pull on plant wheat seeds right then how about we build the other circle this side all right so let's go and grab some oak planks and actually before we do let's go to sleep ah there we go and oh my gosh look at the mobs that i just oh no i forgot to place torches oh look at them creepers and spiders though now thinking about it i think i'm going to go craft myself a stone sword so let me just do that real quick <laughs> let's craft that sword so let's not try and die here and i mean talk about creeper overload oh my gosh stay back creeper oh no 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 oh ah! i don't like this there we go. Okay. Oh my. Okay, there's only one more creeper, to be fair. Oh, no, no, no. That could have been bad. Did I get him? Yay. I've got the creeper. All right, come on then, Spidey. I'm not scared of you. Right, let's place some torches up in here real quick. Right, hopefully, we shouldn't get any more sort of uh, hostile monsters in our space of uh, space of land here. So, But let's get back to what I was actually about to do. Right, so now hopefully no creepers will, uh, you know, potentially come up behind us and ruin our game. Um, let's quickly build our circle. One, two, three. There we go. Right, so now I think we have a symmetrical circle, right? So let's just get it filled in. Let's try and not fall down because I've got such a fear about that, honestly. Making sure I'm crouching while I'm placing these planks. Just got this last little section to do. What isn't my concern at the moment is it's getting diamonds, I think, and some iron. <laughs> I'm interested to see when we start pulling in those, you know. We've already got a couple, couple of raw iron, but we're yet to discover diamonds, so... Right, there we go, and I've just misplaced two by accident, but it doesn't matter because we've done it again. Another circle down, one more to go. Well, actually, I need to place cobblestone around this. Right, so we just got a little bit left around here. Right, now look at that. Oh my gosh, this is going to look so cool when it's all done. All right, we need more oak leaves. Let's go and collect those. Just so we can get a rough idea of what it will look like, even though we kind of do, but I just want to see it all together. I think it's going to look so cool. How about that then? So we just need a few more leaves just to cover the rest of the area. But it's not an issue. I mean, we can just try and get more iron, make some more shears, and then collect some more oak leaves. But yeah, it's starting to look pretty, pretty cool. So above the one block, I actually added like a little cobblestone hut and some fences just in case any like hostile mobs spawned in. So all I've done is I've just took away three blocks here, um, just like a little three by three. And um, so if any mobs just fall here, I can sort of just like push them into the void. So that's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, I've just done it purely just for safety to be honest and i think it looks decent i've also extended this a little bit and put some more fences around here so the animals can sort of you know have more room to play about and then over here all i've done is literally extend maybe like six seven well about seven eight blocks outwards yeah about seven eight blocks outwards just to um you know make it a bit more roomy for us but that's about it i think in the meantime though we're gonna fence this off just in case we accidentally fall off here so let me do that real quick so let's make a few all right there we go 16 that should do the trick and then take some cobblestone and let's build around it all right now all i've got to do is just come around here that doesn't look too bad does it it's like i can just walk in here do some farming harvest some trees around here and then if i need to i can get in uh get in the pen here i don't want no no animals following us screw it go over here and oh hello zombie what are you doing intruding intruding our little island here now i feel like we should go to sleep just in case any mobs come and uh you know harm us but before that could happen we um we slept for another night so let's go down i think we should go over here now and start extending this circle out and you know we've got the three circles going on okay now i've grabbed what i need let's go and head over and do some building five and then one more this end six and then let's build three up and then let's just craft ourselves some more oak planks to fill the gaps in just a little bit left will i have enough two more luckily i had some uh, logs in my inventory but there we go um that's all done now let's just do the edges go around nicely just give it that nice finish oops almost done just got to come around this side and all we have left is just the oak leaves so we've got 14 here so we might as well just use them up real quick that's really going to annoy me but it's fine we're going to grab some more i wonder how it looks now that like all three is um all three circles are built now i bet it looks really cool does it look cool yeah it does i like it but how about we break some more blocks oh hello piggy what are you doing lurking about come on just grab a carrot for you little buddy come through can you see it? Can you see the carrot? There we go. You see the carrot now, don't you? All right, come on then. Come through here. Then what we're going to do for you 
We're going to pop a little block up here. And you're going to... Uh, no? You're not interested? Come on. Regardless, though, we do need more oak leaves. And in order to do so, we need more iron. So let's just get um, breaking this block again. I wonder what phase we're going to get next. Our trees are looking grown again. I'm going to place them down as we go as well. Just in case I forget to plant them later on. We also got another bucket of water early on. Um, breaking the block. We have one in our chest. So that's another one to... Uh, Add to the collection. Look at that. Two, four, five. Five buckets of water. Not too bad. Oh, look. And another two has grown. Plenty of sticks that um, come off those trees. And then it should all fall down like that. And there's a stick on the roof. Can I reach that? Yep. Ah, there we go. We keep getting those chests with the apples and saplings in them. I need some pork chops. So, sorry about this, Mr. Piggy. Did you drop it? Yeah, okay. He dropped us one. That, that's fine. That will do. Thank you. Another apple and sapling. Nothing different. It might be worth just crafting a shovel, honestly. I might just craft two like that. Alright, that's better. Now it just makes it quicker for us to like, mine these blocks. Ooh, another bucket of water. We've got quite a lot of that now, haven't we? Ooh, more oak logs. And a torch. Okay. Ooh, the next phase. Okay, come on. Be a good phase. Don't be a scary one, though, because I don't like the scary ones. Alright, here we go. Oh, um, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, some sweet berries. That's for a change. Don't mind if I just quickly take your chicken. Chicken, don't mind if I take your chicken. What am I talking about? Baby chicken. Oh, sorry about that. Oh, some more eggs. I'm sure we have loads in this chest somewhere. Yeah, look at that. We've got loads. Might actually put some down and get more baby chickens. Because we've got quite a few at the moment. <laughs> look at them. Stay right there. Sorry about that. So I'm pretty much just sitting here farming the one block and cow. I'm gonna have to need you as well. No, 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 no. Oh, no. That was my own fault, to be honest. Push you over here in the safe corner, and then now I hit you, you're all safe. I mean, you dropped us one raw beef and not even any leather, so I'm ashamed. I could do with finding some more iron. Oh, we got leather in the chest anyways. Give us the goods. Come on. Ah, so what's in this chest? Grass block, a couple saplings and apples. We appreciate it, but... Oh! We got another phase. Oh, here we go. Only six more seconds. Way more cobblestone. Let's go. We need some more coal and iron on this one. There we go. Oh, iron. Yep, I like that. I like that. Keep it coming. Keep the cobblestone coming. Oh, mushroom. What are you doing? Let's quickly put you in our pen. Coming in. Yep. Just like so. Alright, let's get that planted down. We might as well just break the wrist. I can't even remember leaving you guys out. I probably did. I'm not sure. But I know why you're looking at me. Because I've got these in my hand. Look at, the, look at them. Look at them. Oh, I'm over here. No, no, no. I'm over here. Now I'm over here. No, wait, wait. Oh, no, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> look at them. They're mad. They're seed mad. Alright, let's continue breaking our block. Oh, no. Alright, come on. Just all squeeze through. Yep, yep, yep. No, 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 no. Why? Come back through. Wow. Hello, zombie. Ah! Didn't expect to see you there, zombie. You think you can sneak up on me, huh? Get down there. Way more iron. Let's go. Oh, hello, you guys. What are you doing there? We've just went ahead and put some raw iron in there. Um, let that cook up for a little bit. Yay, more iron. Oh, let's go. More rabbits. All right. All right, we're getting a bit of iron now. Oh, what's in this chest? Come on. Ah, uh, just your usual. Just the standard, really. Some more rabbits. Seriously, guys. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, uh, uh, okay. <sighs> he just waited for me, didn't he? He literally waited for me. Well, if you're going to just jump off, you might as well just let me have you, you know? Let me have your food. Whoa, that scared me. Ooh, hello, zombie. Oh, there's two zombies. Come through here, come through. I need your XP. I wonder what phase we'll have next. Oh! oh my gosh, I knew this was going to happen. Oh my, my, no, 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 no. I was waiting for the day. Honestly, I was waiting for the day. We can't be caught slacking like that ever again. So in the future, I've got to be very careful next time a creeper spawns. Because I wasn't actually prepared for that one. I wasn't too bad, but honestly, I just wasn't prepared for that at all. Come through, come through. But they both can't fit through the door because they're so eager to come and get me. Come on then, Spidey. <laughs> Why is it so funny when they fall? They don't even move. All right, we got more iron for you, Furnace. We're stacking up on our cobblestone now as well, which is good. Some more leather and string, more feathers. Now, there's no way you can come through here, but, I mean, I don't, I don't want to kill you. Like, I actually... Are you serious? These mobs must be really sick and tired of me, honestly. My pickaxe is literally about to break, so it wouldn't be a bad idea crafting a new one. There we go, that's better. We'll use it up anyways. <gasps> oh my god. 
Do you see how fast that was? Why is he so fast at blowing up, bro? What? Oh my. Why was he so fast? Oh, he didn't even give me a, a chance to even, like, blink. That's what I'm saying, how we got to be careful. So we've got 12 iron ingots now. So we're stacking those up. We made ourselves some more shovels to get through it. Oh, more coal. I'll take that. Let me go and just pop this in the furnace. There we go. All right, we're getting more stuff we actually need now. I've got to be so careful for these creepers, man. Ooh. More coal. Oh, and an empty map. Why is it empty? Well, I mean, it's not anymore, but look how cool that looks on the map. Whoa. Walk down here. I'm just like a tourist around my own island. Look at this. This is cool, though. All right, so I'm thinking of building my um, mob spawn now. Uh, if I head over towards here, I'll show you the plan. So I'm thinking of making a little two by two. Well, yeah, just like two blocks of wood here, like let's say, for example. And then it's going to lead up some ladders. And then I'm going to build a little platform, build the chest, build some hoppers, and then build the big thing at the top. So that's the idea anyways. Um, it help us boost our XP so we can enchant later on. So I think we should try and aim to get it built probably today or tomorrow. I just need two more buckets of water though. I'm thinking obviously because you got to put water inside of it and you got to put like water each side on like the two by twos. I'll show you what I mean later on. You probably already know what I'm on about, but I'll um I'll show you guys later on. Two iron in there. Didn't even realize I had that. Stick that in there. Then we've got 14. We're stacking up now. We are stacking up. How about we cook our rabbit real quick? We might as well. So we've got rabbit hide as well. Let's put that in there. And that's it for now. I'm going to hold some torches in my other hand just for now. We might need it. Like that. Wait, what is in this chest? Oh, egg and wheat. Yeah, let's see if we can get uh, any more cobblestone and stuff, you know, just to help us out with the build. Hello, pig. Don't mind if I just quickly slay you and take your lovely pork chops. Okay, I need he only dropped me one, but whatever. All right, so how about... We've got a lot of uncooked meats in here, so how about... We we take some... Let's take some raw beef. Put that in there for now. Right. Okay, that's cool. Just to stack up on our food sources. I might put some torches in here, actually. I might like... What do you think? Maybe like here? Yeah, I'll leave it like that. There we go. More buckets of water. That's good. We just need one more, really. Oh, lovely. Some more torches and oak logs. Nice. Oh, next phase. Let's go. All right, come on. I wonder what it'll be this time, cow. What do you think? I'm ready, though. Whatever it is, I'm prepared. I'm prepared. Oh... What's going on? This is scary. I don't like it. I don't like it. Why is it doing another countdown? It must be something good. I'm actually really scared. I can't lie. I'm really nervous. I shouldn't be. It's probably like, it's probably literally nothing. It's just probably trolling us, right? Right. Well, we're about to find out. Okay. Honestly, if one creeper spawns in, I am legging it. I will be gone in the complete opposite direction. All right. So we're starting off light with just some more dirt and, you know, and birch logs. Oh, don't do me like that, pig. Stop scaring me. You deserve this. Oh, why are you so strong, though? We might start making a shield, actually, just for protection. Oh, look at that nice cook steak. Right, where is our iron in here? We don't even, we can just breed them cows, honestly. I might just start killing these um these mobs, you know, taking their food. Or oh, I can't even carry any more. What should we drop? Let's drop some clay. Oh, yeah, let me chuck that. Wait, why is it? Ah, uh, because I'm dropping it on the one block. That's probably why. It's fine. We'll leave it on there for now. Why not? Oh, more seeds. Right, hang on. We need to start emptying our stuff. Look how much wood we're stacking up now. This is so good. Imagine how many planks we can craft with all of these logs. So, let's take these wheat seeds out. And then, you know what? We, we might as well just, I don't mean to put that one there. I'm waiting for that creeper. Honestly, I'm prepared for you this time, buddy. Oh, I thought you was a creeper. Stop scaring me. Get in there, actually. Come on, then. Follow me. Follow me, buddy. Right. Can you go away, please? Thank you. Okay, come on, then. There we go. I see you sneaking out, sheep. I see you. Don't think I can't. Right, I say we start building the the mob spawn now. Okay, so if we turn some of these into planks, right? 28. All right, let's see how we get on with that. And then let's start building up. Right, let's start building up. Uh, this is for our ladders. Oh, it's fine. I got a bucket of water. Right, so let's craft some ladders, then. And just to avoid some mobs, we are going to go to sleep. The last thing I want is that creeper to come back and literally destroy us. All right, so... We need to craft ladders, don't we? And we're going to play it crafty. We're going to use some birch wood, right? Right, there we go. We're just going to use these, right, for sticks. Because we I doubt we're even going to need birch wood. Right, so now we can start crafting some ladders. Let's make a lot, actually, just so we got them in our chest. We haven't got to keep making them, you know? 32 ladders might not actually be enough, though. Actually, it could be. It could be. Let's... Let's find out. So, let's place these up top. Is that high enough? Hang on, let's take a look. Yeah, I mean, I can't see why not. Or what do you think? Yeah, I think I think that's high enough. Yeah, okay. That, I, th I think that should be fine. So, now what we're going to do is we're going to build a little platform on top. So let's craft some oak planks. Might need a bit more than that. All right, so let's just make half a stack. Let's build outwards. And then we're going to have to place some chests and hoppers. All right, so maybe like one, two, three... I always don't like risking that water bucket. Honestly, I feel like sometimes, like, I don't know, maybe, like, my Minecraft's just going to lag and <laughs> go terribly wrong. I spent the full day pretty much just breaking my one block, gathering more resources for my mob farm and other builds. I managed to collect more items such as iron, oak logs, cobblestone, coal, water buckets, and much more. All right, so we grabbed our resources that we need, and let's head back over to our mob farm. All right, so I th oh, hello, where did you come from? 
Well, good to see you. Did not expect to see you here today. Hello, llamas. Well, I guess I'll let you roam around for a minute. Unfortunately, I haven't got any emeralds to offer you, but maybe we can make a deal in the future. But anyway, let's get on with our mob farm. So I've built up quite a bit and put some ladders up here so you can get up here. I've also extended this out by four. Um, then I'm going to put my things here with all the chests, and then I'm going to extend right up and build it out of um, cobblestone, maybe. So, yeah. So we need to start by putting both chests down here. So we've already got one chest, but let's go down quick and get the rest. I've realised we've got two raw iron in our hands as well. Let's uh, smelt our two pieces of raw iron in here in the meantime. Oh my gosh, we literally have 56 chests. Well, we won't be, um, I don't even think we'd be needing 56 chests in total, but hey, I'm not complaining. I'd rather have enough than not enough. Oh, and I realise we've got to craft some hoppers as well, so let me place these two chests down here. Why aren't you connecting? Right, there we go. Let me craft some hoppers then. How many hoppers do I need? Four, I think. Right, where's our iron? And then let's craft Let's craft two hoppers. And then like that. Right, there we go. All right, so we've made ourselves four hoppers. So let's go and place them on top. Just like so. And then I'm pretty sure we have to put some cobblestone slabs on top of here. Right, I'll craft a few because, like I say, I'd rather have more than not enough. All right, so then let's go ahead and place these on top. One there, one there. All right, like that. I need to eat some melon slices because my hunger bars are looking pretty low. All right, I need to make some stairs as well. So let me do that. Let's head back up. So now all we got to do is just place two blocks in front of the chests. Then some stairs like so. Come over here. All right, so two here. Followed up with two at the back like that. And then same the other side. Just like so. And I'm going to extend them up like that. So then the mobs can't see me. Um, like that. And then I believe we have to put two trap doors here, don't we? So let's go and craft those. And just to avoid mobs again, we're just going to go to sleep. Right like that. And then let's head back up the top. Place some trap doors just on top. This way the mobs won't be able to see me. Right now we've got to build up about 23 blocks upwards. So let's go to the side. Let's build up. Four... Almost there now, just got to build these other two sections up. Right, like this. Let's get rid of that one there, and also that one. And just like that, we've built up. So now I'm just going to fill these corners in. And then I'm going to get rid of these middle blocks and replace them out for stairs. Like that. got to be so careful right now, because I don't want to let no mobs take my XP. Um, It should be the other way around, so I'm just being very careful. But just like that. Now, I should have took a bucket of water up here, but I didn't. That was really stupid of me, actually. Right, I guess I'll just have to build down and be very careful. We're nearly down, and there we go. Right, let's get some ladders as well, and some water. We're going to take our buckets. Every single bucket we got, we're going to bring it up there. Oh my gosh, look how many buckets we have. All right, let's craft some sticks. Water source here now, just in case we need it. Surrounded him with water, but whatever. All right, so let me place two ladders here and then two ladders there. All right, now I've got to do this on all sides. So it looks like I'll have to make more slabs. Let's go. Okay, one, one, two, three seven same again on this side and lastly and now what we're going to do is we're going to take our cobblestone and build a two blocks high wall like this all around almost done just got this last little section left break this block in the corner oh and we collected it bonus now what we got to do is we got to connect some slabs at the top all right now we just connect this one up to here and then we do the same for the rest of it all right let's hope we don't get any spiders up here <laughs> now the next step is to fill them in So I just placed the slabs each side and then placed a bucket of water on top. So it's now flowing all nicely. And now all i got to do is place a trapdoor each side above each section. So just like this either side. Now we just open them. And then let's just repeat the same on every single side. All right, that's perfect. Now I'm going to place some trapdoors on the top to prevent spiders from spawning. So let me go and craft more trapdoors. And there. And I just got to repeat the same step every single side. Four, four, and two. That's right. All right. So that's it for the trapdoors on this level. All right. Now what we got to do is we got to build three up. So one, two, three. And now we just got to do this all the way around. Just got to fill this last bit in and then we'll be done. And there we go. All right. So we put the walls up and we got to be very careful for any mob spawning. Let's just quickly get up here before anything does spawn. And then all we got to do now is just on top, just fill these layers in with slabs like we've done in these corners. So now all the trapdoors are on the second layer. All I got to do now is just build a two block high wall all around the farm. Oh, this sure is tiring. And honestly, I'd appreciate it so much if you could just drop a like on this video and leave a comment suggesting what video I should try next. From this point onwards, I pretty much just finished filling the roof in with cobblestone slabs. So now, let's jump down and see what it looks like. Let's just build out a little bit so we have more of a chance of landing in the actual water. Oh, that was risky. All right, we made it though. Right, let's collect this water. Where did our little friend go? He must have despawned. I'm not sure. <gasps> oh 
my... I need to place some torches up there. That literally scared the life out of me. What is with these creepers, bro? There we go. All right. Oh, there's already a creeper in there. All right, hang on. We need to... Oh, I think lots of mobs are starting to spawn. This is good. Yeah, listen to them. Oh, my gosh. I mean, this is a good sign, but they're so loud. It's literally stacked. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Look at the XP we're going to get from this. Whoa. This is so satisfying. What do we get in the chests? Oh, okay. This is so cool. Well, at least we know it works. That's for sure. Let's go ahead and place another torch this side. And... I think we're going to sit here for a little bit and let them spawn in. So now we've got our mob farm built. I think it's time to start building our bigger farm. So we're going to go ahead and stick it on the right side, literally just over here. So what we're going to do is we might as well just take up some oak planks and pretty much build out of dirt and then plant our wheat and seeds down. So then we have like a massive farm. So now we're actually going to need all of that dirt that we've collected. So we've collected quite a lot here. So now all we got to do is just strip the wood from the bottom and replace it with dirt blocks. So let's get started. Alrighty then, so I'll show you what I've done so far. So all I've done is literally replace the bottom out with some dirt and make some holes and fill it up with some water. And then all I've got to do now is just craft myself a stone hoe, hoe it all down, and then round the outside of it, I'm going to put like oak slabs around it. I'll show you what I mean in a second, but let me just craft some. Right, let's see how this gets us. I think it should be way more than enough, to be honest. It should be way more than enough, but let's just test it. Take these out and like replace it like this. I think it looks cool. I'm going to do it. So why don't I just take all the wood out first then? I might have to sacrifice a couple of planks, but it's fine. We've got plenty of wood. It's okay. Fill in the bottom like this. See what it looks like so far. Yeah, I like it. I like it. All I've got left is this last corner. So let's just take up the remaining oak planks and then fill them in with the oak slabs. And like that. There we go. It looks pretty cool. And now what we're going to do is we're going to decorate it in the middle. Put some cobblestone walls and some lights on top just for decoration. So let's go ahead and do that then. But how about we get some sleep first just in case we get any mobs spawning here because it is pretty dark. See, like I said... You get the odd mob spawning. Let's go and take them on. It will only be creepers and spiders, so we're not worried about them. Let's go, creepers. You're not going to blow my farm up. Not on my watch, buddy. Good riddance. All right, and oh, would you look at that? Our hunger bars are going down once again. So let's quickly eat some melon slices and let's get decorating our farm. We're also going to gather some wheat seeds and etc. just to plant on there as well. And while we're here, we might as well just take up this wheat. Oh, look at the potatoes. Cool, cool. So how about we make this like a little carrot and potato farm and the rest we can do like wheat over here, yeah? See, I've only got two carrots. So if we plant them, we can grow them. And the rest potato as well. So let's just do that. There we go. I forgot about we already had a stone hoe, so let's use that. Right, let's let that grow, and then let's go and craft some cobblestone walls. All right, 12 should do the trick. So let's head over to our farm and get decorating, I guess. And let's just plant one more over here. And there we go. So that's done. And then how about we start hoeing it down? We might have to craft some more hoes, but whatever. How about we plant some wheat seeds, though, in the meantime? And maybe they might grow a bit quicker as well. Right, there we go. That should do for now. Hopefully we have enough seeds. We might have to go and grab some more seeds, you know. Or just wait for the rest of it to grow and let it give us seeds, you know. Yeah, maybe we might have to just do that. But yeah, it looks pretty cool. Let's check if we have any more seeds. You know what? I don't think we do. So we're just going to have to wait till some wheat grows and then harvest it and let it give us some seeds. But hey, it looks pretty cool. When it's all done though, it looks so nice when it's all grown. Yeah, so I think we're going to take some seeds from this farm over here. So if we just take this wheat up real quick, what's already grew. Thank you, thank you. And I'll take some potatoes as well. And some carrots. Let's go. Alright, so I've got 31 wheat seeds. So now with those seeds, I can go back to my big farm and then and then place them on the empty dirt block. Oh, and if you come over here, look how like grown it is already. It's starting to look really nice. Okay, so let's just place these in line with each other. Yeah, looks good to me. And then let's wait for that to grow. And then we'll come back to even more wheat. When it's all grown, we'll start harvesting it and then replacing it. But let's see how our mob farm's getting on. Um, I already see some creeper's feet, so that's a good sign. Hello, mobs. How are you? Don't mind if I just quickly, you know, get rid of you. Thank you. So if we just stand here then, um, we can just wait for mobs to start falling like that. I missed a skelly here. Oh, he tried shooting me. <gasps> I've got to be careful not to crouch in here because the creepers will be able to see me and they will literally blow it all up. So I've got to be very careful on that. They're just rolling in now. Look how many is coming in. So if we stand here for about a minute, then we're guaranteed a lot of XP. All right, so we've waited here for quite a while. Oh my gosh, look how many mobs there are. Look at that XP though. Oh, that's nice. It's still going. What? 
Oh my gosh. Bro, we're level 30 before we even know it. Look at that. This is a good XP farm. I'm going to sit here for a while, actually. I can hear a witch in here, by the way, but I can't obviously get it because I'm just accidentally going to kill it. But I can hear it in there. As you can hear, it's a little devious laugh. Yeah, that's kind of scary, actually, hitting it. But look at that. Already level 30, though. Oh my gosh. But look at that, they're already level 31. That is crazy. And we've only been sat here for like, what, a minute? Mental. Right, we're going to take our XP and go. Right, let's get back to our one block and get breaking it. We need to go through some more phases. Don't we, Mr. Piggy? Sorry about that. Let's craft more shovels because we need quite a few. They're, they're very handy. They help speed the process up like quite a lot. I'm going to pass through, buddy, and just take you on. Oh, no. oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. It's a magic cow. What? That cow was not going down easy. Right, so we're coming to a new phase now where it's now snowing. So let's see what we can get out of this phase. Look at all these snowballs. Oh, this is different. Oh, look at this. We got some, some spruce log. Okay, nice, nice. It's nice to see a different phase now. It's actually nice to see something something else. Oh, look at this ice. Ah, interesting. I'll click some of this oak logs though because I haven't haven't got any of this. Oh, hello, hello, buddy. How, how are you doing? Well, I guess we got a new little friend on the uh, in the world. Well, I'll let you roam around for now, and let's get back to breaking. Oh, some gold. We're yet to discover this, so that's pretty cool. We've got some raw gold. Oh, oh my! Whoa, whoa, whoa! I need to get out of here. I need to get out of here a minute. Oh my gosh! I was not prepared for that. All that. Scared me. Oh wait, they must have fell. Did they fall? Yeah, they, they must have fell. Well, I wasn't prepared for that, but right, we need to craft ourselves a shield. All right, there we go. We got a nice shield now. So now what we can do is we can go ahead and put this on. And then we got a little bit of protection now. A little chest here. Oh, hang on. We need to empty some stuff real quick. Matter of fact, let's let's quickly make some more chests along here like that. And we can go ahead and just chuck all some random stuff in it. And then we can sort it out later on, but, you know. In this chest, we've got some wheat seeds, some bones, string. I could do a crafting some armor as well. Oh, I'm prepared for you this time. I'm prepared. Come on, come out. I actually want to see what you got to offer us. Wait, what? He's got aimbot. Oh, my. There we go. Come on. Let's go. Don't fall off the edge. Ah, oh, take that. There we go. Get out of here. So we got some new hostile mob spawning in now. Gives us a bit more of a challenge. Look at this stuff. Some ice. Nice. Some more iron. Some more gold. We'll take it. We'll take it. Oh, you scared me. Oh. Oh. Um. What are you? What are you doing? I don't trust you guys. Taking all my loot. What do you think you're doing? Oh, some bone meal. Nice. This can come in pretty handy. Let's put it in this chest. Do you know what I think we're gonna do? We're gonna put all different phases in all different chests. So yeah, I think I think that's a good idea. All right. We'll see how we get on. I'm waiting for that next mob to spawn in. I know it's going to surprise me, and I'm ready. I've got a shield now. I'm prepared. Okay, I mean, you're not too bad. All right, you can roam around. Actually, no, no, you can't. All right, where have you gone? Give me my stuff back. You've got all my... You're taking all my stuff. Where did you... Where did you go? Is that you? Yeah, there you are. Give me my chest. Taking my items. Who do you think you are? Bro, what? What just happened? Uh, okay. Ooh, I don't like you. Get in there. Taking all my items, huh? All right, let's just quickly put all our stuff in there. Um... Let's put, take that raw iron and put it in here. And while we're at it, why don't we craft ourselves a nice chest plate like that. A little helmet. There we go. Now we're starting to look the business. Craft some boots. And then when we've got enough iron, we'll craft ourselves some leggings. All right. Pretty pretty cool. Let's keep breaking these, though. Oh, some more iron. That's what we need. It's perfect. Look at this. Some more bone meal. Some dark oak saplings. Nice. I'm going to shut this gate just in case anyone wants to try and sneak through. Um, hello, Mr. Polar Bear. How are you doing? Some more gold. I mean, there's not a lot we can do with this gold. I mean, there is if you wanted to, but I'm not really going to bother with it. See, iron's more my sort of thing. Oh, I saw you coming. Get in there. Some rabbit's foot. Okay. Oh, and some iron. Nice. Right, okay. That's that's cool. Some more iron. We'll take. We we'll definitely take that. Come over here. I don't want you falling in the pit. What? Oh, my. Bro, what? Oh my, oh my gosh, bro, he scared the life out of me. What was all that about? Well, that scared me quite a lot. Hopefully none of them spawn back in because, oh, and as I say that, oh, they're fighting each other. Never mind, fell down. <laughs> nice, some more bone meal, snowballs, cool. Uh, oh, get him. Yes, attack him, get him. Oh, no, my wolves. Ah, uh, thanks for protecting me while you did, I guess. Ah, uh, no, we need a new pickaxe. Okay, let's grab some more iron. And then let's, have we got any sticks? Nah, we can make some though. Cool. Fresh iron pickaxe, no better feeling. Whoa, it's duking me. <laughs> what is going on? Right, let's get rid of this. All right, keep breaking it. Right, we got to sort out our inventory real quick because this is getting a joke now. Do you know what? Let's just, let's just act, literally put everything in here. We can sort it out later on. All right. 
that's about good. Hello, we got you back. Come out. All right, and just like that, we're entering an, and just like that, we're entering a new phase. It's a bit longer this time, so this is this is exciting. I wonder what the next phase is. Well, we are about to find out. Oh, some is that sand? Oh, some sand. Finally, we can actually make some like glass now and some prismarine blocks. Okay, it's nice to have different variations of blocks. Some dark prismarine, dead brain coral block, dead horn coral block, dead fire coral block. Okay, I'm gonna stand back actually in case some mobs do spawn in. Like that. Oh, look at the turtle. Yo, hello turtle. Um, I don't want you to fall down there. I don't. I do not want you to fall down there. Come on. Um, right. Can you, can you get out of there? Can he? Is he too big to get out? Yeah. Right. Hang on. Let's let's help you out a bit, buddy. Rabbit. Right. Okay. Come on. Go through here. Yeah. Through here. There you go. There we go. Right. Let's quickly mine this fence gate back, and there we go. That turtle can just roam around. <gasps> Some diamonds! We finally got diamonds! No way! Oh, yes! Thank you, how many though? Just one? You know what? We'll take it. We will take it. No way. Oh, look at this stuff. How many are we getting of this? Oh, hello, squid. What are you What are you doing here? Guys, our first diamond. Our first ever diamond. Let's go. All right, let's continue. We've got some kelp, seagrass, lily pads. Okay, more iron. Nice. Coal. We're getting plenty of coal now. Oh! Hello there, Mr. Oh, it's two! It's two! Yeah, wait. If I do this, then hopefully... Yeah, there we go. Look what he's done. Oh, my... What do you think, turtle? We got some salmon now. Nice. Right, we really need to organize our stuff now because we're getting a lot more stuff coming in. Coming in. So, yeah. You know what, though? With all this sand we're collecting, how about we take this salmon out, then put some sand in here, then we can finally start putting in the windows. Look at that creeper's foot. Hello? No, don't fall. Oh, no. Oh, we got a trident. Nice. Some apples, some bubble coral. Right, hang on a moment. I need to organize all my stuff. How's our glass getting on? Nice. Or we can put some more sand in there. Um, let's take all of this. This is cool. We got a trident. This is cool. Yeah, now look at us. We're ready for action. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, wait. They fell. How's our turtle still getting on? He's, he's chilling. He's chilling. Oh, puffer. Oh, no! Take some steak. Oh, my gosh. Puffer fish nearly just ended us. Look at him. Look at him who tried, tried destroying us. Who's the silly one now, buddy? Get off my place. See that turtle? That's why you don't mess with me. Nice. More diamonds. Let's go. Yes. We got two diamonds now. Oh, yeah. We're about to be rich. Turtles are stretching his legs, you know. Getting some exercise for the day. All right, so we powered through that phase, and another phase is already on its way. So let's just wait and see what this is. I'm kind of excited. I'm scared at the same time. All right, let's see what the next phase is. Come on. Some mossy cobblestone. Okay. Oh, look at these. Whoa. Wait, no, 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 wait. No, no, no. Don't go down. Go. Look how, like, bright and vibrant they are. Nice. Some more iron. We like to see it. Matter of fact, we've got... Oh, oh my, yo, yo, I can't, yo, what? I gotta get out of here a minute. Oh my gosh. I gotta get up here a minute. Yo, that's dangerous. Where do they go? Do they just, are they gone now or? Where? Oh, they're over there. No, if we use this bow and arrow, take some arrows, take this bow, and then, can we hit him? Can't really reach them, to be honest. Stay there. Oh, well, whatever. Let's crack on with what we was doing. Ooh, chest. Nice. More coal and bones. Nice, nice, nice. We'll put this in our furnace. Take the iron out. And then with this iron, we can go ahead and craft ourselves some nice legging. Nice. Look at that. We're fully kitted out on iron now. Well, apart from the sword, but let's keep going though with it. Let's keep going. Give us more diamonds. That's what we want to see. Because when I got that diamond, oh, that felt good. I can't lie. I hope we get more. I really hope we get more diamonds. It'd be cool if we could have a full set of diamond gear by like the next few phases. Probably won't happen, but I'd like to see it. Oh, oh, I... Make yourself at home, I guess. I think it's better how we put the slabs around the block now so we can see it more. And I don't know. I, I, I just prefer it. Oh, what is that? Yo, what is that? Some XP. Nice. I like that. Whoa. Hello, panda. What are you doing there, buddy? It's turning into a little bit of a um, little bit of a zoo now, but whatever. Oh, there we go. There you go. See? Not all bad out here. Whoa. Witch. Witch, witch, witch. Woo. Oh, no, 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 no. I knew this witch would come back and haunt us. So this witch needs to go before it poisons anyone else. So get it down that hole. Evoke a spawn egg. Well, I don't want to accidentally be spawning one of these guys. So let's quickly get rid of this egg. I hope to never see you again, Evoke a spawn egg. Well, we don't want to get any of those because, you know, that could destroy us. So... They're so irritating as well. They go through builds and everything. Oh, I, just, I hate them. Oh, hello. Whoa, look at my island. What is going on? There's literally so many creatures everywhere. Look at this. Oh, my gosh. I need to start organizing this. Oh, there's more. Nice. Do you know what? These guys are okay because their colors are really nice. I'll let them off. More chest, more bone meal. Nice. We'll take it. Certainly, we'll take it. All right, how about then we make some windows 
Uh, I think, we, yeah, hang on, we've got a stack here. So I think we're going to fill the windows in real quick uh, while we can. So let's actually collect some more sand here. Honestly, lots of sand. It's good, though, to be fair, because we can just use all the sand to smelt, smelt into glass. Right, how about we quickly... Let's make some glass panes. I think we need more than that, actually. So how about 48? Yeah, that's fine. All right, now let's go fill in the gaps. There we go. Look how much better this looks now. Yep, yeah. and then up here, just to the side, this other side. There we go. Now all four is filled in. Look at that. Now let's go up here to our bedroom room and then fill them in up here just like so now we're a lot more secure uh it saves us having like you know maybe a zombie crawl through the window or something like that while we're asleep which we don't want uh so yeah let's have a look from this angle oh yeah it looks way better now we stand back here yeah look at that that looks nice i like it right so let's continue breaking our block then oh more iron nice oh another turtle nice don't crawl down there where are you going buddy save the turtles guys all right come on up you go maybe i can push you over here yeah. Can you go up there? Whoa, he's flying. Whoa. There you go. Go, uh, I've got a friend for you, uh, Mr. Turtle. Turtle, turtle. Meet turtle. There we go. Oh, look. Whoa, some more diamonds. Let's go. We'll certainly take it. Let's actually pick it up real quick. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Two. Oh, three diamonds now. Oh, so we can craft a diamond pick. Nice. We might need that further phases. Oh, nice. More diamonds. Let's go. Let's go and pick that up. Nice. So now we've got four diamonds. Oh my gosh, we're getting more diamonds than, than iron. Oh, never mind. <laughs> uh, these fish are really... Um... Oh no, I needed you. Why do you keep falling? All right, so now I believe we're on the red desert phase. So, come on, Mr. Wolf, let's see what we get, huh? I don't know what I'm expecting on this one, but I'm guessing it's to do with deserts, right? <laughs> All right, come on then, let's have a look. Uh, let's drop sponge. We've got a lot of red sand. Um, I mean, we don't really need that, but hey... We take it, we take it. Ooh. Right, we need to quickly empty our inventory again. Okay, let's take our iron out and put some more coal in our chest. And let's continue breaking. Hmm. Oh, no, our pickaxe. Let's, um, with the iron we've got, let's quickly make ourselves a nice iron pick. Um, and then we put the sticks and iron... Actually, let me take that iron out and put it in this chest. And then let's continue breaking our block. Oh, hello. <laughs> come through, come through. Come on, over this way. You're gonna... Uh, oh, what are you... Oh, no. Oh, no. What is... Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Stop. You had to play up. You two had to play up, didn't you? Well, you can pay the price now for messing with my dog. Get out. Oh, some emeralds. Nice. Our first ever emerald. Oh, another emerald. Some more lapis. That will help with our enchantment table later on. Some redstone. Oh, some more diamonds. Yo, this phase is good. Oh, look at you scavenging around. Why are you so fast? Oh, more diamonds. Oh, and a chest. And another emerald. Nice. Let's go and put this in our chest. Let's go. Look at this. All right, let's take this chest away. And then, oh, we're going to collect more lapis. I like this phase. Honestly, I like this phase. Hopefully, I don't speak too soon, though, because I don't want to be attacked. Yo, what are you... How did you get over there? What are you doing? Taking my carrot. Come on. What are you doing? All right, well, you can stay there for now. But look, you're breaking my dirt, bro. What are you doing? Come on. Yo, our first villager. Right, do not fall. Do not fall. Patrick. All right, well, I guess you roam around for a little bit then. Whatever. Now, Patrick thinks he runs this land. Look at that creeper on top of the roof. Nice, more lapis. We take that. Oh, and diamonds as well. And iron. Let's go. All in three. Yo, we got two diamonds in here. Look at that. Seven diamonds now. Oh, my gosh. We are stacking. More saplings. Take them. Ooh. Look at this. Right, so how about then we quickly store more stuff in our... Yeah, there's two chests here. Oh, we had two in our inventory anyway. Right, let's get them down then. And then let's put all of this stuff in here, like so. And then let's continue. Oh. Oh, wait, I haven't got a sword. Wait, yeah, I have. Oh, my gosh. Let's use the trident. Boom. Wait, wh what? Where did it go? Did it go through? Oh, it's over here. Yo, what? These guys are pretty scary. Oh, look at this guy. Let me take that XP. So we just had to get rid of the um, intruders there because they thought they could boss me around. Hello? Oh, you don't... You don't look happy to see me. What do you want? Do you want a... Do you want an emerald? Looks like we need to craft ourselves a new axe as well. Oh, do you know what? I think we actually have like quite a lot of raw iron somewhere and in here. So look, we've collected six pieces of iron just like out of the blue. So it, we've got... I think we have quite a lot just lurking around. Just like stored in different places. Oh, I like this block. Oh, more diamonds. Let's go. And emeralds. Iron? Come on, give me more iron. No, okay. Just a broken pickaxe. It's fine. Look at that though. Eight diamonds now. Woohoo! Oh yeah. Let's go in here. Take that three. Take the sticks out of this chest. And then make ourselves an axe. Because we're going to be needing it. There we go. And then let me quickly just put this back in here. And now we got ourselves a fresh iron axe. Oh, hello. You're back. Carl. Hello, Carl. Oh, you can actually trade with us. Um, you haven't got anything interesting. So, you know, but whatever. You can um, you can roam freely if you want. Well, I wonder where that villager went. Oh, 
He's there. Ah, this is cool. It's actually cool we keep him in here now. Look at this. What? Yeah, what if we put like, all our villagers in here, like, roaming around? So it's like, yo, that's cool. That's cool. All right, let's, um, let's try and get you, Carl. Hang on. So, what are you, uh, what are you doing, bro? Oh, nice. Two more emeralds. There we go. We'll let Carl roam around for a little bit, you know, stretch his legs. It's been a long day. And look at that. We got you some more emeralds, buddy. Pick those up. More redstone means more XP. Hello, donkey. Oh, there's two donkeys. What are you doing, levitating? Can you, uh, can you fit through here or well, not really? I don't think you guys can, can you? There we go. Come on, get out. What are you doing? Looking at me. Get out. I'm trying to push you. Oh, I'm trying to... Oh, there we go. You're probably really weak now. I'm sorry about that. All right. We'll sort all these guys in a minute, honestly. We just want to focus on breaking these blocks and getting through these phases. Really? Like, we needed another one of you. Some more redstone dust. Some cactuses. Coal. Nice. We put this coal in our furnace here. Oh, and we take this iron out and then put it in this chest here. There we go. Oh, no. Not you guys again. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, 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 no. My sword broke. Oh, oh are you are you serious right now? There you go. Get out of here. I can't believe my sword broke. How about we craft ourselves an iron sword? Oh, no. Oh, guys, come on. You know what? I can't even be bothered with you guys. Come here, chicken. I can't be putting up with your guys' drama. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, my. Bro, what are you... Come on, then. Like, what are you even doing, bro? Come on. Look how much chicken we have. Oh, my. How about we cook some? <laughs> move move out of the way. Another villager? Hello, Donald. Come out. Come on. Come on out. He'll find his way over to his friend over there. Ooh, nice. More shiny green emeralds. Ooh, two there. Right, now using this iron, we're going to go and craft ourselves another iron pick. Let's put our 17 cooked chicken in here for now. And then let's make ourselves a iron pick. There we go. We can chuck this old one out now. Keep it in there. Yo, so we're in the nether phase now. Oh, my gosh. Ooh, look at all of this. Hang on. Let's... Let's just chuck everything out. All right, come on. Let's go. Look at this. Oh, I knew you. I was expecting you. Holy, look how high he sends us. Oh, my gosh. All right, let's just stand back and pick you off for now because I'm not going close to you. Oh, there's two. Oh, my gosh. Look at all this. The nether is in the, like, is in the overworld now. Who would have thought that? Not me. Look at all this soul sand. One thing I like about netherrack, you can just keep mining it, like, all day. It's so satisfying. It's so quick. See, on this nether face, we have to be really careful just in case we get, like, any blazes or anything like that. So, we don't want them potentially ruining all of our builds, do we? So, regardless, I'm going to collect some of this. Ooh, look at that. Some netherrack, nether bricks. Cool. That's pretty cool. Oh, pigmen. What are you doing? Let me just pick what I've got. There you go. I've got to keep running over and picking it up just in case, like, I don't know. Oh! Right, let's craft a diamond pickaxe. So let's use the sticks we have in our chest and the diamonds. There we go. Now we've got a nice diamond pickaxe. Look at that. Whoa. Right, so now, look at that. We got our first piece of ancient debris. And also, look, we got some obsidian. So let's keep mining this. I think the best thing to do is just, if I have enough obsidian, just build all of this cobblestone and turn it into obsidian. Just in case, you know. I feel like it would make it a bit more secure as well. So <laughs> here we go. Nice, another piece of ancient debris. Let's go. Oh, hello. How are you guys doing? Now, I don't want you to fall. I actually kind of want you to come over here a little bit. There we go. Let's continue. Ooh, some... Oh, wait. I thought something was going to spawn. Some weeping vines. We got some dye, sugar cane, and pig spawn egg. Aww. Hello, pig. <laughs> Welcome to the real world. And if you haven't noticed, I've kind of turned this whole thing around because if any blaze does spawn in, then I don't want them to attack my home and set it all on fire. So I thought I'd done the right thing by literally just turning it around and building it out of cobblestone around the back. Um, but realistically, that is the only change I've made. Oh, and I've also put some fences up here as well, just to, you know, in case we fall off or something stupid happens, you know, just to be, just to make sure. Let's go and collect this. Some crying obsidian. And we've got some more netherrack on the way. Just don't want a lot of blazes, to be honest. Come on, nether phase. Give me some good stuff. More obsidian though, that's good. We could do with a lot more obsidian. It helps. So, matter of fact, I will happily take obsidian. Some more nether quartz. Oh, hello, Hog. What are you doing? Oh my gosh. Bro, he nearly just sent me back to, I don't even know, Mars. All right, let's put all of this in here for now. Um, Right, that's all we can put in there for a moment. And then we can make another chest anyway, so it's not a big deal. There's actually a chest here, so let me grab another one. Right, and then let me put this one... I'll put this one here, actually, yeah. And right, now let me just stick all the other stuff in here for a minute. Right, it doesn't matter. And then I'll just put some diamonds in here. And let me just eat some cooked chicken, and then let's get back to it. I hope not a lot of blazers spawn, honestly. I hate those things. They're so annoying. But I am ready for them. If they want to spawn in, I'm ready to give them a good fight. I'm ready for them. I've got my shield. I can block. And I've got my sword so I can attack. That's all I need. I've come fully equipped. We're not taking no chances out here. That's why I turned this build around. Because if any of those fire hits that house... Here we go. We got our first blaze. Let's go. Block, block. Come in. One, two. All right, I'm going to wait for him. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait for him to shoot his stuff. Oh, no. 
There we go. Oh, no, we didn't get that blaze rod, though. Do you know what? Just in case, we're going to carry a bucket of water with us as well, in case that does actually happen. Like that. There we go. We didn't get those blaze rods, though, which was kind of annoying. But it doesn't matter. We'll get more. I'm sure we will. I'm sure there's plenty more blazes where that came from. Pull one of the chests. Weeping vines, sugar cane, more paper. Let's just put all our stuff in here. Clear that up. Clear that up. Right, now let's get back to it. Some more crying obsidian. I'm waiting for those mobs to come in. I'm waiting. Some more nether quartz. Nice. This is good for XP. And oh my gosh. What a... What are you doing, huh? I mean, you are really ugly, aren't you? I accidentally just pushed it down there, but... I'm sure that's the best place for it. Because he didn't have no intention of being friendly. We've got a lot of nether bricks. Some more XP. We don't mind if we do. Oh, hello, skeleton. Come out. Come on out. There we go. You knew you wouldn't stand a chance against us. We're way too powerful right now. Ain't no stopping us. Some netherite scrap. Right, okay. Some, some gas tier as well. Right. Let's go and stick all of this stuff in that chest. Lovely, lovely. There we go. Let's continue. Oh, wait. Let me just collect those, actually. It's fine. We'll leave it in our inventory for a moment, and then when we're ready, we'll just take it in the chest. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter too much. And oh, my gosh. Oh. Oh, my gosh. Well, that was intense. <laughs> what the? It didn't blow anything up, did it? No. Okay, right. That was that was strange. Let's not let that ghast distract us too much on what we're doing. Weird interaction, though. He was literally trapped there, wasn't he? In the cobblestone. Kind of a good thing, really, because if I made this thing too big, then he could, like, fly around and stuff. So that wouldn't be too good, would it? Ah, uh, okay. You're fine. You guys are fine. You don't scare me too much, honestly. We've got our bucket of water, just in case any other blazes spawn. We've got a cooked chicken. We've got a sword. We've got a shield. We've got armor. Bro, come on now. Who's stopping us? I don't want to speak too soon, though. Netherite quartz are with a skeleton skull. How do we look now? <laughs> look how scary we look. But we're going to take this off because we do need some armor on ourselves. But, you know what? We're going to put you in our house. How about that? We're going to make you like a little ornament. You're going to go right. Hmm, where can I put you, actually? How about we put you right here? That's right. So every time we walk up, you can you can see us. So Mr. With a Skeleton Head, you're going to stay there. Oh, these guys do a lot of damage, honestly. Whoa, how did he reach me from there? I've got to be careful I don't get too close to these guys. They deal quite a lot of damage. I don't want to be pushed off of the edge. I'm trying to get rid of you, if you don't mind. Can you just go now, please? Thank you. Nice, more obsidian. Let's go. It's always good to stack up on obsidian. But it just takes too long to mine. We've got quite a lot in our inventory now, so let's just empty it out. The nether is really a strange place, though, isn't it? Like, there's so many weird things in there. It's just, I don't know, it gives me, it gives me very creepy vibes. A lot more soul sand. No surprise there. Oh, I, I don't like that noise, though. It's very, it's very suspenseful. Lapis lazuli, blaze powder. Nice. Um, let's go and stick that all in the chest. If we can fit it in there, that's for sure. Um, right, there we go. Oh, we need that chicken back. Sorry. Oh, not you again. What are you doing just wandering around like that? I'm trying to... Don't walk towards me like that. That's creepy, bro. That's so creepy. Got some string, though. We'll take that. Nice, some more ancient debris. Let's go. Let's pick that up. Oh, and another bit. Let's go. All right, four pieces now. That's cool. That's cool. Ah, uh, I don't... Oh, we've got to stand back for these guys because they got... Uh, they got a large hit radius. Nether warts. Some gas tears. Okay. Put all our stuff in here for now. Um, yeah, that's cool. All right, nice. Let's keep going with it. Actually, let's click this. All right, let's go. Let's keep going. Oh, you guys, you, you slow me down. Whoa. No, don't hurt me. Get out. Oh, that damage, though. I'm going to stay back and eat my chicken. Mind my own business. Why can't I hit you? I don't want to get too close. You scare me. Ah. Oh, no. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. Bro, what is this? Oh my gosh. Right, we've got to be careful. Oh no, 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 no. Right, let's stay back. Let's stay back. Oh my gosh, you guys are destroying my builds. Come here. Come over here. Oh my gosh. As soon as you hear that noise, you know it is game over. Oh my gosh, bro. Look at what they've done to my build. This is why I turned it around. Now, imagine if it was this way. It would have been an absolute disaster. Oh no, look, they broke some fences as well. All right, so let's get some fences out of our chest. Or well, let's just craft some even. Make some sticks. Uh, cobblestone slabs. It's good that we have a few. Right, so it was up here like that, and then a fence here, fence up there, and then look at the roof, bro. Look what they've done to it. Oh my gosh. Let me build up, come up on top of the roof, and then let's do that. Hang on, hang on a moment. Oh yeah, I've done it wrong. So it was across like this. Yeah, there we go. Right, is that okay now? Let's just have a little look. This is why I've got to be so careful though, because it just as easy as that, it's just, oh. You was thinking of jumping off there, wasn't you, Mr. Cow? You wouldn't have been the first. Let's get rid of these, like that. That's good. 
Right. Honestly, do you know what I might do just in case? I might make these two cobblestone and these two cobblestone up here. So, therefore, the blaze has less of a chance of spreading it, you know? So, yeah, then I'm going to do that, actually. Like that. Yeah, that's cool. All right. So, after all of those blazes that nearly got us, we eventually have now hit the ideal phase. Is it the ideal phase? I think it's how you pronounce it. But we're in that phase now. So, let's get mining and see what surprises awaits us. We're getting a load of nether quartz. And then, also, we've got some emeralds here as well. Look at that. I'm standing... I need to stand back a bit. I'm getting way too comfortable with this. Some logs. Okay. Okay. More emeralds. I thought of an idea that might look really cool. How about we replace all of this inside here with some wheat? So how about we do that real quick? I just think it will look like a lot better. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay. So I've took half a stack of potatoes and half a stack of wheat seeds out of one of the chests. So all I got to do now is grab a hoe and then place some dirt around it. And then yeah, hoes real quick. I'll do three just in case. You know, I'd like to be, I'd like to have enough. And then let's just quickly place them there. And then let's get some dirt, which we have quite a lot of, as you can see. I think two stacks will actually like be plenty. And then, and so yeah, let's, uh, let's get placing them. I don't know. I just had the idea and I really think it looked cool. Like with my build, I just like the whole idea of it. So let's do this section first and let's plant the dirt in here. Then let's hoe it down. Out of the way, horsey. Alrighty then, so now we've got that done. Um, we've filled it in some gaps of some water and then hoed it down a bit. So we just got to wait till all that comes through. But then, let's get planting some wheat seeds. If we run out, we can always grab more. So yeah, okay, we are going to need a lot more seeds. Right, hang on, I need to grab more wheat. Okay, so 64 should do us um, full stack. And then the rest, let's plant potato. There we go. And then let's... There you go. Like that. We need more potato. We'll just go and grab it. It's not, it's not too much of a big deal. Oh, no. Right, we need to grab more. All right, 40 should do us for now. And then, I believe, we filled it all. All we got to do now is just let it grow. Oh, look at him disappearing, thinking we can't see him. We see you. Right, so let's go stick this stuff back in our chest. And I've just noticed one oak leaf block is missing. So, let's replace that. That's strange. <laughs> right, there you go. It's all done now. Um, I feel like we should get to bed as well, actually. Ah, much better. Good morning, Wither Skeleton Skull. It's a beautiful day here on my lovely one block. I say first thing we do is harvest some of the wheat we have here, so let's just do this. Oh, yeah, look how much we're getting from this. Okay, so how about with the seeds and wheat we got, why don't we just put it in our chest? Like so. Oh, yeah, look at that, baby. We got a lot. Oh, Mr. Chicken, what are you doing in here, bro? Oh, more iron, nice. Diamonds, let's go. Let me pick that up. There we go. How cool is that? Oh, we got some honey block as well, so we're going to get some bees on here, right? What's that? Slime block? Nice. So what we can do, we can craft that slime block into some slime balls, and now, what we got to do now is just grab some string, which is somewhere in one of these chests. Ah, okay, there's some here. Oh, wait, no, we need more than that. There we go, that's better. All right, now all we got to do is just stick three up here and one at the bottom right, stick a slime ball in the middle, and then we have ourselves two leads. And then with these leads, what we can do is... Now, where is our friend gone? Here. Well, now we can just... Well, that was silly of me. Sorry about that. Potato, I stopped you from growing there, didn't I? Starting to grow already. Look at that. Nice. Well, I've got leads now just in case I need them. And actually, I know what I'm going to do. How do I um? How do I get in here? Right, let's just craft a quick fence gate, yeah? And then let's put it just here. Oh my gosh, bro, they're all escaping. There we go. All right, now what we're going to do, we're going to bring them all over here. Let's also bring you, sheep. Come on. You two come with me. We're going on a journey. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I thought you fell down. Right, so please mind my farm and don't stand on it. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to take you guys to this island. Um, what are you... What are you doing? Come on, sheep. Stop messing around. We've got work to do. Okay. You guys are going to go in here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to build some fences and build some pens. And then I'll put you guys all separately. So let's do that. Come on, Mr. Pig. Come with me. And you, sheep. Come on, guys. Pig, what, what, are you, what are you doing? You're supposed to follow me, guys. Come on. Created you guys new little homes. I promise you're going to love it. Just trust me. Just stick with me. I promise you're going to adapt quite quickly. Make sure you guys are following me. I don't want you sneaking off now. All right, just down here. Here we go. Um, oh, look at your new home, guys. So, let's just quickly. Oh, I mean, hello. <laughs> um, right, okay. So let's just reopen this up. Yep, there we go. What, what are you? What is he doing, bro? All right, come on, Mr. Sheep. Come over here. All right, come in. I gotta like. There we go. Go, 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 go. There we go. All right, and I think that does it. I mean, we got a Roman trader going around. What's he got to offer us? Nothing great. Never does. Never does. But whatever. This is um. This is the new build, though, guys. What do you think? I got this one open. So in case any new um new friendly mobs want to come and join us, then that's always open there for them. So, but yeah, I think it looks pretty cool. We got cows in one, pigs in one, sheep, because it was all just mad beforehand when it was just every single mob in one pen all together. So, but yeah. So let's get back to the one block then. Let's eat some cooked chicken also. 
<laughs> right, let's get breaking. Oh, hello, B. What have you put that bees in the pen? You know what, Mr. B? You can be our you can be our pet. Let's tie you to the front port. Let's tie you there. Okay? There you go. You're now our pet. And can you fly up a bit? There we go. Right, you can you can chill there for a moment, okay? We're gonna call you Bob the Bee. I just realized there's more chickens roaming around, but I haven't got the patience to grab a lead again and drag all those animals in the pen. Alrighty, so we just got a chest, and inside of it holds a lingering potion of fire resistance and also an enchanted book of Depth Strider 3. So let's just store some stuff in our chest for now. And oh, hello, angry bees. Oh no. Why are you so angry? What did I do to you guys? I, I was trying to be friendly. Look, I got one of your friends over here. Oh, wait. No, he's angry now as well. Oh, no. Well, I'm just trying to be friendly over here. All right, let's get some stuff in here. I also noticed we have another diamond as well, so that's pretty cool. Let's put that in the diamond chest, if you will. Let's carry on breaking this block. Oh, wait, sorry. We need to actually take the stuff out of this first, don't we? But let's put it in here for now. That's pretty cool. Let's keep that in our inventory for now, just in case. More redstone. Nice. This is a mix of different blocks now, isn't it? I don't even know what, what tool to pull out anymore. Hello, cat. Hello, little kitty cat. Do you want some cod? Oh, where are you going? Come here. Can I even put a lead on you? There we go. Come on, Mr. Kitty Cat. Let's tie you to here. Oh, there we go. Look at the collar. All right, I'm going to call you... Hmm, what shall we call you? Hmm, let's call you... Let's just call you Kitty. Okay, come on, Kitty. You can sit down there for now. And you can wait for me while I mine my one block. Lots of different variations on this block, isn't it? Oh, slimes. Hey, give me those slime balls. Right, let me drop that sandstone. I'm going to go store them in this chair. Uh... In this chest, actually, yeah. Right, let's put everything in here. Oh my gosh. Look at this stuff we have. Um, we're going to take them emeralds out and put them in this chest where they belong. Another chest. Some slime balls. Some more honeycomb. Golden carrots. Nice. Put that in a food chest. And these slime balls can go in here. Oh, nice. More diamonds. Nice. Now, this is cool. You know what? I might actually just keep you. Okay? Just for the sake that you're cool. So how about we take Buzzy B here. I'm sorry it had to be like this B, but the changes just sometimes have to be made. Right, come on, Mr. Skeleton Horse. You are coming with me, sir. Can you come through here? Can you get out of here? All right, let's mine this down for you then so you can get through. There you go. See? I told you you could do it. Oh, I've put that completely wrong, haven't I? Let me just change this back. Let me put some cobblestone here. Right, there we go. Right, come with me. I'm going to place you not far, actually. I think I'm going to place you over here. Wait, come on. Come up. There we go. All right, yeah. I'm going to place you right here. Just like that. Okay, there we go. Just soak up some sunshine. Even though, I mean, I doubt you're tan because you have no skin. But just sit in the warmth. I'm sure you like it. A turtle egg. Oh, some more turtles. We like turtles, actually. Turtle, we have you an egg. <laughs> I'm trying to feed this turtle seed. There we go. Just fed it some seagrass. Uh-oh, we need another shovel. Right, so let's go store the rest of this in our chest. Just... Put in here whatever we can, really. We have a stone shovel here that we can use for a minute. That would do, won't it? Oh, not you, phantoms. Not you, guys. Yeah, you can't go anywhere, bro. You can't go anywhere. You're not escaping this. I hate phantoms, honestly. Guys, imagine if we didn't build this around the one block, by the way. How, like, we'd be in such danger. Nice, more diamonds. Let's go. Oh, I wonder where the diamond went. It's there. All right, let's check that off. Right, we need to make more chests. There we go. 58 chests. Oh, my gosh. Right. I don't want to chuck chests everywhere, but I feel like this can be, like, a little storage room. Let's just chuck everything in here. Yep, like so. And then let's take the diamond again and pop it in this chest. We've got 11 diamonds now. Yeah, let's just save it, though. Let's save it for now. Lots of oak wood. Some iron. Nice. Lapis. Oh, well, you can get lost. Oh, a honey bottle and some cake. Well, that's cool. I like that. Put all of that in here. That's nice. Oh, nice. More diamonds. Oh, hey, slimes. How you doing? Oh, we got a music disc. A book, some string. Nice. Put this one here. If it will connect, that's... There you go. All right, let's just pop everything in here. Look at that. We've got some music discs and books. We've got another diamond. That in there, as usual. And then put that in there. Whoa, there's loads of slimes, but the, half of them literally fell on the void. <laughs> there we go. Take them slime balls. Nice. I shouldn't be in here mining. Too dangerous. Oh, hey, turtle. Next phase, desolate land. Let's see what we get on this one. We're getting a lot of stone bricks, which I really like the look of. I think they're such, like... I think they're one of them bricks that you can really just, like, build anything with them, like, in your house. And, you know, I just think they're so good for decorating for, like, interior and exterior. I really like the bricks. Oh, and these ones as well. They've got, like, all patterns on them. The chiseled stone bricks. They look cool as well. Oh, what was that? Was that some bone block? Yeah, I thought it was. Uh, ugh. Look at these little guys. I don't like these guys. They're really... Uh, I don't know. They just... Ugh, they make me shiver. Ah. Ow! What are you... What are you doing? Nice small redstone. Oh. Ah. Uh, right. I see. I see what you guys are trying to do. Let's just pick them off because we don't want to be... But they... Do they fall? They must have fell. Ooh, black dye. Crimson fungus. And what is this? A tropical fish spawn egg. Hey, tropical fish. <laughs> 
we got tropical fish now, so whatever. Let's collect all our items from that. And then if we get too much in our inventory, we can just store it in the other chest that we made. Hence why I made that chest, but whatever. Oh, I don't like these spiders. They're really... Oh, uh, no, 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 They can get through here. Oh, my gosh. Come on, poisonous spiders. Right, I see you, spider. You know what? I'm going to make a quick little cubby hole, and I'm going to get rid of you. Oh, shiny diamonds. Let's go. Oh, my gosh, that scared me. Oh, my God, I just jumped so high. <laughs> no way, bro. Oh, my gosh. I literally just got so scared. Oh, my heart. The lightning is just what scared me the most, honestly. Oh, my gosh, guys. If you just... The panic I just had there is something else, honestly. All right, but let's... Uh, oh, my gosh, bro. That scared the life out of me. Let's just place some stuff in here for now. Oh, that actually really scared me. I never get really scared like that in this game. But that there really frightened me. More bone block. I really like the sound of it, but it's weird. Oh, no. Right, we got to be careful with you then, haven't we? Because you do some serious damage. Just trying to hit and... Boom. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Oh, no, it fell. Let's eat some chicken. Nice diamonds again. Let's go. Take that XP as well. I think we should craft ourselves a diamond sword and treat ourselves. What do you guys say? I say we do that. Yeah, screw it. Right, let's craft some sticks. And then let's... Oh, I keep doing that. There we go. Look at that. We got a diamond sword. Oh, yeah. Sweet. Now we've got a diamond sword. I'm feeling more powerful. Some more iron. Nice. Let's go. Oh, nether quartz, sugar cane. Nice. Now, why on earth would a chest give me a ghast spawn egg? Now... This is definitely, definitely being thrown off of the side. No chance. Some more emeralds. Oh, I hate these things. Go away. Lingering potion of invisibility. Oh, okay, nice. Oh, and we got luck of the sea. Hmm, so we've got some potions coming on here now, which is good. The invisibility one is actually really, really useful. What was that, a jack-o'-lantern? You know what, jack-o'-lantern? We're going to plant you right there. Why not? It, it just looks cool. Oh my gosh, it done it again, bro. That noise is just so loud. Right, let's cook some chicken, actually. Let's take it out of there and cook it in here. Let's get rid of the stuff we don't need. Rotten flesh. Um, yeah, let's just keep picking them off. I will take your XP, buddy. Let me eat a piece of that, though, real quick. Oh, yeah. Bro, it's got to stop doing that. Oh, my. Get in there. My gosh, bro. Stop scaring me like that. I have my game sound so loud as well, to the point that when they literally spawn in, it's like... They're in front of my face in real life. It's just so scary. Oh, if I could ask for one thing, I ask for those to stop spawning. Because they're so loud. For, for what? For what reason? Oh, more diamonds. Oh! I don't like these spiders. They're too, um, too dangerous. I don't like it. What are they doing, though? I can't even... There you go. Oh, he got stuck. <laughs> That's unfortunate for Mr. Spidey. Oh, hot stuff. And it's talking about me, by the way. Bucket of lava, that's cool. More emeralds. Nice, nice, nice. I love to see it. More diamonds as well. Let's go. Nice. Let's go and store them in the diamond chest. We're almost level 40 as well, I've just realised. Oh my gosh. Okay, creeper. Okay. Okay, buddy. You've been sent here to annihilate me, haven't you? Ooh! Run back. Okay, it's gone. Oh, look at that level 40, though. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. We're starting to upgrade our tools now, so we're nearly fully diamond tools. Matter of fact, oh, yeah, we just need a diamond axe, and then, yeah. Uh, not you guys again. Get lost. Wait, what? What are you doing destroying my cobblestone? Sneaky little things. Oh. Cheeky little things. Nice, more diamonds again. Let's keep it up. I want to take those diamonds. Oh, I've just chucked iron away for absolutely no reason. I didn't even mean that. It's time to make yet another chest. Well, another two chests. That also doesn't connect. Wow. There we go. All right, now let's put everything in here. And then this one in there. And yeah. So, guys, I'm pleased to tell you we have reached the end phase. Okay, so I expect to be seeing some Endermen, which are very scary. And I don't like the noises they make. Honestly, that is terrifying. But let's eat a piece of cooked chicken. And a matter of fact, let's go and cook some more food as well. Because we're going to need it. Let's cook some raw beef. Um, yeah, let's let that cook for now, actually. And let's continue breaking the end block. Wow. I can't believe we've already reached the end. This is where things are going to get pretty hard. I'm waiting for that first enderman to spawn in. I'm just waiting on it. Let's go and collect this stuff, though. Some endstone bricks and some endstone. Nice. Purple brick. Okay. Some more lapis. Okay, okay. Well, we got quite a lot of endstone. We keep getting a lot of that, so it must be a very common drop on this phase as well. Um, hello there, guys. Are you trying to get out there, or 
What are you, uh, what are you up to? Eh, stay back. Little things. It's always the little ones that are always the most obnoxious and annoying. Oh, nice. More diamonds. Let's go. At this rate, we're going to craft ourselves full diamond gear. If you didn't notice as well in the bottom left, I crafted ourselves a new shield because the other one was getting pretty broken. Oh, seriously? You guys again? You come for round two? Eh. Yeah. Let me just... Oh, you guys nearly sneaked right through. Get out. Ugh, go away. Go away. Oh, look at this. Spectral arrows and there's some diamonds. Nice. Put that in there. Let's put some of that in there. And oh, with our new chest, actually, we can, put, we can start putting the other stuff in here can't we nice diamond pickaxe not getting that low but i mean it's still pretty low considering you know the durability bar on it is literally orange there he is enderman there they are oh there's three let's take one on at a time i don't think you can get us can you from here that enderman teleported oh my gosh oh let's go in the fighting arena come on come on this is the this is the battle arena let's go come on what you got enderman what you got bro I mean, you're not even attacking me. Oh, well, that Enderman didn't put up such a good fight, to be honest. I was expecting more of a, more of a, more of a challenge. Oh, some oak wood in the meantime. Okay, let's go and collect that. Oh, look at that, an Ender Pearl. Out of them three, did I only get one Ender Pearl? Really? Come on, Enderman, I need your Ender Pearls. Let's meet up in the battle arena. Come on, I'm ready for the smoke. Let's go. Wait, where? Uh, I mean, are you just gonna sit there then, or? Yes, Ender Pearl. Oh, where did you come attacking from? You tried to pull a sly one on us. <laughs> no way. All right, well, we've got two ender pearls now anyways, but oh my gosh. Did you guys see that? Oh, 11 steak. Nice. Let's uh, take the trident out because I doubt we'll be needing that now. The, mo the mobs have got even stronger. So, ooh, look at this. There's more of these arrows, though. Not bad. Let's just chuck everything all into one. Eat some steak. Ooh, lovely. Cooked medium rare. Just the way we like it. Seriously, look how many of them there are now. I can't get them. <laughs> this is embarrassing. There we go. All right, nice. Let's collect all this. These videos take so much hard work and dedication and just... I pour absolutely my all into these videos. So if you do enjoy them, please give me a like. I really do appreciate it. Nice. More Endermen. Oh, there's two this time. All right, come on then. I'll take you on at the same time. You think I'm bothered? You think you guys scare me? All you guys are just all bark and no bite. You sound scary, but... You're not that intimidating, honestly, guys. I'm kidding. Please do not come in my sleep and slay me. Four, en four emeralds in there. We'll just pop them in there. A zombie spawn egg. I mean, we spawn it. Why not? Oh, well, it set a light straight away. So sorry about that, Mr. Zombie. But I thought I'd summon you anyway. Let's go and click the goods. Nice. More coal. What is that? What? Where is that? Wait, what? Where is that? What just spawned? Bro, I can hear it somewhere, but I... I don't know where it is. Is it above my tree? Bro, I think it... No, way, wait, wait. Yeah, it's up there. How did it get stuck in the tree? <laughs> what? That's crazy. Look at it. Oh, what the... All right, let's um, come up here then, I guess. I mean, what was it doing? Oh, my gosh. We've got a shulker shell, so we can make some shulker boxes, but, you know. Let's just store that in our... Oh, actually, let me break this oak plank real quick. And the ones around the front. Yeah, I wonder what happened there. I was so confused. Like, why was he just... Like, chilling in my tree. You gotta pay rent for that, bro. Come on now. Anyways, let's carry on with this. That was a strange interaction. Oh, not you guys again. Ow! Why are they starting to now all of a sudden attack me? They're starting to fight back this time. Get out of sight. Get out. Oh, nice. More obsidian. Let's go. With all the obsidian we've gathered, let's attempt to make this backside... Um, let's replace these blocks out for obsidian because therefore, you know, it's more of a stronger, stronger block. So how about we just place these here like so. And then we can do the corners with cobblestone like that because you're not really going to, you're not really going to see that. Oh, sweet. We got 28 now. All right. I, we had more than I actually thought. I'm not really bothered about the bottom bit because no one's really escaping through there, are they? So put it like that. And you know what? For the sake of it, I think we might as well just like, oh, wait. Oh, no. Hang on. I've realized what... I'd... Actually, is it fine like that? Right, so it's very dark in here now. So, yeah. And we still got six... Well, including this one, we have seven pieces left. But like I say, this is the most important thing. Just like the roof and the sides. Because look, if you look at it, if that if that breaks like that, then like what can they do realistically, you know? So, we'll just leave it like that for now. Another chest with these arrows in. Not too bad. We, we take it. You guys just don't know when to stop, do you? Oh my gosh, you guys are so annoying. Just stop spawning. There you go, let's do it again. I think the best thing is to get them in a group like that and then just attack. Oh my gosh, why are you guys still still so strong? What the? Oh, nice diamond. Glistening melon slice. Nice. Let's go and store this in the other chest. Never mind, we need to make more chests. Oh my gosh. Right, let's just put that there. And how about we eat our cooked chicken? And then one piece of steak because it's not enough. Get that glistening melon now, let's go. And how about we take some torches as well because we need to lighten some things up in here, don't we? It's a bit, bit too dark. Maybe one up here as well. There we go. Now we can yeah that's cool that's better please don't tell me 
There we go. That's a better way to deal with them, honestly. More obsidian. Oh my gosh, it takes so long to break. And some more. Nice, more diamonds as well. Followed up with some more obsidian. Pick that up, though. Oh, this is a much better idea. Just leave them like that. Nice, and more ender pearls. Wait, did someone just... Oh, there you are. Oh my gosh, you do... You do a lot of damage, don't you? Come on, let's go in the, let's go in the battle arena. Come on. Oh, he done a lot of damage though. Fair play to him. He put up a really good fight. Fair play, Enderman. You're not like those other ones that just stay there and let me hit them. Fair play. I have some respect for that Enderman. We settled it like real gentlemen. Damn, that scared me. Oh, lure three. Uh, lingering potion of regeneration. Nice. Take all of our stuff. See, this Enderman just didn't put any fight up. Like, at all. Why can I still hear him so loud? Oh my gosh, they're so loud for no reason. They're just big attention seekers, guys. Okay, so there's a lot of these guys, and I have to take them all on, unfortunately. Right, come on, I'm taking one at a time. Get comboed, son. What about you up there, Mr. Enderman? I can't get you. Oh, let's get these annoying things, because they are really annoying. There we go. Let's just... It's just plenty of Enderman, honestly. So let's just start on one real quick, and then he can meet us in the arena. Come on, I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Let's go. Are you gonna Are you going to teleport then, or are we just going to have to come here and just smack you? Ah, all right, now you want to go, huh? I'm too good for you, Enderman. Get out of here. Yeah, come on. I'm not worried about you. I've already dealt with your friends. Okay, Shulker, you really have to stop teleporting because what are you doing, bro? Where did he go? Is he back in the tree or like where Where did the Shulker go now? See, I hear it, but I can't. Oh, okay. It's there. I see it. Yeah, okay. Come on, Shulker. What are you doing, bro? Come on. You get yourself in some awkward situations, don't you? Them silly Shulkers. Like, what do they think they're up to? Oh, an eye of ender. Nice. Let's go. Oh, and some more diamonds. I'm starting to like this. I like this phase. More obsidian. Let's go and store our diamond back like usual. Look at that. 20 diamonds now. Nice. More diamonds as well. A dirt block? I haven't seen that in a while. Ooh. Look at this. Some bones and arrows. Not a bow and arrow. Bones and arrows. Come on, Shulker. What do you... What do you do? I thought we talked about this, bro. I thought we spoke about this on the phone. I, th I thought we spoke about this. Ah... Uh. Oh, no, 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 no. Luckily, there's a tree just here. And I just want to say, if you are new around this channel and you want to help me out, you can also hit that subscribe button, as it really does help me out. And I appreciate every single one of you. Oh, my gosh. These guys. Let's go check how our wheat and potato farm is getting on around our house. Let's see how it looks. Oh, yeah, look at that. That looks really nice, actually. I might just keep it there just purposely for looks. I really like it. I don't know. I just think it looks really nice. Let's go check on our animals as well. Hello, guys. How are you doing? Just checking in, making sure you're all okay. What about our mobs and our XP farm? Oh, yep, there's plenty of creepers there. How about we go take them out as well? We haven't been to our XP farm in quite a while. Hey, creepers. Long time no see. There we go. What's in these chests as well? Oh, loads of arrows and a lot of arrows as well. Nice. This is what we need. Oh, wait, Eye of Ender, nice. Our diamond pickaxe looks pretty weak as well, which I imagine it would after all this mining. Oh my gosh, how many obsidian do you want to give me? Wait, what's in this chest, though? Some sugar cane and wheat seeds? And by the looks of things, we'll have to craft a diamond pickaxe quite shortly. It's just endless endstone, honestly. Pardon the punt, by the way. Endless endstone. Wow, I'm, so, I'm such a comedian. Let's go and collect some of this stuff here. We're getting a lot of purple blocks. Oh, and obsidian. Oh, hello, Enderman. Where did the other one go? Oh, he's still in here. Come on, Enderman. There we go. Another two ender pearls. Let's go. Ah, oh, no, our diamond pickaxe broke. Well, good job we have more diamonds to craft another one. And just like that, we got a fresh diamond pick. Right, so now let's equip that and get back mining. Ooh, another music disc. Cat, one of my favorite songs. More endermen. Come on, take me on. Staring at you, bro. What are you going to do? What are you going to do about it? Do something. You getting angry? Oh my gosh, there's three of you guys. Uh-oh. Oh my gosh, that actually scared me. Oh my. See how I cook steak. And let's do it again. Let's do it again. Boom. Oh, that was awkward. Aha. You thought you'd get me. Oh, an end rod. Eat another piece of steak. What is going on? <laughs> it said the end is near and... Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at all this stuff. Wait, you said... Oh my gosh, I didn't even I didn't even see that. Oh my gosh, guys. I think this is it. I think this is finally it. I was just breaking blocks and that happened. Oh my gosh, guys. I'm so excited. Do I let it count down or what, what do I... What do I do here? Right. We got about 20 seconds to go. Oh, this is what we've been waiting for. This is what, this is it. This is it. Oh, three, two, one. Right, before we go in here, let's quickly prepare. All right, so we're about to craft our first enchantment table. There we go. And I'll tell you where we're going to put this. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to take these two oak leaves down, and then I'm going to extend it outwards, and then I'm going to make like a little enchantment room with some bookshelves. 
So let me just do that real quick. Okay, so what we've been and done is we've quickly just extended out here and all we got to do is plant our bookshelf down and then put the enchantment table in the middle. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, and we take our bookshelves and all we have to do now is plant them around and then put the enchantment table in the middle. So here it is, as I was saying earlier, it's just like this little entrance thing here. As you walk around, it's going to be right here. So, okay, so now what I'm going to do, I'm going to take my bookshelves and let's plant them all around like so and then same this side. Okay, then so we had to craft some more bookshelves because we needed some uh, just to reach level 30 and now we should have level 30 just like that i know it doesn't look the best by the way but just ignore that it doesn't matter and then let's actually just get some torches as well Alrighty, so we come back here and then let's place one here and then let's place one there we've lit it up so now all we got to do now is just enchant our gear so let's craft ourselves a bow there we go now we got ourselves a fresh bow and let's go and enchant some stuff so the first thing what i am going to enchant is my bow Purely just the fact that it's easier to defeat the Ender Dragon. And I realise we need to put some lapis in here. And guys, I realise we have to put the End Rod on top of the bookshelf. Because it was literally blocking it from giving us the level 30 enchantment. Right, let's go and grab some lapis. So we've grabbed 26 lapis. And let's get enchanting. I'm so excited to enchant some stuff. Right, let's put the bow in here. Then some lapis. And let's see what we get. Power 3. Okay, not the best enchant. But it is what it is. But let's have a look at the sword. Bane of Aphropods. Oh, look at that. Fortune 2. I'm breaking 3. Efficiency 3. That is actually a really good enchant. I'm not going to lie. But I think we're going to go ahead and grab ourselves another bow. Just because I do not want a power 3 bow. I want something a little bit better. There we go. Finally. We got it. Infinity and power IV. Let's go. Oh my gosh. That is such a relief. And now I believe we're ready for the end. So let's dive in and get straight into it. So to prepare for this battle, I'm going to need all the food and all the water buckets I can possibly take. So I finally got a good bow and arrow now. We've got a decent enchantment on our sword. We're ready for action. All right, guys. So I have the final piece to the puzzle. And it's now time to go to the end. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Are you guys ready? Because I'm ready. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Hello, end. I forgot to bring a lot of blocks, so that was a little bit of a mistake. But regardless, let's actually farm some up here because we do need quite a lot, don't we? But look how beautiful it is in here. I love seeing the end. I know it's a scary place. And oh my gosh, there's the Ender Dragon. But I know it's such a scary place, but I really like it. It looks so nice. Oh my gosh! He's trying to attack us already. Well, we took quite a lot of health there, honestly. Right, let's get up here then. Okay, let's get it. Come on, Enderman. Enderman? I mean, Ender Dragon. I've come prepared. Oh, we've got to try and avoid all of that because we ain't trying to die. Let's try and... There we go. Let's try and get that one up there. If we can. Oh, trying to avoid being damaged by this Ender Dragon is going to be quite a challenge, but here we go. Right, let's try and take that out. There we go. Nice, nice. Any more? Oh, no, no, no. I need to run. Oh, my gosh. Let's go. See if we can actually do some damage to the Ender Dragon. There we go. Alright, get that one up there. If we can reach. Come on. Looks like I'm aiming two over. There we go. Nice, nice. What is he doing? Oh my gosh. That was way too close. Let's go ahead and eat some pork chops real quick. Oh my gosh. Ah! He's Enderman! I need to stay back. I need to stay back. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. We need to go, we need to go. Alright, so let's take this one out. Oh! I actually dealt some pretty big damage, honestly. Let's see if we can try and get that one over there. Might be a little bit of a struggle for us, but... Okay, so I'm going to take some more end stone real quick so we can build up. Right, now he's down there, he's distracted. Let's quickly build up. Oh my gosh, he's right there! He's right there! See if we can get this one as well. Over here. Oh my gosh. Nice, we got that one over there. How about this one? Let's go. It's just that one over there. Right, let's go. Right, there we go. We could do with getting more blocks as well, by the way. So let's quickly just farm up some more end stone. As we will be needing it. Just mind this one in a straight line. It's literally just that one left over there. And then we can start attacking the ender dragon. The ender dragon's gone very quiet, hasn't he? Right. Oh, come on, Enderman. Stop trying to attack me. I'm trying to attack someone a little bit more important than you, buddy. Oh, my gosh. I've got someone else on my case now. Seriously? Oh, my gosh. I can't escape these Endermen. Oh! 
Oh my gosh. Right, we need to we need to stop doing silly things right now. Oh my gosh, Enderman, what are you doing? Come on, Ender Dragon, it's time. Come on, let me just shoot you with an arrow. Make you pay the price. Come on, Ender Dragon. Come on. Take that damage. Take all that damage. Where are you running? Where are you running to? Oh! That was close. That was close. But not close enough, Mr. Ender Dragon. Come on. You're almost defeated. Come on. Oh! He's getting lower. He's getting very low. Oh, nice shot. Oh, and again. Can we get him again? It's kind of hard to, like, pre-fire. Honestly. How about we try and get down here? He's so weak. He's so weak. He doesn't know what to do. He's panicking. He's struggling. He's nearly dead. Oh my gosh. He just gave us a little whack there. Alright, come on. He's not going down easy, but... There we go, we got him! Let's go! Let's go, we got him! There he goes! Oh my gosh, we got him! Look at that pool of XP! Give me that! Oh yeah, baby! Give me all that XP! I deserve it! Let's go! Guys, we finally did it! Let's head back to our one block! And as you can probably tell by the end credits, we have indeed completed minecraft on one block and that brings us to day 100 anyway though it is day 100 which means we have successfully survived 100 days of hardcore minecraft on one block so this means goodbye to our beautiful one block we have spent a lot of hours working hard on and all the effort in general and it's just finally time to say farewell if you are new around here which i'm a new channel myself then please be sure to show your support and drop a like on the video and even subscribe and to become a part of the scoops army and also comment what you think bye i've been scoops and i'll see you guys on the next one peace out this is me, and this is the tiny island I will be spending the next 100 days of hardcore Minecraft on. Will I be able to survive and expand my island, surrounded by nothing but unforgiving waters and hostile mobs? Well, let's find out. Well, we found ourselves on a lonely island, and the only thing I can see around us is one oak tree, some sugarcane, a bit of sand, and mainly just dirt blocks. I don't know how we've ended up here, but we've got to survive 100 days, so... And if I look in the distance there, I can see a little fish over there, and I'm sure I saw, like, a dolphin somewhere, but let's not get too distracted, um, with our surroundings, and, and first things first, I think we just chopped the oak tree down, so let's chop this down real quick, hoping also it drops us some saplings that we can re- plant chopping 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 and there we go one last oak log and oh look at that okay so we actually managed to grab some sticks and some oak saplings so what we're going to do is we're going to stick this into our crafting little section here and then we're going to turn all these into oak planks look at that we've now got 20 oak planks how about we craft ourselves a nice crafting table and then how about we place it let's place it there Alrighty, let's create an axe because why not we need that for the trees and then why don't we turn these into slabs because you guys have literally slated me for it um, The last two videos I've made I didn't actually craft any slabs I just used oak planks so I'm changing that today and I'm gonna use my oak slabs wait That was the dolphin. Where did that go? There it is. I knew I saw one. Look at it roaming around you have fun down there, buddy, and uh, I'll try and survive on my own on this lonely island. Right, so how about then we take this sugar cane down, and then why don't we replant some over here? Right, let's replant our saplings then. I can't actually remember where it went, but whatever. Let's, um, let's take some of these up to get some seeds. Break this grass. Nice, nice. Two seeds. Three seeds. Hopefully we get enough seeds by the end of it. That'd be cool. Then we can grow some wheat. How nice is that? Let's get rid of all this. Take all of this up. Nice, nice, nice. Hello, Mr. Fish. Just chilling over there, are you? Well, I may need to eat you in a minute, so don't be going too far. Let's continue collecting these wheat seeds. 
and I think that does it. Yeah, okay, so from all of that, we managed to get 12 wheat seeds, which is pretty cool. So what we do is when we have enough wood, we make ourselves a little wooden hoe, and then we make a little wheat farm for us, so that'd be pretty nice. Even though it's kind of scary out here, and I just noticed that my hunger bars are going down a little bit. It's a nice view. The sun's out. It's a beautiful, well, is it morning? Is it midday? I'm not, I'm not quite sure. I mean, it's hard to keep time when you're surrounded on an island, especially with no time and no date, but it's pretty cool out here, to be honest. It's nice. It's peaceful, at least, you know, away from all the, uh, the others, I guess. But, yeah. But I think what we're gonna do is, we're gonna make, like, a little mine. So, how about... I'm trying to think. Maybe there might be some caves over here, though, like, in the water. I don't know. We might have to explore that later on. For now, I'm gonna take these oak saplings and just quickly plant them, like so. And then I've got to hope for these two to grow, and then I can keep collecting more saplings. I'll make a little sustainable tree farm. But you know what? I'm gonna make a little, uh, a little mine down here. Actually, I just realised there's some cobblestone, so I can't actually do anything. So, I guess we're just gonna have to wait till these two grow. I just guess I'm gonna sit here on my crafting table and hope these two grow. Please hurry up and grow. Well, people, we have our trees. So, let's grab our trusty wooden axe and let's get to work. So, we're hoping to get more saplings. That'd be nice. Drop down. Any saplings? Okay, nice. We got one. Let's go ahead and chop this one down. Hoping we get... Oh, look at that. We just got another one. Nice. There we go. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Look how many saplings we just got. Oh, my gosh. We got nine. Okay, right. Let's get planting these around here then, I guess. Actually, scratch that. I'll tell you what we're going to do. So, this side, we're going to make a little sustainable tree farm. So, how about we put one here, one here, and then one here, and then same over this side. How about we extend out? Let's collect some dirt. And then what we're going to do is we're going to expand our little tree farm outward so we can place more saplings on top. Alright, so how about we just bring it out like that. Yeah, is that cool? Oh, I can hear some fish splishing and splashing around. Let's go check that out. Who was that? Was that you, dolphin? I heard something. Oh my gosh, look at the fish over there. There's the dolphin there. See it? It's hiding. And while we're at it, why don't we collect some sand as well? Let's turn all this into oak logs. Ah, okay, now we can craft ourselves a nice pickaxe to, uh, you know, remove all of the cobblestone and to mine downwards. And when we collect some cobblestone, we're going to turn the cobblestone into a nice pickaxe. And then, so on. I mean, we're, we're, we're moving on. We're getting on in life now. You know, they can throw us out here on our own, but... We'll always find a way how to get back and survive, eh? Right, so now let's extend this out, like so. And then let's get our saplings. Plant one there, one there, and the final one just there. That's pretty nice. We now have, what's that? Three, six, nine trees about to grow, which is really good. And then, yeah, so how about we go into our crafting table, uh, make a little pickaxe for us, like that. And then, how about we just make a chest real quick as well, or even two, right? So let's get them down like that. And then let's put all the stuff we don't need. I may need wood and sticks, so we'll keep that. But how about we dig down a little bit? So where did I start to dig down? Oh, there's a sapling here also. I didn't even see this. Here it is here. Okay, right, so let's mine downwards collecting this cobblestone real quick oh look at that the stone age well wow, we really are in the stone age aren't we you know we're on our own slowly someone help let's just mine down i mean let's hope to you know find a nice cave but before we do so let's get the cobblestone that we've gathered and then put it in here three along the top two in the middle and we have a stone pickaxe now right so this will uh, be a lot quicker there we go look at that it's almost like we have a diamond one except from we haven't not yet anyways we will have don't worry okay so we're gonna keep mining down um some coal would be nice honestly that would be really nice it would be much appreciated because it's starting to get a little dark down here and it's a bit scary when it's dark well would you look at that people we found our first coal block so let's get mining that Lovely, lovely. Oh, yeah. Look how much coal's down here as well. We've actually managed to hit the jackpot with this one. Oh, this is going to help us quite a lot. Brings you some light. Cooks you nice food. Oh, yeah. We like this. We'll take this. What have we got ourselves? About like 27 pieces? Something like that? There we go. Yeah, 27 pieces. Wow, nice. So let's head back up top then. It's quite a struggle to get up here actually with no stairs. Um, I keep hitting my head and it really hurts. And let's make ourselves a furnace. Right, so we've got ourselves a furnace. So let's place this down next to the chest and let's put the coal in it. There we go, 27. Right, so that's all ready for us. And then, oh, actually, wait, let's take some of that out. And where's the sticks? Right, let's make some sticks. And then let's make some torches. Let's make, eh, yeah, let's make, why not? There we go, 12 torches. That would do us for now. Right then, so let's, oh, hello, squid. What are you doing? Huh? What are you doing playing around there? Be careful. Right, actually, before I get any mobs spawning on this island, I think it's more important to place... Oh, look at that. One oak tree's grown. I think it's more important to place some torches around here. We avoid getting any scary mobs. Because that's what we don't want that, do we? Right, so that'll do, right? Yeah? Okay, right. Now let's go down here and then let's place some torches down here because, oh my gosh, look how, like, creepy that is down there. And then we'll place one right down the bottom. About there. Alright, there we go. So, that's lit up a bit. And how about we eat this apple? That was refreshing. Right, so the island's lit up a bit now, which is good. 
We've got to wait for these trees to grow, but actually, let me just chop this one down while we wait, because I'm so, I'm so eager to, to collect some wood right now. There we go, look at that. Oh, yes. Oh, and some sticks as well. I love it when it drops me sticks. It's like, thank you. So kind of you. Oh, hello, squid. Who said you could get too close to my island? Back up. Whoa, he's trying to attack me. What? Back up, Mr. Squid. Back up, buddy. Jeez, what was his problem? Oh, no, I see a drowned. Should we go check it out? Oh, I see him. Oh, he's too scary. He's too scary. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Let's turn these logs into more planks. And let's go ahead and put it in this chest. Follow it up with some saplings. Let's take the saplings out, matter of fact. And my sugar cane's growing as well, which is a good sign. Uh, I mean, I suppose we could, Yeah, we could expand this, actually. Let's grab some dirt. And then let's go along like this. So now I can plant one there. And one there. Then also I put one there, couldn't I? We've always got a sapling left, but I feel, I don't know, I don't like placing the sapling because then it won't look good. It'd just be like one random sapling on its own, but whatever. Let's go ahead and put that in the chest. We've always got it there anyway, so it doesn't really matter. All right, so now we've got a cave going now. We've got some, you know, some crafting tables, some chests, some furnaces. And we've also got a little tree farm going now. So I guess all we got to do now is just... Be patient. Oh, also, we've lit up the island. That's cool. What is that? Oh, my gosh. That looks really scary out there, doesn't it? So, we've got some sand here as well, but let's take some sand out of here because I've got a plan for the build. I've already got it figured out in my head, so it's fine. But we will be needing some sand. A lot of sand. So, let's collect these pieces. Then, let's go up here and let's smelt it. Why not? Actually, wait. I don't want to use all that coal yet. We don't need to smelt the sand yet, so we'll just keep it in this chest for now. It's fine. But, hey, it looks pretty good lit up, I suppose. We need food bad. We might have to go out here and quickly slay some fish so let's go ahead and do that any drowns around yes there is so please do not see me thank you thank you thank you i've got to be really careful that this drown doesn't you know this drown doesn't get me but we head back to the furnace and then let's put this cod in like so we really needed that and oh my gosh he's getting closer he's coming straight for us i don't know what he's doing actually but he's guarding all the cod and that isn't good because i need some cod would you look at that come on uh oh i forgot i had bubbles well it's fine come on take these cod Come on, come here. Oh my gosh, I don't want kelp. What am I doing? Why are they like so hard? <laughs> like, look, there's so many of them. I don't know which one to target. There we go. Nice. Oh, I need to go back up. Oh, there's all the cards. I was wondering where it all went. I need to get some bubbles back and then go back down. And then I'll get this little guy. Like so. Okay, that should be enough for now, actually. We can always come back down here anyway. There's plenty more fish in the sea, but I wanted that one. But hey, let's go ahead and put this in the furnace. And look at that. We've got three pieces of cooked cod. So let's enjoy our cod. Nom, 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 nom. And that's just enough to regenerate a full bar of health. Oh, I see you over there mocking me. i got to get you now. Be gone, cod. Okay, I'm sorry. I just really had to get that cod. I couldn't resist it. But hey, let's put this back in the furnace. And we now have some pretty decent food source. Let's go put this in the chest. But let's keep like, you know, maybe two. Yeah, let's keep two pieces of cod just in our hot bar here. So, you know, in case we get hungry, we can always snack on our cod. But how about we do some more mining? And hopefully by the time we've come back up, these trees have grown. So let's get down. Ow. You've got to love Minecraft sometimes, man. You know, it's always the same thing, but there's always something new to do. It's just like, you know, we've, always, we've all been mining. Every single world we make, we all go mining, but we enjoy it. That is just the pure beautiness in Minecraft, I guess. Right, let's play Let's have a torch down here and how about we put this in our hands so you know we can actually see where we are going that would be helpful wouldn't it and would you look at that guys our first piece of iron nice let's go ahead and take this up how many pieces though okay we've got three four five maybe six anywhere no that's fine hey listen we still got five pieces of uh of raw iron so that's cool let's continue mining though hopefully you know finding some more even some oh no i was about to say even some diamonds but we're not going very far with no pickaxe so let's head back up top and uh you know make another pickaxe hopefully by the time we get back up here our trees have grown Let's just hope so. Even a few. Come on, please. Okay, so, I mean, two's grown. I mean, we take that. Not too bad, not too bad. So, let's smelt some raw iron real quick. Collect that fish. And then, let's get chopping. Then it should drop. Oh, after this one. There we go. I love this mod. Honestly, this mod is just so cool. And now I have no axe. Whatever. Didn't want an axe anyway. Right. Let's make more sticks. Even though I had more sticks in there, I don't know why I did that. Let's make more slabs. So, you know, we keep, we keep stacking our slabs. So look, we've got 48 now. Let's make a stone axe. And also, let's make another stone pickaxe. Just in, just for backup. And then we're going to go ahead and take our iron ingots. And then we're going to... 
take some more sticks and then put them in here and then we now have an iron pickaxe would you look at that right then we've got two pieces of iron left over how about we really quickly make ourselves a nice shield you know just for protection look at us now oh yeah okay so let's go ahead and quickly put all our sticks wood let's keep that torch we might need it let's put a kelp in there some saplings we we'll take the cobblestone actually because it's always handy you know just to stock up on it uh we'll put we'll keep this in our inventory for now and before our own eyes more trees have grown so let's chop these ones down real quick and then with the saplings it gives us we we'll just replant them oh yeah look at that more saplings four saplings let's go let's go ahead and uh you know take this one down oh that one didn't fall because it's connected to this one but it's no problem because all we have to do is just come through here and take this one up oh yeah look at that some of them dropped in the ocean but that's fine we just collect it like so and there we go there we have it right so let's plant these ones back like so plant one there and then have we got any dirt okay we haven't got much dirt so whatever right how about though we place some more sugar cane uh along here like that we'll wait for this to grow also so it gives us more sugar cane and now we have an iron pickaxe we can get back to mining so let's go ahead and do that but actually just in case i am going to take some coal and then put two up here to there you know nine torches that should do the trick for now and look we still have 18 coal but it's not a problem because you know we're going to gather more coal anyways so we're not looking too bad uh for the wood right let's get back mining then oh more iron nice right so let's quickly mine this here let's place another torch there and let's mine this iron. Oh, and there's water. Okay, and I hear hostile mobs also. So maybe I have to craft ourselves a quick sword, actually, just in case. Let's take that iron and that one also. There we go. Let's drain that down. And let's just keep digging down, I guess. I hear zombies to my right. So something's telling me to go right, which I think I will, actually. Oh, look at this down here. Oh, that's where it's coming from. Okay. Hey, creeper. Oh my gosh, he got he was getting way too close. I think we must go up and craft ourselves a sword because if we get into any action, you know, it's not going to be good for us because we have nothing to protect ourselves apart from a stone axe. I think I'm going to go back up top. Why does it take so long to get up top? And it's now thunderstorming and raining. Wow. Welcome home, I guess. <laughs> oh my gosh, but look at this. Look at our trees. They're all growing now, which is good. Sugar cane's growing as well. And there's more fish in the sea, especially for me. Let's smelt this iron real quick. And then with the iron we get from it... Actually, yeah. When we have another iron ingot, like now, we're going to make ourselves a iron sword to protect ourselves. Like that. There we go. Let's get rid of this rotten wooden pickaxe. Go away. We don't need you. And oh, I see a drown with a trident. That's promising and let's put our iron sticks in the chest and oh my gosh oh no oh my gosh this is scary look at me i've only got my shield to protect me oh actually wait i have a i have an iron sword as well but oh my gosh i'm scared of the lightning i don't like this uh i think i'm gonna head back down to the mine oh my gosh no i drowned our first mob encounter right um we'll come up then i guess can you get up i'm just gonna attack you We're down here you don't scare us we're fully equipped you don't scare us anymore let's go Oh, look at that. Get out. We've gained some XP, though. If you look at the bottom, we've actually managed to get ourselves level 5 already. Well, before we get thunderstruck, how about we head back down to our mine? Oh, it's nice and calm down here, actually. It's very quiet. It's nice to get away from all that noise and rain and all that thunder and lightning. But it feels cold. It's damp down in this cobblestone mine. Let's light it up a little bit. Yeah, I, I heard a zombie and Enderman as well. Oh, my gosh. Well, we found our first diamonds, so that's good. Right. Gosh. Okay, there's the creeper. Oh, we need to take these guys away, you know, so we don't get um, attacked. We're trying to mine our diamonds. I'm just being very careful that I don't get anyone come up behind me because that would be terrible right now. Oh, my gosh, that lightning is so loud. Right, let's, uh, let's pick you off. There we go. We've seemed to stumbled across a cave, so that's good. Okay, there's loads of zombies down there. Oh, my gosh right well i'll put that torch there so i don't forget that's there and oh my gosh look how many zombies there are we'll take these on no problem oh no it's fine we got them we got them let's mine this iron in the meantime i swear i just heard a creeper oh my gosh what let's see some cook cod there's loads of mobs down below us as well so we've got to be so careful right now we're in a very risky position right now oh my gosh he's trying to trick shot us but there is a creeper i repeat a creeper has found us Come on. Oh. Uh, uh. Oh my gosh, there's another creeper, bro. Are you serious right now? Okay, wait, he's not coming for us, though. I really need to get those diamonds. I hear a skeleton as well. I can hear him approaching us. 
Oh. Oh, he killed him. Oh my gosh! We need to be so careful right now. I think we're just playing with our life way too much. Why is there so many creepers? Right, we need more. Oh, wait. We got a music disc because that um that skeleton killed that creeper. Oh, my gosh. That was way too risky for us. I don't even know why we, like, challenged them like that. Oh, my gosh, bro. Why is it so, like, aggressive? This weather. This has been a hard first 10 days, honestly. We can turn these into bone meal later on, so. Right, let's grab some sticks. Make some more torches, like so. And then four of those. And then we've got ourselves 24 torches, right? That should be plenty, right? But actually, oh! Oh my god! Um, hello? <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Bro, what is going on? Oh my gosh, that scared the life out of me! What is this? Right, okay, 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 okay. Come on. Stop running away! There we go. Oh, come on then. Wow. Um, that was interesting. <laughs> I, I, I can't even believe what just happened, honestly. That scared me so much. All right, but how about we chop these trees down while we can? What is the chances of that happening? Isn't it like a very low percentage? I think that's pretty rare, right? Let's collect the saplings. I'll take that, and I will take you as well. Oh, I see you guys down here as well. I don't think I can't see you. But now we have a sword. We can head back over to them diamonds that we found earlier. Right, so let's head back to our land. Put the raw cod in the furnace. Let that cook up. All right, let's turn these into slabs oh finally the weather's cleared up it's now a nice bright sunny day well this kind of just sums up english weather honestly so we've got loads of saplings now we've got lo lots of wheat so how about then you know just so we got some in the meantime let's take the wheat seeds out and then let's take take some cobblestone and let's make ourselves a nice stone hoe and then let's quickly put everything back into here let's take the raw cod out let's take the iron put the iron back in the furnace let that smell that is a weird tree we're gonna do it about here actually so let's hoe this down over here and then let's plant these wheat seeds down like that and then let's put one more here there we go right so now we'll have some wheat growing we've got the trees growing we've got a little mine we've got the sugar cane growing as well you know we've found some iron we found some diamonds which we haven't mined yet but we will eventually mine those in a minute it's not looking too bad is it i feel like when we do a bit more mining we're gonna then you know start doing the build i've already got it in my head i've actually got it already sketched down uh to what i'm actually gonna build so it's gonna be pretty pretty cool let's head back down to the mine then and click those diamonds we now have a sword and you know some iron tools and we also have a shield and some more torches now so we've came prepared uh any hostile mobs want to try and attack us it's not going to be good for them all right we're back here we're back where we uh where we left let's put a torch down here you know let's light this up a little bit more there's the diamonds i see them all in their glory uh let's put more torches down here for now as well you know just to give the cave more ambience some more iron up there also so we go ahead and grab that in a sec oh my gosh these skeletons bro i'm gonna wait i'm gonna wait oh i'm too quick for you skelly Oh, there's some more iron up here. I didn't even see that. Let's go ahead and grab that while we're here. I see this enderman looking at us. Oh, let's take this lapis as well. And how about we just, you know, place some more torches around here. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, let's head back over here for now. Oh, my gosh, my hunger bars. My health is not looking good. Let's quickly eat our cooked cod. Oh, my gosh, he's got aimbot. Oh, okay, we actually got to stop playing around. There we go. All right, let's eat some more cod and quickly wait till our hearts regenerate because that was scary. They just keep on coming, though. Look, there's another zombie here. Oh. There we go. Let's mine these diamonds in before we get distracted again. Oh, look how many diamonds there are down here. Nice. Let's mine this one. Nice, nice. I hear more zombies, so I've got to be so careful, especially while I'm in the water as well. Let's get rid of this. Oh, my gosh. Nice. Some more diamonds. There's the diamonds. There we go. Okay, right. So we've got five diamonds in total. Nice. That was a great find, actually, off the bat as well. Five diamonds. We will take those. We will take those. And this is hardcore Minecraft, so we don't want to take too many risks. Let's head back up top. Let's grab some more cod, and we'll explore more further down the mine. Alrighty then. Okay, so our sugar cane's grown, so how about we just quickly harvest our sugar cane? And then let's take some more sand let's just let that all float to the top because otherwise it's so slow mining underwater as we all know let's plant that there 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 
like so. Ooh, the wheat's growing also. Plant two more sugar cane there for now, so that looks pretty cool. And then let's go ahead and put the stuff we don't need in here for now. We do actually need all of this stuff, it's just like not right now, you know, so. Let's go ahead and smelt these two raw pieces of iron, and then let's grab our oak slabs. Let's go ahead and craft two more chests. Let's place two more chests here, and let's put all the wood into one chest. Whoops, that's not wood. Also with sticks as well, let's put that in there. But hey, more wood's grown, so let's just harvest it down. There's a lot of oak wood up here, isn't there? There we go. Oh, yeah. Look how satisfying that was. Nice. More saplings. we we'll take it. Let's plant these back down, though. Oh, of course. Of course. Literally. You just knew that was going to happen, didn't you? I mean, would it be a 100 days video without a phantom? If you guys have watched the previous videos, you know uh, that phantoms love me very much. All right. That's one phantom done. That's two. And then this final one. There we go. Right. We've got rid of the phantoms. They're an absolute nuisance. Let's put the phantom membrane in there because we don't need that. Ugh. I hate phantom membrane. Let's take this uh, one piece of iron ingot out. Let's pop it in the chest. Look at that. Full stack of oak log. Nice. Let's grab some dirt though and I'll show you why in a second. Right. So let's extend this bit out and then we can place some more saplings. Right. So how about we start with this build then? So I've got an idea. So this is going to be like our main sort of island. Well, not our main island. Well, technically this is our main island at the moment. Right now what we're going to do is Actually, well, let's, let's plant some more torches around here. But how about we get started with the main build? So we're going to start off just by saying that this island that we're on already, this is just going to be like, you know, the starter island. And then we're going to build a big circle. And we're going to put different areas for it, like a house, a nether portal area, tree farm, animal farm, XP farm. You get the whole idea. So let's get started. Right, so let's grab the oak slabs that we've already got. Uh, we're going to be needing a lot more wood. But have we got any food? No, we haven't got any food. Well, I guess it's cod time. Let's go ahead and take some cod out. Because we can't be building, you know, if we're really hungry, can we? That, that, that wouldn't be good now, would it? Let's take these two. Well, they're very fast. All right, let's head back over to the island then. Deposit these into the furnace. And did we get any more coal? No, we didn't. Hmm. We may need more coal, but it doesn't matter right now. Let's uh, let's get started with this build. So we're going to make like a little bridge leading out this way. First things first, let's extend it out with our oak slabs. What am I doing? Let's get rid of this kelp. It's, it's in the way. Come on. Get out. That's okay. Let's turn these all into oak planks. That might have been too much, actually, but whatever. Right, let's craft a load of sticks. And then let's make some fences. Right, just like so. So 27 fences. That should do the trick. Yeah, let's actually extend this out by one more this side. Get those fences down. And then let's do the same this side. Okay, so we've started off by building a little bridge, which is nice. And now all we have to do is take our cooked cod out of the furnace and quickly eat this. There we go. And oh my god. Gosh, let's drain that. We'll uh, we'll fix this later. Okay, we'll uh, we'll find a way around this, and then let's build out till here. Now all we have to do is build a giant ring behind us, and then make a center for it. Basically, just go from there. So let's uh, let's get started. We're gonna need a lot of oak slabs for this build. I've just realised. So let's go ahead and craft ourselves a lot. And that should cover us for now. So let's get building. I began by building the foundation of my new base out of oak slabs. I had to make it symmetrical as possible to get that true circle finish. And just like that, we have created the circle. Well, there's our circle sorted, I guess. So now we've built the outline of the base. I think the first thing to do now is just to fill in the gaps. So let's go ahead and fill in the gaps. State the obvious, I know, but I filled the gaps in with more slabs and this took me quite literally all night. And on the way, I met up with two angry creepers. That's better. Okay, so filling in the gaps of our little island here. Well, I say little, it's pretty huge actually but i realized that i'm gonna make some gaps in between the center so like for instance like in this corner here i'm gonna dig all this out and fill it with uh, glass same with that side same with that side and then same again over there so i just think it looked nice it give it some character i kind of like the idea of it all there's lots of kelp and it's actually really annoying like look how much is floating above here just like that i was trying to get rid of it's actually so annoying right but let's just try and ignore it for now right let's get rid of all of this let's just fill this gap in Alright, so we've got to collect more wood in order to have some more slabs. And oh, yes. Look at that. Hello, Mr. Squid. Take our saplings. Nice, nice. And then let's plant them back down again. Let's also harvest our sugar cane. Look at this. Let's go ahead and take all this down. Nice. Good stuff. Oh, hello. I see you, sugar cane. Don't, don't swim away from me. Actually, I'll only be needing a stack anyway just to finish it off. But this is what it pretty much looks like filled in. It's actually huge. Okay, so I've crafted 18 more slabs, which should do the trick. And in the meantime, I managed to place some torches up and down. Oh, 
Okay, that was silly. So I had some more coal and I crafted plenty more torches. So hopefully now this keeps the mobs out of spawning. But let's just finish this last bit off and boop. There we go. Right, it's all done now. Okay, now we have this huge plank. So in the middle, like this side, that side, that side and that side. I want to fill it in like with glass. So that's what I'm going to go ahead and do. Let's grab some sand. So we only have 17 pieces of sand. It looks like we're going to have to, you know, farm some more. So let's take some iron. Let's take some sticks. And we have ourselves a nice iron shovel. So now let's locate some sand. So about here. So we mine it quicker. Let's just quickly place these like so. And then let's get mining. By the way, excuse my voice, I literally have like a bad cold and I kind of have to bear with it. So just please accept my apologies for that. It's that time of the year now where everyone's just really, you know, becoming sick. So let's just hope I'm okay. I'm sure I will be, hopefully. Right, let's get the last bits of sand down here. Just like so. Right, let's go and collect it. Nice, good stuff. Ooh, hello sand. Right. Oh, there's some more here that I was about to leave. I see a cod over there mocking me. Well, let's just mine this bit of wood here. We don't really need it now. So we just put our sand in the furnace. Let's go and collect more coal. But oh, I will take this iron though. There's lots down here. Come to me. Sweet. Eight pieces of raw iron. Nice. Some coal here. So let's quickly take this up. Nice XP. Oh, there's a creeper and a zombie. Of course. Of course there is. Right. Uh, hello zombies. Looks like you're doing the Gangnam style. I hope no skeletons see me here because I don't want to get sniped off the edge. Okay, so let's place a torch here. Oh my gosh. Okay, I don't know what I was expecting, but let's take this zombie on. Take his XP. And we can now go ahead and grab that iron up there. So let's go ahead and grab that. Let's mine that piece. And let's mine this piece. Cool. And then all we've got to do is just mine these last couple of pieces. Hello, suspicious creeper. What are you doing hiding in the shadows? I can see you. You're not fooling me. I'm not falling for those tricks today. No way. But we managed to get ourselves, well, including the iron ingot, 20 pieces of iron. Well, these caves are really confusing, actually. It's a good job I placed all these torches. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Hello, phantoms. My favorite people of all. I'm going to run over here. I'm going to hit you. Wait, what? They hit me. Oh, yes, he's stuck. Get out. Oh, did you see the hat? All right, come on. I'll show you who's boss, Mr. Phantom. So, if you couldn't tell already, um, we've made a few changes. So, I'm guessing you can already tell what changes we have already made. Let me give you a hint. It's the slabs. They've been taken up and removed. I thought it would look better if I just genuinely fill the gaps in with glass instead. I don't know, I just like the look of it. So, after some hard work and time, we finally managed to get there in the end. And I've just realised right in front of us is a villager. We'll go and check him out also, but <laughs> anyway, this is the changes that have been made, and I just realised I have to place some torches down, otherwise I get some angry mobs come and spawn in and, you know, potentially ruin the whole thing. I'm just gonna plant these torches kind of everywhere. Yep. Hello, how are we doing? Let's see what you got for us anyways. Nothing too special, honestly. Thank you for the offer though, but I think I'm gonna be passing on those. How about with the 48 pieces we already have, why don't we start by placing some? I think it looks so cool after when it's all done. It'll all be worth it. I'll place a few along here now. Whoops. Of course, the kelp stops me from placing the uh, the glass block. And I just, oh my gosh. And I just realized my hunger bars aren't looking too good. Let me just place this the other side as well. Plant them around here. I figured out we're going to build our house over this side. And then maybe put like a farm this side, like a wheat farm. I'm not sure what we're going to put here. Like maybe like a nether or something. And then over this side, this is just going to be sort of like the sugarcane farm. And I've just realized, look how grown all my farm is and my trees. Oh, I need to get to work. I need to get harvesting right now. Let's go ahead and take up the wheat. Let's plant them seeds back down. There's also some floating in the water, but we get that. There we go. Well, that's all done. And then let's uh, let's take a sugar cane up. Just like so. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and put it in the chest. We need some food. Okay, cod. I'm coming to get you. Hello, group of cod. I see you moving. Come on. Finally. Peace. Right, let's get one more. There we go. Can we get you as well? Yep. And finally, let's attempt to actually get you as well. If you'd stop, please. There we go. Oh, look at that over there. Right, we'll go and check that out later, but how about we get back to shore and actually eat? Oh my gosh, that's where all the skeletons went. Oh. I knew they wouldn't have gone far. What are they doing? They think they can just stay there forever, or? Well, we'll leave them down there for now. But I've got to be aware of those, because if I want to try and farm some sand or anything like that, and I get caught by those guys, it's... It's going to be a long day for me. But anyways, let's get back up to shore and let's put these in the furnace. Oh, we have 19 pieces of iron ingots as well. Didn't even realize we had those. Right, well, let's put that there. And actually, how about we make ourselves a quick chess piece like so? There we go. Right, so let's go ahead and put that on. Oh, yeah. And why don't we make ourselves a nice little helmet as well while we're at it? Okay, like so. And then let's quickly take our cooked cod out. And now let's eat. Nom, 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 nom. Yep. Okay, that does it. Actually, we might as well just make some like leggings and then boots as well. 
There we go. So, we now have full iron armor, and we also have a shield, and we have full iron tools. We're looking pretty strong. We are looking pretty strong right now. I need to survive out here, all right? I'm sorry. I know I keep destroying you and your family, but it's got to happen sometimes, you know? See if I can get you guys as well. Oh, hang on. Oh, there's loads down here. Wow. There we go. I need to go back at the top, and there we go. Let's go back down. Let's take... You. Oh, there we go. I collected some more. Five should do the trick for now. Just so I got enough, you know, to survive this night. Oh, look at that down there. It's like a big cave. Didn't even know that was there. And he's gone invisible because he's scared of the dark. Let's remove all this kelp. Let's try and take this sand up here. Uh, that's better. Let's place one right about there. And then let's take Mr. Spider on. And then let's also place a torch there. And why not one here? Is that better? Take on Mr. Creeper. Uh, one more time. One more time. Come on. Uh. Ugh. Okay, and with the remaining glass I have, I'm going to place it down here. And I only have one piece left, so I'm going to put it there. Why not? Uh, right, we really need to smelt some more sand, don't we? But actually, just we might need some more torches. So let's just take some oak slabs, and let's just put some in there for now. Let's just take these remaining oak trees down. Hopefully, I don't get snuck up on by a creeper. That would be terrible, right? Please don't happen. Uh, you know, I just want to try and mine my trees in peace. Thank you. And would you look at that? I'm already getting hungry again. So I'm going to eat my cooked piece of cod. Mine this one. I think... We have, like, another two to go, right? But after I chop all of these down... Oh, what was that? A sapling, some sticks, nice. Oh, and over here as well. Didn't even, uh, didn't even see these guys. Ah, oh, there's loads of, uh, oak logs up here, actually. Yeah, so there's some more oak logs still stuck up here. There we go. Oh, nice. And then let's try and chop this one down as well, if we can. There we go. Nice. Let's replant all these saplings. How do we get rid of this one? Is there any, uh... Oh, right. Of course. There we go. Alright, nice. Nice clear tree farm with all the wood collected. How many did we get? We got a stack and a bit, a few sticks there, a few apples, and lots of saplings. All we need to do now is just really smelt a load of sand, collect some glass, and basically just get placing, I guess. So let's just use up what we've already got. Well, it's not looking too bad, so basically I think all night we're just going to really try and grind some sand. Let's get to work. So we've got some more sand there, we're just going to put it in there. And let's get back digging. Damn, it is just so slow trying to mine some sand under here. It's certainly a struggle. You know what? There actually is like lots of sand down here, which is a good sign because sometimes when you're like in a sort of biome like this it's like it's actually kind of hard to find sand sometimes you'd be you'd be surprised let's go and put this back in here all right so we've got a stack here oh there's some floating ones up here also and oh would you look at that nice sunset that's just what you want to see after a hard days of work all right so let's go ahead and put this in the furnace let's go take this what we already have and let's just use it up i mean it's not going to take long but just uh, it's nice to use them up all right okay and it, we're getting there we're getting there well, it shouldn't take us too long to be honest you know when we fill all of this and we can look to uh, start building a house and you know the main things so and we can you know maybe do some more mining so stay tuned for that but look at it, it looks so nice like imagine when this is all done oh it's gonna look good it's gonna look good i can't wait to see the final product but can we make another furnace maybe to you know to try and speed the process up a little better let's make another furnace let's put it let's put it hit oh i didn't want to put it there i wanted to put it just about there. And then let's take some more slabs, what we already have, and let's put it in here. All right, there we go. So we've got some sand cooking up here, some sand cooking up here. And you know what? Let's make another furnace. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? Let's make another furnace, and let's put it here, and let's put the coal in it, and let's cook some cod. We are multitasking right now. Another tree, nice. Don't mind if I do. I'm just going to collect this wood. Drop down for me. Nice. Right, any saplings? Yes, of course. Boom, pop a sapling down. Go back to the chest, put some more kelp, wood, sticks, oak saplings. We've got five diamonds, so... Right, we need to eat that cod. Like, seriously. Let's just let the, uh, you know, the sand do its thing and smelt into glass. Let's go mining. There's a lot of cave to explore that we haven't yet. On the way, though, we'll take up some cobblestone. We're gonna need quite a few blocks, obviously, to, you know, build up and down if I need to go anywhere. Right, back down the creepy, uh, the creepy mine. Should we go down here, or... Can I see a Oh, some iron. Nice. Oh, there's a lot of iron down here, actually. Let's go ahead and take this up. Don't mind the darkness, by the way. I can uh, I can't help that right now, unfortunately. But hello, zombie. You wanna you wanna try and eat me? Take some more. Uh, let's take some more iron up. Nice. Hopefully, we can get a stack by the end of the mine. That is uh, that's what we need. At this rate, though, if we keep finding iron this easy, then I'm sure we'll do it. Nothing down there, so I'm not gonna even attempt to go and look down there. Oh, there's some more iron up there. But what's down here? Well, look. Oh my gosh! And more diamonds. Nice. Bro, this is like a gold mine over here. Let's go. More diamonds. We'll take that. Certainly take it. Three diamonds, baby. Let's go. Oh, some more lapis as well. We can uh, we can take some of those. More XP as well. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind. Look how much iron is in this cave, though. Like, what is going on? And, uh, and those three diamonds as well. Absolutely crazy. But let's just go ahead and collect this iron real quick. Look at that. 25 raw iron and also three diamonds. So... Let's go. Oh, look at this amethyst here. We can take this up. You know, it might look cool on the build. All right, so my iron pickaxe broke in the meantime, but we managed to collect two stacks and nine blocks of amethyst. So, oh, 
Hello, skeleton. Fancy seeing you here. We need to go back up top and actually, you know, make another pickaxe because this stone one isn't going to last much longer at all. So let's head back up then. Yeah, so we actually collected like lots of uh, amethyst uh, blocks, which is cool. And also lots of uh, shards as well. It's, uh, it's a phantom. You guessed that right. I hate these things, honestly. Come on then. You're not scary. Come on, phantom. What are you doing? Let's go. What are you doing, buddy? Look at him flying around. But whatever you're doing, it's not cool and it's not fun. So get slain. Right, let's put the amethyst in here for now. Put some more diamonds in there. Look at that. Eight diamonds now, so it's creeping up. Okay, let's take this glass out then. And let's take that out for now. Let's quickly use this up. Get rid of that kelp, because you know what kelp does to our blocks. It makes them all uh, all horrible. And let's place these seven blocks here. Let's place two over here. Oh, I actually really like the look of this. It looks really nice. At the bottom of this, we could put like lots of colourful coral blocks as well. We could do with a bed though, couldn't we? So how about we make some uh, wool out of the string? Let's try and collect more string. So we could do with some more spiders, honestly. Um, and what we do is we craft ourselves a bed. And then we make a house over there. And then we can finish filling in the gaps in the meantime. So we can like do it along the way. We can also get on to building a big farm and some other things. So uh, let's get into that. Before we do anything, though, it's important to eat. Um, so we are going to eat some apples and cod. Perfect combination, am I right? Oh, look at that. Nice 24 pieces of iron. Also, if you're enjoying this video so far and you want to show me your support, then be sure to subscribe and drop a like on the video. It really helps me out, and I appreciate every single one of you. Try to get these last few pieces up here before I take any damage. Ooh. And look at the trees growing, but why are they so short? They're literally tiny. What is that? Why are they so small? I'll ignore that for now, but let's deposit some more sand in the furnace. Our iron should be cooked. Nice. Three along the top, and voila. We have ourselves a new iron pickaxe. Okay, so let's make some more torches as well, because I feel like we really need that. And yeah, let's just put some other stuff in here, like bones, rotten flesh. Uh, we've got some more glass there. Oh my gosh, bro, you've got to be joking me. Look at it, it's after me again. Why don't we use it up on here, though? Let's uh, let's build along here. Let's just let's just get attacked first. Yeah, let's do that. Why are you uh, why are you doing this? Let's take these trees down then to allow some more to grow. So it looks like they're uh, they're pretty overgrown actually. Nice. There we go. And then just this final one, I believe. Is it this final tree? Now it should all just fall down like so. It's raining sticks and saplings and even apples. Two over here and one there. We'll allow these to grow for now. And then, uh, yeah, let's check this out over here. This is coming along nicely now. Uh, all I've got to do is fill in these gaps. The aquarium's coming along also. And let's just make, like, a ton of slabs. So then we got a stack and a bit. Let's put that in there. And with the remaining pieces of glass, let's go and uh, finish that aquarium of ours. We're going to have to make some buckets of water also. Uh, you know, just to, um, just to uh, you know, fill it up with some water, of course. Okay, right. So let's just get placing that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave a little gap just there so we can, you know, get in and out of the uh, of the aquarium to uh, then fill up with water. As a matter of fact, why don't we just quickly make some buckets now? So let's just quickly move over to the island. Um, right, where is that iron? There it is. All right, let's make some buckets. Buckets. Let's make two for now. Let's take two buckets of water now. And what we can actually do is we can swim underneath it, can't we? So if we go, go like that. Infinite water source, eh? Okay, so now if we check that out, is that all, uh... Okay, it's really tiny. Wow, this is going to be a problem for us, isn't it? Right, okay. Um... Didn't think this one through. Let's just put that on top for now. And of course my axe breaks, doesn't it? I mean, you can see the idea, right? Like, it's it's coming along quite nicely, I guess. Our sugar cane appears to be growing also. So we just leave that till it's all fully grown. And also some wheat is coming through, which is good. So, we're all off to a good start, aren't we? Alrighty, so in the meantime, we managed to get ourselves two stacks of sand. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to go back to the furnace and then place them inside and smelt them. And also, collect the glass that was already left in them. I believe that was the only one, right? Yeah. Okay. Oh, wrong one. <laughs> we'll let them smelt for now. And then in the meantime, I think we should go back mining, honestly. We need some more food. We'll take three pieces with us, just in case, you know, um, just in case we need it. Right, there we go. Um... And I believe that's all we need for now, right? So, oh, and another tree just popped out of nowhere. Right, we've got nine apples. That should do us. So, let's get back mining. We had another successful mine trip. So, hopefully we have another one and find even more diamonds. Let's explore this part. We've done the other part. But let's actually... Oh, oh wait, what's down here? Oh, hello, zombie. Didn't, uh, didn't expect to see you here, buddy. And, of course, there's always a creeper. Oh my gosh, there's loads of zombies. Oh, this leads to the other cave. Ah, right, okay, well, I just see more diamonds, so that's cool. Um, right, let's place some torches down here, actually, because it's getting uh, it's getting pretty dark down here. So, let's mine these pieces of iron here, nice. I love to see when there's lots. Let's go. Oh, hello, zombie. 
How you doing, buddy? All right, let's take this uh, iron. Please hurry up, because I don't want another mob coming in and trying to attack us. Oh my gosh, look how much iron's here. Wow, 10 pieces? Nice. All right, cool. And I think we should go for those diamonds down there also, so. Oh, hello, creeper. How are you doing, buddy? Okay. Just explode, that's fine. Oh, there's like another bit down here as well that we can go down. So let's go down here then. Yeah. Okay. Where was that diamond at? Was it right? Actually, we shouldn't have uh we shouldn't have lost track where that was, should we? Let's head back up. I think it's only below us anyways, but you know, just just to be sure. Right, let's go back down here. Oh, hello, slime. Whoa, what are you uh what are you doing down here, slime? Okay, right, let's uh let's go down here, like so. Let's plant that down. And let's get, uh, hang on. I want to get this slime. Give me your slime ball. Thank you. Oh, okay, okay. All right, come on. Oh, my gosh, there's a zombie villager. Okay, um, right. Okay, hang on. I want to collect my diamond. Oh, okay, there's two. Nice, let's go. Okay, well, we've got two more diamonds, which is nice. We've got a zombie villager. And, oh, my gosh, look at this place. This place is huge. Oh, my gosh. Nice, I needed that creeper to do that. Okay, we need to run. Right. Thankfully, it's mainly just zombies anyways. We need to plant some more torches down as well. Right, let's eat more apples while we can. Get rid of these zombies. Oh, I'm sorry, zombie villager. I can't heal you at the moment. I'm trying to get rid of these zombies. And unfortunately, it looks like you're going to... Oh, no. Oh, no, no. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. We haven't even got no sticks. Oh, no, 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 no. We need to go back up top. We need to go... Oh, my gosh. Okay, we have no sword. So... That isn't good. Okay, maybe we should have brought some sticks down with us. Yeah. Yeah, maybe we should we should have done that. Okay, well, let's go and get some sticks because that could have gone sour. Am I going the right way? No. Wait, I'm so confused. What? Is it down this way? Wait, where am I? Is it... Oh, okay, it's up here, right? Is it up here? Where am I? I've literally lost track of where I am. Oh, okay, right. It's up here. It's up here, of course. Right. Okay, well, I haven't got a sword, so it would have been pretty tough to defend myself without any, uh, you know, any sword. So let's go back up top, make some swords, and then let's go back down and explore that cave because that was huge down there. All right, we we have successfully made it back up to the top and we need to locate some sticks and then let's make an iron sword nice right so let's go ahead and put these diamonds back in here and oh look at that 10 diamonds now 10 nice shiny shiny blue diamonds all right okay we need to eat as well actually let's put the rotten flesh in there because yeah we don't need that but all three slime balls we'll uh, we'll leave that in there and it looks like the sugar cane is fully grown apart from this one but because i haven't got any patience it's all coming down Nice, right. Let's uh, make sure we collect every piece of sugar cane. And let's go ahead and stick it in the chest. Oh, wrong chest, apparently. It's in this one. So now we have a stack and seven. Nice. Uh, oh, the glass is smelled as well. All right, let's go, and, uh, let's go and use this glass up real quick then. Oh, my gosh. This kelp. I hate kelp so much. It's so annoying. But it's fine. It'll, uh, we'll get around that. All right, like that. I think we should just focus on doing one side first, actually, instead of keep doing both. There we go. Let's plant these last bits. Um, go like that, and then let's plant that. Oh no, that's so annoying! My OCD can't take it. Oh no! Oh look at that! Look at that kelp! Ah, oh, you've got to be kidding me! I'm going underwater for now. I can't. I can't deal with this. Oh no! No 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 no! I forgot we was an Aquaman. Oh dear! All right, come on then, Phantom. Oh, and also let's smelt this iron as well. Ah! Uh, whoa! Why are you coming in? Whoa! Why are you so fast there? What? That was crazy speed! What the heck? All right, come on, come on, land this, land this. No, he landed on me. We kind of exchanged there, but the point is he still hit me. Come on, Phantom. Block. What? You've got to be... No, I'm getting beat by a Phantom. Oh, my gosh. What am I doing? There we go. Finally. Oh, my gosh. Right. Um, We are going to take some sticks of us because, like, last time we needed them and, unfortunately, we didn't have them. So, we're going to keep some in our inventory for now. Um... Bucket of water, some apples. We need more food, though, don't we? I mean, you know, our food sources are running quite low here. We need some animals. That is what we need. But where do you find cows and pigs and chickens? Like, you know, we're kind of, uh, we are kind of stranded out here. All right, let's make some more slabs. Let's just take some slabs and let's pop them in the furnace. And it looks like we need more as well. So let's take this iron out here. Let's turn that into logs. And then let's just make some more slabs. La da 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 da. Like so. And then let's put some more in there and then let's put the rest in there and that should cover it now so all right nice oh we need them sticks don't we let's take 10 there we go right 10 sticks let's take some iron with us take like five iron that's it right some cobblestone maybe just in case all right we'll leave that sand to cook in there and let's take the iron out we might as well and um actually yeah we do need some more cod though cod where are you i see you cod don't run too far I need to eat you. Oh, well, I need air. Oh, my gosh. All right, let's go back down. Uh, come to me. I need to eat you. Thank you very much. 
Thank you. Come to me. There we go. Three pieces there and then. Wait, did I not pick up a piece? I don't know. I can't remember if I did or not, but oh well, it's okay. Well, okay, there's a dolphin uh, just chilling. Oh, dolphin's grace. Thank you. And also, I need to take some more cod over here. Oh my gosh, look how fast I'm swimming now. Whoa. Oh, okay, 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 okay. All right, buddy. Come on, fishy. Just come to me. Oh, there's some iron there. What? Get rid of all this kelp. I hate kelp. It's so, uh, it's so annoying. Go away. Would you look at that? Another beautiful morning on our lovely, lovely island. All right, let's let that cook up in there. How's the glass getting on? Nice, nice. Let's take that out. Go and put that in there. And why don't we just use it up in the meantime, eh? Now we can finally place that there. Okay, so now I feel a lot better. My OCD isn't playing up now. Place it all along till we reach the end. There we go. Let's go and take all this kelp up because it's so annoying, like, just floating there. Wow, look at There's literally lots of it. Wow. Well, we definitely won't be needing any more kelp after this. That's, uh, that's for sure. Oh, look how much cod's out here now. Place these last 15 blocks. This section's not far off of being done, honestly. Um, righty -o, then. Let's take this cooked cod out. Let's chop these trees down as well, actually. Make an iron axe because I forgot we actually, uh, ours broke. But let's get rid of this in the meantime. Nice. Hopefully we get some apples from that as well that we can eat. Nice juicy red apples. Oh, nice. Right, let's go and take this up from here. Oh, nice. Look at that shiny apple. Come to me. And you sapling. Ugh, there we go. I'm gonna need me some of this. Right, and voila. There we go. It's done again. I've got to stop saying voila. I don't know why I keep saying that. I'm just I think I'm just getting too excited, honestly. One there, one here, one there. Honestly, I think that concludes the tree farm for now. Any apples? I mean one apple though, seriously. I mean, come on, but whatever. It is what it is. We'll uh we'll leave that back in there. Actually, we'll take it with us, why not? So let's go back down to the mine. Oh, let's eat this apple. We might as well. I mean, why wouldn't we, right? Let's uh, let's regenerate those hearts. Back to the mine we go. I'm curious though, as like to what is inside of that cave because that was that looked like huge inside, and I don't know. It looked like there might be some interesting stuff in there for us, such as you know diamonds, hopefully. And you know that's what we keep forgetting to bring, but we have got sticks anyways. But we do need to keep bringing torches. We just uh, we're not bringing enough, that's for sure. So let's go down here, right? And let's make a little a little fountain down for us. Let's jump down like. So, and right, what's down here for us? Anything? Anything interesting or what? No? Okay, nothing at all. Uh, there's some more iron up there, but we can't be bothered to get that right now, honestly. Oh my gosh, there's some more diamonds I see straight off of the bat, and oh! Hello, actually, we need your string. Yeah, we need your string to make a bed, so. Come on, Spideys, over here. Not you, Creeper. Stay back. Right, come on. Let's go, Spidey. Give me your string. No, he didn't drop us any. Might as well take on these Creepers. Uh, nice. Let's take you on. Oh, there we go. Three string. Cool, cool. Uh, let's take this creeper on over here. And I also see more iron in that corner also. There we go. Let's quickly take this iron before any mobs spot us. All right, okay, that should do it. Wow, look how many ores is up here. Oh my gosh. And look at the mobs as well, but we need some coal. Um, Yeah, we need coal bad. Come on. Let's go. And with the coal we found, let's quickly make some torches as well while we're at it. There we go. That's better. Let's uh, let's start lighting this place up a little bit. Oh, there's loads of skellies here. Oh, yes. They're fighting each other. There we go. All we need is just these two creepers to blow up. Just like so. And, uh, oh, he won. So he's the better skelly. But not an hour watch. Right, okay. Let's uh, let's head back up this way then. Right, let's eat some cod first. And oh my gosh, look how much iron is down here also. Whoa. This place is huge. Oh, let's just pick you off, creeper. Okay, right. There's lots of iron over here. Let's actually go and check this out very briefly. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, right. Oh, there's a, a angry skeleton trying to uh, hunt us down right now. But, oh my gosh, look how many mobs is down here. Oh, okay, there's some more amethyst. Oh my gosh, look at this place. How about we uh, line this place up just a little bit. And let's uh, click this amethyst. Listen to that beautiful sound it makes while you mine it. Wow, how nice. Okay, that should be enough, to be honest. 41 blocks. I mean, I doubt we'll be needing much more, to be honest. Okay, but let's head back out of here now. And, of course, we get attacked by a little spidey. Oh, my gosh, there's a witch. Okay, there's literally a witch right there. Okay, so after a long mining trip, I decided to come back up top, just to the surface, to work on my build a little bit. So, as you can see behind us, well, now in front of us, but we need to finish off the glass for the floor. So, I think we're going to have to grind some sand. But if I do remember correctly, I'm pretty sure I left some in the furnace. So, yeah, there we go. There's seven there and five here. What about this other one? I'm pretty... Yeah, okay. It's only iron in here, so that's fine. So, let's just use up these last 12... Oh, accidentally took a little bit of fall damage there. Let me quickly eat this uh, cook cod. But how about, though, we quickly use up these last 12 pieces but now we've finished the last piece i think we should just craft a few shovels and really get to work with the sand uh try bring as much sand as we possibly can uh, so there's an iron shovel right there and we've already got some iron in our inventory so let's quickly make some shovels i may maybe four is a little bit overkill let's just make 
Let's make two more so then we got, you know, we got three shovels in total now. So, okay, so there's sand here. So, I think we should literally just get to work with the sand. Um, we need to, we need as much as possible. So, I guess stay under here for a little bit and mine some sand. And of course, it's raining again. I mean, what is this weather on this island? It's always raining. Oh, well, I suppose that's just what you get for, you know, being the literal middle, the middle of nowhere, but whatever. But let's just grab as much sand as we can then. Um, just like this and then I think after we get as much glass as we can and you know fill in all the gaps Once we've done that we can start building a house. So that'd be pretty fun It's not gonna be the biggest house, but I think we're gonna have like a nice little, you know symmetrical house over there Um, you know just to keep us going through these uh through these nights. Let's just take this sand nice nice There is a lot of sand down here actually, but it's just it's hard to mine when you're underground honestly Oh, I need to come up because I'm running out of bubbles. But let me quickly grab this sand Ugh, There we go then pick this one up and let's just do what we we do best. Really scary out here, isn't it? When you actually take a close look and look in the distance, it, it is actually a bit of a scary place. Oh, and that is very scary, actually, that uh, that thunder. But it's fine. It's just me and my trusty iron shovel. Brilliant. So how much have we got right now? Okay, so we've got 44. So if we go down there, we can get at least a stack. So that'll, uh, that'll help us a lot, actually. Oh, that thunder's pretty scary. I can't lie. It's, uh... Oh, wait, I'm pretty sure something just got struck by lightning. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. What is this? Oh, my. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, that's that's dangerous. We're gonna, we're gonna head back in the water, actually, where we're safe. Because I'm pretty scared, actually. I haven't seen many drowns down here, though. I can't lie so i don't know what's going on with that but i'm not complaining i mean you know just i prefer to be left in peace honestly oh we need to come back up uh, let's go back down collect our sand yada 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 uh there we go so we got a lot of plans actually after this so like i said we're gonna fill in all the gaps over there so you know we're halfway done on one side we just get up there we go so like i said look we're halfway done on this side here so once we fill this side in we're gonna start this side well we already have made a little start but we're gonna fill on this side and then get to the back Oh my gosh. And then, yeah, once we've filled in all the glass, like I say, we're going to build a house over there and then look into building, like, a bit of a farm over here. Even if we can get some villagers, that'd be pretty cool as well. But, I don't know, it will be a bit of a challenge for us. But, and then, like I said, never over there. So, we've got our plan of action sorted. It's just we need to actually uh, get the ball rolling a little bit and actually, like, do what we say. There's lots of kelp down here. Oh, no. I nearly, I nearly trapped myself there, actually. Right, but we've got to stack in a little bit. So, how about, then, we put our sand in here for now. Uh, what we got? we got some... We've got six coal, but we actually want to save that. Let's make some slabs. Let's make some slabs then, yeah, why not? Let's make 18 slabs, and let's put them in here for now. And we can always top up. Uh, actually, yeah, we need we need more in here also. Oh, no. All right, let's quickly get crafting then. Let's put them in there for now. And then the leftover, we can just put in this one. But anyway, we're going to let that cook in there for now. We've got enough cod. We've got 18 pieces of cooked cod, so that's always a good sign. Let's quickly, uh, ouch. I've got to stop doing that. But let's just wait till that smelts, and then, uh, yeah, we can get placed with the glass. It's not the best looking tank, is it? I feel like we should put the glass here, so. So maybe we're gonna do that. Also, if you are enjoying the video so far, then why not drop a like? You know, it helps me out, and why not be kind? I mean, it's 2024 now by the time this video goes out, so Happy New Year as well, I guess. This kelp is really annoying me, actually. My OCD's playing up. How about we quickly collect this kelp? Oh, and some sand here as well that I've missed. Okay, so it is now sunlight, and oh, look at the look at that sun just glistening on that lovely water surface. Absolutely beautiful stuff. It's daytime, so that's a good sign. There's no mobs outside, so you know we can't be uh, too petrified. But um, nevertheless, let's uh, let's get cracking with this glass then. And oh, do you know what would help? It would help if we actually grabbed the glass out the furnace first. So that's what we're going to go ahead and do. So let's, uh, so that's still cooking in that one, but we've got eight pieces here. I mean, why, why not just use it up? I mean, it's only eight pieces, but this is what we got to do while we wait for the other ones to, you know, finish doing what they're doing. Okay, like that. And that was eight pieces. And that literally got me nowhere. That was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, well, just minus that one there. But that was eight pieces just there. Like, what? But hey, I see some trees overgrown here and obviously we need some new ones to grow. We're gonna miss out on a lot of wood, so why not just get chopping then? Chopping, chopping, chopping. Chop these two down here. Nice. And then, this is why I love, like, the falling tree mod, because it's just so nice. Like, it's, you haven't got to touch the leaves. It just all comes down with it. It's just, oh, it's such a good mod. Honestly, highly recommend it. It saves a lot of time as well. It's just good. I couldn't, I couldn't live without it now. I've got it, honestly. It's so good. Alright, last few then. I'm pretty sure it's just this one and another two trees, I believe. Well, another three, but now it's another two trees. But let's collect those lovely logs and then hopefully some saplings drop and some apples as well, because I, I like apples, honestly. I think, uh, I think they're very underrated. But anyways, let's, uh, where is the missing oak log? 
Where is it? Why isn't it all dropping? Um, am I just, am I not seeing it? Am I just being completely oblivious to it? Or, ah, huh, what's, what's going on then? Where is, uh, where is it? Maybe if I, oh, is it, oh, well, I think it's dropping now. Is it? What's going on? Ah, uh, <sighs> well, it turns out it's not working, actually. This is quite strange. I, I don't know what's going on with the mod, but it seems to not be working. So, uh, this is a bit of a disaster, isn't it? Well, anyway, I guess we'll just leave them leaves to fall and do their thing. But, uh, that's, uh, that's pretty strange, actually. We're gonna, we're gonna try and fix that later. But that isn't our main concern right now. We've got a load of oak logs, so how about we put it in the wooden chest? Um, so look, we've got a stack here, a couple stacks here. We've got actually three stacks of oak logs, so that's a lot of wood. And some oak slabs also, so that's pretty good. We're looking pretty good on the wood so far. Um, this is the thing about the tree farm. I mean, it's just, it's brilliant. I mean, you haven't got to go out your way just to farm some wood. You know, like any other Minecraft world. But anyway, let's just place these last few saplings here then. Place that here, and then that one there. And I believe that is all for now. So we can let these, uh, you know, the rest of these oak leaves just drop and turn into sapling sticks and apples whatever you know what whatever they gotta do but we're just gonna let it do their magic for now so let's check on our sand then okay nice we've got half a stack here so if we quickly go how much we got left 32 that's 36 there so let's just put that in there and then yeah let's use up the 32 glass we already have oh my gosh did you guys see that the lightning again it's just oh it's just so annoying is it trying to destroy me right now is it trying to you know this is the thing with these 100 day challenges it's just oh no okay well like i was saying these 100 day challenges are are literally a challenge challenge because you get you know this this sort of stuff happens on the regular basis and it is so annoying because you try and do one thing and then you got to you know you got to deal with some angry phantoms for some reason i don't know why we can't just all get along you know surely they're just leave me alone by now oh my gosh look at the speed of that one i'm actually losing to phantoms what is going on oh my god oh wait what am i doing what have i done there uh oh uh oh uh oh uh oh my shield my shield my shield quickly quick quick quick, quick. okay what's going on go away be gone phantom uh! wait what are they what are they doing? What is with this weather as well, by the way? This is so like, oh, where's the good weather? Why isn't the sun out? Why is it always raining and so gloomy and cloudy? I don't get it. Okay, what is that phantom doing? Is he gonna come down then, or are we just gonna have a little standoff, or like what? Okay, one there. Oh, we didn't get another hit off of him. That is quite annoying. But hey, it dropped some sticks, some saplings. Nice. Actually, a lot of saplings. Wow, that's uh, that's pretty good. Oh, and a stick there. Yeah, I picked it up. Okay, nice. Come on then, phantom. Let's have it for a last. There we go. All right, well, we got rid of him, but let's use up these last two. Last two, I mean last ten. What am I talking about? And then hopefully by now, most of that sand has smelted in the furnace. Oh my gosh, I I can't catch a break round here. I literally, there's always... Oh, you know what, though, it's always good to be putting under some pressure, I suppose, but come on. Give me a little bit of a break. These phantoms. There we go. Oh, oh no, so close. Oh, okay, they're coming back for some more. Okay, you want some as well, huh? 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 Come on then. Oh, there we go. All right, you're dead. Come on, let's have you as well. Let's go. Get out of my sight. We really need a bed. There's so much things I want to do, but I can't. It all takes time. I want to go and explore that monument over there. I want to go and explore the rest of the world. I need to fill the glass in. I need uh, I need some villagers to help me out, honestly. Okay, so we've got another 18 pieces then. So let's quickly, you know, use them up. Like so. Pretty good. And we've got an apple, so why not just eat it? Like so. I mean, that's really going to annoy me with my OCD, but that little hunger bar there isn't fully regenerated. But it's fine. You know, it's fine. Actually, have we got another apple? We've got a carrot. Mm, let's save that, actually. But, oh, look at these. Two more trees have grown. So let's quickly get rid of these. Nice. And then let's get rid of this one. Lovely. Lovely. Nice. All right, so we've got nine pieces from that. Nine logs. Let's go deposit it in the chest. And, oh, we've got ten more pieces of sand. So it'd be rude not to, you know, smelt the rest. Um, hmm. Where's all that stick? Give me that stick. Right, so I felt like we should craft a boat, then, if we want to go and explore the rest of the world. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, so we've got an oak boat now. Uh, Why don't we just quickly, you know, go and harbour it up? Can we place it? Or There we go. Right, let's harbour it there for now. You know, that's all ready to go and set sail. And now all we got to do is just get over another night and we're going to explore. I mean, I think we're like, for the rest of the night, let's just grind some sand, you know, get the sand in so we got like a lot of it. Do you know what I mean? So we haven't got to keep going back and farming it and smelting it, etc. So I think for the rest of the night, we're just going to go and farm a lot of sand and then see how, we, uh, see how we get on, I guess. I spent the rest of the night underwater in the freezing cold trying my best to collect some sand. And while doing so, I was thinking what to do next after I filled the rest in the base with glass. And boom, the idea that crossed my mind is to first of all, obviously go and fill the glass in, but after, go and explore the rest of the world. So that's what I did. So after spending some time, you know, collecting some sand, we managed to get quite a bit, which I'll show you in a minute in the chest. But if you take a look behind us, it's becoming morning again, at last. So enough of the phantoms attacking us. Uh, we can finally start, you know, building a lot more and, and doing the things that we need to get done today. So if we take a look in the chest, I put it all in the bottom. We got 64 there. Another stack there, three more, and also we got 16, so... But yeah, we got over... What was this? Two, four, five, five and a bit. So we've got five stacks here. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I, I just had to make sure in case I wasn't being dumb. But we've got five stacks of sand here, and also we got 16 just here. Oh, 
sorry, I forgot to mention as well, we also had a stack cooking up in the furnace. What about over here? I'm, yeah, okay. We've got a lot of glass on our hands. Hopefully, we should have a lot of that done. Let's make some more slabs. Uh, that should do the trick. Okay, just a little bit less, but it's fine. We can always can always add. So, right, we've got more sand cooking up in there. More sand being smelted in this one. And we've got a stack of nine pieces of glass. So, why don't we just quickly use it up? Look how much better it looks like when... The, oh, no. Like, ignore that. But like I was saying, look... What am I doing? Like I was saying, look how much better it looks of the daytime. And it's just... Oh, honestly, th this... This, this shaders pack is just so nice. It completely transforms Minecraft, honestly. Y you gotta love a shaders pack. Let's just get placing down here then. Like so. Nice. Uh, oh, that's annoying. But hey, we're getting there. I mean, we're getting there, aren't we? Hello, chickens. What's um, what's going on here then? Um, wh where did you where did you guys come from? Okay, hang on. We need to wear some seeds. We need some seeds ASAP. Okay, we got some seeds here. So come on, chickens. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna quickly craft you guys a nice little. Ah, uh, hang on. We haven't got enough wood but it's fine right hang on we need to take some wood nice all right, now let's make a couple of more of those. And then let's make some um, fence gates real quick. Let's make two, actually. Why not? Right, like so. Rightio, then. Um, oh, hang on. Sorry. Sorry, chickens. Come over here. You know what? Let's quickly just go in. Go in. Come on. Yep. A little bit more. What the heck? What am I doing? There we go. Right, come on. Go in. Shh. There we go. Right, nice. Um, let's actually feed you guys some wheat seeds because maybe you can give me more chickens. Yeah, let's just put that there for now, actually. Oh, there we go. Look at that. We've got some baby chickens. Look at that. It's a little baby chick. Give some seeds. And we got some baby chickens now. So that's exciting. There we go. We've got a little um we've got a little pen going for the chickens now. We can't be too stupid and you know keep opening this fence gate. By the way, as I say that I literally open it. But anyways, let's uh, put the seeds back in here for now then. And let's equip our shield because we need that for protection. And yeah, so it's looking pretty good. Oh, we need our cod. That is what we do need. I reckon, I reckon, I reckon we put more sand in here. Uh, we take more wood and make them into some slabs. Let's put some more in here then, so we got enough. Right, that'll do there. And then let's put some more in here. Let's put it all in there, actually. There we go. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Perfecto. Right. I say, why don't we set sail and, you know, explore the rest of it while, um, you know, our chickens does it. You know, does it thing? Maybe the baby chicken will be grown by the time we get back. But, or oh, actually, we need to have some sugar cane. What are we doing? We can't just let that. Oh. Didn't mean to do that. There we go. Nice, nice. Click some more down here. Cool. Okay, so 20 pieces of sugar cane. Nice stuff. And also, why don't we take up some wheat while we're at it as well then? There we go. Nice, nice, nice. Well, uh, we've got some wheat going there as well. So how about we just quickly get planting them back? Well, there's some in the water as well. Don't worry, I will get those. Nice. All right, so we've got 11 pieces in total. And oh, there's some more sugar cane that we didn't collect. So now I've done that, why don't we just set sail and, you know, go explore the rest of the world? Goodbye, island. I'll be back. I promise. Hopefully, I'll come back all in one piece. And also, when I come back, hopefully, the uh, glass is all smelted. But oh, I hear a dog dolphin somewhere. Oh, there it is. There's two dolphins behind us. Wow, that's pretty cool. But we're just completely going into the void. And what is that over there? Is that like a little uh, little monument there? Or what actually is that? Hey, dolphins, you want to wanna chill? You just, you just following me? Uh, what is, uh, what's the deal here? There's lots of cod down there. Oh, uh, we got some mobs here. We got some drowns. We got some... Oh, uh, okay, this is scary. But oh, look, there's some land over here. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. They're trying to attack us. But the dolphins got our back. You know, they're going to help us. But would you look at that? We've reached shore. And oh, my. Look at, look at all this. Whoa. Okay, let's actually Actually, let's anchor up just here then. There's a lot of sand here actually, so why don't we just take advantage and take some more sand? Just because we can. There's more sugar cane here as well, so why don't we just take this up? And I've just noticed it's getting dark. Maybe this might have been a wrong time to come here. But oh, there's some coral down here. Let's uh, go ahead and take this up. Oh, there's some nice coral here. This is what we need for the uh, for the aquarium. This is what we need. So why don't we just be sneaky about this and quickly take it up? Oh no. No, 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 no. Okay, actually, I suppose we can do that on the way back, can't we? Yeah. I mean, why not? Take that though. Wait, where did it come here? There we go. All right, well, let's just take that there for now, then. And would you look at this? Well, there's lots of trees going on over there. There's oh, there's a zombie here, so let's go and take this guy on. We haven't, uh, we've only seen you in caves. We haven't really seen you on land, have we, zombie? But look at this. Mate, why didn't I come here earlier to farm some sand? It would have been so much easier. Oh, oh, hello, guys. Can I, uh, can I help you with anything? Or are we just gonna battle it out? There we go, all right. Oh, there's some spideys there. Help us with some string, you know, to make a bed. Actually, we could steal a bed, couldn't we? If there's any in those, uh, in those buildings. Oh, come on, then. Oh, hello, creeper, as well. Are you gonna, are you gonna try and blow us up? There we go. Oh, hello. Um, hello, Iron Golem. Oh, there's, there's a few down here, actually, and some hay bales. Why don't we, uh... Oh, are they fighting over there? Oh, my... What's, uh... What's going on? What am I witnessing? Iron Golem just completely dominated everyone there. But let's take these hay bales up, because, you know, they're pretty cool. Oh, my gosh! 
That scared me so much. Oh, come on, Iron Golem. Protect me. Wait, he's not going for me, is he? No, hopefully not. I feel like he's going to come and attack me. He's really scary, actually. Oh, my gosh. There's too many mobs here. What are they doing? Are they going to come back down or? Oh, the Iron Golem isn't that fast enough. What do you think, Golem? Oh, go on, attack him. There we go. Whoa. Attack this one as well. Go on. Oh, my gosh. Iron Golem is OP. Let's go, Golem. Right. Let's take these hay bales in like I was doing in the first place. This look cool for the farm, you know, nice for the build. We're going to collect as many as we can, you know, so we've always got enough. It's always nice to have more than enough than not enough, so. Let's go ahead and take that up, but let's go and explore down here then. Look at this. Oh, you stuck there, Golem? Do you want me to give you a hand there? Can you can you walk up now? Maybe? I'm not sure, but... Oh! I accidentally stood on that, but... You've got to be kidding me. More phantoms? I, can, I can't I can escape these guys, honestly. I can, I can never escape them, but... Oh, look at this. Oh my gosh, speed of that! I want to go in here. Oh, we've got a smoker. Why don't we go ahead and take that smoker, actually? Is there anything under here or... No, nothing. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Uh, what's in these buildings down here, then? Oh, hello, villager. How, uh, how you doing, buddy? Oh, we got some nice wheat for us. Actually, you know what? Let's sleep so then, you know, we get rid of the mobs. There we go. Sorry I took your, uh, I took your bed there, but I'm gonna actually take it for good now. So sorry about that, but... Ooh, okay, let's, let's get rid of some membrane and all that other stuff. Just chuck it in that corner, and then let's take all the bread and all the wheat, and also a book here as well. Um, what can we drop? What don't we need? We don't need kelp, do we? Surely. Uh, dead bush, chest. Okay, wait, no, that is actually it. Okay, well, we took some wheat and some bread, so that's nice. Cool, cool. Uh, anything in this one? Just another bed. Might as well have a double bed. Uh, yeah, go on then. Why not? Some more bread. Nice, some more wheat. Let's go. Lots of bread. I'll leave you to it in there, though. I feel like I'm disturbing you. Why don't we go, uh, why don't we go in here? Oh, we got a stone cutter. Nice. Let's take that. Anything else down here? Is it just, is this it? Or, I think we should go, oh, what's in here? Oh, we've already been all in here, haven't we? Yeah. Right, let's go, uh, let's go back up to the top then. Hello, I am Golem. How are you? I'm really scared by them golems, actually. I always feel like they're gonna go and do something. Oh, look at this. There's a composter here. Some more wheat and seeds. Let's go ahead and take this up. I'm sorry, villagers. I'm sorry, but some beetroot seeds. We don't really need those, do we? Um, yeah. Oh, hello. We could do with you, farmer. We could do with you, actually. I can't help but notice there's a chest over there, so let's take this composter then. Um, what can we drop? What can we drop? Gravel. That's it. We don't need that. Oh, wait. He's not a, he's not a farmer anymore. But we can go and bring him back, I suppose. It would be a bit difficult, though, but whatever, whatever. Um, oh, more bread and seeds in here. Do you know what? Actually, I... What is that? Oh, little baby villagers, look. They're all roaming around. I mean, we could bring them back, but then I like to do my own sort of farming. I mean, it would be cool, you know, to have them there, but it's just, I don't know, maybe we don't need them too much, do we? Little, uh, little well they got here, little wishing well. Anything in this chest? Oh, just a crafting bench, it's fine, we'll leave that one. Anything in here, though? We'll take that, because we're, you know, we're really cheeky. Anything in here? Oh, some emeralds. Mm, I suppose we could take those, actually. All right, well, that's pretty cool. We've uh, met, like, a little desert village thing. That's, uh, that's cool. Where did I anchor that boat? Just to know where... Okay, yeah, it's over there. All right, that's fine. Just so I know, you know, sort of where I'm at. So let's head back down here, then. Some netherrack here that we actually do need to take. So we can take that. Oh, little chest. Golden boots. Okay, some iron nuggets. That'd be cool to use for some lanterns. Glistening melon. With some more sugar cane over there. How about we take this netherrack up, though? We need this netherrack, actually, to make our nether portal look cool on our own island. The nether is actually a really scary place when you go and think about it. When you're actually there, it's I don't know, it's like a, obviously it's a whole new world but it's just scary. I mean, who wants to, who wants to be stuck in the nether? Because not me. That's uh, that's for sure. Just realised we need to drop something here. Uh, let's drop the sea pickles. Why not? Let's take all this netherrack. Nice. So I'm glad we explored this because now by the time we get back, we've got lots of sand. The glass is smelting, doing its thing. And we're collecting some netherrack even though we haven't even been to the nether yet. There's a stack there. A stack should do us actually for now. So let's go and head over here then. Go and see what's uh, what's going on over here. Look at these little underwater caves, though. There's lots of them, isn't there? Oh, some more chickens here. Let's, uh, let's actually take you to take that, and then let's take up some more sugar cane. Actually, that is what we need. We need dirt. All right, there we go. That'll do. So let's just take some more dirt, then. Who would have thought we would have been grinding dirt, because... Not me, honestly, not me. Let's go ahead and just take this dirt, though, you know, while we can. Three more, one, two, three, and then there we go, we got a stack, nice. Take some more sugar cane, then we've got to take advantage of this sugar cane, actually. Get as much as we can, yada, yada, yada. Let's take some of this, and oh my gosh, look at that over Oh, that scared me, though, there's footsteps. Let's go and check this out over here, though. Whoa, what is that up there? I don't want to lose track of where I'm at, but I just, I feel like I want to go and check that out up there, honestly. Take some more sugar cane. Oh, that looked like a little spooky cave down here. Oh, look at all these cobwebs and everything. Oh my, look at this. Go and check it out down here. Is this too risky? Mm, down here, then. There's some coal here. Why don't we go and take that while we're here? Why not? Why not? It would be cheeky to, uh, you know, just leave it there, wouldn't it? Whoa, why is there so much coal down here? What? Look at it. There's lots of it. I've got to drop 
something again. I forgot to drop the string. I'm sorry. Not the end of the world. There we go, though. Oh, some more down here. What? When is it going to stop? What? I have hit the coal mine. What is What is this? Oh, my gosh. It's still going. What? How much coal? Okay, I was going to say, surely it was going to stop there. Look at that. We've got 40 pieces of coal. Oh, actually, 41. All right, that's cool. Um, let's go back down here, then, where we came from. Where was? It? Where did we come from? Down here, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay, well. Oh, I hear some spiders. Got to be careful. Got to be careful. Are they, are they above us? Where are they, actually? Are they... Okay, I hear a ton of mobs, so I'm going to eat this cook card while I can. Where are they? I can hear them, but I'm not quite close to them, am I? Um, where are you, mobs? Are you up here? Okay, i got to be careful, because I'm getting myself involved with a lot of mobs, aren't I? Oh, oh no, not you guys. Oh, there's a spawner. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm getting uh, I'm getting out of here. No way. I've done this uh, on one of my last videos, and it was pretty scary, those spawners, so I'm not going to even attempt to go and check that out but let's go up here for now wait this is where the spawner was wasn't it yeah i'm not going down there let's just go up here uh yeah okay let's go up here then there we go all right so we've reached another sort of villager villager place let's take the hay bales why not all right nice no we don't really need that um anything else no or some more wheat and seeds let's go ahead and take that up <laughs> sorry villagers my bad my bad but i did Oh, there's another iron golem there. I do, but I do need them. I'm sorry. Nothing going on down there. What's, uh... Oh, oh hello, villagers. How are we, uh, how are we all doing down here? Watch this iron golem. Watch what it does. Oh, my gosh. You just love to see it. It's just always one hit. So satisfying. Let's go and, uh, Let's go and check that out down there, actually. Let's take the skeleton on. There we go. Nice. Good stuff. Good stuff. We're already nearly level 30. And we haven't even had, like, an XP farm yet or anything. This is just brilliant. It's brilliant. Um, right. What is this down here, then? I don't want to get lost. Ah, uh, look at this stuff here, then. Okay. Well, we don't need any more netherrack but let's head back to where we came from then oh my gosh zombie villager as well no they got you you got infected look he's after us but let's head back to where we came from okay right let's uh let's try and head out of here then we need to eat some cook god we make it in time yeah okay that's fine right let's head back was it in this direction or was it over this side uh well we came from okay let's let's go over this side we'll find it eventually okay so i remember this over here yes yeah, so i think we're close right okay let's keep heading over this direction then was it over here oh no there's a creeper there let's try and avoid him okay so this is where i came from wasn't it yeah this is where i took all the nether axe so that means the boat should be there there we go right, let's head back now so i'm getting a little bit homesick because it is getting very scary out here now actually but hey successful trip though we managed to get some hay bales some smokers some posters uh we got a scion bed we've got some emeralds some bread some wheat some books some iron nuggets we've got a load of goodies so let's head back then try to avoid that monument over there because we don't want to get attacked Although we have got our iron sword out ready, prepared, just in case anything does kick off. Yeah, look, he's already out scouting us, I can see him. Let's head back to the island. Hello, drowned. Don't mind me, just passing through, buddy. Just passing through. There it is, look at it, all nice and lit up. I've missed this island. I've missed it today. That drowned's really following us, isn't it? Mm. Look how much kelp is under here, though. It's too much of it. We could actually put the kelp in the composter and get a lot of bone meal. Head around the side, and let's anchor up just about here. There we go, that, that looks nice, doesn't it? All right, okay. How's the sand getting on? All oh, nice. Stack there. Basically a stack there. Oh, we should have used this one as well, you know, while we're at it. Oh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Right, okay. Let's deposit all the stuff in here then. Or not actually. Uh... Right, let's put the sand in here, though, for now. Let's put the wheat and bread in here. Some sugar cane there. Some emeralds, boots... All the other stuff. Yeah, let's just let's put it all in there. Why not? Okay, okay. Let's go ahead and cook that raw chicken, though. Where's the coal? There is. Oh, we've got a lot of coal now. Nice. Well, we've got some more chickens now. And I told you, look, by the time we come back, it would have grew. So let's feed it some more seeds in to make some more. And some more baby chickens. There we go. Look at that. Where is the baby chicken? There it is. I... I kind of see it. Where is it? You're you're hiding it. There it is. Hello, baby chicken. I'll give you some seeds. Oh, you thought, you thought. Oh, some eggs. All right, let's go and take the glass out of here then. Let's make some more slabs to cement with. Where is it? Put the sand in here. Right, so we've got that cooking now. So we've got two stacks of glass here. So let's get it used up. Let's just come along. Nice. Let's quickly use this up just here in the corner. Nice. And then let's use the rest of it up. And we should have this one side done. Hopefully. That's what I'm hoping for anyways. Ah, no. Imagine if we only have one piece left, that's going to be annoying because we just used it up there by accident. Okay, it doesn't matter because we uh, we were a little bit short anyway. But look at this. It's basically filled up this bit. That's, uh, that's pretty cool. While that does its thing... Um, oh, actually, do you know what we're going to do? We're going to take some... Where did I put them seeds? Did I put it in here? No, I must put it in this one. There we go. Okay, 32 seeds. Well, 45 actually. And where is that dirt we had? Uh, there it is. Okay, right. So what we're going to do is we're going to extend this out like so. Okay, then what we're going to do is all oh, we need a hoe. So let's quickly craft ourselves a little hoe. We don't need to because there's already one in the chest that we already used, right? So let's quickly do this and then 
plant the seeds on top and we have a lot more wheat seeds a lot more wheat i mean okay so let's do the same with this side plant them down and lovely lovely stuff all right cool if we grab some sand because we have got some sand to spare to be honest take some of that sugar cane and then we can plant some around oh that's that's my bad let's quickly build a little foundation for it there we go now we can place sand on top right I, oh what am I what am I doing? Right like that. So then let's place it on not like that. Let's place it on top of the sand. What am I doing? Well I'm being Oh, what am I Do you know what? I'm doing I'm making silly mistakes. There we go. Right. Let's plant that on there. And there we go. Just like that. We'll have more sugar cane coming through. And also we'll have more wheat. Matter of fact, we can even extend around here. Like so. And then grab some more wheat seeds. Like that. There we go. That's that's looking pretty cool. Nice, nice, nice. Alright then. How's our chickens getting on? Do you want some more want some more seeds? Anyone? <gasps> that was close. Right, I can't give you any more seeds now, so that's going back in the chest. How's the sand getting on? Nice. We'll put another stack in there for now. Uh, let's take that bit out. Let's make some more slabs. Should we just use it all up? Yeah, why not? Put some in there. 36 we need, so let's just have 35. <laughs> We've got just less than a stack, but the most important thing is we'll have this side done. Whoops. I hate it when I keep wasting glass. It's so annoying. But hey, most important thing is we got uh, we got one side done. Now let's get this side done. I got to work with placing the glass and I gotta say this took way longer than I thought but regardless we cracked on with it until it was done. You gotta remember these gaps that we was filling was pretty big so as a result of that this took so much sand and I had to keep going back and forth to the furnace. But with some perseverance, we filled all the glass in, and I gotta say, it looks super clean. Now we had the entire base complete, all that was left to build is a home, a farm, a nether portal, and maybe some other builds. So, let's dive into that. First things first, I saw the tree farm was looking pretty overgrown, so I decided to take care of that, and just to get rid of the logs. After I was done chopping the trees, I sat in patience hoping that the leaves would drop me some more apples, sticks and even some saplings. So after all that, if we head back to our lovely island and then head over here, you can see already in the distance that I've already built the sort of foundation for the house. So if you didn't know already, this is where the house is going and I hear a whale. Where is that? No, I mean the dolphin, not a whale. What am I talking about? Where is it? There it is, under there. I guess have fun underneath my uh, my base, but whatever. But yeah, as you can see, I've already built the foundation here, so I feel like this will be big enough. We don't want to make it too big because obviously, like, what's the point of just wasting loads of materials just to build, like, a massive space that I'm not going to use? And yes, I know, hence the massive circle. Oh filled in with glass in the middle it looks cool okay just just leave me alone all right but anyways yeah so we got that built behind us and uh this is what we're going to build the house on first things first let's head over back to the chests then grab some materials out that we do need so obviously we need like lots of wood but anyways we're going to fill the circle in just with slabs for now and then we'll move on to actually building the house let's take a stack of uh, oak planks out then and then let's go in here and turn these into slabs we're not going to use all of it up because i feel like that's very unnecessary but we might as well just make more than a stack but whatever but anyways let's get cracking with this then so if you just come along like so and then fill the rest of this in we have ourselves a proper foundation for it then and it won't just be open in the middle and you know it'll actually be all filled in i just realized it's becoming night time again and i haven't placed torches around here so yeah bad uh bad idea actually let me just quickly place the remaining torches i have on here just so i don't get any mobs because imagine if i get a creeper come on here and try and blow everything up that'd just be like terrible wouldn't it let's try and avoid that then how have we nearly done a stack already and we haven't even got anywhere why does it take up so much wood what the heck well it looks like we're uh we're gonna have to go back then well we went to sleep and i can tell you i am not scared anymore the sun's out which is really nice and we're gonna break this bed actually real quick and just pop it in here for now nom 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 but we're halfway done filling the base in let's just come along this side damn i keep accidentally doing this maybe while i was over there i should have crafted myself an axe but it doesn't matter it's okay and is everyone having a good day so far you know if you're watching this and uh you're having a good day let me know in the comment section down below i'm curious to what you guys are actually doing right now just gonna place it there and then there okay well we've only got this little section here to finish off so i'm sure we'll have that done maybe even a stack will do it i actually a stack will do more than that we'll have plenty look at this that wasn't even enough well that's just great isn't it i guess we've got to go back for more then guys am i just being dumb or is that genuinely like is that how much it takes oh my gosh well i suppose i'll have to grab some more wood then and then go in here 24 pieces will will be more than enough i can say that very confidently now three and six there we go right we've done it we actually filled it in now we can move on to actually building it up and you know getting it up why don't we take all this up then do a bit of harvesting take all this up nice nice collect those seeds collect those seeds so let's place all these seeds back 
like. Why don't we just harvest some sugar cane then, eh? And do you know what I think would look cool in the middle? If you put some sandstone around the actual edges. I'll show you what I mean in a second, but let's just quickly craft some sandstone. Like so. Okay. Put it like that. We're gonna have to reconstruct this then. Alright, so I was getting pretty frustrated, honestly, with this whole, like, tank thing, but to be honest, we managed to get there in the end, and it actually looks pretty cool. It's like a little fish tank. We're gonna put some fish in there later on, but I just think it looks pretty cool, honestly. I put some coral at the bottom, as you can see. I literally went out my way and farmed loads of coral, by the way. This is how much it actually really annoyed me. We already had some left over in the chests anyway, so that was cool. But we also had to make some sand into some sandstone, and also turn them into some slabs to get this, like, nice little finish. By the time I put some fish in here as well, it looked pretty cool, I think. I also put some seagrass in there as well to give it some, you know, extra detail. I like it. Honestly, I think it looks pretty cool. I think now we should start with the construction of our build, so let's get building. Firstly, I started off by laying down the piers. After that, I raised them by three blocks. After raising the piers, I began placing fences all around the build. This was to make sure I was nice and secure. I thought it would be nice to decorate the piers with some cobblestone walls, so that's what I did. On each side of my home, I built a staircase, therefore you can have easy access and enter any way you want. As simple as it was, it really did finish it off. Thereafter, it was time to fill in the ground floor roof. After doing so, it was time to start constructing the second floor. Whilst watching the sunset, it was finally time to start raising the second floor. For added detail, I made some archways out of oak stairs for the entries. Above the archways, I filled the rest of them with glass and also began to start extending more upwards. For finishing touches, I added oak fences for each corner. And then it was time to get started with the roof. From layer to layer, it was actually quite tricky, so I had to take my time for this one. I proceeded to decorate the top with cobblestone walls. After that, I followed it up by some oak fences. Following that, I added lanterns to give a nice, cosy, warm, ambient lighting. So downstairs, we're going to keep placing these ladders. So if we just place them like so, either side. By the way, look how nice and clean it looks down here. By the time we put some crafting tables and furnaces in here, it looked pretty cozy. Let's just extend up here now, like so. I hope we have enough ladders. But this is the bedroom, by the way. I'm going to put a bed here, a little crafting table. Maybe even put some barrels here. You know, it looked pretty nice. But oh, look at the view outside of our window of our lovely island. Look at that nice view. Wow, I actually wish I lived here in real life. Now that the ladders are in place, let's go back down then. And uh, let's show you what I've created so far. I think it looks really cool actually if we just stand back here I think for especially this sort of build as well It's clean, it's not too much but it just does the job And it looks nice so I like it and I'm very happy with it So I figured I'm going to place my chests here So if I put like maybe four there and four here I like it, that's pretty cool. So we can, uh, you know, locate anything in the chest and organise them well. That's pretty cool. And then I'll show you my bedroom. So if we head up here, as you can see, I made like a little chandelier out of lanterns. We made two barrels here, so that's pretty cool. Even extra storage. And then underneath, we also put some lanterns, just some that, like, just get that nice, cosy, ambient lighting in our bedroom. I like it, and I think it looks pretty cool, if I do say so myself. Also, just crafting tables here, purely just because it, you know, it looks cool. That's our bedroom. And then if we go down the ladders, obviously, this is like the little storage area. So, you know, We've got all our chests here, as I just showed you. And then down here, I'm probably just going to put some furnace, more chests, crafting table. Just, you know, it's looking pretty, pretty cool. And I figured because there's water already underneath us, what a cool idea it would be, like, obviously mainly just for decoration because, like, wheat does look really cool when it's fully grown. But just to, like, replace all of this wooden planks here just with dirt blocks and then obviously hoe it down and then put some wheat seeds on top. So that's exactly what we're going to do. Just like this. So place it round and all we got to do is hoe it down like so and then plant the wheat seeds on top just like that and eventually when it all grows it would look really nice just like this place the dirt in between the gaps and then hoe it all down and then plant the seeds on top there we go see trust me when it's all fully grown it'll look really cool in my opinion so let's just go ahead and do this to uh, the two other sides then then all we have to do is just do it this last side and then we're done and now if we take a step back and actually have a look at the full build with the uh, with the wheat outside of it as well it actually looks really nice and it's all fully grown now which is cool is it all fully grown now or yeah oh actually no it's not all fully grown but i mean it's getting there anyway it's it's, it's 
I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry, wheat seed. I'm sorry from stopping your uh, your growth. I didn't mean to do that. But the majority of it is actually fully grown. I added some furnaces here, uh, two smokers there, two stone cutters over there, and also two crafting tables here. So we've got a little room down here to do our crafting. You know, some smelting. Got a smoker there, and also the stone cutter. So it's pretty cool. I like it. It's uh, it's nice, simple. I'm gonna call these like little water slides because I mean they don't really lead to anywhere. But other than that, that's uh, that's pretty much it for the build. And uh, we're gonna get building the farm over here. But as you can see, there's a lot of kelp. Let's try and get a stack of this stuff. But if we go back up to the base and then walk back over to the main island, I say walk, I mean sprint to the main island. If you look at the composter here, if we actually fill up with kelp, we receive bone mill and with this bone mill obviously we can use it on our farm so that we can you know grow crops a lot faster because there's so much kelp around here it's literally like infinite bone mill it's really cool there we go so now in total we have five pieces of bone mill how cool is that but because the wheat's already fully grown this side how about we get rid of it because we're going to move our farm over there it's become night time again before I even know it. Well, these days are going so fast, honestly. But anyways, that's the sugar cane harvested. And because it's night time and I don't want to risk any mobs attacking me, I'm going to go to sleep. And then in the morning, I'm going to start on the farm. And then we can look into, you know, going back mining, collecting some obsidian and building a nether. You guys don't want to miss that. Have a look at this. Have a look at our nice cozy bedroom. Would you look at that? We're going to go have a nice sleep now with no mobs around us. <sighs> Here we go. We're uh, all refreshed now. After a long night's sleep, we're... Uh, ready to start the day. So let's head down the ladders then. And then how about we uh, make a start on this farm then? But before we do so, let's collect all this kelp floating above the water surface because it is actually quite annoying. And oh, look at that fish. What are you doing? Where's that whale? I keep saying whale. It's a little dolphin. I'm sorry. I keep... Oh my gosh. That was pretty cool. But <laughs> yeah, I keep accidentally saying whale. I don't know why. Oh, there we go. We g give us some dolphins grace. Look at us. We're like a dolphin now. Look. Yeah, we're like a little dolphin. Let's not get too distracted then by the dolphin. Oh, what are you doing with my kelp? The dolphin's playing with my kelp. I need that. But it's fine. You give us some more grace, so I'll, I'll I'll let you off for now. All right then. So we collected all the kelp, and let's go back to the composter and quickly, uh, you know, turn it all into bone meal. I, I'm pretty sure we got lots in the chest as well, by the way. So we can turn it into a quite a bit of bone meal. Yeah, look at that. Oh my gosh. All right then. Let's uh <laughs> let's get composting, I guess. And we're pretty much just gonna sit here for a while and collect some more bone meal. Yep. So just like that, we've used up all the kelp, and we've managed to collect ourselves 31 pieces of bone meal, which isn't too bad. So thank you, composter. Hello, chickens. <laughs> I may need... Okay, I got three pieces of raw chicken, so let me just put that in there for now. I know I've got sticks in there, I don't even ask. I'm all over the place at the minute. I'm just... I'm in the middle of building, okay? Leave me alone. But i tell you what we do need to actually do is turn most of these into some planks, right? Like so. And then let's turn more into planks. There we go. Have you got have you got any more eggs to give me, chickens? Let's try and see if we eat a baby chicken. There, there we go. Got one. And why not get rid of these trees as well? Why not? Nice. But how about we get started with the farm? So first things first, we're going to come over here. For this farm, I'm going to do strictly a carrot and potato farm. Yeah, I think this farm's going to be like a carrot and potato farm, so like mainly food source. Let's dive right into it. So to get started, we're just going to build the circle, basically the foundation of it. We've already built out here, so all we got to do is come out all up here. So one, two, three, four. Then we got to go two up, so two, and then also another two. Oh, sorry, and another two. Wow. Well, okay. So it's three, two. Uh, I think I'm doing this right. I think. One, two, three. Ah, uh, hang on. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, one, two, three, four. Okay, I think this is right. Apologies if it's not. Okay, so lay four there. And then I believe it's six now. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then four up here. Three, four. And then it's one, two, three, four. So... Now we got to do four twos. So one, two, three, four. Okay, now I've done it wrong. Yeah. All right, so we actually managed to fix the circle. So now we've got a nice symmetrical circle. It's now time to fill it all in. And by fill it in, we need a lot of dirt. So let's go and grab some dirt and fill it all in. I already checked my inventory. I actually had a stack in a bit. So why don't we quickly use it up here for now? This is going to look so cool when it's all done and grown. Because I just... Isn't it so satisfying when you look at like carrots and potatoes fully grown and wheat as well? It just all it all looks so nice. I love it. My misplacing is way too consistent. Right, let's go and grab some more dirt then, because that's all I have left. But actually, why don't we hurt down as we go along? That would uh that would help, wouldn't it? I love the way because we're already like on water. We don't even have to go out our way, grab buckets of water, come back and all that jazz. So I'm pleased to say that um I am happy to be on water right now. It saves me a lot of hassle. And by a lot, I mean a lot of hassle. Oh gosh, no, my hoe just broke. Well, I had to go make a new hoe while I'm at it as well and grab some more dirt. Let's eat some chicken though because I'm getting hungry. The sun is making me so hungry right now. Look how hot I am. I'm gonna melt in this sun. All right, so we've got some dirt now. Let's head back over and get it all filled in. Oh, I forgot to craft a hoe. Well, 
Looks like we'll have to do that afterwards. Oh, I just sunk. Looks like we'll have to do that afterwards then. Look at that dolphin. That dolphin's having way too much fun on my island. I might have to might have to charge him for being on here, honestly. He might have to start giving me some like monthly installments or something. Do and I'm nearly done. It's actually quite satisfying doing this. I can't lie. I'm having so much enjoyment out of this. It's really entertaining. It doesn't take a lot to entertain me, honestly. I could do this stuff all day. The sun's going down as well. Seriously. Alright, well, looks like I'll have to go and make another hoe. Oh, and before any mobs start trying to spawn, let me quickly just play some torches down. Why does it keep becoming so patchy for, huh? Why can't it all just settle down? Alright, well, this is the last hoe I'm gonna craft. We've grabbed two carrots and two potatoes, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna bone meal them so they uh, hurry up and grow like that. And then we're gonna do one half carrots, one half potatoes. That, bone meal them, take the potatoes. Basically just keep doing the same thing. Go. And let's do the same for the carrots, like so. And then eventually it will build up. All right, well, uh, we'll let that all grow, I guess. Well, let's go and click some more kelp then so we can turn it all into bone meal to, you know, speed up the process a lot quicker. Well, there sure is a lot of kelp around here, right? <laughs> Look how much there is just floating. All right, let's go and dispose it in the composter then give me that bone meal we managed to collect ourselves 35 pieces of bone meal so let's head back over to the farm and then get placing it let's go and do some potatoes as well because we keep focusing on the carrots it's unfair on the potatoes there we go let's plant all those take up the fully grown carrots and then plant these ones Nice, alright, so slowly getting there then. Ooh, I have an idea with the hay bales we got. Why don't we uh, decorate this little farm here? So give me a minute. Okay, so what I've done is I'm going to do this, that. Let's do this around. So I think it looks cool, actually. I think it looks quite nice. It gives it some, uh, you know, gives it some character. Okay, so while in the middle of extending my main island, I um, encountered one of these guys and... I can say they uh, they didn't leave, did they? When I encountered them the first day. Oh, I accidentally eliminated the horsey there. I'm sorry. What are you uh, What are you doing, bro? Come on now. Oh, he dropped an enchanted iron helmet. What is it? Aqua affinity. That's actually quite useful. Let's collect all these sticks here. Wow, look at this. And yeah, if you couldn't tell already, basically I'm just extending the main island, as you can probably tell. So I'm just going to get rid of all of these seeds right here, like so. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to make it even bigger. Okay, so I'm just going to hoe all this down. Good job I have another hoe in my inventory. Okay, so hold all this down like so. It might break again, but it's okay because we have the majority of it done. About to break. There we go. Get this little bit like here, right? And then all we got to do is place some water like so. Let's place these uh, wheat seeds while we're at it. Hello, drown. I see you over there. And let's hoe the remaining dirt. Hold up. Looks like we need some water around about here. Let's wait till all that grows, and then let's get some sugar cane, and then let's get placing this. Alright, then we can wait till that grows, and then let's get these saplings down. Okay, now we have all the saplings in place. All we gotta do now is just rely on time and wait for all of this to grow. And what's this drown doing approaching my uh approaching my crops? Come over here. Come on, I'll uh I'll have to deal with you myself. Come on. Who told you you could uh stumble onto my island? Get out of it. Alright. And then I think we should actually go to bed now, so then, you know, the sun arises and hopefully a lot of it grows. Especially the carrots and potatoes over there as well. Oh my gosh, look at that zombie on my roof. Maybe I should put a torch on there. Hmm. Okay, so now the farm's built, and then also the house is now built. That leaves us with one more major thing to build. And it's going to be built in this little blank area here. And that is another portal. So in order to do this, we need to obtain some obsidian, enter the portal, and I want to make it a bit of a cool build. You know, I want to make my nether portal look nice and cool. So I'm going to have to go to the nether, collect some items, and then come back and then design it. And then we can start exploring the nether and so on. On. Let's get started then and let's head over back to the main island and then go underground But before I do so I got some chicken cooking in here lovely I'm gonna take some apples with me as well just in case I'm gonna need some torches So let me just grab some sticks and coal and let me craft some torches Okay, 44 should be way more than enough But I'm gonna bring some extra coal and sticks with me just in case we run out Well, let's go and obtain this obsidian then it feels like I haven't been down here in like forever Okay, so let's go and explore this wild cave then. Oh, I should have brought a bucket of water with me We're gonna do things the hard Way. Okay, so there's lots of uh, hostile mobs waiting for me, as you can see over there. Look at the creepers and skeletons. But hello, zombie. What are you? Uh, what are you doing? Do you know what? That iron would be really useful. I might actually go up and mine that down because we could actually craft a bucket and collect some of that water over there, and it uh, it will make life so much easier. But no! Oh no! Our pickaxe is broke. Oh no! Um, I didn't think of that. Well, now I'm doomed. Oh my. 
How are we going to get back up? We'll have to find a way back up. Oh my gosh. Okay, thank God we actually managed to get back up. We need to go back up to the surface, don't we? Because we need a new pickaxe. Oh my gosh. I have no clue how I got up with no pickaxe, but that was actually quite challenging. While I'm up here anyways, I'm going to grab myself a water bucket. So, you know, it just it makes everything a lot more easier. Also, how silly of me. I didn't even craft myself a diamond pickaxe before I went down there and said I was going to mine some obsidian. What am I even thinking right now? Well, anyways, I crafted myself a diamond pickaxe anyway, so that's fine. All right, and... Uh, let's head back down the mine then. Ouch. Let's go back down to where we came from. Oh, I hear a skeleton, so i got to watch him. I think he's above us, so we're fine. Okay. Oh, sorry about that, Bat. Um, don't know what quite happened there. Oh, hello, zombies. Nice to, uh, nice to meet you here. Let's head down this direction. Oh my gosh, there is loads of mobs here. Oh my. Oh, and I see diamonds over there as well. So why don't I um quickly collect those? Oh yeah. Oh, and lots of iron as well. Let me collect that real quick. One piece? Ah, uh, okay. Well, better than nothing, I guess. We're going to try and mine this while these zombies are after me. Oh my gosh. More iron? Nice. We take it, we take it. Okay, right. Now I see some obsidian, so, you know, that's good. Right, let me get rid of these two zombies because they're being, uh, being quite annoying. Go away, zombie. Go away. Oh, are you serious? These zombies have nothing else better to do, have they? Oh, come on then. Ooh, what did he drop? A potato. Nice. Let's get mining this obsidian then. Perfect. Got to be careful for these mobs, you see, because I don't want a creeper coming up behind us and ruining the full 100 days. That would be terrible. Just because I see the skeleton coming towards me, I'm just going to take him out. Oh, and the spider as well. Seriously? I need to eat a piece of chicken down here. Eat an apple, get them hunger bars up, and we can continue breaking the obsidian. I might have to place a light down here, honestly. I might have to light this up a little bit. Look how glossy the obsidian looks. It's got like a really nice finish to it. You can literally see the reflection off the torch. Okay, I hear a zombie, but I'm so close to breaking this piece. Can I do it? No! Oh, I did it! Oh my gosh, you need to push me in the lava. But we managed to collect that piece of obsidian, so... That was cool. It's all about skills. you got to know what you're doing when you're playing this game. There's more diamonds. Why am I finding so many diamonds in here? I'm aware there's a skeleton there, by the way. Oh, and a zombie. Nice. Well, let me just get rid of these guys. Get in that lava. Oh, okay, seriously? Is this what we're doing here? Get in there. Where did you come from? I need that diamond. Give me that diamond. Just so I know I've got that. I know you. Look, I know you're trying to sneak up on me. It's not going to work. It's not going to work on me, okay? Too smart for you. Anything else down this cave, though? Lots of iron, I see. Any more diamonds about anywhere? Huh. Oh, well, there's more mobs. Yay, I love mobs. Oh, my. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Zombie apocalypse. What is going on? Okay, we need to eat real quick. Why is there so many zombies? Oh my, get out of here. Stop bothering me. I just want to complete another 100 days challenge. Please just leave me alone. What's up here though? Oh, okay. There you go. Fight each other. Thank you. Oh my, I needed that so bad. Oh my gosh, zombie villager. They got you. I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, what? What's going on? What's going on? Oh, okay, I need to get out of here. I need to go. I need to go. <laughs> I need to eat that chicken. What just happened there? Oh, I see a diamond up there. Do you see it glowing? Right up in the distance. I can't believe what just happened to me there. I nearly just got... Oh, I thought that was diamonds. I nearly just got eliminated. Oh, that scared me. Okay, well, now we've got our obsidian. Should we start making a making a move back up to the top? Or should we go and explore what's up here? This is risky. I have no clue why I'm doing this. This would be a dumb way to die. This would be a dumb way to uh, ruin a 100 days video. Take this iron, though. Any skeletons? No, okay. You've got to be careful for those as well. Well, that's two things I dislike. Skeletons and creepers. Okay, I don't see anything up here, so I'm just going to head back down. There we go, my two best friends. Oh my gosh. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Oh my gosh, i got to get out of here. Uh, help, help. Oh my gosh. Oh no, what am I doing? What have I done? I accidentally uh, holstered my sword. Look at that behind me. Okay, um, we need to go, we need to go. What's the way out? I'm just going to go to the most lit part. Oh... I need a new sword as well by the looks of things. Okay, I need to go down. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Right, eat chicken. Ugh, what the hell? I just, what? I just blocked that. Right, how do I get out of here? Did I come from this direction? Yeah, I did. Okay, okay. Right, I know where I'm going now. Ugh, uh, uh. Oh my gosh, I'm like, what is going on? I'm getting targeted from all angles. Okay, oh, there's another skeleton waiting for me. Okay, I just missed every swing. That's my bad. Okay, right, we gotta get out of here. We gotta go, we gotta go. Let's get out of here. We need to go. Which way's the way out? Is it up here? No, I feel like I'm going in the wrong direction. Uh, right, it's got to be down here, right? No? Where am I going? I'm lost. This is my worst fear, being lost in a cave. And I've 
actually just done it. Wait, so maybe it is this way then. Is it? Ah, maybe, yeah. Uh, maybe we need to head back up here. Quite sure, actually. Oh, yeah, okay. Here we go. This is the little uh, the little cave we came from. Okay, that's fine. I kind of want to go and explore what's over here, though. Um, let's take a look. Hello, Spidey. These guys are so fast, so I've got to be careful. You see that little jump attack they just done there? Hey, Creeper. Anything down here? I think I've already been up here before, haven't I? I don't think there's actually a lot going on. Oh, my. Oh. Okay, what is up here? Anything? Oh, of course. There's our best friend just waiting for us. Well, there's some amethyst. Um, we'll take this. We've already taken this previously, but we'll take some more. We like those. Plus, I just love the sound it makes. So charming. Right, well, there's obviously nothing down here, right? Although I can hear skeletons. Um, no, I, I don't see anything, so let's head back down. Just realised my sword's broken, and I didn't even notice that. Oh, honestly, I, I, I might just be tired today. Uh oh, 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 okay, 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 okay. I'm gonna play you at your own game, skeleton. Oh, oh, oh no. Okay, miss. Yes, I beat you at your own game. How does it feel? What's down here? More iron, which I will definitely take. I just don't want no mobs. Okay, if there is any mobs here, I'm gonna have to make a run for it. Oh, look at this part. Some more iron. Ouch. Yeah, it'd be rude to leave that iron there. Um, anything? No, honestly, just a dead end. Okay, well, let's head back up top. Let's plant some torches to, you know, say that we've actually been down here. So if we ever encounter it again, because I'm so, uh, I'm so forgetful sometimes, I'll actually forget I've even been up here. Ouch. That didn't work, did it? Um, okay, so I believe all we got to do now is head back up. Oh, up here. Gotcha. Alright. Well, there's to another successful mining trip. In that mining trip, we actually managed to gather three diamonds as well, which is pretty cool. And some more iron, so that's also very cool. But how about we make a quick flint and steel? Okay, so just like that. We've got ourselves a flint and steel, and we're getting a step closer to going into the nether. Now, if you guys don't know me already, I hate the nether. It's so scary. Honestly, I just prefer seeing my own land, seeing the sunshine, and also my little chickens behind me. But I do not like the nether, so this is going to be pretty scary for me. But i got to do it for you guys, so let's go. Hey, do you know what we're actually going to do? We're going to be sensible about this situation. Let's go and craft ourselves a nice diamond sword, so we have a little bit of diamond tools going. Right, so let's go on our crafting table, and let's craft ourselves... Oh. I don't know why I put two sticks in there, but let's craft ourselves a nice diamond sword. And we're going to take this sword, and then essentially what we're going to do now is put all the stuff in the chest that we don't need. Uh, I'm going to be very careful about what I place in this chest. Okay, and I'm going to smelt some iron while I'm at it. I'm going to make myself a chest plate just because I can. There we go. Um, now we look the part. <laughs> um, I look very mismatched, but hey, it, it works, okay? It works. So anyways, now we've got a sword to protect ourselves, and you know what? We've only got two pieces of cooked chicken, so we could do some more food as well before we, uh, you know, head in the nether. We've got 30 pieces of bread, so why don't we bring that along? And if we go back to our farm, I'm sure some carrots and potatoes would have grown by now. Oh yeah, lovely nice carrots. Well, let's take these up then. Lovely, lovely stuff. Oh, sorry carrots. I accidentally broke some carrots that aren't ready to be harvested, but that's fine. It's all good. We'll uh, we'll fix it. Oh yeah, lovely carrots. Well, I certainly don't need any more carrots for now. Um, we need to lose some to gain some, so let's just place them back. Okay, there we go. We've got carrots lying around everywhere. So let's collect all of our carrots and then just place them back like so. And then shortly, we will do the potatoes as well. And now let's take some potatoes up. Let's actually uh, break them, but replace them at the same time. So, you know, it saves a lot of time, you know, just going back and forth. Lovely, lovely stuff. Just go in lines, go back like so. Collect them potatoes over here and then do the same for these two. Oh, yeah. Give me those carrots. Carrots? I mean potatoes. What am I even saying? Oh, yeah. Let's place them up to here. Like that. So we can allow more to grow. Do you reckon we should just place all of them down? Because we might have enough carrots. I say so. What do you guys think? Place it all down? Yeah. Why not? May as well. May as well. It's investing at the end of the day. You know, we're placing all these potatoes down now. But then we're going to get double back. So it's all good. Don't worry about it. And do you know what? I might even do the same for the carrots. So let's just do that as well. So it's all full. This is going to look so nice. So it's all fully grown. Okay. Um, I believe... That's it, right? Have I missed anywhere? Okay, there I did. There we go. So, now that's all fully... Fu oh, there's a carrot there as well, but... Now that's all fully placed. We've got some food here now, so... We'll be okay on the hunger bars, but... Let's eat some right now, actually. And why not have a good night's sleep at our home? Just before a busy day ahead of us tomorrow. Oh, there we go. Much better. Let's head down the ladders then, and then come out the front. So, we've got all the stuff we need to get us started. We've got buckets of water. we got diamond tools. we got... Uh, actually, we could do with some more, like cobblestone or dirt you know just to like get from place to place in all fairness so we have netherrack in the nether haven't we so we'll just collect some netherrack while we're there okay and without further ado let's get started oh yeah okay this is a strange nether portal but hey it's gonna look better when we're all done here goes nothing i guess Ugh. oh gosh well 
we uh, we finally made it to the nether and I can say I can't wait to come home. <laughs> if you didn't know already, I dislike this place very much because it is uh, very scary and uh, it's not familiar to me and I already hear pigmen. Let's collect some netherrack while we're at it then, you know, to stock up on some blocks that we can actually place if we need to get somewhere. We'll see a little gap here, so let's head up here, see what's, uh, see what's going on down here, shall we? Ooh, look at this place. Look at all the particles flying everywhere. Let's go up here. I want to go up. Okay, so it seems like we've found a little way out and oh my gosh. Oh! There's, uh, I already see pigmen. Oh, let's get some of this stuff. This would be cool for the build. Back at the, uh, back at the base for the nether. So, let's collect some blackstone while we can. Let's collect a lot of that. Just so we, uh, so we got enough. I want to try and find a bastion. Honestly, that would be pretty cool. Let's collect some basalt. Because why not? Looks like we could do with some food as well, actually. Good thing I got my carrots. Uh-oh, I hear a ghast. Where is that? Is it below me? I don't want it to, like, you know, completely appear out of nowhere. That's, like, way too scary. Okay. I didn't want to start a fight, but if you're starting on me, then unfortunately I have to defend myself. Where is that gas? He below us. Oh, there's two. Well, well, well. What have we stumbled upon here then? Let's sneak down while we can. Honestly, how can you tell me the nether isn't a scary place? I mean, look at it. It's like a horror game. It's scary. Okay, I'm gonna jump. Okay, we gotta be very sneaky about this place. I'm gonna collect lots of this brick stone. Oh, Okay, um, I've already been spotted. This isn't good. I'm gonna try and mind my own business over here. You do not mind. I'm gonna collect all of this because this is gonna be good for the nether portal build. Okay, I'm gonna drop down, but I've got to be very careful because I've got some angry pigmen who don't want to be my friend. So, I've got to be careful about those, but I'm gonna steal your guys' lanterns. Apologies for the, uh, lanterns, but I could do with some, honestly. It takes way too much iron, and unfortunately, I am lazy. So, I'm being very careful not to fall into some lava here. Okay, I'm I'm gonna collect these stairs. Nice, nice. I've got most variants now, which is good. Oh, look at it. Look how scary that is. Should we try and hit it? What? Where did you come from? It's always skeletons. I'm telling you guys, it's always them. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna get out of there before I get hurt. Oh, look at the little baby one there. And there. Uh oh. Okay, well, this isn't dangerous at all. Um, look how many mobs are down there. And I see some chests. Oh, and some more chests over there. So, I don't know. I want to, um, I want to try and make a move, to be honest. Let's see what we can do here. Let's head down this way then, because it looks a bit safer than the route I was about to take. Oh, I've been spotted. Miss. Oh, hello, little guy. Um, any chests on this floor? I mean, I can't seem to see any. Oh, there is one. Uh oh. Oh, well, go down there now, so it doesn't matter, but some soul sand, some string. I mean, I'll take some gilded blackstone, but, you know, I mean, it. sure, I might use it, I don't know. But I'm collecting all this stuff just in case, you know. Oh, oh, okay, okay, um, 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 gotta go down here. Mobs are so annoying. What if we, like, try to speedrun it? Oh, okay, I wanna go up there. Staircase here. Have I been spotted yet? Yep, yep, yes, I have. Oh, my gosh, oh, my gosh. Leave me alone. Let me regenerate my hearts in peace. Now you're really annoying me. Oh my gosh. Did you see how much pigmen, like, came after me there? Oh, and we got another one? Okay, right. Let's go up here. If so, we're gonna have to defend ourselves. I think all the pigmen actually took the bait and went down there, so it doesn't matter. But, oh, we got an uh, iron sword with smite on it, but fortunately, we can't really take it. Got some magma cream, got some string, some more arrows, got a music disc. Honestly, we don't really need any of this stuff, but, oh, more obsidian. Ancient debris. Okay, we can take that. Um, what can we drop it for? Let's drop that for a stack. Um, um, a lot of arrows. Matter of fact, let's take all of these arrows because we might actually need that bow and arrow. Some golden carrots. Nice. I'll take some of those. I'll eat one. How about that? Um, iron nuggets, some chains. Honestly, silk touch. Ooh. Um, yeah, honestly, we don't need that bread. We can, we can make do without that for now. Okay. Um, without you guys turning on me, can I get down here safely or is there going to be issues? Okay, I want to go and get that other chest. So, let's be careful. Even though before we just literally went straight up and, you know, it could have been very badly, but... Come on then. I've already got one. Die! There we go. Okay, what's in here? Some more arrows, pork chops. Oh, another ancient debris. Nice. Let's go around this side. Um, what's in here? Be something good. Come on. Uh, some more gilded blackstone. I, I hear a magma, but I... I don't know if it's above me or behind me or what. I'm so scared. I don't like this place. This is why I hate it. I hate it. Um, soul speed too. Yeah, we don't really need any of this, honestly. It's just, we don't really need it. But we'll take these stairs. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, oh. oh, I hate this place. I hate this place so much. Okay. Uh, oh, should we go down here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go down here. Oh, I thought I fell off for a second. Oh, this is so risky right now. Especially on 100 days of hardcore Minecraft. Are you kidding me right now? It doesn't want to end like this. Okay. Oh, some XP down there. Hmm. Okay. 
um, honestly, I don't think there's a chest. No, honestly, I don't think there's anything else down here for us. Um, yeah, I think the rest is just things that we don't really need. I think, anyways. Well, let's go back up this way then before we get attacked again. Oh, there's a chest there, and I'm gonna go and take it. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. <gasps> oh, oh my gosh! Look at it. Get away. Where did the other one go? There it is. I can hear another one as well. All more ancient debris, some crimson roots, soul sand, some other bits and pieces that we don't really need, honestly. But, um, I feel like I want to try and find a nether fortress or something like that. You know, get some blaze rods and stuff. Um, so, let's try and locate one of those. Ouch. Well, uh, well don't you just look friendly. Okay, I'm getting out of here for now. Yeah, there's no way I'm going back down there. I want to try and find a nether fortress, like I said, but... Oh. Speaking of which, um, there's one right in front of us. So, let's go and explore that then. Um, how weird is that? Okay, well, that is actually crazy, but... Okay, let's, uh, let's go and head towards it then. Okay, now this is exciting. I like never fortresses. I like these. They're cool, and they're scary, but they're not too scary. I mean, it doesn't, doesn't give me as much as an eerie vibe as the sort of other places, but, oh, let's go on it. Take some nether bricks, why not? Is that a blaze? Yep, it's two... Oh, no, there's three of them. Okay, there's three. What's in here? Flint and steel. We don't really need that. Um, should we try and go for these blazes, do you think? Yeah, come on, come towards me. Well, I've got, like, a stack of arrows, so I mean, I could maybe, you know, try and pick them off. Ouch. Come on, blaze. Aha. Oh, oh, that was so close. Come on. There we go. Right, let's get your blaze rod. Okay, there's another one. There is another one. Oh, nice. Let's go. We've got three blaze rods. Let's go. Okay, let's go back to where we was heading in the first place then, without getting distracted this time. By some rude blazes. No respect. Absolutely no respect from those blazes at all. Okay, um, let's try heading this way. Oh, there's a, there's a wither skeleton there. Let's try and avoid him. <gasps> there's a base spawner right there. Okay, 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 okay. I got it, I got it. Any chests down here at all for me to look at? Nope, just some more blazes. And they're gonna spot me. Oh! Okay, well that was uncalled for, wasn't it? Alright, so we've got to be sneaky about our, our approach here. Let's try and pick them off. Oh, do I get him? Yes. Why are they so quick though? Oh, uh, uh, uh. do I get it? Oh my gosh. Oh, with the skeleton. What are you doing? Ouch. I knew he was there, but I didn't think he'd actually come and like attack us like that. Damn. Ouch. That actually really hurt. Okay. Just checking. Just checking the area. Just checking the area. Peek. Oh, peek again. Come on. And you as well. You as well. Yes, 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 yes. Go, 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 go. Get the blaze rods. Get the blaze rods. There we go. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I believe there's more up here. Okay, there's only one. I can, uh, I can, I can take him on. There we go. Nice. I'll, uh, I'll be having your blaze rod. Anything out this way? Just a dead end? Yup. Just a dead end. Okay, um, oh, what the? Well, so, so kind of you, blazes. Try and attack me like that. Okay, let's go down here. Them blazes are right behind me somewhere. Oh, there they are over there. Hey, Blazes. Um, well, they can just chill there for a moment because um, I want to go and do some exploring. It's all about exploring. So, you know, we know they're there. That's cool. But, you know, it's nice to check out our surroundings sometimes. Not all the time, though, because sometimes they are very scary. But it's fine. It's okay. Um, all right. Let's try and enter back in then. Pretty sure I just saw, like, a window or something here. Yeah, okay. I don't see any chests lying around, to be honest. Oh, there's one here. Unless I've already looted. Oh, no, I haven't looted these ones. Just some armor. Oh, three diamonds. No way. What a find. Okay, you're getting in my inventory for sure. Let me eat some more carrots as well before we continue. But wow, what a great find that was. Three diamonds. Let's go. Okay. Oh, hello. What are you doing? I don't want to be attacked. I want to go down here. Okay, I saw another chest from Glance yet there. Check left, right, right, left. Okay, I hear another blaze probably around. No, okay, they're probably above us. Diamond horse armor. Do you know what? I'm going to take this just in case. I hear more blazes, which indicate there is a spawner right above me, but there's also a spawner over there. Yeah, I want to go check this spawner out then, because there's... Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh my gosh, I'm getting it from all angles. Come on, blazes, let's uh, let's talk this out. Ouch. Come on, blazes, I'm waiting for you. Oh, hello, Enderman. There's not many spawning there. Oh, okay. Of course, when I walk away. Ooh. Imagine if we hit him from here. Oh, I don't know if we did or not, but... 
Doesn't matter because uh, I'm gonna leave him alone for now. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not even going to bother messing with that guy. No way. Not a chance. I hear you, Gast. I know you're calling out my name, but I don't want to. I don't want to be involved. You know, just leave me alone. I don't like this place, guys. Please, guys, if you're enjoying the video, please drop a like because one like equals I don't even know. Just drop a like because I'm actually so scared right now and I could do with your guys' support on this. So please, um. You know, at least show me some love. Okay, what is this? Okay, I'm gonna Oop. ouch eat my carrots. I'll just, I just want to eat my carrots and be left alone. You hear that? You hear that? Weather skeletons? You hear that? All right. Um, anything down here? No. Okay. Well, now that we've got some, uh, you know, stuff, I feel like maybe we should start heading back. Cause I mean, we've already gathered a lot of materials. We've already got some blaze rods. Matter of fact, I think we need to farm some more blaze rods. So that's what we're going to do. Let's go back to a blaze spawner then. Oh, another chest. Oh, okay. We've already been to that chest. But let's. Go to back to a blaze spawner and then take all of their blaze rods. Slay some blazes. Little shortcut here. Don't mind if I do. Right. Where was that blaze spawner? Because I need to go back to it right this instance. Oh, I'm pretty sure it was around here, wasn't it? Yeah, there it is. Nice. So, we're just going to sit in patience then and wait for these blazes. No way I missed that. Oh, I can pick it off. Nice. This one can't even see me. Oh, that one can. Uh-oh. Let me eat my carrots. Come on. Oh, no, 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 no. There's quite a few spawning now. If I can pick you off through there. Yes, I did. Don't mind me. Just going to take your blaze rods. Where did that one go? Oh, that one... I don't think that, that even dropped one, did it? Where is that blaze? That's in there. Look at it. That is just waiting for us. What do you think? Is it a bit risky if we go through here? Come through. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Ow! That hurt. Okay, let's go back. Nice. Take your blaze rods. Cool. I'm gonna take you out as well, actually, because you are... Oh my gosh! What? Where did they even all come from? Why was there so many at one time? That has never happened before like that. Oh my god. Oh! <laughs> I can't believe what has just happened. Okay. Oh, there's another one. Of course there is. Of course. Oh! Nice. More blaze rods for me. Do you know what? I'm gonna take you on as well. Come on. There we go. What's in this chest? Oh, we've already looted this part. Oh, okay. Well, that's cool. Let's just wait for more blazes then, I guess. Come on, blazes. Spawn. Spawn for me. Oh, there's one. There's two. <laughs> Wait, no way did three just spawn. Okay, I was going to say. Where is that? Oh my gosh, there's two behind me as well. Oh no, I'm all out of arrows. You know what that means. Oh, we're going to have to risk it then, aren't we? What the heck? That is crazy. Wait, imagine if we get these guys to fight each other. That'd actually be crazy. Oh, okay, well that, that isn't cool. That's not what we wanted. Oh, there's no way I can go and attack these guys. I have no arrows left. Oh, what do I do? It's not like I can go and challenge them on, surely. Unless I make them all... Fireball me. Okay, that's a very risky way of doing it. Come on. There we go. Right, I took you on. Oh my gosh, there you are. You was hiding from me, wasn't you? Where's the other one? Is it up here? Yep. Come on, I'll take you on as well. Look at all these blazes. Yeah, come down. Come down. Ow! That hurt. Oh, or if you just quickly... Oh, quickly just keep doing these sort of attacks. Oh my gosh, that was close. Ah! I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. Oh my gosh. XP. I will take that. And a blaze rod. Okay, now I'm going for good now. Oh my gosh. Let me eat this carrot. Okay, I'm getting out of here. I'm going back home. I don't like it here anymore. I've, I've made up my mind and I'm going back. Boy, am I not pleased to see this home. Oh my gosh. I have missed you so much. You don't understand. Oh my gosh. Honestly, I hate the nether so much. It scares me so much. Even the thought of going back there just... Oh, I don't like it. Honestly, I don't like it. I'm never going back there again. But I actually managed to get quite a few resources from the nether. So... That's pretty cool. But the point is, it's so scary. It's not even worth going back. Honestly, I, oh, and my little chickens. Oh, I love you chickens. I'm sorry for ever being mean to you. Here's a baby chicken. I didn't even get one. Wow. Okay, so yes, I'm in a composter, so don't even ask. But after that long nether session, I decided I'm going to build some stuff around my island to make it look a bit better. So before I forget to do so, let's quickly do it now. So I began by building a giant ring that connected up to each island. This took quite a bit of patience as it was hard to get it symmetrical, but I did the best I could. I then started placing dirt blocks in the centre, just so I could plant some oak trees, and when it all grows, it'll look all nice as greenery, and it just make the island look a lot better in my opinion. And how much better does this look? So I'll give you a little tour around what I've done. So essentially, I've placed more trees, uh, used some bone meal to grow some grass and some flowers, it looks absolutely beautiful. And if we come along down here, it's literally just this copy and pasted around the whole entire island but look how much better it looks i mean we've got some greenery going on now it looks a lot more filled in 
fine. And also one thing as well, I am going to change this fish tank. I don't know, it just doesn't do anything for me. I feel like we can have like a nice build here, something crazy, something that's going to look cool, you know? So I've decided what I'm going to replace this with. But before we do that, we can't forget about the nether. So let's quickly build a cool nether and then we can get into some other cool builds. But yeah, that's pretty much it really, what I've done so far. And to be honest, it actually looks quite nice. So I'm very happy with it. But without further ado, let's get into the nether build. First things first, I grabbed my oak slabs and got to work. And just like the other islands, this had to be the exact same size. So I had to make sure it was just symmetrical. After that, I started placing the blackstone brick stairs all around the nether build. Followed up with some brickstone blocks. Then it was time to start placing the obsidian for the frame. I made my nether portal frame exactly 7 blocks high. And then I placed a polished basalt on each side of the frame. Thereafter I started placing blackstone stairs for detail on the top. And then I placed some blocks on each corner of the build and underneath I placed more stairs. For the top I followed it up with some polished blackstone walls, purely just for detail. I then placed two walls on each side of the top, followed up with a chain and I thought it would be cool to hang some lanterns to give that cool ambient lighting. And with all that taking place it was time to light up the nether portal. Doesn't that just look awesome? And just like that my cool nether build was now complete. I'm really happy with it and I'm glad the way it came out. Alright, so admittedly, I think it actually looks pretty cool. So let me give you a rundown of what I've actually built then. So first things first, we use... I can hear a spider. I think um, I might... Yeah, okay. I think I might have accidentally created a mob spawner in here without placing a torch. Yep. Yeah, I did. There's... There's a spider. Well, I suppose I could use it for a little um, XP farm as well, actually. So that's not too bad. But as you can see, um, I've added quite a bit of detail on this, so I'll run you through what I've actually built. So first things first, we got some gilded blackstone mixed with some normal blackstone. And we got some blackstone bricks around the side here, followed with the same blackstone brick stairs. Also just normal blackstone stairs. And you see here we, we place some polished basalt on each side of the frame, so it looks pretty cool. Gives that like contrast. Um, we added two lanterns here with walls on it with uh, chains attached. I think it looks pretty cool. But other than that, I mean, there's not really there's not really a lot to say about it. I mean, it's just a cool build all in all. Um, also added some uh, crimson blocks here as well. So I thought it looked pretty cool. And if we have a look on each side, I'd place some stairs as well just leading up to it. Um, I kind of like the idea of it. And I've just realised my hunger bars are running low. So let me quickly just go and grab some food. And I forgot I had some carrots left in my inventory. So that's fine. The carrots are here to save the day. But yeah, what do you guys think? I I think it looks pretty cool. Let me know how you guys feel about this build in the comment section down below. Tell me if you think it's cool or not. But anyways, that is the nether portal. And there is one major build that I do want to actually intend to do. And I'm planning of like getting rid of this sort of uh, aquarium fish tank thing. I mean, it looks cool. Like I had the idea there. It's just, I don't know. There's something about it. It doesn't really, uh, it doesn't finish it off. So I'm going to build something pretty insane. And I'll show you what it is. It's nothing too insane, but it's... It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. So uh, let's go and gather some materials for it. When I say this took so long, it really did. I went around scavenging innocent little sheep and taking all of their wool. Thank you for your wool, sheep. But you must not live. When I got back home, I turned the majority of the white wool into red wool, using the poppies that I'd collected on the way. After a very long and stressful grind for sheep and wool, and the process of just keep collecting poppies, it's finally over and we've got everything we need now, I'm pretty sure. So let's get this in motion then, and let's begin the build. First things first, I had to get rid of the aquarium. It was a little bit sad, but it was time to move on to bigger and better things. So I got started on the base and laid it all out. The most important thing was that I got this all symmetrical. And then it was time to lay down the white wall. I started placing it as if it was inside of the red wall to give it that illusion. I just think it looks pretty cool. And with the red wall I just placed it on top of the white. And basically I just done this all the way to the top.
And then eventually we got to the tippy top. And for extra detail I decided to go one block outwards. And finally it was time to start pacing some glass panes. After that it was time for a new roof. I carefully placed the blocks on top of the glass to make sure it actually looked good. And just like that, the build was finally finished, at last. So I grabbed my trusty bucket of water and got back down to the surface. Okay, so I know what you guys are thinking. This build sticks out like a sore thumb. Yes, I know, but it's cool, okay? I literally have my own lighthouse on my own world. How cool is this? I mean, I don't know. I really like the idea of it. I mean, um, it's just cool. And it really does fill out the island. And I like it. And it's unique. So, yeah, it's uh, finally built. This took so long, though. The longest part, honestly, was just like the whole like grind of it all. And actually like collecting the whole entire wall. But other than that, honestly... It was okay, I mean, it was just basically symmetrical the whole way around, so it wasn't really that hard, but we got there in the end. So, now that's built, and that's out the way, it's time to move on to bigger and better things now. And you may be wondering, Scoops, what is that? Well, let me tell you what it is, and that is to, to first of all, enchant, but second of all, go and slay the ender dragon. So, how about then we go and gather some stuff for an enchantment table, and get enchanting some tools? Because let's face it, we're gonna have to need some like serious gear to go and slay the ender dragon, and we don't want to be slacking way too much, do we? So, why don't we go and do that? Alright, so let's grab some obsidian then, and then grab our diamonds as well. Then all we have to do from here is just pop it in the crafting table, so four like that, and then two each side, and then just one book on top, and there we have it, our first enchantment table. Let's go. So I'm thinking, where do I put it? And I knew I could hear a phantom. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Okay, come on then. Oh my gosh, it's so fast as well. Piggy, where did you come from? What the? Okay, well, most importantly, let's get rid of this phantom. Oh no, I missed it. Okay, oh no. All right, come on then. Come on then, phantom. Oh, this. Get a few. Yeah, okay, let's go. All right, I've got some phantom membrane. I don't need it. But whatever. Here you go, chickens. You know what? I'm going to feed you to the chickens, Phantom. I don't like you. Okay, well, like I was saying, where should I put my enchantment table? Hmm. I mean, I could put it near the nether, which would kind of make sense. So, matter of fact, I might actually go and proceed to do that. I can hear some mobs under here, though. So, let's see if we can actually try and, like... Okay, come on, Skelly. See, if the skeleton comes here, he can't see me. So, therefore, I can just get a few... Good hits on him there and click the XP. Nice. But yeah, how about then? Uh, we could do it here. I was going to do it like maybe at the back of my house, but eh, I suppose I could do it here, right? Should I do it here or should I do it at my house? Um, you know what? I'm going to go and do it at my house because it's my home and I can do what I want. <laughs> All jokes aside though, I just genuinely think it would look better at the back of my house and at least like there's some use for something here. Instead of just like maybe a little porch to do some fishing on, I can actually use it. So let me just go and grab some wooden slabs then, and then we can start proceed to build that. But before we do, why don't we go to bed real quick so, you know, we don't have any mobs attack us. There we go. Another beautiful morning on our beautiful island. All right, let's go down then, and let's go and collect some slabs. Ouch. All right, so let me just eat some carrots then. But anyways, like I was saying, uh, I went ahead and grabbed... Three stacks of oak slabs, you know, this would be enough, surely. So, you know, but um, let's start extending out, right, like this. And then what we can do is we can do like a little symmetrical circle. So let's go ahead and do that. So then all we got to do is just another three up here. So one, two, three, and then follow up with two. And then it's just three, come across one, two, three, four. And then go inwards, three, one, two, three. Oh, if I can place it, there we go. Um, and then I believe it's just one up here, one up here, and then two along. And then all we got to do is just the same again, so four this side. 
one, two, three, four. And then now we go in three, then two, then come down one. Hang on, uh, yes, that's three, two, one, two, three, and then four this side now. Two, three, four, and then three down. I feel like I'm doing the tutorial right now. <laughs> um, okay, then three along, right? And now we have like a little symmetrical circle. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Look at that. Oh, I might put some oak leaves around it as well. Let me go and grab some shears and put some oak leaves around it for decoration. That'll actually look like kind of cool. Okay, so I came over to craft some shears and I'm so confused right now. I've got two little wolves behind me, two little doggos. What are they doing? You can't just come on here without permission. I mean, I guess you're my pets now. So that's like a cool way to sort of, uh, you know, come in and be introduced, I suppose. But let's not get too distracted by them. And uh, let's go ahead and collect some oak leaves. Oh yeah, this is so satisfying all along here nice and I think honestly now we should have enough okay so now what we can do is should we place it like this is that is that cool and then like like this maybe let's see what it looks like afterwards wait there let me just quickly come along here all right hang on let's just see how it looks I might have just wasted quite a lot there if I don't like it but it's fine I'm sure I will actually I don't think there was actually a better way to do this so Nearly there now. Uh, oh, all we got to do is just slowly come along. Then all we got to do is add one more layer on top. Well, it looks like we got to go collect some more oak leaves. Okay, so I know I didn't need this many, but it's safe to say I now have enough. So, <laughs> all right, without further ado, though, let's just place these like that. And what are we thinking of this little private area here? I'm gonna fill the rest of this in actually. But yeah, look at this little private area here, little enchantment room. I'm gonna put some bookshelves here. Slap the enchantment table down. It's gonna look cool. I like it. It's like a little. Um, well, it is an enchantment room, but it's uh, it's a cool one. It's not just like your ordinary one. You know, it's uh, a bit of privacy here. You know, at the back of your house, and you can come here whenever you like, enchant all your tools. I like it. I like it very much. It's simple, but yet so, so effective. Okay, but anyways, uh, it looks like that is it for the uh, enchantment room. So that's pretty cool, right? So how about then we go and make some bookshelves and then I will see you back at this room. Well, actually, no, you'd be coming along with me because you'd be... Okay, never mind, never mind. But the point is, next time you see this is when I'll be coming back and planting some bookshelves down. But yeah, let's uh, let's get straight into that then. <laughs> All right, so now we have the books that we crafted. All we got to do now is put some of these in here and then we have some bookshelves. And I believe we need 15 bookshelves. Uh, okay, hang on. I might need to go and get some more actually. But it's 15 bookshelves um, to get level 30 and that's what we need. So, so let's craft some more books. And now we officially have 16 bookshelves. So uh, that means we can now officially enchant to level 30. So let's pop back to the enchantment area then and then we can get enchanting let's go okay so i'm gonna put my bookshelf approximately where can i put it um you know what i'm just gonna put it there why not i mean literally why not all righty now we have all the bookshelves in place now it's time for the announcement of the level 30 have we got it yes we got it okay nice we got level 30 that's all we want that's all we need so how about we grab some lapis then and uh potentially enchant some diamond tools but how about we get some sleep again because it's getting late and i don't want any mobs attacking me now do i Alrighty, so we grabbed a stack out of the chest and let's go and place it in here. I keep doing that and I've really got to stop doing that. But anyways, let's see what we can get on our diamond sword. So let's put the lapis in here and put the diamond sword in here. Okay, it's coming up with Bane of Arthropods, but I mean, let's see, uh, let's see what it gives us. Literally just Bane of Arthropods. Well... Okay, alright, I mean, not the best enchantment, honestly, but it's it's better than nothing, I guess, right? But how about we go and craft ourselves a quick bow and enchant that too? Okay, so now we have ourselves a bow. Uh, that's pretty cool. Let's see what enchant we can get on this. Now, I really want infinity. Well, it's not too bad, but it kind of sucks that I didn't get infinity. But, oh well, I suppose we just have to gather some arrows together. <laughs> okay, so I'm actually going to eat some carrots as well while I'm at it because I am getting kind of hungry out here, honestly. But now we've enchanted and everything... I think it's time to start trying to find a stronghold and then get into the end. Mr. Piggy, shall we go and do that? Let me give you a little smack. Shall we go and do that, Mr. Piggy? Do you think that's a wise idea? Because I do. Don't you, chickens? What do you guys think? Well, that's what I'm actually going to go ahead and do. So let's go ahead and do that. So let's go ahead and turn these blaze rods into blaze powder then. So now we have a total of 28, and that is actually quite a lot, isn't it? Wow. And then all we got to do now is just grab some ender pearls and then turn them into eyes of ender. And then we got to go and find the stronghold. Oh, hello, zombie. And hello, enderman. We need you. Come here, enderman. We need your ender pearls. Come on. Yeah, okay. Thank you. Yes, okay. I got one ender pearl. And all I got to do this now is just several times. And there's one up there as well. 
Oh my gosh, go away, zombie. We don't want you right now. Come with an Enderman. Where are you? Where are you sneaking off to? Where did you go? Oh, you're down here. Okay. Hello, yeah, I'm not looking at you. I'm not looking at you. <gasps> die, die. Fall. Oh, no. Yep. Yes, you are. Okay, and you dropped an enderpearl as well. Nice. So, uh, let's just keep collecting enderpearls, I guess. Enderman, where do you think you're going? Come here. Give me your enderpearls, quick. I need them. Oh, hello. There's another one. Come to me. Where do you think you're going? Oh, is there any more Endermen around here, or is it just other mobs? Okay, I just heard an Enderman. Where was that? Oh my gosh, there's so many mobs down here. I'm not even going to contest that. Oh wait, there's the Enderman over there. Um, too many zombies. I don't like it. I'll go and uh, I'll go and get someone else. I'll find someone. Oh, hello, skeleton. How are you, buddy? Oh, not you, baby zombie. You can go away. Come on, Enderman. Please. Okay. Now you can go away, zombies. I don't know. Uh, I don't need you right now. Thank you. Let's go and find more Endermen. Go away, skeleton, and hello, Enderman. Come to me. Oh my gosh. You're doing some serious damage. Oh no, 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 no. Leave me alone. Oh my gosh, I'm half a heart. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I need to go. I need to go. That was so close. What is going on? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I need to be so careful right now. No way that just happened. Oh my gosh. Please regenerate hearts. What is going on? Why isn't my hearts regenerating right now? Please hurry up and regenerate. Oh my gosh, please. Zombie, you leave me alone. I'm begging of you. Please. Not, not right now. Not right now. Oh my gosh. That was a very close call. That was a close call. I'm very surprised we actually survived there because it would have been my luck just absolutely getting taken out of the game last minute. Okay, but <laughs> anyways, we managed to get ourselves 15 ender pearls, which is pretty cool after all that grinding. So uh, let's head back up the top now away from these scary creatures because they're going to try and destroy me right now. I just want to get out of here. Especially you, creepy. You can you can go over there. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of here. Okay, and then what we can do now is we, we can put the ender pearls and the blaze powder in the crafting table. And look at that. We got eye of enders. Are you ready? Let's go. We got 15 eye of enders. Okay, okay. Nice, nice, nice. Good stuff. All right, then. Well, we're going to take the blaze powder with us just in case we run out of ender pearls. Trying to find the stronghold. Let's, uh, <laughs> let's try and find it then. So let's uh, chuck the first one up. Oh, okay. So we're going in this direction. Please drop. Don't break. Okay, thank God. Well... Let's quickly break this oak leaf and get our ender pearl back. Oh, and an apple, nice. But um, before we go and explore, because obviously when we actually get there, we're going to have to go and fight the ender dragon. So uh, let's do some quick adjustments before we leave. Okay, so let's grab our boat then, and uh, let's set sail. Oh, wait, we're... Uh We've got blocked entry here, so I'm going to have to quickly uh, take this up. There we go. Okay, right. So if you couldn't tell already, we grabbed some potatoes, some carrots, some water buckets, and some blocks, basically, just to try and help us, I guess. It's a, it's a very dangerous place, so we've got to definitely come prepared, if you know what I'm saying. So let's uh, wish me luck. Let's go and find the stronghold. Oh, isn't it relaxing out here? Just me, you guys. Oh, hello, baby sheep. What are you, uh, what are you doing roaming around here, then? <laughs> What's, uh, what's going on with you? Um, well, I think we're close now, actually. Okay, so it is still in this direction. There we go. It dropped for it. Oh, okay. I was wondering where that went then, and it, uh, it got stuck in the leaves. We don't want that to happen, do we? But, uh, let's keep strolling then. So it's still in this direction. I don't know how much further we actually have to go. Um, we'll soon find out, I suppose. Wait, where did that go? Oh! Oh, wait, guys, I think we might have... Okay, so I think this is it. I think we just dig down. Honestly, I think we just dig down. We, uh, I think we got the stronghold, hopefully. Well, I mean, we walked over there and it said we was too far, so it come back on ourselves, and it landed this exact spot here, so let's not risk any, uh, eye of enders, and let's go down here. This is the thing, guys, you gotta be very, um, strategical with your, uh, eye of enders. Honestly, I don't even use them that much. I just kind of, like, let them do their thing. Like, I, I go to the point where I might be too far that i got to go back. And that's kind of what just happened there. So, that's, uh, that's very good. But let's just keep digging down. I didn't even bring any torches. I thought I did. But obviously, I didn't. Oh, no. Well, it's fine. Whatever. Where is this stronghold, then? Where is it? Is it down here anywhere? Okay, so we took a bit of a fall there, but we actually managed to find the stronghold, um, which is really cool. So, now this is the hardest part, is actually, like, trying to uh trying to actually find it so oh wait have we we actually found it already no way oh my gosh oh no okay it's not oh not you little thing oh i hate those little things okay i need to eat honestly i'm not risking anything right now no way not when i've come this far oh oh my gosh okay okay buddy okay well this wait this is it oh wait i found it oh 
Oh my gosh, alright, well let me get rid of this spawner real quick. Oh my gosh. But, uh, okay, I can't believe we actually found it that quick. That's gotta be like... That's gotta be like some sort of speed run. Right, okay. I wanna see if there's anything like... Where, where's like the bookshelf so and all of that? Where's like the library? Can't seem to find any of that. Hello, creeper. Don't mind if I just... Oh my gosh! Okay, right. I wanna come up here. I wanna see what's in this chest. Nothing but bread and redstone, honestly, not the best. So, we're gonna go back down and we're actually gonna go in the stronghold and we're gonna eat some carrots before we actually do this and prepare for the battle against the Ender Dragon. I'm so nervous, honestly. I wish I wasn't, but I am. Um, right, well, uh, it's right in front of us, so uh, here goes nothing, I guess. Right, let's go. One, two, three. Okay, that's three down, that's three down. This side and this side. All right, and finally, these last two now. Oh my gosh! Okay, it's there, it's done, it's been done, it's been done. Oh my gosh, this, okay, I know I sound really stupid right now, but this actually scares me. So, please bear with me a moment. But it is right in front of us, and this is it. We've come this far, we've built a beautiful base, we've done what we wanted to do, not even with fully diamond armor. We're going here with just a, just a diamond chest plate, and that's all we need because... We're going to win. We're going to slay the Ender Dragon and we're going to go home and we're going to enjoy our victory together. Alright, so here goes nothing, guys. Wish me luck. Alright, we've made it. We've made it to the end and oh my gosh, here it is. Here it is behind us and as you can see at the top, it does say Ender Dragon with its health bar at the top. So this is, uh, this is where it all happens. This is where it all goes down. But actually, let me gather enough end stone blocks so we have enough to you know get around and move around do everything that we uh that we want to do because otherwise we might be short on blocks so let's just get enough so uh so we're safe okay i suppose we can get some up here oh my gosh i can hear the ender dragon already and it sounds angry it sounds very upset why does it sound so close okay that's why because it's right there oh my gosh okay we're here oh my gosh it's already attacking us Okay, 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 okay. Oh no. Alrighty then, so we're here now, and uh, we gotta shoot these little things up here so, you know, the Ender Dragon doesn't regenerate health anymore. All right, that's one. Can we get this one as well, back to back? Oh, close. Let's try and get it. Oh my gosh! That, oh no, 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 we don't wanna walk into that stuff. No way, not a chance. Come on, let's get it. Come on. There we go, nice, nice, nice. Oh my gosh. This Ender Dragon really doesn't like us, does he? Oh my gosh, what a shot. I can't believe we actually just got that one. Can we get that one as well? And oh, we got that one as well. We're insane. We're actually insane. Let's go. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, oh, okay, 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 okay. Listen, Ender Dragon. Ender Dragon? I mean, Ender Man. We can, uh, we can talk about this. Where did you go? Where did you go? Okay, there you are. Why do you deal so much damage, though? I've got to go back here and eat a carrot real quick because, oh my gosh, this is getting way too frustrating for me. Oh, well, I accidentally hit the Ender Dragon instead of the uh, thing that I was actually supposed to hit. Can we get it? Do you think we can reach that? Can we reach that? Yes! Okay, we did. Okay, there's no point going for it because it's going to keep regenerating. But what we can do is, if we come up here. So, let's build up here really quick. Okay, where is the Ender Dragon? Okay, nice. Alright, let's build it out a little bit. So, you know, we don't actually take any damage. Okay. Oh, no. Right, let's mine that real quick. Okay. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, we're going, we're going, we're going, we're going. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh! Oh, that was so lucky. That was actually so lucky. Okay, well that's that one down anyways. All we got left is that one there and that one there, I believe. It's just two left, so let's go and quickly do this while the Ender Dragon is distracted. Was it this one or was it that one? Oh my gosh, I'm so bad. Oh, there's one up here as well. Sorry, I didn't even see that one. Oh... Okay, right, we need to try and take some height real quick because it's just so quick. Oh my gosh, are you serious right now? Okay, so let's try and get this one if we can. Can we even get that one? What if we go up here? Okay, honestly, I think we can get this one. Come on. Can we get it? Is it too far for us? Wait, did we get that? Okay, wait, I actually think we got that. Okay, nice, we got that. Okay, so it's this one as well. So, oh my gosh, Ender Dragon, what are you doing to me? Right. Okay, we're building up. Oh, no. Get me up here. Get me up here right this instance. Hurry, hurry. Why is it taking so long? Now we're up here. We can get a better shot of this one. So let's try and... Nice. All right, so jump down here, honestly. Let's go. Oh, my gosh. 
Oh, 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 oh my gosh, oh my gosh. No, 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 we're getting out of here, we're getting out of here in a minute. Okay, okay, Enderman, okay, okay, okay. Oh, 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 oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Stay away, stay away, stay away. Okay, I need to run, I need to run. I need to get out. I need to figure something out here. Oh my gosh. Okay, come on, quick, 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 quick. Before it comes back, before it comes back. Okay, okay, we've done it, we've done it, we've done it. Right, let's get down, let's get down. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Oh my gosh, right. Now we can start attacking it, guys. Let's go. Come on in, dragon, what you got? Okay, let's get here before it does. Come on. Come on. Get attacked. Oh my gosh! I accidentally jumped. I did not mean to do that. I did not mean to do that. I repeat, did absolutely not mean to do that. Okay, well, do not do that. That was very lucky by me, and I won't be doing that again. Okay, come on. Let's keep attacking it. Let's go. Oh. Okay, we dealt some damage, I mean, but. Not what we wanted to deal, but oh my gosh, hang on. Wait, we might have aimbot. <laughs> what is going on? Nice, another shot. Maybe another one. Nice. Oh, get away from that. Where'd it go? There it is. Nice. Come on. I've got to keep hitting it. <gasps> oh. Come on, we've got to be careful. We've got to be careful. Come on. Nice, nice, nice. All right, let's try and go over here. I'm trying to like pre fire it, if that makes sense. I'm, dr I'm really trying to like figure out where it's going to go. Okay, right, it's coming back down, it's coming back down. Let's go. What the heck? I keep jumping in the wings by accident. Oh, that's not a problem for us, though, because look at this. Come on, come on, keep hitting, keep hitting. Yes. Come on, and again. Yes. Let's go, let's go. Oh, my gosh. Come on, dragon, what are you doing playing around? Okay, maybe you're not playing around. Maybe you're not playing any games right now. You're trying to eliminate me, aren't you? You don't like me. Yes, and again. Come on. Okay, right, come on. Come on. Nice, and again. No. Yes. Come on. Nice. Oh. Oh. I was so close. Bro. Come on. Come on, please. Come on, dragon. Just go. Just go for me, please. Okay, come on. This is it. This got to be it, right? Surely. Surely. Come on. Come on. It's going. It's gone. It's gone. We got it! We got it! Let's go! There it is, it's slain! Look at that! Oh yeah, give me that pool of XP! Let's celebrate with that pool of XP! Oh yeah, give me that! Let's go! We actually done it! We slayed the Ender Dragon, and oh my gosh, look at those levels though! But, we're gonna head back to our island, because, you know, we just wanna go back there and it's safer there than it is here, so... Yeah, but before we go back, let's actually just take in our surroundings for a moment. I mean, look at this. Look at the ender egg. There it is all in its glory. It's going to disappear somewhere now, isn't it? Oh, there it is. It's been emotional. I mean, it's been really fun. Um, there's the ender egg there if you guys want to take a look at that. A little ornament there for us. But uh, yeah, honestly, it is a... Uh... It's been quite emotional. It's been a journey. It's been fun. I've enjoyed it a lot. If you do enjoy this video so far, then leave a like. I really appreciate it. But anyways, now we've done what we had to do. Let's go back home. And there we have it. We successfully survived 100 days on Hardcore Minecraft on an island. If you guys have enjoyed this video, please do feel free to drop a like on the video. And also subscribe if you're new because we're growing every single day. And we're only a new channel ourselves. So become a part of the community. But without that being said, guys, I appreciate every single one of you for watching this video. If you have enjoyed, like I said, feel free to, you know, leave a comment. Let me know how you feel. Give me some feedback in the comment section down below. And I have been Scoops. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out. I'm going to attempt to survive 100 days in a zombie apocalypse in hardcore Minecraft. My journey starts surrounded by abandoned cities where the infected and wildlife roam. Will I be able to successfully level up and progress by upgrading my gear and crafting OP weapons such as assault rifles, bazookas, and even a minigun? Well, let's find out.
Well, it appears to be that I've been left stranded in some sort of bunker here. And wait, is that a backpack on my back? Oh my gosh, wait, look at this thing. Okay, well, this is going to come in very handy then further down the line because that means I can carry lots more stuff than just this. So that's very useful. But oh my gosh, wait, look at this place. As you can see, I'm pretty stranded right now. Are those zombies? Oh my gosh, wait, those are baby zombies too? Okay, all right, what is this, a book? Let me read this real quick. Hey, Scoops, if you're reading this, I'm no longer alive. My name is Sergeant Green. Most know me by the Iron Vanguard. I didn't want you to get infected, so I left the bunker. Sadly, we didn't get to meet. Good luck out there, bud. Sergeant Green. P.S. I left you some supplies you'll find in the chest. You're going to need these in order to survive the first night. No! Sergeant Green. Pay your respects in the comments, guys. Okay, right, let me put this book back there, then. That's gonna be a little memorial for Sergeant Green there. Wait, oh my gosh, why is there so many zombies? What the heck? Okay, right, let's check the supplies that Sergeant Green left us, then. Ooh, look at this. A revolver, some base bullets, an animal dictionary, some bread, and a wooden sword. Okay, right, well, let's collect all of these now. Okay, this is gonna help. Right, let me just quickly sort this out real quick. Right, I'm gonna put my wooden sword next to my revolver, and then my bread at the end, and my animal dictionary can go here for now. Oh my gosh, wait, look at the door! No, these zombies! Okay, right, let me open this animal dictionary. What do I get in here, then? Whoa, okay. Oh my gosh, look at these guys. A raccoon? A cockroach? What the heck? Oh my gosh, a hammerhead shark? A gorilla? Grizzly bear? A fly? A crimson mosquito? A sunbird? Okay, these guys look very dangerous, so I'm gonna have to try and avoid these the best I can. Okay, right, should we go outside here now? Oh no, 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 no. Okay, right. Okay, you ready? I'm gonna lead them over here, and I'm gonna make a run for the door. You guys ready? Okay, right. Let's go! Oh, okay. Get back. Oh, no, 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 no. I've been here. I've been here. Get back. Stay away from me. Oh, no, no, no. I need to reload. Wait, look at these cities over here. Oh, my gosh. Stay back. Oh, hello, chicken. I'm going to need you, actually. Come here. Thank you. Right. Come on. There we go. Oh, what did he drop? A... Is that a potato? Oh, nice. Okay, I'm gonna try not to use my, my bullets. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Okay, that was a bad idea. Bad idea. Stay back. Okay, is that all of them? No, wait, why is there so many? They keep appearing. Let me go back inside of here real quick. Back in the bunker. What do we get from that? So we got a raw chicken, okay? And we also had a potato and some rotten flesh. Nice. Right, let me eat this bread real quick. Oh my gosh. Well, that was pretty scary, if I'm quite honest, but oh my gosh, wait, look at this. When I holster my sword, that is so cool, look at that. Look at when I swing as well. This is so realistic. Okay, well, we've got to be very careful, because those zombies out there were pretty dangerous. So we've got to be very careful. Get back, zombie. Get back. This challenge still consists of the things that you have to do in normal Minecraft, so I'm going to have to try and collect some wood here without being attacked by some random zombie. Okay, nice. We got some oak logs, so let me keep mining these real quick. Hopefully to not get attacked. Wait, what is that in the sky? I just saw something. I think that's a friendly mob, right? Are you friendly up there? I hope so, because I don't want to get attacked. Okay, come here, chicken. Ugh, I need you. Oh, some bones and more XP, some rotten flesh. Okay, let's turn some of these into some oak planks real quick. Right, now we have some oak planks. What we can do is we can head back to the bunker real quick. Where is the button? There it is. Okay, it's very disguising that stone brick there. Okay, right, so let's hit the crafting bench and let's craft ourselves some sticks and let's make a quick pickaxe. Nice. Okay, right, now we have a wooden pickaxe. We can go ahead and real quick... Oh, no. Okay, I didn't mean to do that, but let's go out here. Let's do some mining real quick and gather some cobblestone because that's what we're going to need, isn't it? And then once we've done that, we can start thinking about heading over there into the city. I'm pretty sure there's a few cities around us. So there's a city around there, a city over there. So we can go and explore that later on. But that's going to be quite exciting to see what's in those. They're going to be very dangerous because there's going to be so many zombies in there. But we're going to attempt to uh, survive anyways. Ooh, nice cobblestone. Come to me. I could do some coal as well, actually. That's going to help me quite a lot. I think the bunker's up here, right? Yeah, okay. All right, let me head back to the bunker and I'm going to craft myself a stone pickaxe. Righty then. Let's go ahead and make ourselves a trusty stone pickaxe. Now, it's going to be a lot stronger for us to mine. It's going to be a lot quicker as well. Ooh, nice rotten flesh. Actually, you know what? While I'm at it, I'm going to make myself a stone axe as well because I can chop some trees down quick enough. Okay, nice. Right, now I have a stone axe. Let me quickly go outside here. And now, let me collect some birch logs. Ooh, look at that. Look at all of that fall down. Lovely, lovely stuff. 
Oh yeah, look at that. Whoa. Okay, nice. So we got some birch saplings, some oak saplings. We also got a lot of sticks. So that's very helpful. Let's continue. Whoa. Okay, that is so cool. Oh, some apples. Nice. Let me let me get those. Boom. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> Wow. Right, let me click those. We've got quite a bit of wood now, actually, haven't we? Which is pretty cool. I say we just go mining a little bit. Let me eat some of this bread, because my hunger bars are looking pretty low. Okay, right. Let's make a furnace as well, while we're at it. Let's go ahead and put this furnace right next to the crafting table. And now... Hmm, what can we do? I think we can cook rotten flesh. Okay, nice. So we can cook rotten flesh, which then gives us cooked rotten flesh, and we can eat it. It's not going to taste the nicest, but hey, anything to survive this 100 days in an apocalypse, right? We need to out-survive these zombies. Zombies. We've got to show these zombies who's boss. Right, nice. So look, we have one piece of cooked flesh. So let's go ahead and collect that. And we can actually eat it. That is so weird. Okay, right. What does that do? Okay, that gives us weakness though. For like, what? One second? Hey, anything to survive, right? So let's keep that cooking in there for now. And I say, just so we're safe mining, I'm going to make a mine approximately here, right? So let me take this stone brick up real quick. Get rid of this dirt. Okay, right. Hang on a minute. Maybe I need to start back here. Okay, there we go. Right, so, then we can start mining. We could do with some wheat seeds as well, actually, so we can make a little sustainable wheat farm. That would be pretty useful. By the way, did you see how scary those zombies looked? Those guys are not the friendliest, I can guarantee you that. I also got hit a couple times out there, so I've got to be very careful and on my guard at all times around here. I'm also running out of some basic bullets, so I'm going to have to find out a way how to craft those. Okay, so in order to craft a basic bullet, I need a gunpowder and copper ingots. Okay, right. So I have one piece of gunpowder at the moment. I just need to collect some copper ingots, and then I can start crafting those, because I'm going to need quite a lot, right? Oh my gosh, okay. I've encountered a little cave here, and it's got some zombies inside. Oh, okay, you've got a shovel. Okay, I see some copper. Oh, dear. Right. Oh, no, 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 this isn't This isn't so good. Okay, right. I'm going to have to try and find a way to get down here and sort of pick them off with my wooden sword. Don't tell me you guys can climb up stuff. Okay, there we go. I can pick you off from here. Go away. Get away. I need to find some coal ASAP so I can light this place up. Right, I see some coal over there. Nice. Get back. There we go. Huh. Okay, you don't look friendly at all. Stay back, zombie. I've got a wooden sword, and I'm not afraid to use it. I do not want to get infected like Sergeant Green. Whoa, look at this place. Okay, I see coal. Is there anything down here? Okay, nice. Right, let me mine this coal real quick. I need to mine this so fast so I don't get attacked. Oh, okay, right. Six pieces of coal. And oh, no, 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 no. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh no, oh no. Okay, this is bad. This is really bad. Oh, okay. Stay away from me. Oh my gosh. That was so close. Right, get back. I've also noticed I'm going to be like level 30 before I even know it. Look at the XP these guys drop. It's crazy. If I light it up, does that mean they're still going to spawn or? There's more coal over there, so I'm very, um, I have my eyes set on those over there, right? Is it safe to go down? Okay, my sword's about to break. I've got to be so careful right here. Let me quickly click this coal. I'm going to run back as fast as I possibly can. Oh, no. My pickaxe broke. Okay, come on. Oh, no, 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 no. Right, I have to block this off real quick. So I'm pretty sure they can come up here now because I've made a little staircase by accident. Okay, right. I'm heading back up to the top. I'm making torches and I'm also making myself another sword. And I'm also making myself a new pickaxe. Let's make some sticks and let's turn all of this into oak planks. And then let me just, hang on, let me store some of this in the chest real quick as well. Oh, nice. Some more cooked flesh. And then let's take that out. Let's put the raw copper in there. And then let's, let's put some sticks in there for now. Okay, let me craft some sticks. I'm gonna make some torches. I'm gonna make 12 torches, okay? I'm gonna light this place up a little bit here. There we go. Now we have some nice lighting. Oh no, I see the zombies eyes down there. That is not scary at all. Let me light this mine up so we can actually see where we are going. Stay back. I have a stone axe. Get back. All right, let's make a stone sword. Boom. So we don't need this disgusting wooden sword anymore. We're gonna pop it back in the chest. Let's eat some cooked flesh. Nom 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 nom. Nice. So we have copper ingots now, and we also have the gunpowder here. Okay, I have to make a workbench. So how do I make a workbench? Okay, so five pieces of iron ingots and light grey concrete. That's our aim. We need to make a workbench in order to make some more bullets. Okay, zombies, hey, what are you guys doing out there? Why is there so many of you as well? What the heck is going on here? Do we have bread? Oh, we have two pieces of raw chicken as well. Let me go ahead and cook that. Oh my gosh, I didn't realize this challenge was going to be so hard. Get back, police officer. What the heck? What, what is that guy even doing down? Here. Okay, right, hold up. I need to block that off. There we go. Right, now you can't get up, right? Yeah. Go away, zombie. Get away. 
let's light this place up because I'm very very scared of the dark Let alone it being dark in a zombie apocalypse. Okay, lots and lots of copper down here. I am not complaining. Oh my gosh, that scared the life out of me. <laughs> oh my gosh, that actually scared me so much. That scared the life out of me. Raw titanium. What can we even do with that? Whoa, look at that place. Okay, okay, hurry up, hurry up. Wait, he can't climb up here, can he? Surely. Oh, I left lots of lots of copper here. So let me go and take all of this copper up. Let me go back up to the top real quick. I'm going to break that so no one can jump up here and sabotage me. Oh, there we go. Oh, wait, it's raining outside. Is zombie scared of rain? I hope so, because then they can't spawn in. Right. More cooked chicken. Nice. I think it's pretty safe to say we're ready to go and explore some cities. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm running so slow in this stuff. No, 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 no. Oh, oh, oh. Where's my cobblestone? Quick. Oh. Okay. Oh my gosh. Stay back, zombies. Go away. What is that? Is that a mosquito? Is that fly deadly? So note to self, do not run inside of the oak leaves because they slow you down quite a lot. What is this fly doing? Come here. What did he drop? A maggot? Ugh. Get away. Get out of here, maggot. Let's run on the trees. I feel like we're safer up here than down there. Do some parkour on the trees. Huh. 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 Hello city, what do you have to offer for me? Whoa, look at this place. Let's go ahead and go inside of here for now, shut that door. Is there gonna be any zombies in here waiting for me? What? What is that? Oh no. No, 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 no. Wait, so there's spawners there. Oh, there's a furnace, anything inside? No. Oh, there's a chest. Okay, nice, melon seeds, beetroot seeds, a name tag, some bones, some cabbage seeds. Okay, nice. Right, let me take all of that good stuff. So that's useful. So in every sort of building, there's chests for me to loot. Nice. Right, let's go up here. Any zombies? I hear something. I don't like this. Oh, okay. So we made it to the top. Oh! Where did you come from? Stay back. Stay back. Oh. But I think he can give us slowness. So every time we get hit by a zombie, they can give us some different sort of stuff. Oh, there's a zombie in there as well. Uh, okay, right. You know what? I'm going to break the top of this ladder so they can't actually climb up oh okay right so you can take a lot of fall damage by the looks of things let's see what's going on in this building oh my gosh it's such heavy rain out here okay what's in there okay nothing's in there whoa look how big this place is look at this place oh no it's raining it's lightning it's getting very scary out here i can assure you that but i think it's becoming daytime now i believe so hopefully less zombies spawn in right let's head in this building then because this looks very inviting oh i'm gonna take that Nice little anvil there. Oh, hello, zombie. Okay, anything up here? Come on, be a chest. Oh, no. Wait, is it is it snowing? What the... What the heck is that? What? Okay. Um, is that a mutant zombie? Oh, my gosh. That can stay very far away from me. Oh, wait, there's a chest in here. Okay, so now there's mutant zombies. Nice. This is just getting easier and easier, isn't it? That was sarcasm, by the way. Okay, anything else around here? There's another spawner there, I believe. Right, what's in here? Ooh, some emeralds, potatoes, more bread. That's going to come in very useful. I just got a snow block. Okay, I've got to be careful because these zombies, I believe, can actually climb up these ladders. So, yeah, I've got, to be, I've got to be very careful when it comes to things like that. What is this? Why is there so much snow? Why is it even snowing? Okay, I do not want to fall down there. There's traps everywhere around this place. Let me eat some of this bread. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Stay back. Oh, no. He's running so fast. Let me out of this place. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, hello, buddy. Well, that was close. That might have been a high IQ play from me there, actually, because they all sort of fell down there. Okay, uh, mutant zombie. What are you doing there? Don't hurt me, please. I'm begging of you. Please don't hurt me. There's another zombie there. Great. Oh, let me make a little gap here so I can sort of get rid of you. Ooh. Nice. Oh my gosh, these zombies just spawn out of nowhere. Oh. Okay, you don't look very happy at all. Um, I'm scared. Okay, I am very, very scared. Give me your rotten flesh. I need to eat it. Shouldn't it be like the other way round? You guys should be eating me. But technically, I'm eating you as well. So am I like part zombie right now? I don't know, but hey, give me those stuff. Oh, some gunpowder. Let me take that. Oh, some rope. Okay, a saddle, iron horse armor, some more pumpkin seeds, bones, more rotten flesh. Okay, right, I have a full inventory right now. But hey, look, I can put some stuff in my backpack. <gasps> oh, no! Why are you so fast? Oh my gosh. What is with you guys? Give me a break around here. Come on. Ugh. 
There we go. <gasps> Mutant zombie, I'm gonna leave you there, okay? I'm feeling nice. I'm feeling generous. Totally not because I'm really scared or anything. You look like you're trapped. Can you fit through that gap? I'm not sure. Oh, wait, there's a brewing stand there. Right, quick. Brewing stand. Oh, oh. Okay, so you can just appear from thin air. Let's sort of build down here then. There we go. I see my bunker, and I think it's becoming daytime again, so... Wait, but look at this revolver. Look at the way it's swaying. So cool. I have five bullets left in the chamber right now. I kind of want to get rid of this guy, but I don't want to waste my bullets. Hence why I keep using my sword. Right, okay. Okay. I think we should start heading back to the bunker, guys. What do you think? No, they got the villager! Zombie villager, no! Get out of here. Wait, is that a baby zo- Okay, no, I thought that was a baby zombie. I was going to say, those guys can literally crawl through windows and everything, so... Oh, no, 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 the sword's broke. Okay, now we definitely have to head back. We're gonna have to make a run for this, guys. Oh, wait, there's a chest there. That could have some good supplies in it, actually. Let me try and... Oh, there's nothing in there. I'm pretty sure the mutant zombie's down here, so I have to be very careful. Right, okay, but let's make a run for it. Let's go. Oh, chicken, come here. I feel so bad when I slay those chickens. Those guys are literally minding their own business and I'm just coming along. But this is the things I have to do in survival. Okay, right, so we have an anvil and a brewing stand. So we can place that there. And we can also place the brewing stand right there. So that's cool. Some rope. What can we do with a rope? We need some more iron. That's what we're lacking. Okay, so it's B to open our backpack. Okay, that's really useful. We can put some stuff in here. That's a much easier way to do it, isn't it? Right, we need to find more iron. That's what we need to do. Right, let's go back down the mine and... Let's go back down the other bit. Oh, I see lots of iron. What? Where did, where did you come from? I haven't got a sword. Okay, this is stupid. I haven't even got a sword. Oh my gosh. I nearly just went into combat with no sword. What am I thinking? You can't be doing these risks. This is possibly the hardest 100 days I have ever done. This is so hard. Okay, let's go back down. There was lots of iron down there, but there was lots of zombies down there. Hey, I suppose this is literally a zombie apocalypse, isn't it? Whoa, okay. Wait, but where did they even spawn from? I feel like I need to put a torch there. Okay, you look really angry, so I'm gonna slay you. I can. You know, guys, I'm, I want to be friendly. We haven't got to do all of this. Where's Sergeant Green? I hope one of these isn't Sergeant Green. Ow! What is that over there? Wait, wh what, what is that? Okay, we'll go and check that out in a second. Let me place that torch there, though, so I remember. What? Okay, right. Let me take this iron. Come to me, iron. Nice. Four pieces. That's cool. Oh, my gosh. Look at this place. It'd be rude not to take this copper while I'm down here as well. Oh, look at this place. Oh, there's lots of coal, lots of goodies in here. There isn't that many zombies. Or am I just saying that? Okay, I think I'm just saying that. I think I'm just trying to make myself feel better, honestly. Oh, do not want to fall down there. Whoa. Let's carefully... Okay, carefully. Scoops. Look at this place. It's huge. Wait, are they fighting down there? What the heck is that? What is that? What is that? Oh my gosh, I don't like this place. This is even scarier than the nether. And if you know me, guys, I do not like the nether. I see more iron over there. Oh, what is that? Wait, is that a zombie on a chicken? That's an infected chicken right there. What is that? What am I looking at right now? Oh, oh no, 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 no. <laughs> okay, this place is getting really scary now. Okay, 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 wait. <gasps> Stay back. Do you know what? Out of all the bullets I got, I think I should... Okay, well, that did nothing. Oh my gosh. I feel like he's going to jump up and attack me or something. <gasps> okay, apparently he can. Okay, I'm out of here. I. Oh no, this isn't good. Oh no, I have no cobblestone. Okay, hang on a minute. I'm going to have to make wooden one. I'm going to have to collect some cobblestone real quick. I have to survive 100 days of this. Are you kidding me? Right, okay, well, at least we know that's all down there for a moment. But we need to really just sort ourselves out a moment. I feel like we need to smelt this iron and, you know, just sort of better our tools. I never thought I'd be saying this, but I've never been so happy to see a bunker in my life. And it's nighttime outside, okay? <laughs> hmm. Okay, well, let's use some oak planks for now, right? And let's smelt some of this iron. I wonder if we ever do find Sergeant Green. We have no bullets. We have zero bullets, by the way. Can I just add? We have no bullets at all. So hopefully in one of the chests in the cities, we find some bullets. Oh my gosh, I can never escape these guys. They're always around me. Nice. So that's all smelted now. Oh, we have five pieces. We can make our first iron pickaxe. There we go. That's much better, right? Right, let me, let me just... Collect some of this cobblestone, because I need this to actually build. Actually, wait, let me use my stone pickaxe, because I don't want to waste my iron one. All right, there we have it. We have a stack and a bit. Okay, so that's going to do us just fine. 
for now. Come on, leave me alone. You look so friendly. But yet you want to eat my brains. Look at this guy's mustache. Look how cool that is. The guy's got one cool mustache. What is this? Wait, is it? <gasps> oh my gosh! What the heck have I just done? What have I just done? What have I just done? <laughs> oh my gosh. What did I just do? I'm getting rid of these spawners. Oh, there's a chest here though. Please be bullets. Let's go! Basic bullets. Smooth stone, stone bricks, and more bread. Okay, oh my gosh. Thank you. They listened. Let's reload our revolver. Let's go! We got more bullets! We needed that so bad. I I literally cannot explain to you. Oh, and the bread as well. We really needed that. Why would why did that happen, bro? That was like a trap. Oh. Oh no. <gasps> okay, 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 okay. Um, should we should we go out of here? I feel like it's safer out of here. Okay, well now I have bullets, that's gonna help me a lot. Um let's go ahead and take these bookshelves and get more books. We might need those. I can hear a lot more zombies. Anything in here? More rotten flesh. <gasps> what the heck? What? What just happened? What? Wait, where, where did that zombie come from? I just got hit with all of those things. Oh my gosh. What just happened? I was minding my own business and a zombie just came out of nowhere and gave me like every poison he could possibly give me. I need to get rid of these spawners. I think that's what I've got to start doing. It's just... Getting rid of these things to stop them from spawning on me. Whoa. It looks pretty empty, honestly. What 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 is that over there? It looks like a underground train track, maybe? That goes from city to city. I'm not quite sure on that. What is that? Are they are these guys friendly? Are you guys friendly? Oh, some sea oats. What I wonder what I can do with those. Oh wait. Oh! Hang on a minute. Is this an NPC? Hello, Tyler. Okay. Well, there's NPCs as well. How are you? I mean, wait, what, what are you doing out here? Can I talk to you? Can I interact with you? No? Do you need help chopping these down? Okay, well, you don't want to talk to me, do you, buddy? So, I'm going to leave you to it, but that's pretty cool there's NPCs around, though. But where are you going? Oh, okay, you're just chopping your trees down. Okay, I'll leave you to it, Tyler. But nice nice meeting you, I guess. Uh, my name's Scoops, by the way. Whoa. Oh, wait, was that iron? Ooh, let's go. Do you know what? I'm going to take you on one-on-one, -on -one, okay? I'm feeling brave. Stay back. There we go. I told you I'd take you on, zombie. I'm not I'm not scared of you guys anymore. You're too familiar to me now. I wonder what Tyler's up to, that NPC. I mean, how did he even get here? What What is his deal here, you know? Like, what is his purpose? I think he's just out here trying to survive, honestly. I think that's what we're all kind of doing out here. But I'm pleased to know that I'm not the only one trying to survive out here. We need food. Anything in the backpack? An apple? Okay, see? I told you the backpack would come in handy. Let's eat these apples. Get us to full hunger bars. I've also got lots more bullets now in my revolver, so I can actually start using it. Whoa, look at this tree! Can I chop it down? Oh my gosh, are those crabs? Wait, can they attack me? I think you guys are friendly. Oh no, it's becoming night time again. This isn't good. I need to start putting some more stuff in here so I can hold it. Let me collect this. Wait, what is this? Coconut log? Whoa, that's so cool. Oh no, 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 zombie, stay back. Get back. Oh, that's so cool. Come up here, zombie. Stay back. There we go. Oh, and I hear a chicken. Where is that? Oh, okay. Of course there's a zombie on it. Of course. <laughs> Let me get rid of you. Oh, no. I killed the chicken. <laughs> no. I'm sorry about that chicken. I need to reload. Oh, coconuts. Leave me alone, zombie. Ow. Come on. Oh, no, 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 no. There's loads of you. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. I need to eat fast. We don't want to get hit by them and slow us. Oh no, there's a mutant zombie. Okay, I'm definitely heading in the opposite direction of that guy. Okay, well, it's daytime and I'm feeling much safer. It's like I'm on holiday in this section. Look at it, it's all palm trees and sand and lovely blue crystal waters. And then you look behind me, it's an abandoned city and a zombie. What the? <laughs> okay, well, anyways. Oh, look at this biome. Okay, let me head over this direction. That looks so cool over here. Oh no, wait, why is there so many zombies still? This is crazy. Right, I think I should jump in the water and swim over, honestly. Oh no. Oh, what the heck? They're swimming zombies. <laughs> what is this? They're very slow, so I think I'm fine. Oh, look at this. Oh, there's another anvil in here. I don't really need that as I already have one. I think I actually have two, but I just didn't place the other one down. Anything up here? No, okay, right, let's actually go and loot that chest, though. Oh, hello, seagull, how did you get inside of here? Okay, well, all right, let's see what's in this chest. Oh, some rope, some more wheat, nice. Oh, wait, some more bullets. Let's go. Lots more rope. What was that, a music disc as well? Where did that go? There. Let's open our backpack and just 
put all of this stuff in here. What can we actually... Oh, wait, no, let's keep the bullets. Um, okay, cool. That's uh, that's very handy. Now we have more bullets. Nice. We have lots of wheat now, actually. I think we should head back to the bunker. What do you think? What's in this chest? Nothing. Okay, cool. Nothing in the backpack that we can eat. Oh, no. We need to find some more chickens. Or at least find more bread in a chest or something. Come on. Yes, more bread. Nice. Okay, let me... Oh, nice. Look at the iron ingots. Nice. Let me hit this furnace. Let me put the raw iron inside of here. And let's cook it up. There we go. Now we can cook some rotten flesh and we can eat that. And then we can make a bucket like so. And then we can make a little wheat farm. Oh, I need to eat this flesh. I never thought I'd be saying that, but here we go. It adds weakness though for like two seconds, but it's fine. Who cares? I still need to craft that workbench. That's what I still need to do. I just need to find light grade concrete. Okay, that's fine. Okay, right, let's see how our rotten flesh is getting on. Let's eat this. Okay, and when this is all done, we're going to start heading back to the bunker, I think. I think that's the best thing to do in these situations. I hear those zombies. Where are they? They're in there, aren't they? Yeah. I think these zombies drop all sorts as well. They have, like, different drop rates of, like, certain things. So, it'd be pretty cool if they drop some cool stuff. Ooh, potatoes. How's my cooked flesh getting on? Nearly done. Oh, my gosh. Look at the weapons you can get. Look at that. You can get an Org A2, an F2000, Ace of Spades. <laughs> this is so cool. And if you notice, you can also get attachments as well. So, you can get stock suppressors, silencers, angled grip. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Look at that, you can get holographic sights as well. That is super cool. I can't wait till we get all of those. And look at this netherite diamond sword. There's so much gear to get. Okay, right, now we've got some food though. Oh, let's place a torch in here. Oh my gosh, it's getting super dark. Hang on, let's hit the backpack again. Let's put some bricks in here and other stuff. Do you think we should swim over here? Okay, I do. Are you ready? Oh, okay, wait, there's zombies, but it's fine, let's go! <gasps> Oh my gosh, they're heading towards me so fast. I need to get out of here. I need to get round. Oh no. Okay, right, let's go. We're gonna have to take a hit, I think. Or not. Okay, we're fine. We're good, we're good. These baby zombies are extremely fast, and I don't know why. But I have my revolver out, just in case anything happens, you know? Just in case things get out of hand. Whoa! Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's keep swimming. We gotta keep swimming. Oh my gosh. Oh, no, I need to reload. Actually, I think I can take you on the sword. You don't scare me. Nice. Come on, Scoops, you can't make these mistakes. Oh, no. Ah. Build, 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 build. Oh. oh, what the? How do they climb trees? I think they can climb trees now. These zombies do not fail to shock me. Come on, can it just, like, hurry up and be daytime already? Like, what is going on? Are you gonna, are you gonna hurt me? I don't know if you're going to hurt me or not. Oh, wait. Don't steal my rotten flesh. Can these guys attack me? I, I think they can. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna run and hope for the best, honestly. Oh dear. Oh no. Run. Oh wait, there's a village over here. Oh my gosh, right. I need to go and check that out in a second. I'm gonna head over there now. I could find some help over there. Okay, so we've encountered our first village by the looks of things. Come on, we need to find some loot in these. Oh wait, there's a cauldron with some water. Wait, let's go ahead and take that up actually. Well, we found some leather armor. Put that on? Then how are we gonna hold our backpack? Okay, we just won't we won't wear it. We'll just keep it there for now. Oh no. <gasps> oh gosh, these villages are not safe. I thought they were, but they're not. Stay back. Oh wait, was that a slime ball? Let me pick that up. Oh my gosh, why are they so fast, these zombies? Oh wait, what is this in here? Wait, what is that? Is that... Oh my gosh, wait, there's an actual villager here. Hello, buddy. Wait, I want to take your loot and XP. So don't mind me. Oh no, why are they so fast? Any chests or any... Oh wait, I saw a stone cutter in there. Another villager. What is that? Oh, okay, that's a horse. I thought that was like a gorilla or something like that. Oh, right, let me go in here. Okay, I'm going to take this. I'm going to need this for the build. It might be handy. You never know. I really need to stay in here and just recuperate for like two seconds. Oh, hang on a moment. There's a wheat farm. What is that? Is that a squirrel? I have no idea. Right, let's go. Actually, do you know what? Let's take this. Okay. Stay back! I got slowed down there, but I'm fine now. That was really scary. Thankfully, I had more bullets left. What is that? What is that? I'm definitely not messing with that thing. Is that like a rhino or a buffalo? I, I, I really don't know, but I'm definitely not contesting that for a minute. Whoa, look at this place I just found. Oh my gosh, wait, there's a chest up there as well. Look at this place. This is the coolest village I've ever seen. Okay, right. Oh my gosh, hello. I accidentally put the seed in that composter, I'm sorry. But okay, right, we need to find loot. Loot, loot, loot. Right, I'm going to take these lanterns. It's going to be cheeky of me, but I'm I'm going to take them. Whoa, look at this. If you didn't know me already, I absolutely love lanterns. So I'm going to steal every lantern I possibly find. 
Okay, this is so cool. Is that like a little toilet? That's so funny. Look at that. It's got like a little flush thing on it. That is so cool. More lanterns out here. Oh, no, there's more zombies. Oh, wait, there's upstairs. Whoa, look at this place. That is so cool. Another lantern. I will certainly take that and that as well. There's some honeycomb blocks. Okay, I'm going to put that back. Should I not be doing this right now? Oh, well. Who's going to stop me, right? We're in an apocalypse. This is desperate times. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Let's go back downstairs then. Let's enter another building. This is so cool. Okay, I think these villagers need help. They look pretty organized though, I can't lie. Has one of these got a workbench anywhere? Blast furnace, blast furnace. <gasps> Thank you, villagers, for protecting me. Oh, chest. Oh, look at this. Iron ingots. Some gold nuggets. Iron nuggets. I'm definitely taking those. An iron pick. Okay. Nice. Oh, look at these beds. Okay, I'm definitely going to find some cool loot in here, aren't I? Oh my gosh, look at the iron golems. Whoa. Look at this guy go. He's protecting the villagers. This is so cool. We need an axe. That's what we need, though. We do need an axe. Whoa, look at that bridge over there. Look at the iron golem go. You show them who's boss, iron golem. You show these guys who's boss. Whoa, look at this place. It's like a big castle. Whoa, look at this place. They've got like an archery here with a target. They've got some hay bells. They've got it all going on here. They have a whole castle, like a whole village going on. They have a bell. Right, well, let's explore this place then. What's, what's over here? Oh, <gasps> we found diamonds. Let's go. We needed that so bad. Oh, my gosh. The trouble is, what do we drop? I feel like we're going to need this stuff. Okay, we don't need beetroot seeds. I'm pretty sure we can take diamonds. Oh, look at that. We found our first diamonds. Let's go. Whoa, these villagers got it going on around here. Just more lanterns for me to take? Okay. Why is there so many villagers in here? What the? They're not all going to be infected and turn into zombies on me, are they? I hope not. Whoa, look at this. Oh my gosh, they got like a birthday cake or something. I'm going to eat that. I need to eat that. This place is so cool. Wait, there's another floor? What's out here? Any chests? Okay, none up here. Let's go back down. I'm going to take these scaffolding. I might need them. Okay, I'm not being greedy, I promise, okay? I just, I might need them, okay? It's a, it's a zombie apocalypse, I might need them. I need to look out for some chests, though, because on one of these levels, there could be some chests down here, you know? So I've got to be, got to be on the lookout. Some campfires in there, okay. Anything up here, come on. Yes, there's a chest, come on, please be something good in here. Oh, yes, some more bullets. String, a bow, some arrows. Oh my gosh, wait, I can't even carry this stuff. Let me drop those mushrooms. Let's go, more bullets. Nice. Some arrows and a bow. Okay, well, hang on a minute. We have too much stuff. We have way too many stuff. Okay, right, let's dump some stuff we don't need. Oh, there's some zombies, but they can't get into me because I'm literally secure here. This is so cool. Okay, right, let me drop this stuff in my backpack. I don't need, like, a spider eye. I don't need a snow block. Can always get titanium. Terracotta, I don't need... Okay, I actually don't need a lot of this stuff. Well, wow. oak hollow logs, I don't need them. I don't need that. I don't need that. Now, we can get that bow. Some tripwire hooks. I don't need those, right? I don't know, but I can... I now have a bow, which is super cool. And more bullets in my revolver. Some glass bottles. A cobweb. A spider eye. Okay, what's in here? A book and a quill. Flint and steel. Whoa, we've got an enchantment book. That's so cool. Bookshelves. Let's take these. Whoa, that's so cool. Is there anything written in here? Okay, right, there's nothing written. Okay, that's super cool, though. Uh, anything in the barrel? Whoa! Okay, lots and lots of food. Oh my gosh, look at this. Yes, we definitely, definitely needed that. Oh gosh. Wow, there's lots of you guys. Okay, um... Wait, how are you... Oh no, I need to break that somehow. Oh my gosh. Okay, we need to get some of this stone brick or something to build. <gasps> okay, I need to be careful. Now, this is where things start to get a little more interesting. Okay, and I also remembered I need to make a workbench, you know, so I can craft even more guns and craft some more bullets and sort of see what else we can do. It appears to be that it's becoming daytime now and also look how nice this shader looks. Okay, well, it's definitely morning time. Oh, look how beautiful that looks. It doesn't look as scary now. Oh, hello, villager. How are you, buddy? I thought you was a zombie for a second. I was about to attack you. For some odd reason, I can't find a crafting table. This is risky. This is very risky. I know, I know. Oh, wait, I see a barrel in here. Let me go in here. Oh, my gosh. Wait, there's three. Oh, look at this. An axolotl. Oh, hang on a minute. Some raw cod. Oh, my gosh. Okay, hopefully they can't break doors down, because if they can, I'm definitely doomed. Is that a zombie? Oh, wait, there's a chest there. So let's craft a iron sword. Now we have a sword. We can start attacking these zombies off. Come on. Ugh. Oh, no. I just got hit there. Let me eat this piece of steak. Oh, no, they got the villager. No, the villager got infected. Little farmer. 
Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I did not mean to do that. Okay, 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 okay. Stay back. Stay back. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, okay, okay. I've got to be careful. I've got to be careful. I can't be making these mistakes around here. Right, let me take some baked potatoes out of here for now. I want to go see what's in this chest real quick. Look at this. Power one bow. Right, I'm going to take these arrows as well. Lots of string. I'm going to take this. Oh, yeah. It's only one iron nugget. I don't need that. I need to craft a workbench, build a bunker with a sustainable farm. Craft better guns, even more bullets. Maybe even looking into, like, enchanting some weapons. And also, you know, getting better armor and etc. So, that's what I have to do. But how do I enter here? Oh, wait, this is the entry? Okay. I've got a shovel with efficiency 2 on it. Oh, is this like a little make-believe bed? <laughs> Look at it. It's just like carpet. Okay, I don't know why this is flooding. Ugh, that's annoying. Okay, anything in here? Oh, another diamond! No way! Let's go. Right. Uh, another iron pickaxe and more iron nuggets. Nice. Good stuff. Oh, wait, I see some cows. Okay, and also a zombie, apparently. Nice. Come here, cow. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Baby zombie, stay back. Do you know what? I'm going to have to... Oh, my gosh. Wait, where am I? <gasps> I just fell into a trap. Okay, come here. There we go. Oh, look at that sunlight beaming through that building. Give me some beef. Give me your beef. Come on. Come here. There we go. And just like that, it's another beautiful... Well, it, it is a beautiful morning. You know what? It is a beautiful morning. I'm not going to let these zombies ruin my lovely morning. Do you know what? I need to make a shield. Ah, that's what i got to do. Why haven't I made a shield yet? I don't know. But I'm going to go craft a shield. Oh, no. This little village is scared. No. Oh, wait. No, no, no. You're becoming infected, aren't you? Oh, no. You've been infected. Okay. I'm going in here for now. Now we have a shield. It wouldn't hurt to shoot a few zombies, would it now? Okay. Now we have a shield... We should be able to defend these guys, but now I can defend myself a lot more. How did that miss? There we go. Okay, now I've really got to stop wasting bullets. I need to craft this workbench. Right, so I need concrete, don't I? I need grey concrete. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. So I need to craft grey dye, and then I can mix it with some sand and make some concrete. And then it takes some iron as well for a workbench, right? So that's what i got to do. You know what, I'm going to use this bullet, because you deserve to be shot. Just what we want to encounter. Let's see what this is all about in here, because it's all broken and stuff. Oh my gosh. Look at this place. Oh, what is... What's going on down here? Any chests? Oh! <gasps> uh oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! Okay, 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 okay! <gasps> oh my gosh! Desperate times called def desperate measures! Okay. Reload. Oh! What is in there? I don't know. Oh no. Stay back. i got to time my swings right. Because if not, I'm going to get hit uh, like that okay oh my gosh no wait what was in that chest again uh oh uh. okay some wheat some more rope a bucket some more string a music disc gunpowder get me out of here go 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 I wonder what happened here I wonder how this virus all started oh hello mr. piggy I'm gonna let you live okay I feel bad. Whoa, it looks like some sort of old library. Uh-oh, uh-oh, okay, okay. Let me get out of here. Oh my gosh, there's so many! Okay, I have to aim for the door again. Let's go! Go, 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 go! Oh, there we go. I blocked them. The harvest moon rises, your crops provide a better harvest. Ah, okay, well, that means we have to try and set up a little base here. Do you know what? Let's use one of these homes real quick as one of our homes. I think that's the best thing to do right now is just to sort of make do and then we can make a little farm outside. And then I'm going to put these chests right here and then I'm just going to dump all my stuff in it that I don't need for now. There we go. That's that's much better. Now we can sort of manage everything. Let's go and grab some of this. You know, we're going to need this. Okay, wait, let's make a furnace. Can we make a furnace? Absolutely not. Okay, and I feel like we should go to sleep if we can. Wait, the harvest moon sets. Okay. What is this guy? No! Tell, don't tell me that's Sergeant Green. Is that Sergeant Green? I don't know, but he's wearing his army clothes. He's wearing his uniform, so I don't know. Oh my gosh, why is he so fast? Oh my gosh, there's so many zombies. What was that? Oh my gosh, what is that thing? 
Oh no 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 no! Absolutely not! There is a mutant zombie right behind me. Okay, I need to get out of here real fast. Look at it! Look at that thing! I can't even shoot it. I have no bullets. Oh no 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 no! Okay, I need to go back in. I need to go back inside. Oh no 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 no! <laughs> go go go! I feel like it's right there. <gasps> oh my gosh! It can hit me through walls. What? Okay, hang on. I need to do something really fast. Okay, I need to grab this wood. <gasps> Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Oh no. <gasps> run, 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 run. Oh! Okay. Oh my gosh. Why is there a mutant zombie right behind me? It's daytime. It's literally daytime. I need to go back in the castle. I think I need to do it. Oh, okay. I thought you was a zombie. Oh my gosh. Why is it so dangerous? I just want to know where that guy is. He's definitely outside the front, isn't he? There he is. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, bro. Look at the size of this guy. Look how scared these villagers are, bro. <laughs> Look how scared they are. As soon as they see that mutant zombie, they are definitely heading in the opposite direction. I can assure you that. <gasps> oh, yes, I can attack you. Yes. Come closer. How many hits is it going to take you to just go away? Come close. Come close, mutant zombie. I need you. Oh! Okay. He's getting angry. He's getting really angry. <laughs> There we go! He's finally down- wait, is he slain now? Or is he sleeping? What? Oh my gosh, you've got to be kidding me. He's coming back for more. Oh no, 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 no. No, my sword's broken. Okay, now I definitely need a new sword. <gasps> what was that? Oh no, my iron is in the other chest. No! Oh gosh, right. Hang on a minute. Do you think they're distracted there? Do you think I can- <sighs> No, no. This is bad, this is bad. Okay, right, the mutant zombie's still here, so if I go this side, right, I can outrun these other zombies, okay, so... Okay. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Go, 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 go. Get your iron, get your iron. Boom, let's go, let's go. Go, 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 go. Oh my gosh. What is going on? No. Okay, nice. Alright, so now we can go back. Up here. Right, and then if we go in here, we can make a crafting table. Right, let's put that down there. I don't know why there isn't already a crafting table here, but whatever. Okay, and now we can make an iron sword. Nice. Whoa, look at this. I can make an iron knife. Huh. There he is. There he is. Hello, mutant zombie. Oh, my God. There we go. Oh, wait. What did he drop? He dropped some sort of hammer. Okay. I've got to think strategic here. Screw it. If I run all the zombies over here, right, and then if I go back... There we go, yes! What is that? I'm about to go check that out. What the? Why is there zombies in here? Oh my gosh, I thought this was safe. But look at this, I got a Hulk hammer. Whoa, look at this thing. That is so cool. What does it do? Nine attack damage, no way. This thing is insane. Should we test it out? What do you guys think? I think we should test this baby out. Boom! Oh my gosh, whoa, look at this thing. Boom! This thing is insane. Oh no, just because I have a Hulk hammer in my hands doesn't mean I should be messing around, okay? I think I nearly just got humbled there, so I've got to be careful. If I can just keep attacking these guys like this, honestly, I'm, it'd, be, it'd be fine. I can't believe I encountered Sergeant Green as well. I'm pretty sure that was him. You know, that's got to be him, right? We're not scared. Come on, little hit. Boom! Boom! Oh no. Oh, I'm stuck. Okay, there we go. Oh, no, 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 the water's pushing me. Boom. Go away, baby zombie. You appear to do the most damage for some odd reason. Right, now, let's take our stone hoe out. Oh, my gosh, you've got to be kidding me. Why is there so many of you guys? Please leave me alone. Right, let's dig out this part here. Right, let's break all of this. Okay, so it gives us enough room for a little farm here. So this is where the little wheat farm's going to go. Okay, so let me just, let me hoe all this down. And let's get our wheat seeds, and let's place all these wheat seeds down. There we go. Nice. So now we have a little farm going on. A little wheat farm here, you know, that's cool, right? Oh, look at the little turtles. Are they friendly? Okay, they're friendly. Whoa, look how cool they are. Oh my gosh, look at those over there. Are those harmful? Wait, I see a squid. We need its ink sack. So we can, you know, have some black dye. And then we need some, like, bones, which I think we have. Okay, yeah. To turn into white dye. And then we combine them and make grey dye, right? And then we can make grey concrete, I'm pretty sure. So, let's take this squid on. Drop me your ink sack. 
I hope these fishes aren't going to harm me, by the way. They look very frightening, but I think they're friendly. Oh, another ink sack. Why is this squid so fast? Come over here. Oh, no. No, 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 no. I have three ink sacks now. What the? What are these guys doing here? Look at these guys just roaming around thinking they can boss me around. This is an apocalypse. You know, nobody's a threat to me right now, apart from zombies. Lots of coal, though. Ooh, yes, come to me. Yo, wait, so what is uh, your guys' deal? Okay, wait, no, 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 I don't, I don't want to be attacked. Don't attack me. Okay, I see how it is. Come on, then. Ouch. What? Okay, well, now I have a bad omen. Let's keep placing all these carrots down. And then we have a little carrot farm here now. Wait, where's a piece of dirt there? So if I place this piece of dirt right there, hoe it down, and then place a carrot on top. Now we have a little carrot and wheat farm. Okay, so this is going to get us going just for now. But then obviously we're going to make, you know, like a cool bunker with some fences around it, some barbed wire with like a much better farm than this. This is just for now, okay? So this will get us through the nights. Okay, right. So let's put that ink sack in there. And then we have some black dye. Nice. So we can go ahead and put that in there. And then what do we need now? I think we need white dye, right? So let's get our bones. Right, let's take that bone meal. Let's put that in there, and then we get white dye. So now if we combine the black dye and the white dye, do we get grey dye? Okay, nice. Now we have grey dye. Okay, nice, right? That's how we do light grey dye. And then we just need to make concrete, okay? Where's some gravel? This is all gravel here, isn't it? This will be enough. Oh my gosh, and all I need now is sand. Is there sand? Okay, no, there's sand here. Take all this sand, because I need it. Hopefully I don't get attacked by any zombies while doing this. So I have my gravel, I have my dye, and I have my sand, right? So now I can go back and make light grey concrete. Head back to the make-do house, passing our lovely wheat and carrot farm. We need a crafting table, first of all. Let's place our crafting table down, and I believe the order is light grey dye at the top. And sand like that and then the rest gravel there we go light gray concrete powder and now to harden it all I have to do is place it in water and there we go we have our first oh where did it go light gray concrete block nice all right let's place all of it in here quite useful that there's water only here oh that one didn't get any water at all but it's fine oh there we go okay nice now we have light gray concrete now we can finally craft a workbench and I believe it's one piece of iron there okay right Let's go. We have our first workbench. Nice. Look at it. We got it in our hand. Right, let's place it right there for now. Whoa, look how cool it looks. Oh my gosh. This is awesome. Look at this. Oh, AKM custom, an infantry rifle, battle rifle, machine pistol. Oh yeah, I gotta get that. Oh, look how cool that is. So a double barreled shotgun, an F2000. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Okay, wait, what should we try and craft? Because a lot of these contain a lot and a lot of iron. Grenade launcher. Wait, so how do you make the bullets? Oh, you can also make attachments. No way. All the different sights, the muzzles. This is so cool. Oh, a stun grenade. So this is how you craft bullets. Grenade, small bullet. We need basic bullets. So this is how you craft basic bullets so it's gunpowder and copper ingots right so we have raw copper in our inventory so we can go ahead and smelt these into ingots and then we have gunpowder here so we can officially craft basic bullets this is like the coolest thing ever wait what other guns can we get whoa look at that an m4a1 that's gonna be cool that's going to be absolutely insane. Look at this automatic shotgun, though. Tell me you guys don't want this. Oh, my gosh. Look at this minigun. I need this minigun. 38 pieces of iron ingots. We got that easy. Okay, is our copper ingots done? Let's take our backpack, Hulk hammer, bread. Let's take gunpowder as we need it. And let's take some ingots. Right, so now if we head over here, and if we go towards the basic bullets, there they are three stacks. That is so cool. Wait, let's keep doing this. Boom, assemble. Four stacks. Now we can reload our revolver. No problem at all. I want to go and shoot some zombies. I'm no longer scared of you anymore. I no longer have to run. Oh, there's a pig here. <laughs> Give me those pork chops. Oh, yeah. Is that a mutant zombie? Oh, no. Oh, you know what? Let me make a gap there. I'm going to pick you off from a distance, buddy. Okay, well... We at least made a workbench, so that's pretty cool. You know, we can start crafting even more guns, more bullets, and all stuff like that. But I do want to sort of work my way to craft a better gun, so what gun should we go for? Okay, I might just make this one. So a heavy assault rifle consists of 25 iron ingots and 5 planks of wood. Okay, we have no pieces of iron right now. So, you know what that means. We're going to go do a little mine, and we're going to go and find some iron. Okay, well, I don't know what you're doing there, but... Hello, little guy. I want to slay you and see what you drop me. I'm so sorry for this. 
but I really want to see what you drop. Literally nothing, just XP. Okay, well that's fine. All I need is 25 iron ingots. That's very doable. Okay, it's very doable. Wait, is that a backpack? What the? What have you got in here for me? What's in here? Just some bones and rotten flesh? Oh, and a saddle. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, buddy. Well, hey, that's cool. I have a blue backpack now. Nice. Can I shoot you guys from there? <gasps> Wait, no way. I didn't realize I could shoot that far. But what are you guys up to right now? Are you in bed watching this? Are you studying while watching this? Let me know in the comments down below. I'm very intrigued. I'm interested in what you guys are up to right now. Because I'm just trying to survive these 100 days in hardcore Minecraft in a literal zombie apocalypse. So that's what I'm doing. But let me know what you guys are doing. Let's go. We're on a mission. And that mission is to find as much iron as possible. And hopefully there's some down here. That would really help. What the heck is that? Was that a crocodile? Or like an alligator? Wait, what is that? Oh my gosh, it's coming towards me really quick. Okay, what did that drop? Does that drop anything? No. I think it was an alligator. Was it an alligator? I think it was. Or a crocodile. Whatever it was. Oh no. Is this like a radio tower of some sort? Is that a crow? Let me get rid of that. Let me have your feathers. That's a baby zombie on a chicken. Oh, no, there's another one. What is this place? Is it like some sort of factory? Okay, what's in here? Anything in here? Okay, I hear someone. I hear a zombie in here. Okay, what's in here? Oh, two iron. Oh, actually, four iron ingots. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, no. Anything up here? I've got to be careful with these mutant zombies because one hit of those guys, I'm sure would deal quite a lot of damage. They could even be one hit. Oh, okay. Let's get out of here. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Right, I'm going to have to get back up. I think it was this level, wasn't it? Oh, there's zombies above me as well. Cool. Why is there so many? I need to escape this. Oh my gosh. Okay, right, let's go. Come on. These zombies can see me from so far, which is so annoying. Do you think I'll be fine here? <gasps> no! Oh, run, run. I'm half a heart. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. The baby zombies. Oh, oh, oh. Right, let's eat the cooked flesh. Oh my gosh, please don't be no zombies in here, please. Oh my gosh, what has just happened? I was on literal half a heart there. What? That challenge could have been all over at that split second there. But what was the odds of a baby zombie literally falling into that little gap and attacking me? I just want to go home. Stay back. Gunpa oh, nice. Iron. Let's go. We really needed that, honestly. Huh. Oh! My aim is terrible. Whoa, what is that? Okay, I've got to go down there. That's where i got to go. There's so much to explore. Okay, do you know what? I really need to go down here, though. Oh, look at this. Right, let's be careful. Check the left and right. Sort of maneuver around here. Anything? No? Oh. There's lots of chickens. Yes, I need you. Yes, look at that. Seven pieces. Oh, that'd be eight. Oh, dear. Okay, there's lots of you guys. Come on, chickens. I need you right now. Come on, sheep. Give me your mutton. I need it more than you right now. Drop. Do I get... Okay, I've got, I've got quite a bit of food now, actually. Oh, no. I've been hit. And, oh, uh, would you look at that? It's now becoming daytime. Just what we want. Oh, that's much better. Feel that warmness beaming on my skin. Wait, hang on a moment. Have I reached some sort of, like, ice biome? What is this place? I feel like I should go over there. Oh, wait, look. There's, like, a city here as well. Oh, wait, what is that over there? Hmm. Come on, I need more chests. Give me more chests. Oh, my gosh. Look at look at these things. Can I break them? Okay, I can't even break them. Look, there's loads of them. I don't want them to fall on top of my head, though. That would be bad. <gasps> An enchantment table? What the? Yeah, okay, I'll definitely take that. What was that doing there? That is the randomest thing I've ever found. Right, let me keep exploring this building then. Okay, now this is beautiful. This is this is what I like to see. I'm going to go and collect all this. Ow, ow! That really hurt. There we go. All for the ow! Oh, wait, is this a cave? Please be a cave. Please be some iron. Yes, wait, I think this is a cave. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Okay, this is good. This is what I needed. My mission is to get as much iron as I possibly can without dying, I suppose. I think the aim here really is just not to die. I'm going to block this off uh, just in case. Whoa, okay, there's lots of zombies. Right, so if we start mining in this direction, we can mine down. Okay, nice. Let me drop down and place that torch just there. And whoa, look at this place. Okay, there's iron over there. Whoa, that villager had a spyglass. Whoa, there's lots of iron. Little baby zombie, go away. Oh, no. There's lots of iron here. Let me place a torch there. Okay. Oh, my gosh. 
Whoa, there's lots of iron down here. I feel like this is really risky. Why am I digging myself a hole? In order to craft most of the guns, they require a lot of iron. It would be not wise of me to not take all of it, would it? Okay, there we go. Ouch! 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 Run! Oh, that was risky. That was really risky. Get out of here. Get out of town, Buster Brown. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Joking. All right, let's take this iron before anyone else comes along and tries sabotaging us. All right, nice. 23 pieces there. Let's go and take up all this lovely iron. Nice. Any more of it lying around? Oh, there's one piece up here. Oh, more iron. Oh, no. Get away, get away. Oh, I nearly just got trapped. That is not what you want to be doing in a zombie apocalypse, is being trapped by a zombie. That isn't what you want. Right, we have 47 pieces of iron now. We have quite a lot. If we keep collecting it, that means we can literally craft some, like, iron gear as well. Right, let's go back around here then, where we came from. Ooh, lots of iron here. How much coal is down here? An insane amount, apparently. Oh, hello, officer. While I'm collecting this iron, I'm really picturing myself with this assault rifle. It's going to be so cool. All right, let's go up here. All right, where did I come from? I come from up there, didn't I? So let's build up. Oh. Would it be cheeky to take this on the way? Oh, no. I've run out of stamina. I'm going to get hit a couple times, but it's fine. It's fine. you got to lose some to win some, you know? All right, let's head back then. We've got our iron. Let's go back to the workbench and craft some weapons. So we are back at the make-do house and I'm pretty pleased to say we have enough iron now to craft some guns. So the gun we was going to craft was the... Where is it? Let me find it. I think it was... Was it just the normal assault rifle? I think it was right. So the assault rifle consists of 28 pieces of iron ingots. And so far we have a stack of raw iron there and 15 raw iron there. So we've just got some chicken cooking up at the minute. But once that is all done, I'm going to smelt the raw iron into ingots. And then we're going to craft some guns. So I'm so excited for this. But oh, by the way, I put my other backpack on the workbench. I think it looks pretty cool. What do you think? And I hear zombies outside. What are you guys up to? Huh? Are you stuck there? Or what's uh, what's going on here? Oh, right, you're being pushed by the water. I see. Well, it sucks to be you, I guess. Let's see if there's any other zombies around here, because I'm feeling... I don't know. I just want to... I want to shoot some zombies. There we go. Oh, little mosquito. Nice. Don't sprint at me, buddy. Ah! I hate being hit with this... Ugh, look at it. I want to make sure there's no zombies around me to hit me while I'm in this state. Okay, there we go. Should we go over here and check it out real quick? Why not? Let's go and check it out. It's probably going to come and contest us, but... Oh, wait, here he comes now. Okay, actually, I'm scared. I'm going to go around this side just to be safe. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Zombie horse, zombie horse. Well, that came out of absolutely nowhere. Oh, no, I need to eat my cooked flesh real quick. Oh, my gosh. Where did that zombie horse come from? I didn't, I didn't even see it. I thought I was just being attacked out of thin air. Honestly, oh, little squirrel here. Okay, right, what have we got around here? We've got an iron golem sort of trapped. I'm going to shoot you because I feel like you're stuck or something. Oh, what did you drop me? Five pieces of raw bison? Okay, cow, I need you. Give me your beef. Where did it go? Wait, did I pick it up? No, it's here. Okay, right. Hello, iron golem. Don't hurt me. I know you can do lots of damage. Okay, right, we have seven pieces of raw beef now. I think we have some back in the chest. What's this villager up to here? What are you doing, buddy? You're not infected, are you? Anything in here? Did I miss anything? Like, any chests at all? Or sheep? Oh, thank you. Oh, no, they look so scared. Look at their eyes when I, uh, shoot them. <laughs> Poor sheep. Oh, 15 pieces of raw mutton, though. Certainly will take that. Oh, the rain's cleared as well, by the looks of things. It actually looks nice around here now. It doesn't even look like an apocalypse anymore. It looks very safe, but it, it's not. These sheep could be infected. What is that over here on fire? Oh, that... Okay, well, that was a zombie horse. Some pork chops. I'll certainly take those as well. Anything going on down here? Any fishes in the sea? Any? No, just squids. Okay, well, I'll let them roam around there, do their thing. Okay, is there any chickens, though? I need chickens. Is it a chicken? No, that's a sheep. I'm going to head back, and hopefully my chicken in the furnace should be cooked by now. I think it was chicken I was cooking. Ooh, a little bit of parkour there. So, yeah, I'm going to take my chicken out, and then I'm going to smelt my iron. And then we can get crafting these cool weapons. I'm so excited to craft these guns. I wonder how it's going to work with ammo, though. Are they going to go really quickly? Because, like, obviously the fire rate on them is just crazy. Like, it's really rapid. Nice. Cooked chicken. Uh, we're going to eat one now. And then I'm going to put this iron in. 
Right, so that's all going to cook. I'm going to sacrifice some spruce planks there. Um, you know, just to keep that cooking in there for now. Okay, I have a gold. I have three golden apples. Mostly just rotten flesh. But as you can see, we actually went and hunted some beef and mutton and stuff. So, actually, do you know what? Let's make another furnace. You know, get, get these moving at, you know, sort of multitask here. Um, I'm going to place that just there okay and then i'm gonna put the beef in there which is gonna give me nice cooked steak what was that out there was that a was that a zombie or was that a sheep oh apparently it was it was nothing okay well and actually you know what while i'm here and i see these trees i'm actually just gonna take these down i'm obviously going to need the wood at some point right you know when i build my farm and build my base so let's get rid of that lovely lovely stuff i think that does damage to me yeah okay I've got to be careful of stepping into that. But I got eight pieces of spruce log from that. So let me go and take this oak tree down over here. Being careful not to be infected. What is that? Oh, no. They captured the cow. <laughs> the cow's stuck. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Okay, the zombies are starting to appear because it's apparently becoming nighttime now. So I've got to be careful. Come on, then, zombie. Come on. You can't touch me. Oh, no. Maybe you can. Okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I won't test you like that again. Oh, my gosh. I was being too clever there, wasn't I? Let's get rid of this oak tree here, though. Very useful. I've got to be careful now because it's getting extremely dark. Get this oak tree over here. It is really getting dark now, isn't it? Oh, my gosh. Okay, I can hear all the zombies. They're spawning in. Wait, what is... Wait, what? What's going on? Wait a minute. What? Oh, baby zombie. Okay, 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 okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, okay. I want to get rid of this guy. Oh, no, no. Don't stand in that, Scoops. What are you doing? <laughs> Why was that guy playing music? Did that guy drop anything? Why was he playing music? I'm so confused. That's very strange. I don't know why he was playing music. These zombies can't get me. Haha. -ha. <gasps> run, 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 run. Oh, my gosh. These zombies always coming up behind me, bro. I've got to eat this piece of chicken real quick. I know, I'm only doing that over two hunger bars, but it's got to be done, you know? It's got to be done. Okay, another baby zombie. Look at this guy. Oh, no, I only have five basic bullets left. I'm running back home. There's no way I'm risking this. It's getting too dark now. Oh, my gosh. Oh, look at all these guys stuck down there. Oh, okay, I'm running back home. No way. Go, 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 go. What was that? Oh, I'm going to hit this guy with a shovel. Okay, there we go. Let's eat this piece of chicken and regain some health. Oh, some steak's done. And then I'm going to put my raw biz on in. Let's do this thing. All right, how much iron have we got now? All 32 pieces. I have 44 pieces in total now, so you know what that means. I can now start crafting some guns. Right, let's see. Let's see. Oh, look at this. I can craft a rifle, an AK-12. I don't know what I'm feeling. I don't know what to craft. There's so many weapons to choose from. Oh, look at this machine gun. Um, assault rifle. Okay, so this does 6.5 damage. How much does the AK do? Okay, 12 damage. Okay, here we go. I'm about to craft it. Are you ready? Boom! Did we get it? Oh my gosh, we got it, we got it, we got it. Look at this thing. Oh wait, it takes basic bullets too? No way. Okay, right, hang on. We need to craft some basic bullets. I need to quickly cook some copper. Oh my gosh, yes baby. We finally got an assault rifle. Let's go. This is so cool. Look at it. Oh my gosh, this is going to be so cool. I can't wait to test it out. Right, come on, we just need two more bars and then we can start testing it. By the way, we have so much iron. I'm actually going to craft myself some iron armor real quick. Okay, there we go. Now I'm pretty sure we have full iron gear, right? Yeah, okay. Let's go. Look at us. Now we're definitely prepared. We are prepared for some zombies. What? Wait, what? Is this guy back playing the music? Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> Look how cool this is. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Oh, hang on a moment. That is so cool. Wait, it's all my... Oh. Okay, okay, okay. We've got to be careful here. This is so cool. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Okay, I don't think we have many bullets left, honestly. We need to keep crafting those bullets. Why is there so many? It's this guy, though. What is he doing? He doesn't drop anything, though. Huh. Okay, let's quickly go back inside. We need to craft way more bullets. Oh my gosh, that is so cool, though. Okay, let's craft more bullets. There we go. Okay, so I'm going to put my medium bullets back in there for now, but I am... I'm going to let that do its thing in there and then after that's smelted i'm gonna put more food in here you know make sure to put some raw beef and rotten flesh at the bottom here so i don't forget about it okay well i won't be needing this revolver anymore that's for sure oh yeah i can't wait to craft some more guns oh my gosh why is there so many oh my gosh this is so cool let me shut that door oh yeah 
Come on, baby zombie. I'm not scared of you guys no more. Oh, yeah, look at the XP and stuff here. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Where are they now? Zombies are getting quiet now. This is so fun. I went through those zombies like pure butter. This thing is insane. What the? Get out of here. Oh, this is how you put attachments on so I can put a scope on here, a barrel, stock, underbarrel. Do you know what? I really want to craft a shotgun next. Let's do that. I'm going to craft a shotgun. Double barrel shotgun. Oh, yeah. Give me that. Whoa. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. That is insane. Okay, so I need shells. Have I got any shells? Okay, here. Shells, right? Oh, I need gold nuggets. Wait, actually, I think there's some in here. Yeah, okay, right. There's some gold nuggets in here. Okay, here we go. I'm going to craft as many as I possibly can. Oh my gosh, look how many shells I've got. All right, I cannot wait to test this out. This is going to be so, so cool. Where are you at now, zombies? Huh? Where are you at now? There were so many of you when I only had a little revolver. Where are you now? Mosquito? Boom! <laughs> Where are these zombies? Come on, I want to find these zombies now. Is there any down here? Oh, what is down here? Oh, here we go. We've got our first zombie. Boom! <laughs> this is so fun. Wait, let's check how our crops are getting on, actually, because we haven't even checked on those. Okay, so it's coming through. It's very slow on here, though. That's one thing I've noticed. Oh, carrots are ready, though. Let me harvest these real quick. Nice. Okay, so we've got a few carrots from that. We'll plant some back. And we'll go back to the chest and deposit them back in. This water's really saved me right now because it stops all the zombies from coming to the front door. So, actually, good idea. Let's practice our aim real quick. Boom! How can you miss the target like that? Whereas the assault rifle is actually like straight where you want it you know well it's safe to say i've about oh my gosh that scared me so much oh my gosh oh here we have another one boom <laughs> well there's a chest in here more gold nuggets i'll take those okay pretty cool to see there's a few gold nuggets placed around here okay right i think let's explore further into the city now because we have our guns here actually before i go in i'm going to craft more basic bullets so i can use my assault rifle and when i'm up close i'm going to use my double barrel shotgun i think that's what i'm going to do here because obviously i don't think this can hit zombies from far it might do but you know just to be safe i'm gonna craft more basic bullets all right here we go basic bullets let's assemble like a lot let's pick all these bullets up okay now i think we're safe what do you think? Look how many bullets we have now. And look, we can always craft more. I'm going to smelt this real fast. That's cool. We now have two new guns. We have complete iron armor. We have our food. So, I think we're ready. I'm going to take this coal with me as well, just in case, actually. Right, let's go. Let's go explore. Oh, I am so ready. Look at me. Who's going to approach you when you look like this, you know? I've noticed it gets rid of my shield as well when I pull it out. That's quite funny. Who's lurking around here still? I hear them, but I can't see them. They're probably in here, aren't they? <gasps> Another enchantment table? Okay, because we're close range, we're going to pull out the double barrel shotgun. Whoa, look at this place. I haven't even been in here yet. I need some chests. Oh, is this a chest here? Right, come on, please be something good. Okay, food, but you know what? We don't really need any of it, so we're going to leave it in there for now. But we're going to try and remember where it is. Oh, I think a zombie just spawned. Got to be careful for these zombies here because they literally spawn out of thin air. I just saw something jumping over here. Oh, little crow. Double barrel is equipped. Oh, Get out of sight. There's a chest here. Come on, please do something good. Oh, okay. How do we... Do you know what? We're going to break this to get in. Okay, so the zombies disappeared, but right, let's see what's in this chest. Oh, no, it's it. There we go. Right, let's check what's in this chest. Hey, I'm just being chased around by zombies. Move. There we go. Okay, it's so dark in here. Right, let's check what we got in the chest. Please be something good. Oh, just more bones, saddles, string. Oh, wait, yes. Look at this, a dot sight. Increase ADS speed. What? Oh my god. Wait, how do I put this on again? No, I've got to get out of here. Oh my gosh. What are the odds of that? How do I do this? Right, Z. <gasps> no way, this is so cool. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. This is the coolest thing I've ever seen. Oh my gosh, this isn't even Minecraft anymore. Look at this. I need to find more attachments. I need to really start exploring these places, don't I? Because I'm leaving so much loot behind. Look how far I can... Look, because my aim is so good now. Oh, look at the chicken. Boom! Get out of here, chicken. There's another one of them zombies in there. Okay. Oh, no. Ooh, some iron boots. Who's about? Who wants to feel my raft? Well, my double-barreled shotgun. Anything in these? No, okay, wait. There's nothing in these places. You need to look in, like, the bigger buildings, I think. 
Come on, let them out. Oh, oh no! Oh my gosh, I got hit there. I've got to be careful, I've got to look around me. Oh, a little zombie coming from the right side of me there. Reload my double barreled shotgun, and boom! <laughs> that never gets old. What's this guy doing in his shorts? It's, it's cold outside. Oh my gosh, put a coat on. You need a scarf and gloves in this sort of conditions, and you're out here with the shorts. Oh, I can even shoot the fishes. Ah! Oh, I think I accidentally shot the iron golem. I didn't mean that. Help me, golem! Wait, I'm going to free this golem. Oh no! Oh no, I accidentally hit the golem! <laughs> I want forgiveness. Is this a bad idea? Can you not come out? Okay, surely you can come out now, right? Yeah, okay, and you're coming straight after me. Why? We can be friends. You haven't got to do this, Golem. You haven't got to do this, buddy. Come on now, we can talk through things. We can sort this out. Oh, you leave me with no choice. Be gone! Oh my gosh, you're a lot stronger than I thought. What the? Okay. Oh my gosh. Sorry about that, Mr. Cow. Does anything else want to try and attack me today, or... And would you look at that, another beautiful day in an apocalypse. Oh no, what is that horse doing over there? How did it even get over here? What the... Wait, there's another one over there? You know, I haven't got my saddle on me, so I'm sorry, but... I don't think I can help you here. How did you even manage to get yourself in this position? Oh, there's one down here. Oh no, this is a zombie one. Okay, this is a bad one. Ugh, sneaky, sneaky horse. Thought I wouldn't even notice it. Okay. Look how beautiful these waters are. Who would have thought it was an apocalypse, eh? I would have thought I'm on holiday right now. Okay, right, let's swim up to shore. And now... Oh, squirrel, what are you doing? Where are you running from? I don't want to attack you. Do you know what? I'm actually gonna... I just want to talk, you know? I'm joking. Okay, let's return to home. Where is our home? Okay, it's here. I'll tell you what we're going to do. Now it's daytime. We have a perfect opportunity now to start building something. What don't I need? I don't need that. I don't need that 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 oh no i do need that actually okay so i'm only gonna keep the things i need there we go right now let's take some resources in here like sticks for example these spruce trap doors some scaffolding i'm gonna take some cobblestone oh my lanterns don't forget those some wheat some sand i'm gonna take some coconut log and okay we'll see where that gets us right so i'm planning on building only sort of local so i want to build i'm thinking maybe over here you know let's have a look around here and meet this chicken nom 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 okay yeah so i want to build sort of here only because it's quite local you know to all the cities and we've got some water around us it's quite a nice location okay so what i want to do is okay let's think here i'm gonna flatten all of this okay that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to start digging in a straight line to sort of around here and go from there, really. Come on, squirrel, you're in my way. Don't make me do something I don't want to do. Okay, so I want to dig out this area here. Okay, there we go. Um, I don't know how wide I'm going to come out. I might come out to about... I'm going to dig out to here. So if I... Oh, sorry, squirrel. I did warn you, though. You know, you're kind of in my way, buddy. Let me dig sort of around here. Demolish all this dirt. I want to build like a little bridge, so, you know, I want to build like a little castle thing where like, on the entry, it's like, I don't know, I want to make something cool. Oh, my shovel just broke, so it looks like I'm going to have to use my... Okay, let me quickly pop this crafting table down. I need this for construction. Okay, let me make some shovels. I'm going to do three for now. Okay, there we go. Let's get through this dirt. Going to drop me some seeds as well, which is quite useful. So you see like that there on that castle, it has like a pier. I don't know what you call it, like, it's sort of like a tower thing. I want to make one of those on each side so I can, you know, go out there and get the zombies off. Okay, oh, little turtle. Oh no, sorry. Sorry. Oh no, <laughs> I keep accidentally hitting you. I'm sorry, buddy. Sorry. I didn't mean that. That is my bad. Okay. Right. Yeah, okay. So this is cool. Um, I'm going to... Let me make some coconut planks and then... Let me see here. Let me flatten some of this out. Yeah, so I'm going to keep going wider, I think. Maybe up until... I'm going to just... Yeah, I'm going to do all of this, you know? Why not? I may as well, right? I'm sorry about that, turtle. I'm sorry. You're not going to attack me, are you? You know, we're all friendly out here. It's just the zombies we don't like, isn't it? Okay, get rid of all this stuff. There we go. Okay, so I'm going to extend this out to about roughly here. So I'm going to come out... Hold up. So, like, I'm going to keep going till about or as far as i've went out the other side i think that's enough what do you think yeah let's do that and i'm gonna have to fill it all back in which is going to take quite a while but we got it come on zombies 
I'm trying to put some work in here, you know? You're really putting me off. Ooh, yummy XP. Okay, I think we should actually go to bed, though, because we have a lot of work to do on this new build. There's some sugar cane here as well. I'm going to take that. Nice. Now we can start off a little sugar cane farm. Okay, let's go to sleep, though. It's sleepy time. Okay, there we go. Right, now I can show you what I've done with the place. Morning, zombie. Good night for you. Oh, little baby zombie. Boom! Boom! <laughs> that will never get old. That is so fun. Come on, let's take these zombies on. Come on. Come on, bro. All right, well, enough of that now. Right, as you can see in the distance, that is the flat land we will be working with. What? What is this zombie doing? Why is it so fast? Oh my gosh. Okay, get out of there. All right, let me show you. So, some more zombies following, but as you can see, I put some graft in. I sort of flattened it all out here. Oh, okay, hang on. Hang on just a moment, guys. Bear with me. Oh, okay, right. Well, let me just wait till all of this wears off. Oh. We flattened it all out and basically replaced all the stone over here, all the cobblestone and stuff for dirt blocks. So we got all this land to work with now. So the good thing is that it's on water as well. We can actually make a little farm here. As a matter of fact, I have some sand. Why not, just for a moment, place some sand around here and grow some sugar cane? Okay, so we'll leave that to grow for now. Let me just get rid of all this. But yeah, a lot of uh, digging, a lot of dumping off dirt and dumping some cobblestone that I didn't need. So... Yeah, now we have all this flat land. Why don't we start trying to build something here? What should be the entrance? This way? Or Yeah, okay, this way, right? That only makes sense. So, why don't we get a crafting table real quick and then place it about... I don't know. Let me, just, let me place it here for now. Okay, let's make some coconut planks, right? But let's make some slabs like that. Oh, I hear something approaching me. What is it? What was that? Okay, oh... Okay, I think it was just you. No, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Did I scare you, buddy? Okay, no, I'll let you live. Right, but now we have some coconut slabs. What we can do is... So the middle of this is 17 blocks. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Okay, so this is the middle of our build, right? So let's just make a bridge like that, okay? Is that fair? Okay, then we're going to build out 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. What do you think? Should we build out to about here for now? We can always extend, can't we? Okay, so let me just do this for now. Use up all these coconut slabs. They're really nice, actually. I like the look of them. Okay, I haven't got an axe, so bear with me. Okay, I know this is triggering you guys right now, but I can't help it, okay? Oh, oh my gosh, what are you doing down here? Okay, hurry up, hurry. Okay, I'll leave that guy down there for now. Oh my gosh. Gosh, no! Okay, here we go. Boom! That worked out quite perfectly. Let's go back to that crafting table, and then let's craft more of those. There we go, right, we have 36 more now. So now what we can do is, we can take this oak log, turn it all into planks, and then make some fences. Okay, let's see if that's enough fences. Oh my gosh, I need to make a chest here actually as well. Let's put these chests here temporary, you know, just to literally put everything in and then we can go through what we need, you know. Okay, so of course we need our guns and then we need our sword pickaxe. We need our cooked chicken, lanterns, fences and wood, right? Okay, right. That's all we need for now. And then what we can do is we can place these fences like so, coming out like that. Same this side. Oh, we haven't got enough, so we need to craft more fences. Okay, now we have enough fences. Let's go back and place these down like so. And then let's take our lanterns and put them either side just like that. Okay. Oh, wrong place. My bad. Right, boom. There we go. Okay, so now we have a little thing going on here. What we can now do is, I'm going to get some stairs, right? Now, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to make a thing like this. Okay, midway trying to find some cobblestone and stuff. I stumbled across this cave, and look at this guy after me! Oh my gosh! Look at this thing! Oh no, 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 no! Do you know what? I actually need these mossy blocks for the build. They look so cool, but oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, okay, it's gone. Oh, Few. Didn't drop anything useful, but look at this place. I mean, it's just full of cobwebs and stuff, and oh, gives me the creeps. Oh, lots of iron, though. Oh my gosh. Look at this place. It's actually packed with iron. Lots of cobwebs as well. I wonder why there's so many cobwebs. Well, I'm not quite sure, but I'm going to take this mossy cobblestone as well, actually, because this is going to come in useful for the build, and you'll see why in a second. Oh, hello, buddy. <laughs> Oh, he, no! I was about to say he got stuck in the cobwebs, but now I'm stuck. I'm fine now. This is actually really useful. I actually needed to stumble across this cave. So, I'm going to take as much of this as we can. I want to eat some chicken. Oh my. What's down here then? Nothing. Interesting. 
Some redstone. I will take some of this redstone because to go <gasps> Oh my gosh! Oh! Oh! Oh my gosh. Where did that even come from? Cave centipede. Oh my gosh. I have no food. Oh no. Okay, I've got to go back up to the top. I can't sit down here any longer. I'll come back down, but as I was saying, I need this redstone. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I need this redstone to craft the sites, like the red dot site and stuff, because it requires some redstone. All right, I'm going back up to the top. Okay, so as you can see, I've gone for this sort of look where I've got the whole dock going on over here. And I'm going to make these like piers, as I was saying. So this requires some, you know, stone bricks and stone brick walls. So I'm going to do this, this side and both that side. And then also, as you can see, I put two pieces of scaffolding here because I thought, you know, why not? But then I've got a little staircase going down to the dock here. So you can go down, you know, do some fishing if you want to. But in order for the zombies to even enter here, I'm going to have like a little thing here, like a big doorway. And I'm going to have these two towers so I can check on on it so yeah but let's carry on with this then so oh no this is going to be the entrance for it isn't it so let me do this okay and it's going to be the walls on the corners like so so it gives that little effect i think it looks pretty nice i like it so let's continue building up like this i don't know how high i'm going to take this i might go this high what do you think let me jump in the water real quick there we go okay now i'm going to take this wall down if i can even get up oh my gosh okay so i'm going to do this corner while i can oh like that take that off there we go right that looks pretty cool to me let's see what it looks like do you think this is high enough let's find out oh my gosh i keep forgetting we can't go up that way oh actually there we go no okay it needs to be higher than that oh i forgot to put the wall up this side oh no it's raining no it's raining terribly out here oh my gosh give me a chance oh okay as i say that of course i get a zombie trying to attack me oh no i didn't mean to barrel roll into the water okay let me swim back up here but yeah i'm gonna barbed wire all of this off and it's gonna be all fenced off and all private so you know we make sure we don't get attacked so i can't wait for that oh what is that oh no he's trying to throw a little trident at me please go away we're going to try ignore these zombies even though the wise thing to do right now is probably go to sleep but sleep is for the week am i right oh oh my gosh look at the tridents <laughs> what oh my gosh okay well didn't realize i was going to be using these towers sooner i'm gonna go up to about here for now go all along like this with the stone bricks this side Oh, there we go. And last side. There we go. Right, okay. Seriously, zombies? You want to do this now? Oh my gosh! He actually hit me. Okay. Oh my gosh, why is there so many zombies? We're going to run through this little gap here. Oh no, I'm going to run out of hunger bars. I need to return back to the other base quick. Otherwise, I'm going to stop sprinting and I'm going to slow right down. Huh, huh, huh. Oh no, go, 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 go. No, zombie, go away. Ugh. Okay, quick, quick, quick. All right, I need to go to sleep. Actually, but I need food first. Food? Anywhere? Seriously? No food? I need to cook this mutton. Oh my gosh. Okay, right, let's go to sleep. Oh no, monsters are nearby. Of course they are. I'm eating this as quick as I possibly can right now. There we go. Right, as long as we can just regain some health. It's officially daytime now, and the food's getting on okay. So, let's go back outside. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Okay, let's clear some of these zombies away from the home. Oops. Go! Oh! oh my gosh, I'm still getting hit by that trident. Where is this guy? What? There you are. Oh my gosh, look at these things. You're making a mess of my beautiful village. Oh my gosh, why is there so many of you? Oh no, I don't want to go on my crops. Run, 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 run. See, it's already looking cool already, you know? By the time it's all finished, it's going to look really nice. Right then, let's go back. Let's actually use the dock, what it's sort of used for. We're going to build a boat as well, you know, to put here, so we can go back and forth. Right, okay. We missed some walls here. Ah, did I miss any this side? No. Wait, what about over here? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Let me in! All right, nice. We'll work out how high we're going to bring them up, but we're just going to put them here for now, you know, just so they're sort of up. I was expecting a zombie to come and attack me there. Right, okay, so I think I'm going to bring this back maybe two more like this, so, you know, I've got enough room. So let me just come along with my oak logs, with my oak planks even. Right, nice. And now we're going to make some oak stairs and come all along here, okay? Well, maybe not all along there, actually. We're going to come to about... Okay, I think that's enough. What do you think? Okay, yeah, I think I'm going to, like, corner the stairs off to give them that look like that, you know? Okay, right, so that's pretty nice, isn't it? Now, for the entrance, let's see. 
So I'm going to go along like this. Make a solid wall going like that. Yeah, okay, I like that, I like that. And then, in the middle, I'm going to do like a big doorway so you, we can all get in. Let me get my mossy stone brick as well. Now, to give it that oldie sort of zombie look effect, I'm just going to sort of mix it in with a build. It looks really cool. So how does that look? Oh, no, drowned. Go away. Oh, my gosh, these tridents, bro. Hey, you're not the only one who can hit from long distances. Wait, where did you go? Not sure. Okay, right. How does that look? Uh, okay, it doesn't look too bad. We can always, you know, fix it as well. So we can put some more mossy cobblestone here. Now let's do the same the other side. Okay, so I'm going to just place them in. Yeah, so what I'm going to do is actually I'm going to place all of this normally down now. And then I can always, like, fix it and add the mossy cobblestone. So that's what I'm going to do. Okay, now we can drop down and then get on top of this little dock here. And now, oh, hang on, let's eat some cooked mutton because my hunger bars are not looking great. Okay, there we go. So, yeah, I'm going to add some maybe here, here, here. So, oh, wrong place. So, like, maybe there, 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 and there. And I'm going to add one up there too. Oh, my gosh, my placement is terrible. Okay, right, that's pretty cool, right? I like that. We need some spruce wood. I'm going to do some, like, spruce trap doors and normal doors. It's going to look really cool. Then we've got a whole entrance here so no zombies can literally get in. We're going to do these little corner things on each side. We're sort of following the whole idea of all of that over there, making it into our own. Maybe we've got to do this. And we can always insert the mossy cobblestone later, can't we? Right, nice. I'm probably going to bring it up around about this height. Let me jump down here. So I'm going to come to about there with the wall. Okay, I'm going to take some full damage. Ooh. So this is going to be the wall. So let's see how that looks. Yeah. Okay, I like it. It looks pretty cool. So let's continue that. Okay, I will show you guys the current progress and what I've been working on. So as you can see, the front wall's up and the side wall's up. And also all the piers are done. And I'll quickly show you around while I can. Let me just hop on this lily pad and jump up here. Right, so as you can see, let's start from the front. Right, it isn't done yet, obviously, but just... This is the progress so far. So you walk up the dock. You've got the little front wall here. This is all going to be trap doors and normal doors. So you walk through this part and then you're inside, right? So inside, I'm thinking of putting a little hut over there with some chests inside. Maybe put a little wheat farm, carrot farm and, you know, get all that good stuff going on. But right, let's walk around the sides and sort of show you how you enter. So you go through this little gap here. It's got a little lantern here for some lighting, some windows inserted in the front. And then you climb up the ladder like so. And then when you reach the top, like that you know you can sort of come down here any zombies intruding you know you can shoot them down here anyone trying to enter you know all that good stuff i think it's really nice i like it it's a cool touch i've done this every single side so you know you get the idea i haven't really got to show you guys but let me just jump back down and yeah pretty much i did that on all corners so it looks really nice really castle like and in these little things here i'm going to insert some more mossy cobblestone to give that sort of contrast so let's do that right now but my pickaxe actually broke so let me go and craft another iron pickaxe and we can start you know inserting these mossy cobblestone blocks let me just go back to the og chest um, it wouldn't hurt to steal some of these decoration blocks either. You know, these like bushes with the flowers inside of them. We can do that as well. But let's just go back in here. Did we leave anything in the furnace? Oh, 12 pieces of cooked mutton. I will take that. You know what with the diamonds we got? I'm actually going to craft myself a diamond one. Why not? Okay, there we go. So our first diamond pickaxe. Nice. Let me eat this cooked mutton real quick. Oh my gosh, I'm so hungry out here. Right, but now we can actually mine some blocks. Let's go back to the castle and insert some of these mossy cobblestone blocks. Doesn't it just look great? I really like it. I think it looks so nice, especially when it's all done and detailed. It's going to look super, super cool. So let's just mine some random blocks and then, you know, we can get placing them like this. Yeah, that will do. Let's place some of these now. Come along like this. What does that look like? Yeah, we're going to add some fine detail. I'm going to add some on the back as well. But don't worry, I'm going to go back down to the mine and grab some more mossy cobblestone if we ever run out. Oh my gosh, look at this tremendous rain. So horrible. Okay, let me try and place that there. We can always add more, bear in mind. So it doesn't matter too much. Okay, that's fine over there. Let's add some up here. So one, two, three, eight... So, right, let's use up all of these. It's also thunder as well. We can always add more, okay? At least the actual foundation is all up, right? Now, what I'm thinking... Oh, my gosh! The accuracy on this guy. Ooh! Get out of here. Got some more intruders. Little baby zombie there. I see you. 
Oh my. Let me take this shotgun. Oh gosh. Let me reload. Oh no. You look human. <laughs> I thought you was like an NPC for a second there, buddy. Ouch. These tridents. Oh no. Oh my gosh. Hurry, hurry. There we go. I hate it when I get that like little side effect. It's really annoying. Right, let me eat some of this cooked mutton before I get attacked. Oh, we have another little... Oh no! Let's try and focus on the build. It's so hard to build in an apocalypse, honestly. But... We, uh, we did most of it, to be fair. Oh, oh my gosh, this guy got a fishing rod. What the? Is he trying to reel me in or something? Oh, no. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Okay, right. I need to run, 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 run. Oh, no, I'm running out of basic bullets. I'll have to use my shells for now. Oh, look at my wheat and carrots, though. Oh, yes. Okay, that's really nice. Look at these zombies. They're so fast in the waters. Come on, hurry, hurry. There we go. Oh, yummy XP. Get out of town. A little bit of parkour here. Oh, <laughs> I just fell straight into the water. Oh my gosh. Right, up here and then... Yeah, I'm really running out of basic bullets. I've only got 49 left. Oh no. I want to collect the XP, but it's too risky. Okay, now I want to close this off. And then, you know, I'm, I'm completely safe then. So I feel like we should do that. Okay, I need to smelt some more cobblestone, turn them into stone, and then put them in the stone cutter and then get more stone bricks. So that's what I'm going to do, I think. Oh my gosh, these zombies, bro. Oh, wait, did he drop a backpack? Wait a minute. Oh my gosh, yeah, a backpack. Let's go. Oh my, wait, what? Look at this inside the backpack. Enchanted golden moss clump. What the? Emeralds, golden nuggets, diamonds. What is going on? Okay, I'm going to take that. Thanks, zombie. Well, that was very unexpected. Very kind of that zombie. <laughs> I'm going to put this here. Well, that was very strange. You know what? I'm going to put all my valuables in here so I know exactly where they are. That goes for my iron too. Golden apples as well. Anything else want to go in there? Wow, look at that. Jukebox. What the? It has its own jukebox on it? Okay, I'm going to pause that. That's actually so funny though. What I wanted to do was I wanted to steal these banners over here for my castle. You see these ones like here? Look. I'm going to steal these. There we go. Oh, ah, look, baby zombie. What the? Why did that just get eliminated? There we go. Okay. Oh my gosh, you are fast. Okay, come on. I want this. Now I have both. Let me quickly head back. Oh, these zombies. I'm going to place a lantern here. Why not? I might have to steal some chains as well to put my lanterns on. Oh no. Okay, right. So, by the way, new style. Okay. Okay, hopefully the zombies can't get up here. One there and one there. Right, how does that look? Does that look cool? Yeah, I'll take it. It looks cool. So, right. We open the door. We go in here. And then it locks itself. Okay, so we haven't got to keep turning around. Now we have all the doors up. We're protected. We're actually protected now. So we haven't got to worry about anyone interrupting. But I'm going to make a little hut. It's going to come out to about here. Okay, maybe like this big. And then I'm just going to literally put like a crafting table in here. They're going to make like a bunch of chests. There we go. Right, so four chests. I'm going to put one there, one there, like that. Okay, I'm going to bring this out by one and then get rid of this part. The wooden axe is so slow. Then what if I put like some scaffolding there for like bedside tables and then maybe, you know, a crafting table in each corner. Actually, you know what? I could put two little chests here. Right, like that. Let's go and collect some more wood, though, because that is what we need. Okay, here we go. There we go. Look, I think it looks really cool. I'm happy with it. Okay, so we'll grab some more wood. We'll grab some of that. We'll just grab a bunch of different things. Go back on the lily pad, because that is our only way up here. But the zombies don't know that, so don't tell them. I'm going to light this up a little bit as well, you know. Get some lighting around here, like that. Zombie, what are you doing trying to get up here? The main thing is the foundation's up, right? We got all that rolling. Okay, so back at the original chest, there is an enchantment table, and I'd like to place that down. So let me go back and get that real quick. Ah, yes, a chain. I'm going to take this, if you don't mind. Any more of these chains lying about? I'm going to lend some of these torches, okay? You know, totally return them after when I'm done. Where is all the villagers, though? They must have got all infected. Are they still around here? Gotta be careful in case any zombies are actually around here. What do you think of my bedroom? <laughs> you know, it's got some trap doors up here for some shutters. Um, you know, it's not the best, but hey, it's just a place to sleep, right? You know, it's nice and cozy. Just, it's only to stay extra safe, you know? We might have some plants and stuff later for decoration, but... And also fill the gaps in with glass. This is a defensive base. You know, we can't be doing anything too pretty around here. It's an apocalypse. So yeah, I think this looks fine. Little build here. Um, any zombie... Oh, we have... Oh my... Wait, no, it's a mutant zombie! Oh my gosh. Well, that's interesting. 
<laughs> now we have our own castle to be worrying about. But right, hang on a minute. I need to start. I need to keep making this thing. So right, let me let me see here. So I got to do the same sort of thing here. All right. So what we got to do is got to put two ladders here, like so. We got to come along like this. I can hear that mutant zombie out there. He doesn't sound too happy. I can't lie. Got to make some gaps like this. Okay, there we go. And then all we got to do is make a little floor here. I think that, that was our problem. Look, we come too far up, I think. Yeah, this is it, right? Okay, and let's just uh, keep repeating this till we're done. <gasps> what was that? What was that? Oh, was it the mutant zombie getting angry again? This mutant zombie, man. All right, cool. Now let's do this for this side. Oh, what? Wait, why is there a zombie? Oh my gosh, I didn't put any torches down, did I? Oh, wait, how? What? Wait, how are you guys getting in? There's no... Oh no, what is that? Hunger 2? Oh my gosh, it's the mutant zombie. How did they get in? Well, let me just place some of these around then, I guess. Surely that isn't what's making them spawn, is it? Wait. Oh my, I gotta eat something. Okay, how is this mutant zombie getting me? Makes no sense. Oh my gosh, wait, they're all stuck down there. Oh, wait, where are they? Oh. <gasps> There they are. Oh, actually, this can be like a little XP farm here. Haha. -ha. Oops. Oh, I do not want to accidentally fall down there. That's for sure. Wait, what? How is there zombies still spawning in here? It makes literal no sense. Be gone, zombies. Get off my lawn. Good riddance. Oh my gosh, look at that XP. But these guys can get in. That is the only thing. Okay, you know what? Maybe I should just put that there. Okay, so now the baby zombies can't enter. They probably still can. But, oh well. Hey, but you know what? We've done a lot of exploring, right? But hear me out. So as you all know... Oh, hang on. I hear zombies. Wait, are they underneath? Oh, yep. They're underneath. Okay, well, I'm going to try and avoid them for now. But, like I was saying, we've done a lot of exploring, right? But we've only explored this sort of part of the map. But we haven't yet to go and see what's around this side. So, what do you say? I say we go and see what's around this side. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no, 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 no. Get away. Well, actually, you know what? Let's craft some bullets first before we leave. And apparently some food, because we have none, as usual. Oh, that zombie came out of nowhere. Right, come on, let's quickly go back. Oh, there we go. Some copper ingots and gunpowder. And let's make some basic bullets. Okay, so we're going to take... Three stacks of that, and then let's make some shells. So we need gold nuggets for that one, so let's take out the other chest. And then let's go to shells, and then assemble a few of those as well. Okay, right, so we have three, well, two stacks of shells and 19, and then we have three basic shells. So we're pretty good on ammo right now, we just need food. I've got to hope this mutton cooks. Actually, there was some stuff in the other chest. I'm just going to cook these last few pieces of this mutton, and then I'm going to cook some raw beef, and then we'll head over in that direction. What do you guys think's lurking over there? Let me know down in the comments below. I'm very curious, though. I'm not sure what's going to be over there. There could be, you know, some other survivors. You, we don't know these things yet. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I'll help you out there, buddy. Oh, no, I missed. Right, come on. Boom. Right, just these last few pieces of raw beef, and then we'll be heading on a mission. Come on, smelt. There we go. Right, okay, so we have enough food to keep us going. Let's go and head over in that direction. Let's go. I'm actually really excited. I don't know why, but I'm really excited. I'm, I'm really thinking that we're going to see something over here that we haven't seen before. Let's just hope it's something cool. Oh my gosh, look how weird this looks when I'm swimming with a gun in my hands. That is so funny. Okay, so it's over here. And I need some air. Oh, yes. Lovely little refreshing dip. Right. Oh, what are these? What is that? A rock? A shell? Oh, a seashell. Okay, I got it. Well, I'm going to put it back because I don't really need it. I'm going to mine my way up here because I'm very impatient. And we've made it. So, this one's very tropical. Look at this place. Look at the seagulls. They're all happy. This is like a happy place. I feel like I'm on a deserted, apocalyptic island of some sort. Oh, look at this. Hang on a moment. What's this down here? Well, this is scary. Oh, it's like an abandoned railway track. Any chests or anything? No? Okay, well, I'm going to leave this for now because I don't fancy getting in any sort of action yet. I want to just do some exploring, you know? It's quite scary and dark and gloomy down there, so I'm going to try and avoid that. But let's enter some of these buildings then. You know, they may hold some valuable loot. Oh, is that a, is that a surgeon? Oh my gosh, it's a doctor. No! The doctor got infected, so who's going to save us now? Oh my gosh. Okay, I saw a chest. 
How do I get to that chest? Got to be careful. Got to be careful. Any mobs? Okay, none. All right, come on. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Nothing. Oh, okay, never mind. Oh, wait, there's a chest here. Come on, please be something. One piece of bread, some string, a saddle. No, I mean, more gunpowder. I could do it. I'll, I'll take this rope, actually. Okay, but nothing else going on. Only a piece of bread. I mean, I can eat it. So, okay, let's see what else is going on over here. Show yourself, zombies. Oh, no. Spawners. I see spawners. I'm going to take these out so no one can spawn. You can't sneak attack me now, zombies. Okay, another brewing stand. Another chest, come on. Okay, redstone dust, some bones. Yeah, nothing else really happening over there. They're not the best chests, but better than nothing, hey? I can't be too ungrateful. Oh, what's on this level? Anything? No. Okay, what's in here? Please be any chests. Ah, uh, just a crafting table. Okay, right, let's get moving. There's obviously nothing here. Let's go to the roof. Here we go. Right, now we can sort of shortcut our way into other buildings. Oh, I hear some angry zombies. Oh my gosh, they're there. That really scared me. Okay. Let's speed run these. Oh, no. Okay, there's no chests in here. Well, that's a shame, isn't it? We might find something interesting. You never know. I'm going to hold my shotgun out for protection. Oh, lots of spawners. That's got to go. Oh, and I see a chest around there. Come on, please be something good. Just some more books. Okay, you know what? We take it. We'll take the paper as well. You know what? Why not? It looks like it's that time to start eating again. We are getting very hungry out here. Oh, I see a chest. Okay, nothing else in there. It's so horrible. Why put a chest in front of my face and then literally give me nothing good? You know, it's so horrible. Come on, please be something good. No, nothing again, just seeds. Seeds, 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 that's all it is. Well, oh no, some zombies have escaped. Bad zombie. It's so beautiful around here though. Oh, what are these guys doing? Hello, crabs. Ow! Don't attack me. Oh, coconut slices. I'm pretty sure I can eat these. Okay, I can actually eat these. Give me your coconut slice, crab. Thank you. Ha, ah, where are you going now, buddy? Wait, no! Seagull! The seagull's got a coconut slice. No, bad seagull. Oh, I see a horsey up there. Have I got a saddle? No, I think I left the saddle. It's fine. We don't need the horsey. Deep down, I'm crying inside. I really want that horsey. Let's keep heading in this direction. Whoa, look at this place. Oh, a little cave down there. Okay, I see some cows, which is very interesting. Come here, cows. Oh. There we go. I need these. Get away, crab claw. I don't need that. I got a shell with your name written all over it. And you. Oh, wait. What's that over there? <gasps> what's that over there? Oh, my. Wait, what is that? What is this? Whoa. It's a broken nether portal. Oh, I see a chest. Come on, please be something cool in this chest. What? Oh, my gosh. A golden knife? Iron nuggets, yes. Come to me. Oh, my gosh. Wait, what is, what is this? A golden knife? Okay, I gotta try this. Whoa, look at this thing. Look at it, it's so tiny. Okay, right, let's try this. Come here, cow. Oh, oh, okay. Wait, let's try it down here. Oh, okay, no, this thing isn't good. What is that? What is that? Oh, it's a little raccoon. Come on, I'm gonna use this knife on you. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh no, we've got to clear these zombies before we explore that. Look at that place. What is it? Are those CCTV cameras? Oh my gosh. Oh no. Why is there so many zombies? Oh my gosh. As soon as I need to explore something, they all come after me. Oh my gosh. I've got to get rid of all of these. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's why you don't mess with me. Mr. Scoops. Oh, loads of XP. Oh my gosh. Why is there so many of you? Whoa, what is this? Look at this big cave. Oh my gosh. Okay, right. All right, we're going to sort ourselves out a second here. Ah, oh, I hear a baby zombie. Get away. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, go, 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 go. Oh. Get the XP, get the XP. I need to eat some of these coconut slices. Wow, there's so many of you guys. You didn't come here to play around, did you, zombies? Oh, no, I'm looking short on bullets. I'm going to start using these shotgun shells. Oh, no! Oh! Oh, no, 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 no. Run! Oh, my gosh. I've never seen so many zombies. Oh my. Now, the only thing I can really do is just keep trying to pick them off because I don't want to get myself too involved there because there looks like there's absolutely hundreds of zombies. 
Yes, I said it. Hundreds. Come on, look at that. There's going to be at least a few, you know. I'm going to light this place up though. Oh, baby zombie. They're so fast. Ah. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. Good news, I'm level 45. So, you know, that's always good to know, right? Oh, no, I hate being hit with this. Ah! Run, run, run! I was so lucky to make it out alive there. Oh, no, I have no more basic bullets. You know what? I'm going to have to get rid of you last, guys, and then head in that little bunker thing there. Looks like the bunker I started in. Okay, well, it looks pretty clear now, so I think the best thing to do right now is head inside of here. Okay, let's go. Oh, wait, hang on a moment. These are roamers, aren't they? What are they doing in here? There's a chest near, some barrels. They've got the whole setup going on in here. Uh, are you guys awake? Should I go to sleep with them, do you think? Oh my gosh, look at this place. Oh, okay, you guys are awake now? What the? Oh no, wait, this is burning. <laughs> Your ceiling's on fire, guys. What are you guys doing? You out here trying to survive? All right, let's check what's in this chest. What have they given us? Oh my gosh, look at this stuff. <gasps> a heavy assault helmet. Operator chest rig? Like, what is that? A stack of bread? A camera monitor? Oh my gosh, an over-under shotgun? Some shells, basic bullets? Whoa! Okay, right, I have to deposit some stuff. Is there anything in these barrels? Okay, nothing in the barrels, but what? That's crazy! Okay, I can't wait to put this stuff on. Right, let me empty some of this. I don't need... Okay, I don't need that. I don't need that. Oh my gosh, give me this stuff. No way. Look at this shotgun. This is better than my other shotgun, isn't it? This one's 16 damage. This is 56 damage! <gasps> oh my gosh. Look at this thing. That is awesome. Look at this. It's so tiny in my hands, but I promise you, it does a lot of damage. Oh yeah. Should we try it? What? No way. This thing is insane. This thing is like one shot, one kill. Look at this thing. <laughs> oh, yeah, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go back inside of here right now. Oh, my gosh. Okay, right. Let's check this stuff out. So, I have a heavy assault helmet. So, let me take this dusty iron helmet off and let me put this on. Whoa, look at that. Look at this. Oh, my gosh. Look at me. No way. I've got like a little flashlight on the side of my head. Oh, yes. Okay, right. What is this? An operated chess rig? No way. This is the coolest thing I've ever seen. Look at this stuff. Oh my gosh. Okay, right. What else have we got here? We got a camera monitor. Wait, is this something to do with the, the cameras or... Okay, right click a security camera to view it. Wait, no way. Bound camera. Okay, wait. Hold up a moment. So I can check on the camera. Whoa! What? That is so cool. I can zoom in, zoom out. No way. That is awesome. This is unbelievable so i can literally zoom up on stuff and zoom out and just be really nosy no way that is the coolest thing ever night vision it even has night vision well that is cool what about this one wait can i hook them both up oh, so i right click that one and then i can right click that one wait hold on a minute and then if i head back in here right no way this is cool this is cool. And then look, I can go to the second one, have a look at this one as well. Look at that. That is so cool though. Oh my gosh. I'm definitely taking these cameras home with me. That's for sure. But look at this over under shotgun. This thing deals so much damage. That is awesome. Right, I'm going to take these cameras then if I can. Okay, there we go. So that's one camera. Let me get the other. Where did it go? There it is. Right, okay. So we have two security cameras now. We have the camera monitor. And then we have our new shotgun, some new gear. This is what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. Okay, right. Let's head back. Let's definitely head back now. I'm so pleased I come and explore this part. Oh, my gosh. I can't get over how much, like, damage this shotgun deals. It's crazy. One shot, one... Right, look at this poor little cow. Boom! Boom! <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> I'm having so much fun. This is absolutely insane. Oh, is that another cow? Hello, cow. Goodbye, cow. I also got some more basic bullets for my assault rifle as well, which is really nice. Whoa, look at this up here. What is that? I cannot get over this shotgun, man. That is so cool. Okay, back to the home I return. I've made it back to the castle, and I am excited to set my cameras up. Let me just get outside the front, and then what we can do is we can set these bad boys up. Right, so I'm thinking, where should I set these cameras up? I just think one on the left side, one on the right side, right? Let's do it. Let's do it. Right, let's enter. Let's go up the pillar thing here all the way up like so. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it right there. Okay, then I'm going to go this side. And then, bro, this is the coolest thing ever. Okay, right then, put one there. So now if I jump down in the water... 
I literally have two cameras checking the area at all times. Look, so one up there and then one over there as well. Oh my gosh. Okay, right. Oh, I forgot I had to hook the camera monitor up to them, have I? Yeah, okay, right. So let me get rid of these two and then I've got to hook them up like this. So I've got to go back up to the cameras and I've got to right click the camera with the monitor and then it will automatically pick up. So let me quickly go here. Right click on that one. So that's number one, okay? And then let's go to this side. And then let's right click on this camera. And then that's number two. So camera number one's over there. And camera number two is over here. Right, that's so nice. So now we can finally check the area and see if it's safe to leave or not. Look at this. So number one, you know, we can also zoom out here. Zoom in on any suspicious activity. You know, I can even check out on the city how it's doing. Well, this zooms in so far. Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, that is cool. Okay, right, so that's number one, and then number two is this side. Nice. Whoa, look at this. I can even zoom in in the windows. That is crazy. And it even has night vision. I can't wait to test out the night vision as well. That's going to be awesome. Okay, right, well, we have the two cameras set up now, so... Let's keep that in our little hotbar here. So we have a new shotgun, new monitor, new cameras, and new gear. We're upgrading, guys. We are upgrading. I think the amount of progress we've made from day one is absolutely crazy. Okay, and while the sun is rising, I think this would be a pretty good time to go and make a little farm inside. Oh, let me just head back inside and show you. So, what I'm thinking is, I'm going to put a little wheat and carrot farm here. Therefore, I haven't got to keep going out, you know, being unprotected, you know, being attacked by those zombies. So, I'm going to make a little farm here. Here and see how it goes but I hear zombies outside so let me head up the tower real quick and I should be surprised by some zombies anywhere no actually there is no zombies well that's a major shock these drowns absolute mad guys another thing that I'm going to do that I didn't mention is actually get my workbench and put it in the castle I don't know why I haven't done that yet but that's what I'm going to go and do right now so let me do some parkour on the lily pads oh as you can tell I'm quite terrible at parkour huh, huh, there we go Okay, so let's run over to the original house and then what we'll do is we'll grab our workbench and head back over to the castle, get it placed in there and crack on with a farm. So here it is. Just remembered I need to drop some things as well. What's in the backpack? Oh, okay. Let me put some of this in the backpack. Just things I don't really need on me. Okay, right. There we go. So let's take the workbench like that and the backpack can stay there for now that can be a little ornament okay i'll leave this here for you guys but let's see so we take this water bucket let's check anything else that we're missing oh 17 pieces of iron yep we will definitely be taking that some bones for bone meal and okay right looks good to me so let's head back I'm very surprised i haven't seen any zombies trying to make some suspicious moves on me yet i'm not complaining let it stay this way right so where shall i place this workbench i might actually put it in my little bedroom what do you think? I might do that. So, where is the workbench? Here it is. So, let me grab the workbench in my hotbar. And, uh, actually, you know what? I might just put it, like, there. Yeah, okay, I like that. So, I'm going to leave the workbench here for now. But, I also want to go and craft... Oh, my gosh, that bazooka would be insane, by the way. I think we should craft this... Where is it at? Okay, hear me out. Come on. Tell me I haven't got to craft this. I'm definitely crafting this. So after we do all of this as well, I'm definitely crafting this minigun. It's only 38 pieces. I have 17, so it doesn't take that much to actually get there. But what I'm going to do is, where I'm going to put my farm, I'm going to dig down and see if there is actually any water below. Okay, right. Th so there's no water below. So that means I'm going to have to go back and forth to get some water. But that's fine. That's no problem for me. I also need to craft myself a little hoe. So where is a crafting table? In here. Um, oh, I have no wood. Seriously? Where are those hay bales as well? Because there's some things I want to do for this build. Where are... Okay, I only have one piece of wood. You've got to be kidding me. Well, looks like we're going to have to go and collect some wood while we're at it. But that's fine. We love a mission, right, guys? We love a mission, don't we? So, let's head out here. And let's head over this side. Where are trees? Are there any trees around me that aren't, like, 100 miles away? Let me just quickly check. I definitely have some wood left over in the other chest, haven't I? But, oh well. I haven't even got an axe on me. Oh no, this might be a bad idea. I see some trees. All I need is to take you. Okay, and then I'm going to craft these into... Oh, where are they? There they are. So, into planks, then straight into sticks. There we go. Right, that'll do the trick for now. But let's head back to the castle, and then let's craft ourselves a wooden hoe. Or a stone one. I'm not bothered. They all do the same job, right? Ooh! Oh my gosh. I need to just touch the fire. Okay, you know what? Actually, easy access a minute. Hear me out. Easy access. 
Okay, there we go. Right, so we made it back in here. Let's quickly jump through the window and craft ourselves. Oh, hang on a minute. It might actually have to be a wooden one. Oh, that's an axe. There we go. Okay, wooden hoe. That'll do the trick. Now, all I have to do is place some water approximately here. Okay, and then I'm going to hoe all this down around here. Sorry, Torch. I'm going to have to remove you real quick. Okay, so I'm going to make a little farm. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, so plant that back. And then I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to come out to about here, I think hold all this down and then what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to go back and actually collect some more wood and I just realized my hoe broke but it's fine because I got another one okay I need to go and grab another bucket of water which I will proceed to go and do which I haven't got far to go so <laughs> pretty helpful okay I'm just gonna put one like there there we go and like so right there we go now that's gonna do its thing I'm gonna let nature take its course right there actually you know what? I might as well just extend one more you know why not right now we have our own personal little farm inside, so we're all safe. And look, it's perfect. The sun is just pitching on it, which is absolutely perfect. Okay, wheat seeds are going to go this side. So let me plant three of my wheat seeds I already have there. I'm going to have to go back to my other farm this side. Oh, actually, that reminds me. Okay, right, so let's go back to the original farm over here. By the way, how is the sugar cane getting on? I forgot I even planted that. Where is the... Did I get rid of the sugar cane? Oh, okay, no, it's, it's over there. Okay, well, I'll keep track of that in just a second, but let me go over to the original farm over here, and then I'm gonna take all of the crops and put them inside the castle. Oh, no, there's a zombie. Oh, no! He's playing some songs. Oh, my gosh. Okay, where did he go? I can't seem to find him. Oh! How did you get in there? Oh, my gosh! I, I didn't even realise this was below me. Look at this thing. Hold up a second. What is this? Oh my gosh. How have I not seen this before? Oh dear. Look how huge this is under here. Okay, I'm going. Oh my gosh. I don't know how I haven't noticed that before. Right, but it's getting dark, which is bad. We're going to make some sacrifice. Okay, let's take these carrots and all this other stuff. Okay, there we go. And then let's take all of these wheat seeds. Okay, there we go. It's finally all done. Oh, I see a zombie. No problem, though. No problemo. Right, nice. So we have a stack of wheat seeds, which is really nice. Is that all we need for a moment? I think it is, right? Oh, we need to actually eat. Let's have some bread. Since when did I have a stack of bread? Huh. Well, anyways, let's proceed to go back to the castle. And then what we can do is we can get our farm in the process. So let me avoid the zombie. Yeah, that's right. I'm going to avoid. Actually, you know what? Just because you was uh, being cheeky. Now, oh, actually, do you know what? I'm going to do this in the daytime. It's too dark. Okay, that's much better. So, let's get placing these here. Oh, my bad. Let me... Oh, my gosh, what? Wait, how are you guys still spawning in here? Imagine if, like, one day I'm just, you know, sat here minding my own business, farming my crops. I turn around and there's a big mutant zombie behind me. You know, this is, this is some scary stuff. I can hear lots of zombies outside. Let me check the cameras. Okay, no, they're just, they're all underneath. It's fine. They're underneath me. So, let me plant all these wheat seeds down. I'm gonna go, how long is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So, one, two, three, four, five. So, this side's going to be carrots, and then this side is going to be wheat. So, it's all nice and even, you know? And then we're going to get placing these carrots, just like so... Lovely, lovely stuff. Oh, and we've ran out. So what we're going to do is we're going to turn some of these bones into bone meal. And we're actually just going to speed up the process a little bit so we have enough carrots to finish the farm. Have I got enough? No. Nope. So you know what that means? So now we're all done. And I may as well just use up some of this, you know. Why not? I just realized though, I maybe have to do another water bucket. So that's what I'm going to go and do. Ah, that was silly of me. Okay, there we go. Okay, now it's all going to grow. Right, surely. Okay, nice. Right, well, let's craft some more sort of bone meal. You know, just start growing this stuff. There we go. Speed up the process a little bit here. Oh, more bone meal. Oh, no, that's a phantom membrane. Never mind. Why is there so many zombies outside? Yeah, but then when I go on the cameras, there's nothing there. They're all underneath me, aren't they? Yeah, I knew you guys were under here. Oh, my gosh. Why is there so many of you? I need to come up here for some breath. There's too many of you guys. You're taking my breath away. And no, I'm not flirting with you. This zombie's stuck over here. Oh my, come on now. But our farm's starting to look really nice. So, yeah, that's pretty much it for the farm. Oh, actually, that reminds me. Where are those hay bales? I'm going to decorate my farm a little bit here. Nothing in these chests. Okay, no. What I'm going to do is I'm going to make these little um, little farm chests. So I'm going to put all my seeds and carrots and stuff in here. Piece of dirt, why not? Okay, and then let me go and get my hay bales real quick. Because I'm pretty sure they're in the other building, if I'm not mistaken. I'm about to go and find out. But, oh my gosh, these zombies. 
There's so many down here. They're mostly underwater than actually overground. So strange. I'm gonna take some of these as well. Some glow berries. Why not? Where are those hay bales? Where are they? They gotta be in here, right? Surely. No, I took all of them. I knew it. But where are they? Well, I've got a carved pumpkin. Okay, I'll uh, I'll try my best here. Right, let's return back to my home. Actually, is there anything? Nice in here. Yeah, I like the lilac. A little bit of parkour. Maybe I should build a little bridge here as well while I can be bothered. Okay, let's go back to our beautiful castle. Okay, our manor house. And then what we're going to do is I'm going to place this right here. We're going to get some stone walls and some torches. Did I have any lanterns left over? I have. All right, let me take all of these up. Okay, because what I'm going to do is I'm going to, instead of those lanterns, I'm going to place these torches, okay? Because what is, it's not necessary to have these lanterns placed around, is it? Even though these torches are placed, it's still so dark down here. It's crazy. Okay, right. What I'm going to do is I'm going to place that on top of there. Then I'm going to do the same thing this side. Okay, so let me actually take this pumpkin up. I don't know what to I don't know where to place it now actually. I'm going to I'm going to place it there. <laughs> you know what? Why not? No, actually no, it looks terrible there, doesn't it? I need another one. That's what I need. Let me go and get another one. So to craft some barbed wire, we have to craft some nails and then from there, and then all we got to do is put the nails with the iron and then it gives us a barbed wire. So, we've got some iron here. Let's quickly make some nails and then make some barbed wire. So like that. Oh, okay. So it crafts two different things. What is this? An iron stick and some nails. So, we need to craft some nails. Okay. So let's take our nails and then it was like this with barbed wire all around it okay there we go so let's see what we can do here um let me check these nails out okay right so eight pieces of barbed wire ah ah it's really effective to stop these zombies from hold up a moment let me just let me quickly place this backpack so now i've got some barbed wire what i'm going to do to stop these zombies from coming up here do you know what? i'm gonna put it about oh my gosh oh I'm going to put the barbed wire here so there's no entrance. So the zombies cannot come up from there now. And then maybe some barbed wire. Where do zombies mostly come here? Ouch! You know, they like to come over here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to barbed wire all of this off. Like so. So that's all barbed wired off here. So now they can't even come close here. And then it's also barbed wired here as well if they want to try and swim up here. We're extra safe now. Okay, right. Let's test the barbed wire out on this zombie. So if this zombie comes towards me in my direction, this zombie's going to get caught in the barbed wire, right? Or maybe not. Okay, right. This is just a fluke. I promise. Right. Let's see what happens now. There we go. So the zombie gets caught in the barbed wire and it deals quite a bit of damage. Ow. There we go. So that'll stop them. So we've got some barbed wire in place now. This is looking very, very secure. I'm going to get these pieces of lilac as well, actually. And I'm going to put them... Hmm, where should I put them? There you go. I'm going to put it at my little farm here so it looks nice and pretty, right? What I'm going to do is I'm going to put these remaining wheat seeds in my farm chest. Also followed up with some more carrots. Nice. Okay, so I need to place some of these torches up in these corners as well, actually, to light them up a bit more. And do you know what? While we're at it as well, we're going to change this floor into all, like, cobblestone. We just need one more place, which is up there. Okay, there we go. Oh, and in these two corners up here course we can't forget that right and boom there we go so now it's all lit up oh my gosh did you see that lightning strike okay right let me check the cctv see what's sort of happening out here oh see look they're getting they're getting caught in the barbed wire them zombies are stuck in the barbed wire and obviously they're oh that actually eliminated the zombie okay, so it does work good to know good to know so let me eat some of this bread actually i'm getting really hungry nom 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 yeah so another project we're going to start doing is changing all this grass floor into cobblestone actually there's a quite a few stone bricks i could mix some cobblestone in with some stone bricks can't i yeah i could i could do that okay right well i'm gonna put some stuff in here that i don't really need for now you know such things as nails one iron ingot Actually, I could need that. Some raw beef and stuff. While I'm down in this mine, I need to get some coal as well. Because that's what I'm lacking majorly right now. But I think we should go down mining now. Let's go. Oh, I forgot there was barbed wire here for a second. That was close. And we made it back to the mine. So there's lots of coal I can see here and iron. So I don't mind if I do. It's a lot faster with this diamond pickaxe, that's for sure. We light this place up. I've got to be careful that centipede because that guy tends to spawn around here. Got to be very careful for that guy because he's not so friendly now, is he? Oh, okay. Where is that coal? There's coal here. Oh, I hear something. What was that? Oh, what is that? Is that like a mini centipede? Oh, get away. Oh. There's loads of these little guys roaming around. I think they're little cockroaches. Oh, it gives me the shivers. I hate things like this. Okay, let me go ahead and get some of this iron. There's lots of iron around here, isn't there? They sure do put a lot of iron in these mines. Some bones there. There's the little cockroach. There he is. 
Okay, I'll let you escape. I'll leave you be. Nice. I need to get some more coal, though. That's all I gotta do. Where is the coal? Uh, oh, there's some more coal here. So let me go and collect all of this good stuff. Also it gives us good XP as well, so... It's kind of a... kind of a W. And by the way, guys, if you are new around here... Please do subscribe, you know, it means a lot, and I'd really appreciate it as I am a new channel. Honestly, if you can find the kindness in your heart, just, you know, hit that subscribe button. Honestly, it goes a long way, so I appreciate every single one of you. I love you guys. There's more iron over this side. I'm gonna take this. Only three pieces, that's fine. Oh, there's another two over here. So that kind of makes up for it, right? Very surprised there's no zombies down here yet. I mean, I, I like, I'm not complaining, but kind of a shock. Not to see any zombies down here. There's lots of lapis as well. I'm going to collect some lapis only because I want to enchant. And I feel like I need lapis to obviously enchant, right? So, oh, I thought I could hear footsteps and it's a little cockroach. I think they're harmless anyways. They can't do much. Poor little guys. Oh my gosh, look at this down here. This cave really does go deep. Okay, what is down here? Oh my gosh, this is like a real cave. Yeah, I'm not getting stuck down here. I'm taking out my shotgun just in case. Gotta be careful, you know? We don't know what lies in these caves. There could be another creature down here that we are not aware of. You never know. We nearly have a stack of iron as well. There sure is lots of this iron though. That's great. Oh no. What is this? Is this just lava? Okay, yeah, I'm getting out of here. Oh no. I'm not risking my life for this. Do you know what's cool as well? I can actually check back on the cameras while I'm like down here. Like, look at this. I can still check how my castle's getting on. That is so cool. Okay, right. More lapis over here. So I'm going to go and take this good stuff up. Nice. Got to be careful for these zombies, though. I don't know where they're at. I think they're all sleeping right now or something, because where are they? Normally, they're all out here and stuff, but honestly, I can't seem to find any zombies. Hmm, that's very strange. There's something in this cave scaring them off, or am I missing something here? Oh, yeah, that scared me. I don't know why. There's some titanium there. I don't need that. I need iron. This is going to take forever to break, isn't it? Oh, I'm only going to click two pieces of this stuff. Okay, right, nice. We have 56 pieces of iron, which is way more than enough to... Oh, look at these guys. So that's way more enough to craft ourselves a minigun. Oh, I think I see more coal in this side of the cave. Oh, look at this part. I didn't see this. Oh, yeah. Hey, guys. Ah, yes. Beautiful, beautiful coal. Any more around here? Huh. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. No, no, no. That was a genuine reaction. Oh, my God. No, I need to take a minute. Headphone users, I am so sorry. Oh my gosh. That scared the living life out of me. Oh, that isn't even funny, guys. That isn't even funny. You guys got to drop a like for that, surely. I'm risking my life out here to record for you guys. Please do drop a like. Oh my gosh. There's so many down this side. Oh, no way. I actually, I can't get over that. How have I just been scared that bad? I thought the nether was bad enough, but no. This takes the cake. This definitely tops it. Oh my gosh. I need to sort myself out. You guys may think I'm overreacting, but trust me, that was a genuine reaction. Okay, anything else lurking in this cave that just wants to come and scare me? Or I want to go home. I want to go back to my castle. I think I've collected enough iron now anyways and coal, so I think I'm going to go back. Yeah. I'm not risking anything for this. I'm going back. I'm going to eat my bread and I want to go home and sleep. That's what I want to do. I want to go home and sleep. Oh, these guys are so, so, so sneaky. I'm going to retrace my steps here. Oh my gosh. I hate this place. Get me home. How do I go home? Am I going the right way? I have no clue. Okay, I think I am. Yeah. No, that's not even funny. That is not even funny, guys. Okay, there's a cockroach down here. Where did the cockroach go there? Ah, come here. There we go. Let's go back up to the castle. I'm sick of this down here. And we made it back all in one piece. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go and put this in a furnace, some coal and smelt some raw iron. Then we're going to make our way over to the workbench and craft ourselves a minigun. Oh my gosh, that zombie still scared me. I'm, I'm still scared. Like I'm actually still scared. <laughs> so we already have five iron ingots. So I'm going to put the rest of the iron in here. So we're going to let that do its thing. And let's check on the farm real quick. Nice. So we've got some wheat coming through. And because we have lots of bones, uh, I think we should turn some into some bone meal. I'm going to turn like 42 pieces. And then I'm just going to go through and speed up the process a little bit here. Like that. Okay, there we go. So, we're going to let that grow. Oh, we have some characters already grown. So, let's go and take some of this up and plant some back down. We've got to lose one to gain one, right? I've got more wheat. 
So I'm going to go and put it in a wheat chest, followed up by some wheat seeds and carrots. See, look, we're already stacking on this. I'm going to take some of this wheat, actually, and we're going to go back to the crafting table and make some bread, like so. Okay, I'm going to put some of that in there. I'm going to take half of this and put it in there like that, okay? So, you know, we've got some stuff stacking up in here now. Okay, I'm going to put some wheat there as well. Uh, put some reeds in here, some of this. That's right, that looks better, right? Just putting them lanterns like that. Okay, right. That looks way better. Let's check some activity outside. How's it going out here? Is it all okay? What is that? Okay, that's my other camera. Oh, there's another zombie up there, though. So we see another zombie. Any more zombies around here? Let's check. Oh, wait, there's lots of sugarcane over there. That's right, we need to work on the sugarcane farm, don't we? Because we placed the sugarcane before we even built all of this, but we didn't do anything with it. So I'm going to go around here real quick. All the sugarcane here. Yeah, see, I didn't even I didn't get any of this. I'm going to take some of this sand, actually. There we go. Place some of that there, there, and there. Okay, then we're going to extend our sugarcane farm, and we're going to have it running all along here. We're going to let that do its thing over there. Beautiful sunrise. Then I'm going to go back over here where I saw all this other sugar cane and then I'm going to take that and put it in my sugar cane farm, okay? Do some parkour on these lily pads like usual. Huh. Oh no, there's a drowned. I see a drowned. Where is the sugar cane? I smell it. Oh, it's over here. Oh, there's lots of sand over here as well that I can take. Right, let's take all of this sugar cane. Yep, that's right, all of it because I'm greedy, okay? Oh! Oh my gosh! What are these things? Oh no! What the... Oh my gosh! Why did they try to attack me like that? What is that? Fish bones, get out, get out of here! Oh! There's another one! Why so many? Is there any more? Okay, yeah. Oh my gosh, there's a zombie on one! What? No way! The zombie was riding it! Oh my gosh, look at that thing! Oh, 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 oh! No! I hate that thing! I hate that thing! Those are horrible things! I wanna get this XP though. Okay, I need to collect some of this sand though. Come on, zombies, you can go away. Just for two seconds, guys. Come on. Okay, I'm going to collect more like this. Ah! It's attacking me again. Get away. What is the deal with these fishes? Where do they even come from as well? And why am I only seeing them now? Horrible, horrible things. Ugh. Okay, I'm going back to my castle where I feel safe. Because I've had enough of this place. Right, let's go. Oh! 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 I forgot about the barbed wire. i got to stop doing that. Imagine doing that on only, like, two hearts. It'd be game over, right? Don't tell me there's any more of these bone fishes over here. I'm going to place some cobblestone down here so I can just come along like this with my sand. Come on now, zombies. Come on now. I can only go two more for now, but I can keep extending when I want, you know? There's a lot of these zombies now spawning. Come on, zombies. I'm going to go around this way, actually. I'm going to see what's around here. Oh, little shortcut. Get rid of this zombie. Okay, right. What? He came from the castle. Okay, go, 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 go. Huh. Okay, now we're safe. So now we've got the sugar cane in the works. We've got the farm going on here now. We've got this all decorated. Oh! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. No, this isn't funny. This isn't funny. I hear lots and lots of zombies. Oh yeah, wait, let's check on the iron actually. What? There's another one. Is that another zombie? Oh my gosh. How are you guys getting down here? I've got to cover that up, maybe. Right, let's check on the iron. Let's see. Oh, nice. 55 pieces. Oh, guys, you know what that means. You know what time it is. It's workbench time. I can't wait to craft this. I'm going to go over to the minigun. Oh, there it is. Are you ready? Boom. Look at it. Oh, my gosh. Look at this thing. That is so cool. No way. <gasps> what the... Oh, my gosh. This is the coolest thing... I have ever seen. I take back what I said about all these other guns. This right here takes the cake. Oh my gosh. Wait, what do I need? Basic bullets, right. Let me go and craft a bunch of basic bullets then. No way, this is so, so cool. Wait, I need some copper. Okay, I'm gonna go and get some copper. Okay, the iron's still cooking, which is good. Let's go and get some copper now. Wait, let me check if it's safe to go outside. Any zombie that's gonna surprise attack me? Oh, they're all in the barbed wire. That's dealing quite a lot of damage. So, yeah. I've got to be careful of these guys. They're all going to be out here waiting for me. There we go. That soon got rid of them. Ouch. Accidentally tapped that. Oh. Ow. No, I hate this guy. Look how fast he is in the water. It's unfair. Right, I'm going to go and collect some copper now. Because I need some basic bullets for this bad boy. Oh, nice. There's some copper around here. Is there more than one, though? So I've got four pieces there. I need some more. Hopefully there's some down here, right? Oh, some more iron. Oh, there we go. More copper here. That's what we need. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Okay, I think that's all we need for now, honestly. 
gonna get this iron as well in the meantime because why wouldn't I right oh and down here as well nice okay so oh what's down here is this the same cave I believe yeah okay this is all connected to the same cave oh lots of copper Oh, and iron. Iron and copper. Wow. Okay, now we have a stack of that. Let's collect some more iron here. you got to love a diamond pick, right? Cut through everything like butter. Okay, right now, let's go back up to the top. Being very careful here. Ah, what the? Why is that on fire? All right, that's why. <laughs> oh, no, there's zombies trying to attack us. Let's go back up to the top quick. Oh, that's right. I need to collect lots of cobblestone as well so I can do the floor. Let me get a load of this stuff. Ah. Can't be left alone. You can't do a simple task without being bothered by these rude zombies. No respect. Anyone would think it's a zombie apocalypse or something. Oh, wait, it is. All right, we nearly have a stack of this already, so we're going to get one more stack, then head back. Ow! That isn't nice. What the? Oh! Oh, no. i got to get this other stack fast. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no! Oh. So rude. Oh, 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 no, 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 oh, quick, quick, escape, oh my gosh, I almost just got trapped, go, 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 okay, there we go, let me eat some of this bread, wow, I nearly just got cornered, how am I still alive, I don't know, I don't know how I've came this far into this 100 days, Honestly, this has been the hardest 100 days by far. Okay, there we go. Officially, we have two stacks now, so we can start going back up. Uh-oh. These guys are angry. Oh, no. Oh, wait. It's the guy with the cool mustache from the start. Hey, buddy. Okay, right. We're nearly up now. Okay, we've made it. Where are we? Oh, we're behind the castle. Right, let's go. Boom. Out of my way, zombie. I've got some business to take care of. Oh, my gosh. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, right. Quickly, let's make a run for it. Let's climb up here. Go, 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 go. Hurry. Okay, there we go. Nice. Go, 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 go. Let's go around the side. Sugar cane. Hello. Please do grow for me. Ooh. Oh, no. There's barbed wire here. I can't go around that way, but I can go around this way. Okay, go. Okay, we made it back again. This is cool. Oh, that's good. So, now, all the iron's done. Let's smelt some of this raw copper, and then it's going to give us some copper ingots. Then, we're going to craft more bullets that's right we're crafting more bullets for the minigun oh yeah i hear lots of these zombies turning into the drowns the little noise when they pop in the water it's kind of sad to hear you know it's kind of sad to see i'm sure if we go on the monitor here we can take a look what they're up to is there any let's go on the other camera actually okay i don't oh wait yeah there's a zombie down there oh there's a couple yeah so they're all down here basically just turning all into drowns any more zombies around here anywhere is the area clear oh no, there's one of these guys again. See this guy here? These kind of guys here are the ones that play all the music. I really like the helmets. Really cool. Oh my gosh, that was really loud. What is that? Oh no, they got another doctor. Everyone is getting infected out here. How's the copper getting on though? Let's quickly hit the furnace. We've got 11 pieces. So that means we can officially craft some basic bullets now, All right? Okay, basic bullets. Let's assemble as many as we possibly can. I have some basic bullets now, which means I can reload my minigun. This takes so many bullets though. It's crazy. Let me grab more of that. So I can grab more basic bullets like that. Okay, right. Should I test this thing out? What do you think? I say we test this thing out. Let's go. I'm going to get loads of zombies in a row. I'm going to collect as many as I possibly can. And then I'm just going to literally... Oh my gosh, there's a mutant zombie as well. This is perfect. This is perfect. This is perfect. Okay, I'm going to get as many zombies as I possibly can. Like I said, and then it's go time. Look how many zombies there are. Oh my gosh. I cannot wait to use this thing. Look at the mutant zombie. Oh, look at them. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is going to be so fun. Okay. Mutant zombie, today is not your day. Okay, I'm going to keep collecting these zombies here. Right. I think we're ready. Oh, no. Here we go. I'm about to do it. We haven't got any torches, have we? No. Okay. The mutant zombie is extremely close. Right. Here we go. Are you ready? I'm going to get them all in a pile here. Okay. Right. I think we're ready now, guys. Are you ready? I'm ready. Right. Three, two, one. Fire! Oh, my gosh. Look at this thing. Oh, my gosh. This is a zombie horse on us as well. Get out of here. Get out of here, mutant zombie. Oh my gosh, I still gotta be careful. Oh my gosh, there's two mutant zombies! No! Run! Oh my gosh. Why is there so many zombies? Oh my gosh. This thing is insane though. Oh no, these mutant zombies are getting very angry out here. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's one mutant zombie down. 
Let's reload. Ah. Oh my gosh, this thing is insane. Oh no, another surgeon. It's another doctor. Oh, I think we should use this as well. Oh. Oh no, these mutant zombies are getting very angry. Oh no, I'm out of ammo already. <laughs> I knew that ammo in the minigun wasn't going to last so long. Oh. Oh no. Oh, is that one mutant zombie down? I think it is. Okay, alright, he's only down. Oh, but he's back up. Oh, and he's back down. This thing is actually OP though, this shotgun. Oh, run! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, wait. I think they're both eliminated now, the mutant zombies. It's just these guys left, right? Wait, what if I bring all of these zombies back to the barbed wire? What do you think? I'm going to try and see what happens when I do that. Go, let's go. Go, 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 go. Oh, oh no. I nearly fell in there. Go, 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 go. Do not fall in there. Oh, yeah. I'm going to stand on this lily pad and pick them off. Oh no, there's another guy with a trident, of course. Oh my gosh, look at this barbed wire though. Where is this guy? Oh, you're there. Get out of here. Oh, you guys are so weak now. Oh, thanks to my barbed wire. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is crazy. They're, they're all just jumping in the barbed wire right now. Well, it's a good job we have lots of shells, isn't it? Because that sure did just save us. Because of the minigun, we run out of the basic bullets, like, really fast. Oh, no. Oh, no. I've got to stop risking this too much. Oh, no. The lily pad broke. Oh, no. Little chicken, no. Oh, gosh. Go, 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 go. There's another baby chicken. Wait a second. I hear another one of those guys with the backpacks and the jukeboxes. Wait, let me check the monitor here. Yeah, I knew I could hear you. Let me go on this tower and snipe you. There we go. No more Mr. Nice Guy. Now there's no zombies bothering us and they're all cleared up. Now is the perfect opportunity to fill all this grass in for cobblestone and stone bricks. So, let's quickly craft ourselves some shovels so it's quicker to get rid of this dirt. Alright, so we've got two shovels now. We're going to start clearing out this side. So I'm going to quickly go around here and then make my way throughout the whole entire base. Oh my gosh! Hold up a second. There's drowns literally below me. Oh my gosh. I've got to be careful because I have no ammo whatsoever. Oh no. That's why they keep swimming underneath. It's because, look at this. There's a massive gap here and they can literally just smell me through the floorboards. I've got to fill this in real quick. Oh no. They're looking for me. No wonder. Look! <laughs> Not today, buddy. I'm going to do sections at a time, so cut a big square out like this. Oh! Kind of cool how it automatically becomes like a mossy block because of the dampness. That's actually really cool. So that is what we need. Okay, and then i got 38 more to go. Okay, then I'm going to do this area here. Just come along nicely. There we go. Little misplaced there, but that's not a problem for us. Oh no, I haven't even got a sword or anything to get rid of these guys. Okay, last finishing touch then. And I think the floor is now successfully all made out of... Oh my gosh, wait, why is that open? It's now all made out of cobblestone. Nice. And then what I'm going to do is, on the inside of these right here, I'm going to make them into stone bricks, because I think it looks better. Now it looks way better, right? Okay, let's go and do that over here. Oh, I forgot about the bedroom floor as well. I won't forget about that, don't worry. Place the lantern back. And carry on with the floor. It seems to be very heavy rain and thunder out there as well. It's all I can hear. It's terrible weather. It's a perfect weather for an apocalypse, that's for sure. These are made out of wood. Hmm. Uh, I might leave that hit there like that then, I think. Yeah. Alright, well, that looks nice. 
I've got some more torches here that I need to place as well. Otherwise, I'm going to get zombie spawn all over here. And I need food. Bad. That's one thing I do need. Okay. That's much better, right? It's a bit dark up there, so I'll have to put a torch up there or something. There we go, that's much better. Oh my gosh, I'm so slow without food. Have I got any food? Oh, I have a one piece of cooked steak and some bread, so that should do the trick. And I also forgot to click my 50 copper ingots. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make, or oh, I'm going to get some gunpowder and then make myself some more bullets. There we go, right, I'll grab a stack right there, and then let's go over to the bullets. Oh, we need gold nuggets for the shells, I forgot about that, but we can craft a bunch of basic bullets and then where is the golden nuggets we got a golden nuggets so we can go over to here and craft a bunch of shells like so now we can reload our guns reload my assault rifle and also reload the bad boy minigun which takes quite a while to reload we can go and test this out even more hopefully there's some zombies out the front waiting for us is there? Yep. Hello, buddy. Oh my gosh, wait, why is there fire over there? Is that from the lightning strike? Oh no. Oh. Let's use the assault rifle a little bit here, the red dot sight. Oh yeah, we can't forget about this. I'm going to get rid of a load of these drowns because there's too many of them roaming around here. I can swim underwater too, you know, but I need to breathe, unlike you guys. You're used to these sort of conditions, but I adapt to them. Oh, you want something as well, buddy? Boom! 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 I love this shotgun, though. I can't lie, this is probably my favourite weapon. It's so OP and very satisfying to use. Oh, but the sun's coming out now as well, which means zombies should be leaving anytime soon. I think that's all the zombies cleared out around the area, is it? Yeah, I mean, there's one over here. I think we're good now. Oh, no, there's a drowned under here. Well, there was a drowned. But he fell to the raft of my double-barreled shotgun. Hey, but you know what? Ah! Ah! No, 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 no. I do not want to get stuck in that. That is for sure. But, like I was saying, ouch! I keep doing that by mistake. I apologize for that. But like I'm saying, I want to make an enchantment room and enchant some of these weapons. So what I'm going to do is, I already have an enchantment table. All I've got to do is craft some bookshelves. So that's exactly what I'm about to do. I just realized as well, I need to collect a lot of wood. I already have lots of leather and like books, so I should be fine. I just mainly need some wood. So let me go and collect some. Oh, I need to eat though. Make it out alive. Ah, there's still a cow here, stuck. Okay, let's chop this tree down then, because this is all we need. I see some angry zombies through the window, and they're going to stay mad, because I'm not going to contest them right now. I'm focused on getting some wood, and yeah. Hey, buddy, you are mad in there? Well, stay mad. Oh, well, we have a villager on our hands. Oh, and he's running very fast, so... We'll have to give him a cheeky little uh, shotgun to the nose. We can't be having that. There's even more trees over here. So let's get these. I'm going to have to make a little crafting table here. Plant that there. And then I'm going to have to make myself a wooden axe. I've got to be careful with this stuff because when it falls, if I step on it... Wait, is it going to do it? Oh, it's not going to do it, but it normally hurts. Oh my gosh, wait, there's still a mutant zombie in here. Ah! Oh! Mutant zombie's down, I repeat. Mutant zombie is down. Ah! Oh my gosh, look at that one shot. Watch this. Watch when the mutant zombie wakes up. Watch. There we go. That is satisfying. Tell me that isn't satisfying. He's literally one shot. Watch. Look! It's just so fun. This shotgun is just so good. You really can't beat it, man. Okay, we are back to base. And what we're going to do is now, we're going to hit the crafting table and craft some bookshelves. The level 30 is 15, right? So, oh no, looks like I'm short of a few books, but that's fine. I'll have to quickly go and get some more leather. Okay, right, well, we have 13 bookshelves, actually, so we need two more. Actually, wait, I know where some bookshelves are, so I'm going to mine them, take the books, and then quickly craft some more. Oh, of course I'm two bookshelves short, man. It's always the way, right? When you're so close to achieving something, it just, it gets further and further. Like, you know, why does that always have to happen? Okay, bookshelves, give me lovely books. Okay, and we already have enough. There we go, and let's run back home. Try not to get contested on the way as well, because it's becoming nighttime again, and you know what that means? Nighttime equals 
More zombies. I want to get this mosquito. Being careful not to touch the barbed wire, I'm going to go over that. And I'm going to run from here. Oh my gosh! That scared me. Oh my 